Hi right, guys, welcome back to another Steam free. To uh, it is not free to play. Steam walkthrough. Today we're gonna have Juan Yuan Miss Beyond the Mountain. Sorry if I mispronounced things. It's twelve dollars right now. Just came out. As always, we'll leave a link to the game in the description. If you like the video, please like and subscribe. Helps the channel grow, and I always appreciate it. So this is like a turn-based. Tactics RPG game, not tactics, turn-based game, I guess, would be better. Uh, continue the journey. A new beginning. I've never played any of the Juan Yuan franchise, so, first time for me. Sorry in advance for the bad voice acting, I'm gonna do the best I can, unless it's already voice acted, and then I don't have to do anything, which is always nice. Soft Star presents. Dun, dun, dun. There's like 50 achievements. I don't know if we'll get them all. It's waning. Looks awesome so far. Grab the sword. We crave it. The monster. <laughs> That's not a cool name, dude. It's pretty dope. Burn a foot. Oh, he just killed a dude. Nice. Best way to start a game. Murder. I like a ninja or a assassin guy. Doubt. For the Imperial Army. I read the, I never read the synopsis thing. We'll get betrayed old. Can't read what that says, but I'm sure it's Joan Yuan must be on the mountain. Allegedly. I got two different colored eyes. Neat. This is like only a gig of memory with this cutscene. Even though it is kind of like PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2 graphics, it's still pretty action packed. Dabbed a dude, wrote down some notes. Mission complete. We're in Europe for some reason. Venice. Oh, nice. What a mess, what a mess. 
Venice has always been an autonomous region. How can the Pope send Templars from the Frankish Kingdom to meddle in our affairs? Yes, they said that they are here to eliminate all heretics in the world of God, in the world in the name of God. What a lie. Aren't heretics everywhere on the other side of the sea? Even if they kill the heretics here, can they kill them all on the other side? Only those crazy church people believe this nonsense. Shh. Yes, keep your voice down. Church is too powerful. We can't afford to upset them. We might be caught and be burned alive in the, at the execution ground. Be careful. Huh? Burned alive? They'll make me starve to death before that. As a trading hub, Venice needs foreign traders. How can they? How can we make a living if all of them are arrested? I'll take a glass of wine, please. Hey, I haven't seen you before. Are you new here? And this isn't a mess. No matter what religion you believe, just you are here. Just read some verses from the Bible for the time being. The Bible? I have already read the Bible. That's good. Thank God. Amen. <laughs> okay. But I don't believe in God. Wait. Oh. Mate, you can say this here, but don't say it in public. As long as they see people with oriental faces like you, they may arrest you as a heretic at any time. Don't worry about me. By the way, is there any ship heading to Arabia in this port? No way. The knights from the Frankish kingdom have captured all the Arabs. Arabs. So there is no way to Arabia. Are they killing heretics? Yes, I heard that they were going to burn the heretics in the public at Piazza Vienza. Venezia, whatever. Bad. It'll be bad. Alas, I really don't know how our tribute can let people do such things. Actually, I need to turn my key off. Before it pops off. Aha, I preempted it. Okay. Who? <laughs> That's what I said. Finnish girls have a fishy smell, and our Frankia girls are awesome. Alright, dude. But sir, in our place don't have water. Our place don't have water for shower while the girls here take it can take a bath every day. Hey, I want two large beers. Oh wait, wait a minute. I heard that Venice sells tea. I have never had it tried its taste. Bartender, I, bartender, I want two big cups of tea. Hurry up. Mm. Sorry, we don't have tea here anymore. What? No tea? Isn't Venice a trading port? No tea? Are you kidding me? Ah, <laughs> uh, you know what happens to those who look down on our sacred Templars. We we buy the tea from foreign merchants, but they they were. They were all taken away by these darn Templars, so we don't have any tea anymore. Insolent, how dare you say such a thing to the Knights of God! I'm going to tear your down your tavern. Wow. The guy that said it just took off running. Look, there's still a guy over there who hasn't left. That's me. Oh, look at his axe. Cool. Fight me. Hey, man. Why aren't you leaving? You. Wait, you don't look like us. You have those heretics face. Turn around quick. Now. Huh, you, I think I've seen your face somewhere before. Let me think, you are... You know me? Yes, I remember. It is you. You are the one of the knights of our Frankish kingdom. You are... Oh. Oh. Sorry. You shouldn't have recognized me. Wait, are we on the same team? Why are we doing this? How dare you. You're also a heretic. You are one of them. I thought he said I was Frankish, which is what you guys said you are, right? Auto attack. Oh my god, I just murdered that man. I'm killing everybody. Good for me. We killed him. I like the art style. It's pretty dope. I leveled up. Crap. That didn't be popping off, boy.
You, you killed them. Don't worry, I just knocked them out. I don't know, that dude's split into four pieces. Hit them too hard. I'm afraid they won't wake up until tomorrow. It's alright, as long as they don't get in my way today. This, this, do you know who they are? You're in big trouble. You need to leave the city immediately after I get that shiny item over there. Sorry for the trouble. Please don't tell them my whereabouts. Here's the money for the drink and the extra is for keeping my secret. No, no, I won't. I would not never do that. Forget about the money. Oh, by the way. What? What else do you want? I want to ask you one last thing. Do you know where they keep the Arabs? I... I heard that they are kept in the cathedral of our city. But... but... I... I'm not sure. You better ask someone else. Thanks. I'll leave these two up to you. Oh lord, what a mess. What should I do? Let me... no, don't leave. We need... there's an item over there. Ha! Huh. We Franks seem to freak out everyone in here. But what's more troublesome is that it seems likely that these religious madmen will release the Arabs. Okay, I still need to find those Arab merchants first. What I need to do is go back in this hotel. How'd I go in? I don't know how to... Can I not go in here? Weird. Talk to me, people. Spacebar. You know... You know foreign merchants being, bring a cloth called silk from the Far East? I heard that this material is fresh, soft, and has a heavenly luster. Oh, does such a cloth really exist? Yes, but it is very expensive. Only people in churches and nobles can afford it. People like us can't afford clothes made of silk. But I hope that one day I can wear clothes made of silk. Okay. So I can't go back. I don't believe. What about in here? Ah, uh, the weapon and armor shop. Who's this lady? My father is the best blacksmith in Venice. Even foreign merchants came to buy a court sword here. It is it really is a great sword. Okay. I need a great sword of awesomeness. I already got one. Wow, that's cheap, actually. I have tons of money. I'm rich. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, wait, I already got one of those. Well, I was recommended by that little girl to buy that armor, so... Aquiline Scar Sword. What? That's not what I bought. I bought a Quart Sword. Hmm. Used. What? I just bought that. What? There's a hater or something. Maybe I can't equip it. Uh. Maybe I'm too low level. No, no, he equipped it. What? What's going on here? Oh, that's my skill, so I'm hitting E- Okay, I'm an idiot. It'd be like that. Sorry, guys. But where's that helmet I just bought? Armor and helmet. Okay, nice. Now we did it. Fantastic. Oh, man. Oh, look at this bald guy. What's up, baldy? Thank God they finally arrested those heretics. Have you forgotten the story of Sodom and Gomorrah in the Bible? Oh, God is furious. Our God is furious. Excuse me, where are the heretics locked up? Oh, no, young man. Don't approach those evil heretics. We are the children of God. We must follow God and not get corrupted by those who worship idols. That doesn't answer my question. They must be in here somewhere, right? To the cathedral. Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy. Huh, what a magnificent cathedral. It should be the St. Mark's Basilica. Seems that those Arabs are locked inside here. Wow, I'm good. Go away! I'm sorry, I have to search for a certain cleric inside. Get out of here! Unauthorized people are not allowed to enter this church. Okay, I need a disguise. Of course. 
I can't enter the church directly. I need to find another way. Oh, that's cool. Oh, what about this sneaky boy over here? Little boy, I want to ask you a question. Do you know if there's any secret passages to this church around here? Yes, I do. There's a hidden secret passage hidden among the tombs. It leads directly to the back door of the church. Brother Joseph discovered it. He said that it was made in secret by the previous builders of the church. Great, thank you. You are amazing. Oh, yeah, thanks, dude. Obtain copper ring. Wow, good for me. I'm really killing it, I feel. Where do I go from here? I'm killing it. Turn all the lights down low. I don't know why it's grayed out when I can equip it. I guess because it's not equipped yet. I get Alright, so we gotta find the tombs. That's down here. Ooh, there's a monkey. Hey, monkey. Meow, meow. That's a weird monkey noise. Oh, wait. Who are you, old man? The oh, last pirates were rampant a while ago and scared some of the foreign merchants away. The Tribune specifically invited the Templars of the Frankish Kingdom to destroy the pirates. Look at that dude's dome. But we didn't expect these knights to arrest the air merchants. My fabric shop is out of stock. How can I deliver the goods to Lord Hugo? Oh, man. I don't need to go to the residential area per se, but maybe the t tombs are over here somewhere. I don't know. I'm not an adult. That's a potion shop. I can tell. Whoa, water. A oh, flower. A snake berry. Oh, oh it's an end. Briar Tuck over there. No treasure. That one place had treasure, but they won't let me in. Sucks. How long does it take for a dog to change for rabbit? I seem to be in trouble. My dog went after a rabbit and it hasn't lot returned yet. I wonder if it lost its way. I know that a rabbit runs 7 meters a second and my dog runs 9 meters a second. At that time, the rabbit was about 150 meters away from me. How long does it take for my dog to catch up to the rabbit? Oh crap. I think it takes... oh wait. I didn't get to read it. Ah, uh, one minute and a half, probably. I don't know. 90 times 9 is 810. 7 times 9 is 630 plus 150 is 880. Oh, okay. Well, I guess it's not right then. Well, then it's got to be the other one. Math. How dare you math at me? It's a nice little... I like that they have a little question music game, though. That's dope. Well, that should be the answer. Please accept my little gift. Wonderful. Alright. Good luck, man. Look at these little dogs. Could these be one of your dogs? What are they doing? Looks like Scrappy Doo in the game. Let's go to the right. Maybe it's to the right. I don't want to leave town again because I don't know if that's correct. Oh. Secret path. Secret path. What's down here? JC's house. What's up, JC? Jassy. With your chrome dome head. What's up, man? You won't talk to me. What are you doing? Oh, space bar. Hello, oh, us. I'm so worried about my nephew. Is he safe? Last month, he said he would go to Alexandria and buy his antium and to do business. He should have come back a long time ago. I heard the pirates rampant recently. What if he encountered danger on his way back? Oh, I'm so worried. Worried to death. Now nah, you're still alive. Don't worry about it. Good man. You're good. There's nothing special in this. Your house sucks. Do 
Jessica and Beth. Better have some treasure. Some I better have some. There ain't no Jessica or Beth in here. I have the biggest feet. Oh. Private house. Not so private anymore. Not with your boy invading. Call me Big Feet McGee. Over. All right. I tell me that lady. She looks like she has a wealth of unimportant knowledge. That lady over there looks distressed, but I'm here for the tombs. Oh, scrappy do again. Can't we just stop them when they're about to burn them in the town square? Leave Vinzi, Vinzi again. Hey. Kelly, it's not safe. Oh, Kelly, it's not safe outside. You're not allowed to go out. Do you understand? I, I want to visit other kids. No, if you run around outside, those bad guys will burn you. But it's been a long time since I've visited my friends. I said no. You're not allowed to play outside anyway. Okay. Where are these so-called tombs? Oh, here we go. Perfect. I found it. There should be a secret path afoot. Oh man, I have a question. Can you help me? Yeah, I guess. Well, my husband passed away last month. He knew that I was pregnant, so he made this will. It is our son. Son, our son will get two thirds of his property, and I will get one third. If it's a daughter, I will get two thirds, and our daughter will get one third. Oh, that's sexist. That sounds good. What's the problem? The problem is we got twins, a boy and a girl. Can you tell me how to divide the property? Sure. How many parts should the property be divided into? Uh, I don't know. Wait a minute, let me think about it. Seems wrong, would you please rethink it? click too much and I get to the clicking of the answer and I screw up. Okay, screw you then. <laughs> I don't care! things to do. Screw your math. I don't care. I hear- oh! I don't know where to go. I thought there was a tomb. Maybe it's not in the cemetery. Maybe there's a different tomb. I don't know. No my eyeball itches. Jesus. Let me talk to that kid again. He knows something, I guess.
I might have misinterpreted the dialogue. Hey, where's that thing again? Strange switches on the tower besides the church. However, I refuse to tell me what they're for. Hmm. Strange switches on the side of the church. There's a secret path to the church. He won't tell me where the secret path is again, because I already talked to him, I guess. This works at the cemetery or a tomb or something. I'm lost. Already. How did this happen? Ah, here we go. The text on the tombstone at the bottom is the life experiences of an old man interest interested in future generations may try to calculate my age. Would you like to calculate? Oh, one seventh of my life was a happy childhood. After my childhood, I spent one fourth of my life studying. After these days, I got married. Five years after my marriage, I had a son. I was very happy, but unfortunately, my child only lived half, half of my time. After my son passed away, I'd spent four years in sorrow. I don't care. Let's see how many options I get. Okay, I can figure this out. Brute force. 70 years. Ah, oh, hell no, I ain't doing that. Do I have to do this? I just want to go to the church. Take a passage somewhere. Got it! This tomb was the strangest and nothing engraved on it. Yes, pull the handle. Thank God. Okay, sick. interest in doing your math puzzles. No interest at all. Uh oh. Skills. I suck. Huh. Well, good thing we one shot everything. Who needs skills when you can just one shot everything? The what? Oh my god. Random encounter Zubats. Okay, I was just wondering what button I had to press for it to work. Space bar. Ah, if you auto attack, then it'll just keep attacking. Nice. That's kind of convenient, I guess. Double five. What is he reaching for? What's up there? What? What's up there? The treasure over? Oh, Jesus. Fighter, kill it. Had enough fighters in my life recently. Since I played a JRPG, or I guess it'd be. Well, I think the genre would still be JRPG, even though it's a Chinese game. The RPG. Ow, he hit the hell out of me, actually. I want to see if there's treasure in this up. God bless, dude. Where's that one thing that keeps things away from you? I need a Helen or something, Jesus. Constantly under attack. Constantly. What's in here? Treasure. Oh, it is treasure. Sick. I love treasure. 20 silver coins. Antidote herb. Herb. Oh, sneak attack. I'll teach you. Apparently when you level up, you get all your health back. That's really nice. Thank you, game. How kind. 
I have a big ponytail. My ponytail gives me strength. Oh my god. <laughs> They're everywhere! We'll be level a billion by the time I get through this cave. Oh, it's a zombie. Where the hell? We escalated this, didn't we? Frogs are zombies. A oh, treasure. Hell yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Melt it. Snake. Kill the snake. Or don't. Whatever. Level up. I knew it. I could cry. I felt it in my soul. Hell's over here. Oh, treasure. Is that better than the sword I have? I don't think so, but I'll check it. No, it's trash. Absolute trash. Stop giving me trash game. Like seeking rock. Like second. Waterfalls everywhere. The one hell of a secret passage. To be honest with you. <laughs> I think after they saw me just slaughter their friend, they'd be a little bit more hesitant to butt da 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 me every five seconds. But I guess not. They have no sense of danger, I guess. A bunch of grapes! Is this a save point? The sword of ceiling, pull it out? Hell yeah. Yeah. I knew it. I knew it was a save point. I'm psychic. Jesus, look at me. Yeah, save. Save. Okay, sick. I have the Sword of Sealing. Wow. And it's trash, actually. Well, whatever. I guess that girl wasn't lying when she said the core sword was OP. This underground waterway... Why is there such a monster here? I don't know. However, it seems that we'll not be able to get out without defeating it. Oh, he's doomed. Ultimate. Aquiline Scar Sword! Omni Slash! Ha! Ya! 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 Ha! Oh my god, it had, it's a laser beam coming from the cell. That's good for him. Wow. Amazing. I didn't mean to auto attack. You're hurting me, by the way. I can only use my ultimate every so often, it seems like. Fireball! Okay. Super not effective. Ow. A bunch of grapes! Right, I'm gonna do one more attack and then we'll heal if we have to. We win! Level up! Oh yes. We crave the levels. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Septim's a bad man. Oh my god, what the hell? What are you doing? That is a weird looking man. Okay. What a questionable decision you just made, Kung Fu man. Yes. Gosh. We did it. Amazingly. Killed the griffin. Did some good stuff. I'm the hero of legends, obviously. Can I pick up this antidote herb? It looks the same. Fine. A bunch of grapes! These items look the same, but they won't let me pick that one up. A magic leaf! Wow! So magical. Ahaha, what's up for our tuck? 
You, who are you? Are you the foreigner who came to rescue the prisoners? Tell me, where are they, the heretics? Uh -huh. My friend, please put down the sword. For all they take, the sword shall perish with the sword. This is what Jesus taught us. You want to go to the church to save the people? Go down the right side. There you'll find a side entrance. The heretics are locked in underground cells. Only the leader of the Templars has the key if you want to access it. You must go to the top of both towers of the church to activate the secret clockwork. Huh. Thank you for telling me. But how can I be so sure that you're not trying to set me up? Friend, you will know it only when you arrive. Anyway, you can kill me if you don't believe it. Not all Christians agreed to kill foreigners, as they are also God's people. Well, I believe you. Thanks. Please rescue those foreigners. They are innocent. I cannot stand to see the church killing innocent people. May God bless you. Oh, thanks, dude. A copper ring. I have equipment slots for that, I believe. Wow. We found our way in. Let's go down to the left, see if there's treasure. I knew it, treasure. Alright, I gotta go to this tower first, I'm assuming. It's closer. And there's treasure, so that's good. I love treasure. Treasure loves me. Very love lover. Oh, hell, he's got a magical book. Kill him. Kill him, take the book. That was a critical hit. Hit that switch. Smash that like button. Ow. Wait! Don't hit me! I was forced! Hit him. If you let me go, I'll let you in on a secret, okay? <laughs> yeah, okay, I guess. Tell us the secret. I heard that one left and right of towers, there's a switch that controls the gate leading to the dungeon. Hmm, I see. I What the hell? I knew that. Next time we kill him. We're gonna throw an axe at him next time he does that. Crash. I was forced. Psh. What man of God be forced? It's a picture. Ah, oh, hell. Surprise! Oh man, this game has a plethora of treasure. I like that. I do like that. Hell, look at that guy in the middle. Slap him. Bop him. Oh, he didn't die. That's not good. Oh my god, he hit me and ran. You kidding me. How dare you. He's got a shield. Oh my. Oh, the music in this game's kind of falling. I wish I could keep the music up, but the game has too many super loud sound effects when battle happens. I do gotta say, those little combat animations do look pretty slick. The mechanism seems to be triggered. Yes, triggering all the mechanisms. Get triggered. Oh. Oh, there might be a path over here. No. Oh my god. Level up. Nope, I was wrong. Uh, there's a first for everything. Killing the clergy guy first, because one, he asked for help. Two, he has fireball, which hurts. Ah, oh, was one battle. So close. What's up with the stat game, bro? It is pretty randomized, it feels like. Ah, oh, treasure! Okay, I'm guessing that yellow bar near my. Portrait is probably my special bar, allegedly. Oh, what's up, guys? Who are you? How did you get here? Heretics! Heretics are breaking into the jail! Well... Aquiline... Nah, no, I didn't leave that. I'm saving that. Oh, maybe I should've used it. Nah, they don't hit very hard. We're good. All good, baby. Oh, 
Ah. Oh, what's up, heretics? I'm loving cake. Oh, shoot. Somebody killed that old man. 50 silver coins or 5 0. Septum, Septum. Huh, who is this old man? Why does he know my name? Who are you? How do you know my name? The question. Water, water. Did I hear him wrong? I'd better fetch some water for him first. Better get that treasure first. Actually. Oh, what a nice bed. There's water. Oh, hell, they just... Okay, what's up, guys? Thank you. Thank you so much for saving us. I want to set sail to the east. Do you have anyone from Arabia among you? Yes, yes, sir, but they were taken away not long ago. Taken away? To where? The, the Frankish knight tied them up and took them to Piazza Vienna. Of course. Venezia to be executed by a fire sentence in public. Yes, yes, I am afraid we would be burned too if you didn't come to save us. Thank you for saving us. It's dangerous here. We must escape as soon as possible. Yes, you should leave fast or the Templars will be back. But first... Oh, cool. Solar Flare? Go wrong with that. I'm guilt to the nines, boys. It's good that there's some water here. I will fetch some for the old man. Genius. Septum took some water. Good job, Septum. Wow, way to contribute by taking water. Water! Water! Sir, I got water for you. Water! Water! After this time, turns out this old man is already unconscious. Then I'll help him drink the water slowly. What a face. Thank you. Thank you, young man. He looks kind of evil. It was nothing. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a lot of things to do. Wait. Wait, Septum. Don't. Don't go. I, I have been looking for you for a long time. Ah, you know my name. Who are you? I've never seen you. Septum, I need to go out quickly. I, I want to do one thing for you. One very important thing. Important thing? Hey, you haven't answered me yet. How do you know my name? Septum, Septum! I am running out of time. I ha I have to hurry up to the altar outside. Wait, you can't go out like this. Templars might be outside. Oh, well, he's not listening to us. Very old man of him. Oh, uh, come on. Wait a minute, those Templars will be back soon. Let me have a look first. Seems those Templars haven't returned yet, but it's dangerous to stay here. Let's leave as soon as possible. Septum, let me, let me go to the altar. I have an important thing to do. The old guy's pushing his luck. I'm in a hurry to save the, those Arabs. Why is he still here? Does he want me to stay with him till those Templars get back? Okay, cool, come back. I actually need to clear my memory after this, so give me one second. Don't go, Templars may come back soon. Septum. Wait, wait here, I'm going to give you a gift. Oh, I love gifts. Thanks. This guy can't even walk straight anymore. Yeah, he wants to give me a gift instead of leaving. Why? Aha! Pentagram. Hey, what is he doing? He bit his finger in something uh, too fast. Come in the Lord of name Satan. I hereby summon you from the underworld. In the name of Satan. What the fudge is going on? He's the devil. He said, I wanted to give you a boss fight. Oh, hell. Here comes the female trick, I bet. A companion. There she is. Knew it. Psychic. It's succubus. Or something. Old men just giving people random babes. Lord, Lord Satan, I have completed all missions you gave me. I have to go. 
Bye bye. Oh wow. Wow, he melted. That's amazing. How did he do that? What happened? The older man disappeared, and someone with wings popped up. Hey, you. Who are you? You have wings and you can fly. Where the hell did you come from? You are so rude. Nah. Wow, what a beautiful place. Wow, what's this? What a beautiful painting. Who painted it? Oh, she's living her best life. Good for her. Wow, it looks more beautiful from this side. Much more beautiful than my place. Hey girl, I ain't got time for this. I got people to save from burning. Wow, here's also good. I <laughs> just with her. <laughs> what is your name? Strange wink, he just following her around? Well. Hey, who are you? What are you doing here? Uh, living her best life, bro. Yeah. Hey, who are you? Answer me. this poor guy why has was he hung here what did he do wrong that's Jesus I think oh it's just a statue a statue of a man named Jesus Jesus hey do you people here enjoy abusing others just like us hey I've talked with you for a long time where did you exactly come from what is it like there stop beating around the bush yeah are you that septum you're so mean yeah. What's going on? Why does he, she even know my name? Everyone knows my name. I'm famous. I'm level 8. Where are you from? Alright, I am Septim. Why do you know my name? Septim, my name is Nicole. Nicole, Nicole. I'll stay with you from now on. Babe acquired. Nicole with me? Oh, there she goes. Oh my god, he turned into a blood puddle. This guy keeps evolving. Holy hell. I gotta clear. Where's my 40 hours of punch club? Literally. That's the only reason I need to do this, because if I don't, I feel like I'm gonna run out and then I might not start recording again. And then it'll be a big problem. Sorry for the intermission, I guess. Sorry, right, did you delete the other one? How much space do I have right now? Okay, we should be good. Alright, babe. Bud Puddle Man. Ah, oh, hell. They're still here? Still. Ball or binding. Oh. Actually, need to clear my throat again. I get like super flimmy, bro, when I've been reading like game chat for a while for some reason. Prisoner said that the Templars were going to burn the Arabs at the Piazza Ven Venezia. Things will get messy if they really burn them. Captain, are you going to save them? Ah! Hey, why are you following me? I'm looking for you. Looking for me? What do you want from me? Well, I don't know either. Anyway, Lord Satan asked me to help you. Satan? Do you mean the devil, Satan? Look, you know it. I never believed in any gods or demons, so why should I, would I get involved with you? I don't know. Either way, Lord Satan asked me to help you. I don't need the help of Satan. You can go back. No. Lord Satan ordered me to follow you all the time. I can't go back. Go back. Get away from me. Don't follow me. No, I won't leave you. I'll follow you. Go away. No. Forget it. You can follow me if you want. I hate to argue with women. But let me make it clear. You're following me because you want to. I don't owe Satan a thing. Yeah, that's great. That's great. Nicole won. Do 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 do. By the way, I almost forgot one thing. Nicole, Nicole, are you still there? 
left him. What is it? You said that you came to help me. Do you know how to fight? Of course. Who do you want to fight? <laughs> that face. I'm going to save some Arabs. I may encounter some troublesome enemies on the way. So I may need your help. No problem. That's easy. Nicola helps help them. Nice. Party member acquired. You're right back. Nicole, Nicole, Nicole. Let's do this. Any more treasure in the well? No. Maybe I can go into that inn now and get the item that I saw earlier. No, no, auto cutscene, you got me. Darn it, let's go of me. I don't want to be burned to death. Let me go. Oh, that's a woman, actually. Please don't burn me. Leave us alone. Fortunately, the fire soonest hasn't started yet. I still have a chance to save these people. We're only here to do business. Why do you burn us? Allah, please save us. Please save us. Huh, isn't that the leader of the Templars, Miles? Why is he in Venice? To get his butt kicked. It's troublesome. I don't know how many knights are around plus Miles. I wonder if that weird Nicole can really help. Oh, nice. Septum, did you call me? Oh, did you suddenly show up? Oh, why did you suddenly show up? Septum, you called me, so I called it and came out. Hey, Septum, are they going to burn them? Yes, they are the Templars controlled by the Bishop of the Frankish Kingdom. They are knights just like me, but they specialize in catching heretics. They can weave crimes at will. So, lords and nobles with great power don't dare to provoke them. <laughs> Septum, so are you also a knight just like them? Nicole, get back first. I will call you when I need your help. Alright, alright. Then I'll wait for, S for Septum's command. Hey, who are you? We were talking... You were talking to yourself from the beginning. You look suspicious. Wait a minute. Your appearance, you don't look like one of us. Are you a heretic just like them? Dude, what are you talking about? I'm just a little tanned. Listen to me, isn't it an authentic Frankish accent? Hmm, sounds it... Sounds right. But you may also be a heretic who speaks Frankish. Dude, you're being too far-sighted. I am a knight... Directly controlled by Lord Pepin, the ruler, just like you, I am also a knight of Francia. I came to Venice a little earlier than you for my task. Um, so you're the subordinate of that dwarf, Pepin. Seems like anyone can have any subordinates these days. What are you doing here? I came to Venice to collect intelligence on the orders of Lord Pepin. I heard that you caught many heretics to burn, so I came here for fun. But why are there so few of you? Aren't you afraid that other heretics came to res come to rescue them? I sent the rest of my men to other cities to catch more heretics. Those heretics won't dare to come here. Heh, <laughs> the three of us alone are enough to deal with them. So it's just the three of you? Yeah, that's great. I've collected all the intelligence. What? What are you doing? You are a heretic! Somebody get this man! That's what he said allegedly. I don't know. X1 too fast. Take him down! Yes, sir! Oh, she's fast. Swift Lightning. Special. Oh, she doesn't have her ultimate charged up yet. Got a bow. I gotta kill them first, apparently. Oh, that hurt. She vaporized him. We win, I guess. He's on late. He makes a lot of noises. Stop it. Oh my gosh, you did it again. Who the hell are you? How dare you stop us from burning heretics? I'm so sorry, but I had to disturb your precious barbecue activity. I am saving those Arabs no matter what. I need their selling skills to do a task. How dare you? Burning heretics follows the sacred laws enacted by the prophets. Do you want to challenge God? I don't care about prophets. I have long waited once to see meet you, Sir Miles. He's about to get special moved. Ooh, it's fizzing. That arrow did no damage. The arrow's weak. Yeah. 
What? How could I lose to you? I'm the best. Oh, Miles, no. Uh oh. Huh? L Lillian? How could she. Get away, Septim, you bad guy. Don't, don't hurt Miles. Lillian, it's really Lillian. I. Septim. Go away, Lillian. Do you think. Do you think I, a knight, need a woman to protect me? But. But, Miles, I just. I just. Ugly woman, you're very annoying. Get out of the way. No. Oh my god, she just. Oh, 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 bugs after. Lillian! Nicole, what are you doing here? You, where did you come from, dim demon? How dare you take my Lillian? You was annoying, and so are you. Oh my god, she's zapping everybody. Strange, why haven't you died? Oh, oh my god. Nicole, stop! What are you, on earth are you doing? I'm helping you, Septum. Helping Septum kill the enemy. What have you done? How can you just attack that innocent girl? She is also an enemy. She's with them. You do it on purpose? That girl is not an enemy. But you almost killed her with such powerful lightning. What am I going to do? How would I know? I was kind enough to help Septum fight the enemy. I thought Septum would be happy. Boo-hoo. Septum was mean at me. Septum scalded me. Boo-hoo. Okay, okay, stop crying. I surrender. I surrender. Don't cry. Septum... Septum is not mad at Nicole anymore? No, I'm not mad at you anymore for the time being. Wow, great. Septum is not mad at Nicole anymore. Alas, I can't understand... I can't stand you. Seems that you don't understand the rules of this world. I will teach you later. Shut up, dog. There is no time. We have to get down to business quickly. Save those arrows first, and then get out of here immediately. Still can't go in the hotel, but there's an item in there, bro! I saw it! By the way, I should save all the arrows. Okay, sure. Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! He looks like a sailor. Thank you! Don't thank me yet. I'd like to go east. Can any of you help me? Sir, I am a merchant from Arabia. If you want to go east, I can be your guide as thank you for saving me. Our ships have been burned by the Templars, and thus we now have no means of transport. I can't tell who's who. There are pirate ships. Our ships are hidden in a sea cave on southeast Venice. They can help us escape from this place. Great, this is what I wanted to hear. Let's go. Templars may come back soon. Let's leave this place as soon as possible. But the treasure. Wait a minute. I have one more important thing to do. Don't give her a herb or something. You, you heretic. What do you want to do with my Lillian? It's simple. I want her to be my hostage before I leave. You, you brute. Are you trying to defile her? You brute, leave her alone. Let's go! There's no time to take care about him! Wow, Mr. Snatch your girl! Uh oh, that's not good. He seems like a bad man. Huh, isn't he the cleric who was there at the execution ground just now? Hasn't he escaped? Sir, this person looks evil. Please be careful. You lost sheep. A disaster is about to befall you. The righteous anger of God is about to blaze. Ha ha ha, let me, Cornelius, pray for you, amen, ha ha. What a weirdo. Let's go leave him alone. <laughs> See, man. Ignored. Ha 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 ha. They said southeast, correct? Peace indeed. This way. Oh, Jesus. It's a one armed monkey man, I guess. <laughs> Lillian's cute though. Oh, uh, not Lillian, uh, Nicole. I like her dialogue so far. Even though she does like to scream a whole hell of a lot. Septum is level 10 achievement. Nice. I did it. I'm the best. It's a bear! They say the east or the southeast. I thought they said southeast, but I could be wrong. Come 
monkey. Can't afford to be wrong. There's too many battles. Oh, East is to the. I'm an idiot. Sorry. East is this way. Oh my god. Please. Where did- oh, I see it. I see the cave. Gotcha. Actually, I kind of want to go back and do that math problem for that. Can I do that? Wait a second. I think I know the answer now. Oh, I can't go. Okay. More battles! I'm an idiot. Love that, guys. Do your math problems before you escape Venice, or Venezia, whatever it's called. Sure, this is our ship. So it's actually a pirate ship. Are you the only one left of the crew? Yes. The captain and all the others have been burned to death by the knights. See, everyone, let's get on board first. What's her condition? You all right? Sir, she is badly hurt. I'm afraid she may not last. Now we must give her time to rest. We have done everything we can. It depends on her will to live. Survive now. Sorry, Lillian. I'm not. She deserved it. Star-Cross Lovers! Yes, yes, I know, I know. Bor is a good boy. Bor is the greatest boy. But Nicole's better. Oh, what are you doing? You bad dog, why do you keep ignoring me? Captain, so you were hiding here to relax. I almost went crazy, Sergeant. It's Lillian. Boy, are you here alone peeking on your crush? She was seen as the most beautiful girl in Frankia. Many people were obsessed with her. She is cute, but isn't she already interested in someone? That loser? Miles, Sir Miles. Oh my. oh, Miles, my dear Miles. Felix, Felix, let me ask you a question. Do you happen to know Miles? What does he do? This is why he became a knight. Huh? I thought you knew him. He is the captain of an army under the Bishop's direct control. They're called the Templar. An army under the Bishop's direct control? Yes, their army aims to capture and execute heretics, although it normally belongs to our Frankish kingdom. It's actually not j under our jurisdiction. Even His Excellency Pepin can't command them. See, I've heard of this. Septim, you need to look on the bright side. You see how much Lillian likes him. You won't get any chance, so don't think too much. Well, I know. Anyway, many people discriminated me for being mixed race since I was a child. I don't even know which country my father is from. Septim, I know you're sad, but... And you suffered a lot when you were a child, but... The way you're thinking now isn't right. Maybe Lillian just happens to like Miles, but not you. She doesn't mean to look down on you. Everyone is a child of God! Thank you, Felix. You're right. I shouldn't feel sorry for myself. Don't mention it. We've been friends for so many years. There's no need to... Let's leave here. Don't think about her anymore. No matter how deep the wound is, it will heal as time goes by. Ah, yes. Back to the 3D graphics as we walk away. Perfect. Into the moonlight. Sir, sir! 
Sir, we will never forget you for saving us. We'd like to know your name, if it's possible. My name is Septum. Septum, I think I've heard this name before. Yes, I remember. You are the Knight of Frankia. How do you know? Do you know me? Of course. I used to go to Gallia in the Frankish Kingdom to do business. I have heard a lot of your stories. So he is with those knights we saw just now? No, no, no. Although he is also a knight, he is very different from What's more interesting is that he saved the Shorty Pepin several times for losing the whole troop. Pepin, do you mean the present Prime Minister and ruler of the Frankish Kingdom? That's right, he also did espionage for Pepin. I heard that he did many important work. He has made many great contributions, so Pepin knighted him, regardless of his domestic objections about his race and origin. That's really something. And it turns out that the person who saved us is a great hero. Sir, please tell us more about your heroic deeds. Sorry, they are all military intelligence. I am not at liberty to disclose them. Darn it. There is no charge on board, so we can't go out to sea. Can't go out to sea without that? Of course. The sea is so big, you will certainly get lost. The charge is critical. The charge is critical. Our captain usually keeps it with him, but he was born alive by the Templar. This is the case. It should have been taken away before they burned him, right? I overheard the cleric say they were keep all the heretics belonging in the monastery before burning them. Ah, oh, jeez, we got backtrack. Sick. A monastery? The monastery is not in Venice. It isn't located in the field to the northwest of the city. But I don't know if the chart has been burned. Okay, I'll search for the chart. You collect as much food and water as possible while I'm away, and we leave as soon as I get back. Sick. Mr. Septum, are you going to sneak into the monastery? This is too dangerous. Don't worry about me. You need to hurry up and leave. Hurry up to leave. Please take care of this girl. I'll be back soon. Mm hmm Rest assured, please take care of yourself. Come with me, dog. I need a new party member, and you look just like you had the stuff. Is there treasure down here? Treasure! Yar har! Pirates! Uh oh. Well, Septim, are you really a knight? You again. That's just a title. I don't really care about it. Wow, you're amazing. I'd love to know more about your past. An important thing to do. Is that why you came out here? No, I noticed you carrying with you that big bronze pot. It's a very special one. You mean this bronze pot? This is a treasure I've had since I was a child. I heard that it belongs to a heritage country at the end of the world. But I don't know more details about its origin. Really? There's a spacious, beautiful place inside this bronze pot. Let me show you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, nice. What is this place? What have you done? This is what I just told you about, the world inside the bronze pot. Isn't it beautiful? Nicole didn't lie to you. Okay. There's a safe spot. That means battle. How do I use it? Yeah, I don't... It is pretty though. I need bronze pot. Something's mumbling at me. Where we get our magic. Hey, what's going on? What the hell is this place? Haven't I told you this? It's a beautiful world in the bronze pot. I brought your soul here. What? Only my soul? What about my body? Your body is still outside, Septum. You can go back the way you came. Don't worry. Okay. Speaking of which, it turns out there is another world in this bronze pot. How amazing. What's it called, that thing they do where they become, like, good at using their key or whatever? I, there's, like, a word for it. I don't remember. I watched some Chinese animes that talked about it, but I can't remember what it's called. All right, there's a stone tablet. There may be clues here. Huh, what are they? They're, these are so square. How many... 
How come there are such strange characters in this world? Arcadia is still intertwined with the human world. I can't bear people suffering from never-ending wars by the mortal and the spirit fusion pot. Strange, I've never seen this kind of language, but I understand it. The mortal of the spirit fusion pot, so we are in the realm of the spirit fusion pot and the mortal is the owner of this place. Stone tablets should have been placed by the owner, but where is the owner? Oh, there's also an another message. Those who use this pot can contact contract with and order demons. The user must be prudent using such power. Well, this is interesting. I didn't expect a bronze pot to have so many secrets. I wonder if it has anything to do with where I want to go in Eastern Arabia. Except him, there's no one else here. Nicole checked it carefully. Oh yeah? Maybe the stone tablet was made a long time ago. It, look, it also looks like something from a distant, very distant past. Septim, this is a great place. I want to stay here in the future, so I don't need to stay outside all the time. As long as you're happy, I'm fine with it. Obtain spirit fusion pot. I always had the spirit fusion pot, apparently. Instructions. You will have a new skill tamed during battles. This skill enables you to make monster become your companion. Success rates higher when the monster has low HP. That's perfect. We're catching Pokemon. Phew, I finally returned to the original world. Nicole delayed me for a long time. I had to go to the monastery to find the chart. We're gonna catch all the Pokemon. I'm a Pokemon master. Really? I have been a Pokemon master multiple times, actually. Not in any of the new games, because I haven't played them, but the old games, I'm quite, quite the Pokemon Master. Look at these tridents. Good for fighting lure folk. I'm looking for treasure. No treasure here. See if we can catch some Pokemon on our way to the monastery. Did he even say where the monastery was? I know he said it's outside Venice, but... Chi healing. Uh, how do I tame? I don't know how to tame things. Ah, there we go. Don't let me. Are these guys not tameable? Huh. Why wouldn't it let me tame them, I wonder? What about these things? Oh, I can try to tame them, at least. Capture failed. I if I attack it, it's going to die. I don't have, like, weak attacks. See? That crap. That right there, what she just did. Come to me! Wind whirl. Maybe the status element will make him easier to catch. I don't know, dude. Oh my god, I can't catch him. What? He stuck. Oh my god, he put stun on me. He paralyzed me. Try a fireball, but I think it's gonna kill him. Oh my god. Well, he's uncapturable, I guess. Can't catch that one. So you can't catch all the Pokemon we've learned. Where the hell is the monster at, I wonder? Hey! <laughs> 
But I guess those things don't count as monsters, they count as animals. I guess, maybe. I don't know. What the hell's a monster? It's blocked by a stone wall. It's blocked by a stone wall. It's blocked by a stone wall. <laughs> nice. What the hell's a monster yet? Fifty victories. Nice. over here I can feel it maybe not okay trick me really thought there'd be some treasure over here Same. but what about this side aha can't hide the treasure from me old man Oh, he won't talk to me. Oh, there he goes. Really nerve-wracking. Who is the 13th person for the, of the Last Supper? Seems like something troubled you. I wonder who among... Judas. It was Judas! Judas! Ah, yes, it's Judas. Here's a little... You call yourself a clergyman? How do you not know that, bro? Come on now. Come on now. What are you doing? Ah, oh, treasure! Yeah. Ah, da! Treasure chest is booby trapped by music. You hear sound after pressing the button. It seems to be connected to the floor head. Yeah. Oh, hell no. I gotta remember that. Oh, no, we ain't doing that. You know how I am so bad at music puzzles, bro. It is insane. Actually, let's try it. I don't know. Let's listen. There's no way now. Nah, I can't do it, bro. I hope they don't have music puzzles for, like, Late game, because God, I will never get it. I am so bad. Alright, well, nothing that way. What about this way? Need the chart. A book on a shelf. The three goddesses, Hera, Athena, and Venus, had. Why did they have. Okay, whatever. Had an argument over. Shouldn't it be Juno if it's gonna be Venus? Argument over the golden apple for the most beautiful goddess. The three goddesses did not want to lose to each other, so Zeus, the ruler of heaven, became very concerned. He asked the three goddesses to ask the prince of Troy to make their judgment. Each of the goddesses also offered a bribe in return for the apple. Hera, the queen of the gods, offered him power. Athena, the goddess of war and wisdom, offered him victories in battle. Venus, the goddess of uh, love and beauty, offered him the most beautiful woman under the sun, Helen, to... Prince of Troy, 
chose hell and the bride that v goddess Venus offered, and then got everyone killed because he's a moron. This decision depressed the other two gods. Worse still, Helen already had a husband, the king of Sparta. The prince, with the help of the goddess of Venus, escaped with Helen. Helen's husband, in a fit of pique, invited neighboring countries to attack Troy at the prompt of Athena. Greek soldiers hid in the Trojan horse, and Trojans dragged the horse into the city. In this way, that night, Troy was slaughtered. The Trojan War started with the golden apple and ended with the Trojan horse. Some call the Trojan horse massacre. Okay, well, that was... Yeah, I, I know Greek mythology. Thank you, though. Well, I don't know. If, yeah, pretty much. The Odyssey and the Iliad. Prince Paris was a douchebag. Septum, septum. I just like him. Thought you were fine inside the pot. Why did you come out again? No, I felt there was an underworld. Underworld merchant nearby, so I came out to tell you. An underworld merchant? Where? I haven't seen any. The store of the underworld merchant is by the stone lion on your left. You can buy many bizarre things from him. So what should I buy for me? Used to buy from him. Are there any danger or other requirements? There is no danger. You can buy things from him with comet silver. There aren't any re other requirements. They're very nice. Okay. Honestly, it seems like I... Ever since I met her, I keep running into weird people and things. Welcome, welcome! Huh? Aren't you human? Why can you see us? Oh, I see. Someone from Lord Satan is with it in you. Okay, okay, please wait a moment. I'm going to confirm. Hello, welcome. Our underworld store is full of goods. What do you want to buy? I have this. This is better, so I'm gonna get that. Guess I'll get that as well, because I have plenty of money. I need a... I guess. Mink garment. I don't know if I can wear the mink garment. I don't need it then. I'm ready. How much is this? Very expensive. That's okay. Oh, that's not. That's. Oh, I thought it was going to do it for me. I was like, that is convenient. But alas. Oh, wait. I've been working in the shop for so long, and it's the first time I welcome a human customer. I'm giving you five spirit world indicators, which can help you find a way out of it. Oh, thanks. I don't think I'll need them, but maybe I will. How do I? Oh, tab. Okay, thank you, game. And we're ready. Detox talk to? Can't find the mechanism. Ah, yes. What's up? What shall I do? How long will I be kept in here? I don't know. How would I know? Sir, could you, could you help us? Yes, but how can I save you? I, I overheard... Monks say that one of the four stone lions outside is the secret me mechanism of the dungeon, which can open the door. Got it. I'll give it a try. Eye tracking. Yay! Not this one. It is this one. Got it. There's something like a switch here. Strange. It doesn't move at all. And there's a line of words engraved next to it. Apostles of Satan, my devil's on blah. Anyone who wants to open this mechanism shall gaze at the eye of the stone lion and recite the devil's code in your heart. Huh, it has something to do with the underworld. Let me have a guess. The devil's code is... 66666. 
Obviously. Seems to be correct. The iron gate is open. Nice. I'm the best. Welcome, Vanessa and Becky. Oh god, there's a lot of them. I'm surrounded! Thank you, sir. I can't thank you enough. Oh good. What crimes have you committed? How can you be locked up in here? I I was arrested because I secretly read the Greek Bible and questioned some of the church's practices. My husband and I came here to do business. Because we didn't want to convert to Christianity, we were arrested and locked up. The habit wanted me to be his concubine, but I fervently rejected him. So he falsely accused me of being a heretic and locked me up. See, do, does any of you know where the keep her, where they keep the heretics' belongings? Usually, the abbot takes and keeps the valuable things to himself. So maybe he can go to him. Okay, all good. You can use this opportunity to run away now. Thank you. Thank you very much. What are those two doing? Huh? Why aren't you two leaving? Thank you for saving us. We we don't know how to thank you. You don't have to be polite with me. Hurry up. It's dangerous here. Sir, we have a secret key for you. The key can open a secret underpass of our house in Venice. My father found it. He said there might be treasures, but many monsters were there, so people were afraid to go in. We are afraid to stay in Venice for the time being. Here's the key to the house. If you're interested, you can go there. I see. Thank you. Okay, let's go. Thank you. Thank you for saving us. I know where it's at. I know where that's at. Treasure is mine. Eventually. Any treasure over here? Not a native mist because I didn't come over here. Oh, no treasure. No treasure. It's another stone lion. This guy really likes stone lions. Uh oh. The left and right. The left, right. Oh, hell. The maze has begun. Treasure. Mimic. Or, no, not a mimic. That guy. Oh, I can tame this guy. Maybe. Oh, my God. Don't kill him, please. Yes, perfect. I tamed him. Capture successful, absorb one monsters. Obtain 20 silver coins. Gnome. Oh nice, they give you sets. Cool. Attain an herb. It's another monster. He doesn't seem to kill things, so perfect. Ah, didn't work. Sucking all the things. I don't know what this consumes vitality means. Honestly. Oh, it's that thing in the... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Ah, yes. Koi fish. Oh, she, she killed that one. Taming all the critters. Treasure. Huh. 
Wow, that one just ascended to heaven or something. What happened there? <laughs> what the hell? Soul just left his body, bro. Oh, it's a vampire. He seems really good. Oh, I'll give it to her anyways. Treasure. I like that. Suck him. I give one to Septum. Oh wow, he did so suck the hell out of her. Oh my god. Bunch of grapes. Oh, he died. I can't tame that one. difference between silver and gold is in this game because I find silver coins in these chests but I get gold when I beat these guys. I wonder if there's actually a difference. Him, I guess. The soul pill. Or soul pills.
Huh. Door's locked. The door's locked. Save point. Which means... I should actually go the other way. One moment. Oh, how'd I get down there? Ah, I see. Jump! The court sword and a hundred silver coins. I want to check the other way real quick, because I feel like the boss is that way. Gotta go fast! I knew this was the right choice. Oh, yeah. The bamboozle. You have an AoE spell? Single. Oh, that sucks. Oh, we have a single target attack. God dang it. Hunting bow. Is that an upgrade? Yeah. Maybe. Yes. Yes. Hi, dudes. I wonder if I can use these things in my pot later, because it is a spirit fusion pot. Save because we got treasure. Crap. For some reason, it won't let you use the A key there. You actually have to hit, click the S key. I don't know why it's like that. Boy. Boss fight. Who are you? How did you get here? I heard that you have a nautical chart for Arabia, so I came to see where you put it. How dare you? You are on the heretic side. How dare to trespass the God's secret place? I'm going to arrest you. Alright. Evil pagan, I'll let you witness my holy power. So I gotta guess which one's the right one. Hellfire! Wind whirl! Neither of those. Well. Mystery solved. Missed all of it. What the hell is it? That's not good. Huh. There we go. Found him. Huh. 
Does he keep shifting? Where? Wait a minute, we can always talk things out. Hell nah, kill him. Wait, wait a minute, don't kill me. God will punish you if you kill me. I am not afraid of God. Tell me, where are the charts you took from the heretics? They, they were all burned. Keeping things of air, evil heretics will provoke God's wrath. Hmm, burn, hmm. I was to spare you if you handed over the charts. Seems like your God didn't bless you, bye, die. There. There are still three charts that are going to be burned in a few days. I can give you those. Mercy. Very well, hand them over and I'll let you go. And now we kill him anyways. Huh? Is that all? Oh, mercy. There is also a hexagram of a heretic. Uh, you can also take it if you want. Oh, thanks. Huh? Anything else? Is that all? That's all. Really? That, these are all I've got left. Oh, we let him go. Then. Huh, he ran away so fast. Septum, the hexagram you got is a treasure that can be exchanged for monsters in the underworld. How to use this treasure? You can use the spirit fusion pot to exchange the monsters you caught with the underworld. Septum learned to use spirit fusion pot. You will ne find a new section spirit fusion in the main menu. In this section you can create new monsters, but currently only western monsters are available. Huh, I'm here. What's up, girl? Except to my guess, the owner is either a ghost or an immortal. True. An ordinary person wouldn't live in a pot. Facts. Yes. Sir. What's this? I'm so confused, actually. Huh. What the hell? Oh, here we go. Shift. Okay. So... Oh, dang it. Struggling with the UI right now? How do you unequip? Oh, there we go. You can make that, I think. I don't know. No, I don't want that. I don't think. I'll oh, we'll just leave it. Now yeah, we'll do that later. But I guess you can fuse your things, but I have not mastered it. Oh no, do I have to walk all the way out of here? Shortcut, I guess.
All right, let's go use that secret. Oh God, here they are. <laughs> here you are. Arrest them. Oh no, the abbot tipped us off. This isn't good. <laughs> uh oh. It really isn't good. Sinners, you can't escape this time. Surrender now. Sir Miles, what are you doing? I am a Frankish knight just like you, but with a different mission. That hurt our friendship. People who help the heretics are traitors in the eyes of God. Everybody get him. Sir Miles, you can't may catch me, but don't forget that your woman is still in my hands. If I don't return on time, her life will be threatened. Yeah, she fell into your heretic hands. I'm sure she must have been corrupted long ago. The next time I see her, I will kill her in the name of God. According to the law of the prophet Moses, so that I can keep the purity of our kingdom of Zion. Hey, are you serious? She risked her life to protect you, and that is why we caught her. Didn't her sacrifice me more than Moses or God's word in your eyes? Sinners, you have no authority to criticize God. Everyone catch him. Septim, are you going to fight again? Let me help you. Wow, so many enemies. Then I'm going to find a helper too. I don't know, she summoned something. Ifrit. Thanks, Ifrit looking. Septum, this is Muspal, one of the generals under Satan, Lord Satan. Darn heretic, you, you are with the devil Satan. Don't think you can scare us by summoning such a monster attack. Muspal, kill all these soldiers at once. Nicole, how do you, who do you think you are? How dare you command me in this town? Satan said that I could call you for help at any time. Kill them all. Dumb woman, it depends on who the enemy is. Calling me for these underlings, underdogs, what do you take me for? Enough, I can handle these soldiers by myself. It's okay, please go back together. Little B-word, how dare, who are you? How dare you order me like this? Ah, uh, you pissed me off. How dare you? Uh, give me one sec. This, this is, who is that? I don't know, man. Lord Mosebaugh, please calm down, don't do this. You piss me off, I'll kill you all. Oh. Septum, Septum. Hi, dude. Oh, what's wrong with me? My head hurts. Septum, Septum, are you all right? Hmm, what about the weird guy, Moosebell? He, he, he... Tell me, what's wrong with him? Tell me, don't bother following me if you don't tell me. What do you want? Are you trying to bother me on purpose? Tell me. Septum, Septum, don't be mad at me. Lord Satan, he wants you to join the underworld and help him to... Help him to... Uh, I'm just an ordinary human being. What can I do for him? Go back and tell him that he thinks too greatly of me. Septim Lord Satan said that if you join him, you can he can help you become the richest and most powerful person in the world. Huh? What if I reject him? Why would you? Don't humans being human beings love money and power the most? Those clergy who serve God also love them. Don't change the subject. If I don't accept it, what is going Satan going to do? Tell me. He, he will become your enemy and order all demons and monsters to make your life hell. Huh, I've never provoked Satan and I don't want to associate with monsters. I don't want the things that happened today to happen again. I almost died by saying a word. Septum, so what, what do you want? Go tell him. Tell him that my answer is I don't accept. But, but Septum, I, I will... What else do you want me to say? You also leave me now. Stop following me. Septum, Septum. Aw. Told you to leave, don't you understand? 
Time to no kick me out. I t dare not go back like this. Septum, please. I told you to leave. Why are you still following me? Septum, I I dare not dare not go to go back to that terrible place. That I will die if I go back now. But you dare not go back. You don't need to go back. Really, really? So I can follow you? I didn't say you could follow me. Septum, I'll be in trouble with, by demons and monsters in the future, just like you. They're they're stronger than me, much stronger. We can cope with it together if I follow you. I will die if you leave me alone. Okay, okay, don't cry. You can follow me, don't cry. I'm most afraid of girls crying all the time. Septum, do you mean it? But I need to tell you that this is all only for now. You can't bring me any more trouble, okay? Septum, that's very kind of you. I like Septum the most. Yes, I can't stay mad at you. Bum, bum, bum. To Venice. Again. <laughs> Looks like we're making everybody our enemy. The hair, the church people, Satan, everybody's mad at us. So. <laughs> Everybody's pissed. Yes, the treasure is mine. Finally. Emperor Boots. I knew this was worth it. I'm the Emperor now. And there's treasure. Head scarf. Crash. Do, 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 do. Is this the one? Uh, it's Jesse's house. Jesse! Okay, this is the one. Open the door with the key! Yes, treasure awaits. Unless it's a bamboozle. Did you... Oh man, what if they bamboozled me? I haven't found much treasure yet. Ah, <laughs> oh, there's a treasure. Finally. Well, quite the big basement that you have here. More treasure. A silver necklace. Worth it, I guess. Maybe.
I went that way. Yep. There's a lot of these bugs. Bugs as far as the eye can see. Do 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 Like a truck, bro. Right this way. All right, dead end. I'm guessing, probably. Sucked up, bro. Whatever you are. Boss fight. Allegedly. Ah, treasure. Steve Spirit World Indicator and Blank Talisman. Emperor Gloves. Oh, we get all kinds of Emperor. We're gonna have all Emperor suits soon. scary looking actually I'm the Emperor now Using someday. Wouldn't hurt to have some extras, I guess. Okay. We've gotten all the treasure. Oh, wait, I have that Saturn Thorn Ring. To, what the hell is this do, by the way? Talisman used for practicing magic has ability to absorb the enemy spells. Cultivation, that's what I was thinking of. That's what the magic thing they do in those Chinese animes. Cultivation. I can't use it. How do I use the... Oh, maybe she can use it. I don't know. Huh. How... Who uses that thing? Oh, here we go.
Oh god, we're almost out of here. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. <laughs> Yes. Escape. They haven't returned to their house. What happened to them? I don't know. Doesn't matter, I don't guess. Oh wait, I can go up this way, actually. Now to get on our boat. Boat time, baby. <laughs> One day. Kill the hell of that chicken, that's for sure. About to Kentucky fry that boy. What's that quest in East Arabia, I wonder, by the way? Oh, I do. Yeah, what does Septim actually want? What is your quest? Septum help. What's going on? What happened? The two eastern merchants went to a secret pirate cave in the southwest to find food and water, but they haven't returned yet. Secret pirate cave? Why would they go there? Cave is where pirates used to hide food and treasure. We blocked the entrance with big stones so no one will find it. I know what that is. That, that whole place is desolate. There isn't any food nearby, plus we are wanted by Venice. They were afraid to go in, so I told them this place. Once they heard about it, they were very happy and rushed there right away. But they didn't come back. I see, I'll go and have a look. Hey, They're really determined to keep me on this island. Oh, I got him. Nice. First try. So is my tame ability getting better as I'm leveling up? It seems like it might be. What sucked up the booger monsters? Right, I'm gonna fuse the booger monsters, see what happens. Because they don't seem important. I have two slimes, actually. Should, anyways. Ah, they gave me an accessory. I don't need that. They gave me a slime. Grapes. Herb. Oh, cool. Guess I want that. Pokemon! Nice, fusion succeeded once. Oh, you can fail? Oh, the goal kind of sucks, actually. Who would have guessed? Somebody moved the rock. But why? Oh, what was that? Aim the oven loving cake. Oh, I should have her attack that guy. Oh, no, never mind. It worked. Soul sucking everybody. A hundred victories. I guess you can count that as a victory. We actually just snatched up people, but that's cool. Whatever. What with that little black screen thing and then the music stopping for a bit? So 
Sorry, I like to explore everything too. I'm trying not to do it as much as I usually do, but I still want to fuck around a bit. Magic hand. The stone wall. Earth flame jade. What is that? What be earth flame jade? Okay, I can give that to what's her face. There. Okay. Let me see if I got any new things from fusion. Silver ring, that seems nice. Zombie, I already got one of those. Ah, uh, I have him equipped. Well, there he is, actually. God dang it, my bad. A lot of trash in here, actually. Just know if you fight me, I will suck you up. Uh, like so, as promised. Soul pills, whatever those do. Appreciate it. Probably save it for the boss coming up though, that'd be nice. What's up guys? Good boy. Sir Septon, thank you very much for coming back to save us. What happened? I thought you were lost. How did you get caught? Septum, the pirate named Moray, told me this is their secret cave where we can find some food. However, the cave has been occupied by monsters. We came for food, but almost came became their food instead. 
Uh, during this journey, I was tied up to be burned and then almost became food. Once I return to Arabia, I must write down this thrilling voyage to let everyone know. It's the sound of that monster. Uh oh. You go first. I'll bring up the rear. What? Darn it! How dare you let my delicacies escape? Then you'll have to stay to replace them. Now? He can't be tamed, so he must die. How that hurt, bro? God, he's killing everybody. What the hell? <laughs> he's killing everybody, boys. Ah, oh, new skill. Eat this. Adoken. Oh, that's an AoE spell. Let's go. Yeah, this guy's tanky as hell, actually. Miss, idiot. We did it. Yeah, that was a strong boss. What does that do? Copies of enemy skills onto a blank talisman in battles. Guess we'll use that. I don't know. Where'd those weirdos go? Sucked I got kidnapped again or murdered. And that suck. Seems like it would suck. You guys better be with that boat. Or die. Not monsters for something. Allegedly.
Sir Septim, you're back. Got the chart. We'll set off at once. Yes, Sir Septim, but... But what? Sir Septim, Mr. Rune and Mr. Hardin just told me that they weren't able to get any food. And even our current water supplies may not be enough. Let's be pirates along the way. We can just rob food instead of money. Won't that be enough? This, this is a bit too, too... I'm convinced, Mr. Septim, you are completely different from the other knights. Good, since Sir Septim is fine with it, everyone get ready to sail off. Wait a minute, I almost forgot. There's still one more thing that needs to be done. What? Oh, he blew up the cave entrance. Nice. What is it? I blocked the entrance of the cave with fallen rocks to prevent them from pursuing us. This mechanism was set up by our captain before. I didn't expect it to come into handy. Well done. Get in your places. Let's... Let's... Oh, get in your places. Let's put out to sea. Oh! When the ship starts to sail, I want to be on it and see the sea. No problem. Please come on board. Let's go. And we get attacked. Unlocked after completing the story. And then... We fight. Pirate ship. Dolphins? Dolphin. Dolphin. Nice boat. The ghost pirate ship. Oh, hell. Oh, they're pissed. That gal back there? That's our gal. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Full speed. At oh, my God. Well, this isn't good. Are they fighting each other or are they fighting me? Oh, they're fighting each other, thank god. You'll never catch me alive. Ah, uh -oh. ramming speed! What the hell is going on? Oh, hell. I thought they were coming for us. How did they end up fighting each other in the end? Go to the cabin and hide with the others. I'll go check it out. There's a lot of dead people. Oh my god. Ah, hoo hoo Ah, hoo hoo Alright. Oh my god, he has no head. That is violent. Oh, Jesus. What a hit. Good job, chick. Oh, just smited that man. <laughs> Hell, him, kill them all. Hey, what's up, guy? What are you doing? Don't get close to the Tribune. What are you doing? Don't get close to the Tribune. Stop. He is not the enemy. He is the hero who fought against the Templars and rescued the Eastern Merchant. Yeah, it's me. Sorry for being rude to you, my friend. What happened? Why did you and the Templars fight each other against each other? 
But alas, it is a long story. Venus used to suffer from pirates, so I invited these knights from Frankia to eliminate the pirates for us. Unexpectedly, after they arrived, they unscrupulously arrested foreign merchants and turned Venice into a mess. Now foreigners dare not to come and trade anymore. See, just now, they drove our two merchant ships away without our consent, saying that they were going to hunt down heretics. We couldn't take it anymore. That's why you came to destroy them? Exactly! We are far better in Navy battles than they are. And we can excuse ourselves to the Pope by saying the pirates wiped them out. Friends, are you willing to help us? I guess so. I don't like them anyways. Thank you very much. Please be careful. Alright, time to go whoop up on what's his face again. Blizzard! Yo, 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 it's me. Receive sufficient rest. Hell yeah. My favorite thing. A brand new throwing axe. Wonderful. There are so many random encounters in this game, which you might actually need because that troll was pretty tough. He almost one-shot both of my people, actually. So maybe these are necessary. Necessary. Arrgh. Where's my clat? Or whatever his name was. What was his name? We got going on here, huh? I should have blizzard him. Oh well. What the hell? Is this a dead end too? Everything's a dead end. What is this? Fudge, man, what? Am 
I supposed to go talk to that guy again or oh, what? Uh, I don't know, there was a safe point, so this has got to be semi the right way, right? Attacking me, God bless. Oh, he didn't die. Oh, wait, I got an idea. Maybe. Yeah, I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Okay, I got it. I know where I'm supposed to go. Sorry. Be like that sometimes. I'm glad I didn't backtrack because I was heavily considering it. Because I thought I was maybe supposed to talk to that guy again, but this is the right way. Jesus Christ. I wonder why that doesn't take any skill points from her for some reason. Is it broken? It's a dead guy. Okay. I'll have been headed people. Oh, it's this dude. This dude again, I know him. Wizard! Oh, it took points that time, I guess. I don't know. Huh? Aren't you the clerics who was with the Templars at the execution ground? Tell me, the captain of those Templars, Miles, where is he now? It's you again, you little B-word. We were destined to meet again. Ha 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 ha! Hey, <laughs> quit rambling. Tell me now, where is Matt Miles, captain of the Templars? <laughs> Where's the rush? You think knights aren't good at naval warfare? So you want to take advantage of the opportunity to destroy us, don't you? Hoo-hoo, don't even think, don't even think about it. I, Cornelius, won't allow you to succeed. Dancing black magic, domo, 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 domo. Oh, great god, domo arigato, Mr. Roboto. Please raise a piece of land on this great sea for your faithful, most faithful warriors. Huh. Eh, <laughs> will be word. Your display of hell is about to begin. Take your time to enjoy it. Stab him. Ah, oh my god, don't worry. He disappeared, what's going on? Sir, Sir Septim, something bad is happening. The sea. Take a look at the sea at there, at there. Oh Jesus. The sea's pissed. I fight money. All right, that was uncalled for. What is this? A piece of land that really surfaced. Mister Septim, what happened? I felt the ground shaking. Not sure either. That weird cleric we saw in Venice summoned an island. I've traveled a lot. Is this something that happens frequently at sea? No such thing, Mr. Septum. This is also the first time I've encountered such a thing. I have encountered all kinds of weird things during this trip. I must write them down once I get back. Okay. Mr. Septum, look at the island. 
All of the Templars went ashore, and the captain and golden armor is there too. Oh no, the Venetian Navy are after them. There may be traps on the island. I'll stop them. You guys need to go take control of a ship that can still sail, so that we can leave immediately once things go wrong. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Alright, you fools. You fiends. Fight me. Yeah, they're fast. Others have gone in. You guys get in there quickly, too. We'll guard. Sir Miles, what? What about you? Don't worry about me. Leave now. That's an order. Captain! Captain Miles! Are you still here? Get in there now! The enemy's coming. Darn knights, where else do you want to escape? Heh. <laughs> oh. Charge me if you dare. The mighty Miles is here. Come show me what you've got. He's running. Okay, dude. Wait a minute, you're excellently... You can't go in. I'll go in. Why not, friend? We're almost done annihilating these guys. Why shouldn't we go after them? You're excellently... The island and the castle are very suspicious. Traps or ambushes may wait for us. It would be too dangerous to enter without careful consideration. Ooh, let's check it out from the outside for now. I'll go in after a long time. It's my turn. Strange, these knights have been gone quiet for so long. Have they escaped through another way? Rex, see, I'd like to enter the castle to check the situation. Friend, as you said, there may be an ambush waiting inside. Isn't it too dangerous for you to go inside alone? Even if there is an ambush. No, even if there is an ambush, there, it is still relatively difficult to be spotted if I go alone. Besides, the knights may consider me as a bait. So even if they found me, they would not dare to attack rashly and expose themselves. That's a good point. Staying here won't isn't helpful either. Be careful. It's my time. I'm the hero of legends. Give me treasure. Well, since the owner left, there are fewer customers. I didn't expect any guests today, especially he- I didn't think he'd sell to me. Hello, that we have some unique weapons here, and I am sure you won't find them in any other shops. Take your time. How nice of you. Well, I've already got that. These are trash, bro. What? Are you selling me trash? Hmm. Weapons suck. Man, no patronage for you. My armors are sturdy and durable. That's good. Well, at least he's got good stuff. Ease. Scale boots. Crash. Who are you? Hello, what do you need? The grocer boss. Oh, nice.
Oh, should have. Well, whatever. That's okay. He has items, I'm sure. Very, dude. So, what revives people in this game? What's Phoenix Down in this? Is it this? Is this Phoenix Down? I don't know, it's kind of cheap to be Phoenix Down. I don't think. I'm good. Thank you, Tentacle Monster. Gary Tentacle Monster. Alright, I'm ready. Let's do this. Find me, heathens! Oh wait, that door just... No, what just happened? Oh, watchtower. Yes, perfect. Treasure. My favorite! Love treasure. Door's locked. Do it. Called it. Oh, look at all those things. Nerb! Oh, hell. Look at that scary thing. Oh, I could probably tame that sucker. Ah, oh, hell, don't. Nicole. Bad girl. Naughty. Naughty. Yeah, dogs, hush. A oh, man, I see that you have light seeking rock on you. Can you give it to. Yeah, hush. Thank you. Take this healing dose as a gift. Oh, okay, what a homie. Bye, dogs. Ah, crap. I, I should have had her attack this one. Oh, that was an optimal. The dog just did a front flip. Where the hell am I going? Ah, he's probably tameable. Eventually. God bless America. I should have went first. It asked me first. Oh, it's another vampire. Oh, it's a vampire king. Fancy. Oh my god, that hurt, dude. Let's kill the dogs first. Ow. Oh my god, he's so weak. Jesus. Impossible. Treasure. Ambitary crown. What's that do? Maybe it's one of these things. Nope, what is it? Ambitary crown. There it is. Yeah, it goes on somebody. Not me, though, I guess. A new party member. Oh, this is a dead end. God, stop critting people, you turd. God, you're pissing me off, actually. Lord. 
making my life very difficult. Oh, that thing is tanky. Alright, so we got something. Go ahead and crit and kill it for some reason, but thanks. Two shot it last time though. I feel like she did. Uh, I guess we just... Yeah. Some of these things are hard to capture because she they just die so easily and they don't want to be tamed for whatever reason. Whatever, more XP for me, I guess. Oh, we're back here. Nice. Do not credit, please. Don't kill it. No. Okay, we have a chance. Yay! Good job, Nicole. I'm not killing something. Save points in the game. Okay, so that's probably to the boss, so I'm gonna go to the right first. The third floor. Maybe this is the way to the boss. I don't know. Oh. Boss, these two brats have just beat me up badly, and since we've joined forces, help me regain my reputation. No problem. I'd like to see for myself how good they really are. Dude just dipped. Alright, kill him first. Oh my god. 
probably shouldn't use that since I'm so close to a save point, but... Yeah, we captured a Vampire King. Thank goodness. Do so. Like, uh, trash. Trash. Pull the trash. Oh, insufficient level. Unable to make contract. Okay. Stop. Wait a second, why couldn't I fuse him with him? What happened there? Oh. Still on sufficient level, what the fudge? What level I gotta be? Wait then. One day. I can tame a centaur, but I can't make one, which is really weird, actually. Monsters. I did do that. Oh, she killed him. Killed her. Killed it. Whatever it is. Second. First, we look for additional treasure. got crit, don't you? Except for these wolves that I can't capture. You don't want to crit those. Well. that do? I like that they have this new tab. That's nice and convenient.
Where'd my centaur go? Didn't I grab one or oh, I probably didn't get it. She probably credited him or something. I thought I got one, but I think I might be wrong. Seems like a buff. Seems like a buff too though. Wow, the Vampire King is worse than the Vampire. That is really weird, actually. Hmm. We want more of the McGray-Yay things, because they're prime. Oh, look, it's a Medusa. I'm too low level to make that one. Oh, hell. She petrified. I'll teach you. No status ailments on my boy. Oh wait, did I go north? God dang it. Ah, whatever. I can't tell you their health in the top left. I didn't know that. Till now. Is that good? Oh god. Second guessing yourself is a guarantee to have another fight. Always. Always. Uh, she's hitting too softly. For these guys, anyways. I wish she'd hit the enemy monsters softer. I guess the more you level up, the easier it is to take things, so that's nice, I guess. Convenient. Oh, hell yeah, treasure. Garbage. Unable to open this chest. Did I have to pick one? Ah, oh, crap. I picked the wrong one. Make sure it's weaker, but I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah, sucks. Oh, sucks! Well, I guess it would probably help with capturing things, but I ain't that worried about it, honestly. Alright, I know if he has her, she's gonna die, but... Now's the time. Suck that chick up. Switch! Go wrong with that? I don't think. That's the way you want me to go.
Oh, at least there's no enemies up. Oh, Emperor Armor, yay! We do have a full set of Emperor stuff, even though it's worse than my Leaf Armor, so... Lame. Lame, lame, lame. Our leaves so OP in this game, it makes no sense. Whatever. I haven't been over there yet. How the hell do I get over there? Can I now press this button? There's gotta be a way to press that button. Right? Oh, let me. That's weird. Wait a second, I got an idea. No, I don't. I thought I had an idea. Gotta be something awesome over there, because it doesn't want me over there. You know what I mean? And I really want to get over there. Oh well. Wait a second, I got an idea. Might not be a good idea, but it's an idea. What is this? What if I unflip the switch? Alright, whatever. I don't want it anyways. That's cool. Dead bodies everywhere. What the hell? <laughs> Cornelius, are you... Are you crazy? How dare you kill all my men? Ha ha ha, they merely returned to God's embrace. That was his will. Ha ha ha. What's going on here? Isn't Lillian supposed to be in our captain? Cabin? How could she be get crucified? What am I? Soldiers who fled into the castle either are dead or turned to stone. Moreover, Miles and that cleric are turn also turned on each other. What the hell is going on? Question. You screw your god's will, Cornelius. He's gonna join our party. Our Templars have always strictly adhered to the oracle from God, as you said. And yet you kill them like this. What do you want? Ah, 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 God needs sacrifices. Only blood and life can stop his sorrow. Look, Miles, thanks to their blood, the magic circle can now be completed. Their sacrifices weren't in vain. Well, what? Cornelius, you, you, you! Eh, <laughs> don't be hasty. Now it's your favorite girl's turn. I will sacrifice her life, flesh, blood, and soul to honor the holy name of God! Darn, so you're the heretic. I'll kill you. I knew it's time to die. Return to Lillian back to me. Ah, 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 poor child. Oh my god. How hateful, you monster. You know demonic magic. Ah, 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 Sir Miles. You are not a match for me in your current state. Why don't you show watch the show quietly? Oh. My lord, thank you for the guidance. I finally found a pure girl who is willing to sacrifice her life for others. I will now offer you the Virgin's life to appease your wrath and glorify your divine authority. Please accept the most humble offering of your servant, Cornelius. Cornelius, you you heretic! Stop, stop talking nonsense and blaspheming God's holy name. God loves people. How could he possibly ask for sacrifices? Ah uh, ha uh, ha! Uh. Miles, are you sure? God loves people. Why would he tell Moses to write the scripture to execute heretics? And why would he allow idiots like you to be deceived by me to kill them? You. You. You B-word, Cornelius. So you've been using me all this time. You're a monster. The devil's apostle. Ah, uh, yeah. I am the devil's apostle. Well said. Ah, uh, not too bad. My master, seems like you're finally starting to recognize me. You, what do you mean? Ah, uh, I mean, Sir Miles, I did all this for you. I hate Miles. Let the hatred of God fill your heart. Let the power of anger and darkness fill you up as much as possible. 
Ah, uh, not good. Time's running out. The girl's dying. I have to perform the ritual as soon as possible. By cutting out her heart before she dies or it will be too late. Darn, evil cleric! What are you doing? Stop it! Septim, you! Septim, I beg you, please save Lillian for me. She's in danger. Miles, you... Septim, this cleric, I've seen him before when I was in the Underworld. He seems to be one of the most important subordinates of Lord Satan. Ah, I see. No wonder I always felt like something wasn't right. Get off that girl right now. Ah, uh, kid, it's you again. You came just in time. I never expected you and Miles to join forces just because of a beautiful girl. How touching. Ha ha ha. Septum. Lillian is nearing death. Hurry, hurry! Uh oh. Oh, well, at least he didn't hit me for some damage. I appreciate it. Firewall! Hadouken! Oh, you didn't heal near enough to survive. Oh, he doesn't. He's, that's not effective. Lightning attack! Oh, that's not super effective either, actually. Okay, that's okay. Actually, let's see how hard we hit him for. Uh, we hit him for a mess. Nice. Alright, lightning it is. Okay, nice. Uh, that was a damage. I'll take it. I can she heal as well, idiot. Stronger than you, idiot. <laughs> Lillian, hang in there. I'm co I'm coming. Lillian, Lillian, it's me. It's me. It's Miles. It's a me, a Miles. Lillian, can you hear me? It's me, your Miles. Miles? Thank God, Lillian, you finally woke up. I was so worried. Come with me. The nightmares are over. Let's go back to Francie Frankia together. Back to our home. When you're cured, we'll ride horses. Oh, she's so dead. This is a death flag. We'll ride horses over the wilderness together like we used to. We can go back to the mountains of Gallia to see the clouds and the sheep. Then you'll pick wildflowers to make me a lovely necklace. <laughs> make me a necklace! Miles, I'm, I'm so happy you finally came to save me. 
I knew you would come. Lillian trusts you the most forever, Miles. Ah! Lillian! Lillian! Don't do this to me! Please don't die! Lillian! Lillian! Adrian! Wake up! Lillian, we just agreed to ride horses on the mountain. We pick wildfires and watch the sheep together. Did you agree? Did you really? Lillian! 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 Oh, she dead as hell, bro. Oh, it'd be like that. And Miles thus joins our party. Lillian. Left him, that Miles guy, he is so terribly awful. It is you who fought hard and finally defeated the enemy, but the girl ended up thinking he saved her. Hey Septum, say something, am I not correct? Honestly, I'm jealous of Miles. Septum? She had liked Lillian all along, but she only loves that empty shell Miles. Jesus Christ. Septum, did you know each other? I just finally realized Miles was so truly in love with Lillian. He was always arrogant, but in the end he lowered his head and begged me to save her. Miles is no longer an empty shell. Perhaps Lillian's kindness has redeemed his soul. Septum, I have to go back. What? Whatever. Don't understand. I got a vampire ring. Yay. Cultivation. Oh, no, I'm still working on it. Oh, I like that. We'll give you this. You're welcome. Oh yeah, I got pee actually. So you know, actually, can I use that one thing? I wonder what it does. The dissolution compound. Then I have a. Spirit world indicator. What? No, I don't know what that means. I'm scared to use it. Creature catalog. The resolution of one species in creature catalog reaches 100. What does that mean? At all. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, I don't care anymore. Yay! No monsters, please. We're leaving. Your boy got pee. Actually, let's put him on. Put him on all day. I got pee. No capture. Shadow Sever. Nice. We learned a new ultimate. Fantastic. The best. Fight me and die. DQ would work on this part instead of having to click. Ah, one shot. Can I open this now? The door is still locked, but why? Hell yeah. Probably needed to grab something from that one room, but it's too late now. I refuse. Welcome, welcome. 
shop is finally open. There have been fewer customers since the owner left. For this special occasion, it will only take... No, hell no, hell no, no, no. Not to the nah, 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 bro. I have done it. Your hero emerges from this place. Your boy. My friend, you were in there for so long. I had thought something unexpected happened to you. I was so worried. I appreciate your concern, Your Excellency. By the way, since you were inside, how's the situation in there? Very strange. When I entered, all the temples had been killed. Some were beheaded and some turned into gargoyles. What? What happened? Who did that? It was the cleric who was with them before. I don't know why they turned on each other, but in the end, the cleric killed everyone with strange magic. Uh, how could such a thing happen? So was that cleric, or uh, should I say wizard, still in there? No, in the end, he was also killed. There's many monsters in the castle. I guess they were summoned by the cleric. That's terrifying. So the Holy Temple, or who aim to eliminate heretics, are heretics themselves. I really messed up this time. I set a fox to keep the geese. But in a way, if they turned on each other and killed themselves, our goal has been achieved. These darn knights deserve death. Alright everyone, we're going back. Everyone return to the ship. Get everything ready. We're leaving as soon as possible. Sick. What happened? Why are you panicking? Mr. Septon, this island is, is moving. Island is moving? What are you talking about? It is true, this island, this island is moving. When we were checking the ship just now, we found that the island is moving slowly towards the south. Are you sure? How can there be a moving island in this world? Your Excellency, if an island can emerge from the sea, it's not surprising that it can also move. Ooh. By the way, I must leave. Do you want to come with us? No, it's fine. I want to use this island. Use. Since this island is moving to the south, why don't we use it as a vehicle? Your septum is this, this idea is too bold. So what? Let's investigate. At first, we'll not be too late. We'll not be too late to slip away if there is danger. My friend and I am leaving now. Take care. See you, man. Bye. What about you? Those who want to leave can go with the, the Tribune. Sir Septon, I am a pirate. I dare not go with him. Yes, I am fine with everything, as long as I can return to my home, Arabia, my hometown soon. Okay, let me investigate the surroundings. You wait for me in the castle. Surroundings time. Yay. Pirate ship. Treasure? Maybe? No treasure? I don't want treasure. Wow, these ships are so wrecked. It's a bear. I don't think. What the? What in tarnation is this situation? There's a volcano. Oh wait, there's multiple castle sites. I'm glad I found that because I will probably need it. Oh, hell. A cave? Oh my god! That's nice. <laughs> 300 silver- oh my god, I'm rich. That's a lot of money. Tarnation is a situation. Rainbow. Reading rainbow. Butterfly in the sky. I can go twice and fly. Take a look. It's in a book. A reading rainbow. I can go anywhere. Wow. 
cheat. Ow! Ow! See, ow! That is quite the annoying noise, to be honest with you. That is quite the annoying noise. Unleavened cake! Silver flute! Treasure! Treasure yet, but soon. Good boy! Traveler, I am trapped in the chest. If you get to me, can help me get out of here, I will join you and fight the enemy. Okay. I need a witch cat and an odd what? A to tyrannous to get out of this place. Thank you. Do I have that? What do I have? How do I get one of those? I have a witch cat. I need an odd dot to tyrannous. Or that one. Sure, if I run around enough, I'll find one. Oh, Danto Tyrannus. Oh, Danto! I haven't run into any of Well, we have a witch cat. I don't need you, but I'll take one anyways. I'll take two, actually. Oh, there might be one. Yes. Not I didn't have her attacked it. She would have killed it, probably. That thing has come to me. Weird. Oh. It's like a cow. Is it making cow noises at me? This time, for sure. Don Satyran is captured. Yes, that's what it is. I knew it. Ah, oh, Don Satyranus is really good, though. Let's go get what's his name, and then we'll capture some of Don Satyranus. There you go, friend. Great, you brought the Don Satyranus and got in the Witch Cat. I'll be out right away. Oh, cool. We got Ar Argus. Whatever the hell that is. Kind of cool looking, but. Adds a lot of strength, but also takes away a good. Argus acquired! Yay! Dawn's Tyrannus.
do to do. Probably should have just named it, but it's okay. The side castle. Perfect. Hell. That's me. Huh. I know. Oh, it's a shortcut. Sick. Paint a court sword from something. This person is dead. <laughs> That's actually what he said. I can't believe that. This person is turned into a gargoyle. He did it. That was interesting. I don't know why that side place is there, but it's cool, I guess. They're gonna be super shocked when I come in the other way. They're gonna be like, oh god, how did you get over here? And I'll be like, oh, there's a side castle. Cool. Oh hell, can't go this way. Side castle is broken. Side castle sucks! Why do you walk like that? I have explored the island, friends. There is nothing out there. Kinda sucks. Oh, it's the people. Hello, people. I never expected we would travel by an island. Me neither. Can I open the store now? Oh, hell. Door still locked! But why? Oh, so many strange things happen on this trip. I didn't expect I would travel on the sea by an island. I will definitely write it down when I get back. I hope I can get home soon. I hope you can too, bro. Hello, statue. I never expected we would travel by an island. What the hell am I supposed to be doing right now? Uh, use. Maybe we got fun, Miles. Where you at, Miles? Loser over here. We probably buried her somewhere. Do I have to go back in the cave? Did I miss something in the cave? I am confused. Very confused. Special move. Oh, a new special move for her. You don't get new special moves. Maybe there was some place I was supposed to go after I got the Argus thing. Maybe. Not uh, looking like a dead end to me, but it do be a dead end. Okay. Well, god dang it, bro. Boost. Okay, we're going back to the pirate ship, I guess. I don't know.
Oh, maybe I'm getting these abilities from the things that I'm grabbing. That makes sense. So those monsters are probably giving me these abilities. Interesting. I think. So many witch cats. Witch cats for days. <laughs> I'd like to find more odd Gato Tiramis as well. Septim is level 20. 420. Nice. Mm -hmm. Sick. Miles, where are you? You have to join my party, loser. The game won't let me progress. Exit. That's an exit. Everywhere's an exit. That's an exit as well. Oh, hell yeah. Progress. Iron ring. A snake scale garment. Marshall bracelet. <laughs> Sort of sailing, sort of trash. Oh, that seems kind of nice. I'll close that. Miles at. I know he's somewhere. Was that all I needed? I'm so confused. Maybe I need to explore the castle better. Mount Vesuvius. They're way up that mountain. Very confused actually.
Can we leave? How do we make the ship go faster? Yeah, whatever. Fair. Probably has something to do with that puzzle room, maybe. I'm lost. Give that to him in a second. Yeah, give her the damage ring, I think, and then take the combo ring from her, I think. Because that's 100% more damage, while the other one's only 50% more damage, so. Alright. Oh, wait. God darn it. God bless, dude. There are so many encounters. I can't even look around without being harassed, dude. It, it could get kind of toxic. Oh, wait. I know there's... I need... Where was the stupid thing at? Stupid switch to platform room. This way. Oh, well, cool. That one boss thing. From the beginning. Observation. Oh my god. This is very late. Uh please stop attacking me. What is lunar absorption? Or is oh that's cool. Six times in a row, that's one less than the other time. I better do more damage.
Still can't hit that switch for some reason. It's something. I'm missing something. Wait a second. I think I got it. No, I don't. How can I make this button pressable? <laughs> That's a good question. Maybe he has nothing to do with that, but I don't know. I feel like it does, though. I feel like I need to figure out a way to get over there. Wait a second. I'm an idiot. When did this happen? I'm an idiot. Obviously. Oh, thank God. It'll probably just give me some treasure, but I hope it gives me... Oh, I still can't press that button. What the hell? Oh, I opened the thing. Ah, suck. Plain. Useless. Don't want it. Uh, how the hell do I get out of here? What's taking this island so long to dang float on? Maybe this thing steers it or something? Dude. Yeah. Hey, he's dead, we know. Damn, where this game wants me to go. I explore the island. I feel like I've explored the island. What's up with this stupid walking scene? Maybe there's... There's gotta be something. I don't know what, though. Obviously. I cave again, because I just keep getting attacked by enemy monsters. There's something. Somewhere. Maybe if I go into the ship from the left. Somehow. I don't know how I would do such a thing, but maybe.
Why is this like this, dude? Yeah, this guy have to have something to do with the cave, I guess, because I cannot figure out anything. I don't know, man. Let me check the intro. Tom. Move the stag on island, bro. Oh wait, is this a different way? Fingers crossed. I hope so. That's a dead end. Oh no, thank goodness. Oh, progress. Oh god, thank you. Oh, so here you are. Join my party. Is this the land's grave? Then I won't be a bother in your time of grief. Take care of yourself. Don't understand. I don't understand what god is thinking. Miles? has the power to create this world the world and mankind what does it make mankind suffer in this world why uh, maybe that darn Cornelius is right God it really exists this world should be free of pain he really cared about people why would he allow us to torture the heretics to death how could he let Lillian die she was so kind yet ended up dying so tragically free will son Huh, I see. The whole time, God has never cared about us. We are the ones that want to desperately believe in him. Darn it, we don't need such a useless God. I have miles vowed to search for him till the ends of the earth and let him taste the same pain. I don't think it works that way, but I... Why did not join my party? You suck. You seen it, Lillian? Lillian, Miles is sad for you, but why does he end up on a more extreme path? He must be very sad right now, Lillian. Septim, is this the grave of Lillian? Septim, you must like Lillian very much, right? So annoying. It's between me and Lillian, and it's none of your business. Septim, why are you being so mean? You seem very, to be very sad, so I came out to make you a little bit happier. Huh, speaking of which, you were the one who hurt Lillian at first. You shouldn't go around hitting people in the future. Septim, how can you talk to me like that? You've killed a lot of people, haven't you? It's not fair. It's really not fair. Ah, oh. Mac. Doggy, poor you. From now on, you don't have an owner anymore. Woof, woof, woof. Uh, good dog. You like me too, don't you? Okay, okay, then I'll come here often with you, play with you. Dog required. Woof, woof. Uh, I don't know. I know. Don't run away. Don't you run around. There they go. Can't move. Okay. Strange. I remember Boar's very little. How can he ru just run away with Nicole when his owner just passed? Left him. I found something. Come here. Is that a question mark? Oh, okay. Get to move now? Sick. Yay! Stone people. Septim, look, there's a pond. And a rock. Serious rock. What a bizarre stone statue and pond. I wonder who made it. Septim, look, this gargoyle was, has an engraving on its head. Let me check what it says. Sphinx. This gargoyle is called Sphinx. Septim, this gargoyle also has an engraving. Athena. This gargoyle is called Athena. Sounds like a female. Cargo also has an engraving, and this one, this one. Miles. Wow, this wing gargoyle looks just like Miles. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I'm not Miles. Michael. Wow, this gargoyle can talk. What the hell are you? I am a stone fairy imitating the figure of Archangel Michael. Called it. Michael, who is he? Besides, what's named Archangel? Old Master, did you really forget, or are you pretending? Don't you remember us? I don't know. I don't remember you at all. Old Master, we are the guard decorations you created thousands of years ago. I did this? Garden decorations? How can I not remember you at all? 
Didn't you say you were going to follow Satan? Then you left us alone, don't you remember? Yes, yes, old master. You left us here during hundreds of years. No, thousands of years. Yes, yes, and then Satan left us at the bottom of the scene until he called us out again just now. Wait a minute, you've been talking a lot. What exactly is this island? This island? This island is Nicole's former home. Really? Really? So that big castle over there is mine too? Yes, Lord Nicole, you made us decorate your courtyard. Great, I, I'm going to check my castle. A piece. Wait a minute, Satan's subordinates have been troubling us all this time. This could be another trap from Satan. Huh, I hate Satan. Yes, yes, we also don't want to listen to Satan. True, true, our master is not Satan. Nicole is our master. Wow, so I'm your master? Yes, Master Nicole, you have been our... Michael, get it through your head. What kind of master would get us and leave us in the sea for ten th of thousands of years? Yes, yes, speaking of which, I'm reminded that an octopus used my head as a nest and refused to leave. Hey, you should thank me. It was me who shook the island and scared the octopus away. You can control this island? Yes, yes, as long as Satan is away, we can control this island freely. Huh, you underestimate us. We are the fairies of this island, right? Great, Nicole, can you ask them to please move this island to our destination? Wait, who said it was okay to ask that? We haven't admitted Nicole is our true current master. We were made by Master Nicole, so she is our master. Sphinx, stop basking in the sun. How about telling us where you stand? Hey, both of you made a great point. I don't have a, any suggestion. Huh, how useless if only Poseidon was here. Athena doesn't like Poseidon, so that makes sense. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> Poseidon? Who's that? Our three gargoyles are symbols of the continents of North, East, and South Europe, Asia, and Africa. Poseidon is the strong spirit symbolizing the sea in the middle, Mediterranean. But he was taken by Satan's subordinates for decoration. How about this? Please give me a straight answer. What do I have to do to get your assistance? Alright, then I'll come up with two challenges. If you solve them successfully, I'll grant you one request. Still, tell me the challenge. Go to the middle door of the castle's watchtower and give treasure at the end of the room. That sounds easy. It's not challenging at all. <clears throat> the first challenge is going to keep... Just to give us some time to discuss the second one. I guarantee you the second one will be super difficult. Don't get scared when the time comes. Master Nicole's friend, this key will help you. Ah, oh, thank god. Progress. Michael, don't be so nice to them. Nicole, let's go. I want that rock. Can I have the rock? Stop talking to me, Boris. Can't get the rock. Screw the rock. Hey, what's up here? Treasure? It's a dead end! Ah ha ha ha! Alright, I guess what's his name's not going to join our party after all. What a loser. What a loser. There's quite a few JRPGs that have gotten me with that, where the door is on the left or right, and I always assume, for some reason, that they go to the same place, but they don't. Weakness. Now that I've recognized it, though, I shall never fall for the same trick again. Allegedly. How the hell did I get over there again? Gosh. You thought you were going to fight me? Wrong. Oh, 
I'll probably be the last, but I'm sure Vampire King I capture, I have a bunch of them. Let me get to that super place again. Oh, I need more of these ones, though. Thank you. Thank you very much. There is a way over there, over the way to the door from over there, but way over there, over there. But whatever, that's why it worked too. God. Yes! Yes! I actually want to do some of the new things. Come on! Gives you a throwing axe. Centaur. I don't have one of those yet. Maybe I should make a centaur. Yay! Centaur acquired. Tiger for garment. That seems like an upgrade. Oh, what is that? Ah, too weak. Senna, though, that seems cool. Next time. Thank <laughs> you. 
least it wasn't a dead end. You never know. This isn't a place where you should be leave. We're looking for a very important treasure and cannot leave until we find it. Then I'll have to invite you to stay here forever. Uh. Oh my god. Can't tame. He has to die. <laughs> oh, that's really dope, actually. Yeah. A lot of damage. Oh, he lives. Huh. I'll teach you not to do that. Thank you, Sal, too. Son, give me treasure. Arcane stone. That's probably the first challenge. Hey. Treasure. Have I been to the right yet? Get in. Let's get out of here. Thing. Yeah, I want to make the goddess eventually. I'd like to do that. Oh, that's a boomerang. Cool. Nope. Nope. Yes. I want to, though. This way, so I can remember how to get here. Really? Guess why I did that, but I guess not. Obviously. I have a lot of money. boys it's all the first puzzle what's the second one <laughs> Nicole's friend we were waiting for you to come back I just thought of a puzzle for you truly the most suitable for you haha <laughs> Michael you tell him this time 
Master Nicole's friend, are you aware of your own ability? You could travel through time and return to the past. I can do what? Right, Athena said she would like to see your ability. Therefore, your second puzzle will be to return to the past and save yourself. Oh, and Nicole's friend, if you don't return to the past, you will certainly die. You may consider this a friendly warning. We can help you awaken your time traveling powers. Are you ready? Hmm, yeah. I knew you would agree. Pumpkin, this is too much fun. I just hope you can make it back alive. Oh hell. Septum, Septum! I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it was my fault, but I'm no match for most spell. What should I do now? You, you devil, how dare you fight my man? Prick, what do you want to say? You must be the leader of this group of losers. I'll kill you. Prepare to die. Oh my god. You, you devil. Darn it. Miles won't accept dying here. I refuse to believe that I would die to you devils. What boy, what did you say your name was? The symbol of V. But how? How could you have Lord Satan's mark on your forehead? Or six. Can't be. You must be the man that Satan spoke of. How can it be? How can it be? Ah! I'm sorry. I don't know. Fight me. What's going on? Where is here? Isn't this the Venetian monastery from the past? And why is there another me laying there? What the hell is going on here? Is this really the past? Oh, nice. There's two of you now. I understand now, Septum. This must be the time in Venice when you were beaten by Moosepel. There's even two Nicoles? The stone statues used your power to send you back here. They wanted the future you to save the past you. What could the future me have really really have saved the past me when that monster knocked me out? It's a time loop. Indeed, I told you many times that Lord Satan had sent me to invite you to join him in the underworld, he has great respect for your ability to time travel. You haven't, but you haven't listened to me at all. Lord Satan requires your aid to bring chaos to the world and... Darn it, would you stop ignoring my sisters, Nicole? Blue spell. So you're the time traveler that Lord Satan spoke of. How surprising. Very well. Then for what? Or with Lord Satan's special orders in mind, I'll spare your life for today. In return, you must join the Underworld. I'm afraid I'll have to pass. I have nothing but disdain for the Underworld. You brat. Who do you th who who do you think you're talking to? You you you. Lord Satan has taken a liking to you. It should be your honor to be invited to join him in the Underworld. I may have forgiven you for refusing us, but you dare defy me? I'll destroy you. No, you won't. No, you won't. I have my ultimate ability yet. Beat him. Wait, can I tame him? Oh. Uh, oh. Done. Cross Hellfire, go! Oh, I can check how much health he has, probably. He has... Uh, no, I can't see it. A lot of health! I have life still, you'll never kill me alive! Well, 
Better absorption it is. Give me my health back. That's a huge heal. That was easy. You suck, Moose Bell. You suck. Back to hell with you! <laughs> You're too good. This is a fun. Managed to defeat Moose Bell. We've become so much stronger. Indeed, after such a long struggle, we you finally be we finally become stronger than him. Septim, are you are you really from the future? Uh oh, I saw the one. That's right, Septim can travel travel through time. Isn't that amazing? Also, that past Septim is really nice. In the future, he wants to send you away. Remember, you must stick to him tightly. Nicole. Oh, okay. So that's what happens. Huh. What's up, guys? Back. Hey, we're back! Heavens, Master Nicole, we were just betting on whether you would be able to return safe and sound. Fortunately, you finally returned. How are you two feeling? Was it fun? It's like having a dream. Did I really return to the past? Why would I make that up? Have you completed the mission? You really need to ask. They returned alive, Athena. Of course they completed the mission. By the way, how did you know I have this ability? Because we are fairies, we know many things about the world, so we also know that some things about you. Right, right. Also regarding Satan wanting your power. It was big news in the underworld. Everyone knows it. So I have questions about my ability. If I really have this ability, can I travel to the past to save Lillian from dying? No. Uh, you can try, but you may not be able to. What do you mean by that? Why wouldn't I be able to? Master Nicole's friend, the role is very complicated. In fact, even we don't understand it very well. But from where I stand, there are many Arab scholars studying the law of cause and effect. You may consult them. You're lying. There's no one under your feet. Huh. Come on. Michael is talking about his geographical position. You were the one who decided his position, Master Nicole. Do you see that floating island on the pond? That represents our current location. We're still a long way from Michael's position. Wow! What is the law of cause and effect? It is a study of the relationship between the cause and the effect of things. For example, planting an olive seed will cause an olive tree to grow in the future. It's a very simple thing, but since you can time travel, it becomes very complicated. This is the knowledge you must learn. That sounds interesting. Why are you so cautious about it? Why don't you just go back in when you want to go back? No, Master Nicole. The more powerful the ability is, the most more dangerous it is to use. So your friends shouldn't understand it for Strange, but somehow I have a restless feeling about this ability. Alright, since Nicole has passed this test, let's keep our promise and take them to the place they want to go. Any objections? Oh boy, you were the one who guessed it all along. I never had any objections. Arabia, my sworn has taken us to Arabia. That's the place where Septim wants to go. Don't get carried away, Nicole. Moving island, move towards southeast at once. The moving island begins to move towards Arabia. Oh, there it goes. So that's what that ball was. You still following the dog? <laughs> yeah. During this time on the island, Septim studies Arabic with Harun. Great. A few months later, Jesus Christ, it takes forever to travel. Lillian, we've been away from Venice for several months. That you say that we will reach the offshore of Arabia soon. Never believed in God, but recently I can't help but wonder if heaven and hell really do exist. Lillian, I'm sorry, I decided not to use my ability to save you because you might be happier in heaven. I'm destined to live in never-ending fights in the future, so I can't give you a happy life. She doesn't like you anyways. 
except to my Pepin the Third, the mayor of this palace and the ruler of the kingdom of Frankish, officially grant you the title of knight in the name of my king, Moravindian. Oh, he's asleep. Sir Septum, from today, you are one of our knights of the Frankish kingdom. Don't destroy our, your reputation. I was always a knight, he said. Yes, I, Septum, pledged my lo loyalty to the Frankish kingdom until death. Congratulations. Oh, this is a flashback. Septum, you have finally become a knight. I am sincerely happy for you. Sir Septum, as you can see, all of us have high expectations for you in the future. Yes, I will never fail His Majesty. Your Excellency Pepin and everyone's expectations of me. Other oh, people have been saying that Septim is an outsider, not one of us Franks. Outsiders have not been, never been granted the title of knight in the past. Many people are talking about it. Charles, my son, let me ask you. If you were a leader, which would you val value more? Ability or ancestry? Answer me. Well, of course, ability is more important, but ancestry can't... Because ancestry can't help us defeat the enemy. That's correct, my son. You answered very well. Septum has done a lot for Frankia. He deserves to be granted the title of knight. People out there are just jealous. That's why they use excuses like ancestry, race, and so on to attack Septum. We just need to ignore them. Listen, Charles. To be a great hero, you must abandon prejudice. Be open-minded, value talent, and have a greater insight than anyone else. Do you understand? I understand, Father. Thank you for the lesson. I'm sorry, Mr. Septum. I just said something I shouldn't have. I'd like to express my most sincere apologies and beg for your forgiveness. Oh, Charles, please don't say that. You're still so young. <laughs> yeah, you're able, already able to distinguish right from wrong. I think you're great. Septum, thank you for thinking that way. My son Charles still requires your guidance in many aspects. Please, you must help him. Help him become a wondrous hero. Yes, I will follow your orders and do my best whenever there is opportunity. Oh, what's up, guys? This today's no, no, this is flash forward. What's up, Peppy? Now I figure out what my quest was. Septum, you have done so much for us recently. I appreciate your effort from the bottom of my heart. My pleasure, sir. I just did what I had to do. Giving up a good reputation and comfortable life, you disguise yourself to get intelligence from the enemy, which our people with high opinions of ourselves can't do. Most people believe that the ones who charge on the battlefield have the most credit, but your information has saved us from several times from being wiped out in times of crisis. Many people look down on your effort, but in fact, I know that you deserve the greatest merit. <sighs> Okay, he just moved. Septum, do you know what is my greatest hope right now? Sorry, I don't know. As you know about... Apparently I do know. Our current situation. We have a war almost every three or two days. Because of Lombards in the south, Saxons in the north, Islamic pagans in the west, and the papal states in the east. But our king is doing nothing but eating and sleeping and playing every day. If he goes on like this, the Frankish kingdom will be in jeopardy. <sighs> uh, if I have to... What's wrong with you? <laughs> you heathen. To be honest, my greatest hope is to let the people live in peace and harmony. A while ago, I heard some merchant from Venice say that the Far East know a method to winning wars. Method to winning wars? Yes, my greatest ambition is to solve all eternal and external troubles altogether. So I'm eager to find this method. It will be an arduous task. You need to go to the Far East, face the heretic, stay hidden, and don't let the enemies know about your mission. After tough consideration, I believe you are the only one who can complete this mission, but I can't bear to send you. Your excellent Excellency Pepin, I am willing to do this mission. Septum, you... Please let me do it. I am willing to go to the East for the Frankish Kingdom to wit find the method to winning wars to kill people. Method. Maybe I started my journey to the east to find the method. Maybe I will be responsible for destroying other countries in the future without knowing where to be the end of mine. Uh, family and happiness. What a distant dream, Lillian.
Ah, uh, I miss the carefree life of spending afternoons basking in the sun so much. Oh, that stupid Nicole made us soak up in the sea for thousands of years. That is why it is comfortable to bask in the sun now, because we've been soaking for so long, you fool. We're almost halfway through. I wish something exciting would happen. No, no, I prefer to bask in the sun every day than go to the bottom of the sea again. Huh, worthless coward. Ah, uh, hell, here we go. She jinxed it. What's that noise? Oh, she... Doggo. Woof, 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 woof. We landed! We're in Arabia! Arabian nights, like Arabian days, are hotter than hot in a lot of good ways. I think that's how it goes. I don't know. Done. I love Aladdin, though. Damn. I need to watch that again. I do have Disney Plus. I'm not utilizing my Disney Plus like I should. Hell, where's. And. Oh man, let's talk to the people. They know. Uh, nah, nah, nah. What happened? What should I do? Where should I go? Oh. And where it's supposed to be? What is it? Oh, maybe I should talk to the statues. I'm an idiot. I guess. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I have to go to the cave. I don't know. Oh, no, no. What's going on? What happened? I don't understand. An unknown object on the east is rushing toward a moving island and it's coming very fast. Exactly. We are not sure what it is, but it's definitely not good. It's all Athena's fault for talking nonsense. Mr. Septum, please go to the castle watchtower and check what is rushing towards us. Okay, Nicole, let's go. Yay, boss fight, maybe. Da -da 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 -da. Ah, crap. to the team. Snatched his butt from behind. Present rules. Keep forgetting I can go left here. Oh no, I can't see far enough. I can't see anything. Go back and ask Karun and the others to see if there are any possible solutions. Okay. Somebody's got a thing, I'm sure. Resolution of 20 species in creature catalog reach 100. Nice. The Moose Bell. We got a lot of these suckers. Bad skeleton. Very bad. A troll! A troll! There's a lot of creatures we haven't seen yet. Hey guys, I need a... Go. What happened? What? I don't know. There's a strange sound coming from a distance. Mr. Septum, I have a tool that can see things from afar. Oh, what about him? Should I talk to him too? Okay, no, just him. Perfect. Wish you would have gave it to me the first time I talked to you, you dingus. Enhance. Holy hell, what is that? Iceberg. Oh, hail, we're the Titanic. Oh, no. 
Athena, what have you done? Ah, dang it. What's going on here? A huge ice chunk of ice hit our island. I'll ask the gargoyles. Maybe they'll know what's going on. I guess this is pre-Titanic. He wouldn't know what just happened to us. We're screwed. Everybody get off the island! Panic! Main characters and demons for, uh, get to go first. Oh, no, 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 no. oh my god, what is happening? Master Nicole's friend, that heavy impact just now, did you see what it was? I saw a huge chunk of ice coming straight up to our island. Oh, that must be the Kelpie in their iceberg island. Kelpie, the horse that drag people to sea? They are a group of demons who live on the sea and occasionally took for trouble with human ships. Look for trouble. What is strange? Why did Kelpie come to us? Why do you ask? It's obvious that they're after Nicole and her friends. The Kelpies are seeing subordinates. <laughs> Mr. Septim, help! Oh, Jesus! The penguin. Oh, that is not a penguin. That is terrifying, actually. That is not a penguin. Hopefully she's not dead and we can dethaw her or something, because that'd be kind of sad. That we just let her die right in front of us. I swore two Kelpies were killed immediately. But the woman and dog were free frozen instantly. Freezing is Kelpie's specialty. I wonder how many Kelpies slipped ashore. Boar, return my boar. Master Nicole's friend, you must go to Iceberg Island to find the leader of the Kelpies, the Cyan Witch. Otherwise, it will be too late to save them. Nicole, let's go. We will find the Cyan Witch on the Iceberg Island. Mission acquired. Always some kind of monster that hits you at sea. Always, always. It wasn't a ghost ship though, so this is unique, I guess. Oh hell, there is like what this is. God, there's something. Else. And they're kind of tanky. Let's deal with these guys first. Kelpie's gonna kill. I guess. That's fun. We're kelpied out now. I have more than enough. What's happening now? I don't know. Uh-oh. It's a battle fleet. But why? Everyone listen up. Lady, we're land on the Iceberg Island. Knowing these sea demons is our secret test. Let's do our best. Yes, sir. 
Ah ha ha! Oh, wow, there's a lot of them. Who are these people? They showed up out of nowhere. Captain, leave them alone. If we don't hurry up, Burr will be in danger. Strange, they also seem to be targeting that iceberg island. Let's sneak up from behind. Yes. Attacks from behind are the best attacks. Sneaky boy. Ha ha. Darn, the door won't open, darn. Are you Arabs? You almost gave me a heart attack. I thought it was. You don't look like an iceberg monster. Who are you? Why do you speak Arabic? I had a few Arab friends frozen by these monsters, so I came to the island to see if I could find a way to save them. I see. So you are on our side. We are the Islamic Navy, responsible for patrolling the sea and ensure the safety of the maritime trade. Our captain found the lair of these monsters who were harassing the ship, so she sent troops here to attack. I see, what about them? The captain led the troops inside, but as soon as they entered, I sealed the door. I can't... couldn't open it no matter how hard I tried. Oh no, it might be a trap. Luring them in and then wiping them out. What? So everyone is in danger? Darn, open the door, darn it! I'm going to look for an entrance somewhere else. Okay, dude, keep banging on it. It'll work eventually. Oh, hell. Dragon. Dead dragon, too much on it. What's this way? Oh, look at that. It's a lady. Maybe I don't want to be captured. Too bad. Oh, hell. Blind frog, actually. Frog with wings! I'm gonna use one of those. I don't know what they do, so I'm screwed. I guess it's so I can know I've been there before and tell myself which way I've been. That's kind of interesting. Neat mechanic. I should combo and then do the capture. Oh wow, that hurt. Or did it? It didn't do damage for some reason. That's weird. Oh, she did blue damage to me, whatever that means. Oh, that's another lady. 
And some Digimon. They look like Digimon. I'm dying. I'm Dean! Gold Dean, Gold Dean. Water Leaper, that's what they're called. What about that goddess lady I captured? Where'd she go? Oh, there she is. Aura Maid. a lot of regions it seems like their armor that seems cool can I make that one thing yet I wonder uh, what do I need to do it it was centaur Tarn something. Nope. Nope. Yes. So can't do it. Okay. So. Whatever, whatever. Sucking up all the things. Hot herb. Capture unless I have a magic spell that won't one shot her. Try that next time I see one, I guess. Down here. Treasure. Okay. 
now. Oh no, not the way out. Frost Hellfire, bro. Oh, it's a lady. Lillian. Step to my soul's imprisoned in Iceberg Island. Can you help me? It's a trap. But yeah, sure, why not? Of course, what should I do? Come and hug me. Uh oh. Uh, he's all about it, bro. What have you done to Sept? Oh, what have you done to Septum? Nothing. I only made him fall into a deep slumber. Huh. How atrocious. Oh, well. That was weird. Very strange. Very good direction. Um, he's dead, actually. Pretty sure you killed him. Wait, can I use these? What's this do? Oh. Yeah, that's weird. Alright, cool. So it adds the monster in our squad, I guess. That's kind of interesting, actually. Kind of cool. <laughs> do I lose one, though, when I do that? I wonder. I'll have to check the number next time I do it. Cool, man. Boss fight. Oh, 
Oh, what's up, dude? What's hiding? Strange, what kind of stone statue is this? What's hiding, bro? Take him with us. Oh, he's pissed. Hear that? What was that? Was there a sound? Oh. Yes, this gargoyle did emit a sound. Never catch me alive. Hmm, interesting. Ah, oh, hell. Intruder, there's another intruder here. Except I'm the person that Lord Satan wants. Die, it is I. Guys are kind of tanky, huh? Collapsed and is inaccessible. God darn you people. Now I fight. Oh, hell. Darn it, there must be something wrong with this gargoyle. Oh, I am, I am not the enemy. I just felt Master Nicole was nearby, so I came to check it. Talking gargoyle. I see, I think I know what's going on. Septum, Septum, I heard someone calling my name. What well, was it, you? Ah, oh, you, you must be Master Nicole, although you have a different look now. I can still recognize that you're Master Nicole. Well, I see. You're the missing gargoyle. Master Nicole, I was moved here by the Cyan Witch as a decoration. It pissed me off. The other three, I forgot their names again. What, who gargoyles? My old castle are just outside. You can go home soon. What, the moving island is nearby? Great, Master Nicole. Then I will teach the iceberg monsters a lesson to avenge my thousand years of frustration. What are you going to do? Master Nicole, have you forgotten? I am the primary fairy of the moving island. As long as I return to the moving island, I can control it to attack this darn iceberg island. Septon, what do you think? Do I have a good subordinate or what? Let's take it back. Fine with me, but we still need to find who the scion witch to unfreeze everyone. I don't remember who desperately begged me to set off. Septum, no! Oh, Septum, no! We have to hurry to save Burrow or it'd be too late. Master Nicole, the sign which loves the sneak attack. She is hiding in the deepest part of the iceberg. You will never find her. You take me back first. I can bomb the iceberg to force her to show up. Right, Nicole put it inside the bronze pot. Let's go back to the moving island. I have places to explore, though. Still. Boy, I kinda gotta use the bathroom, so hopefully a battle will show up so I can do it while they're auto-battling. God bless it. I hate that you can't use your directional keys on some of these menu options. You have to use, like, A or D or something. Okay, perfect. Ah, oh, get off me. Good job, guys. We did it. Okay. Ooh. This away. This away.
Yay, we got one, finally. We captured an Undyne. Nice, treasure. Yeah. Magical bread! Magical bread! Abilities. Icy. Oh wow, nice. Good job, Septim. Matching people up. <laughs> Level. Uh. Actually, can't. Uh. Absorb a hundred monsters. Yay. Magical heirloom achievement. We have... I don't know how many achievements, because it's the new Steam System Star! There it is. 12 out of 50. God dang, there's a lot of them. We probably won't 100%, let's just be honest with you. Actually, you know what I would want? I want to make that mirror armor that I can make. I don't know if it'll be better, because I can't- I don't think I can see the sets while I'm making it, but... I want to make one. If I need the amphora made. I actually have a bunch of them, so I can make a couple things with them. It'll let me... I do want one of those, but I have something else that I can probably turn in. That's what I want. Air armor! And then... I want one of those tiger fur things, even though I don't know if it'll be an upgrade or not. I can use this one. Oh, nope. Oh, does the order matter too, it seems like? Okay. Wooden bow, trash. Trash. That seems cool, but trash. Gives me more status, I guess, but uh, I don't want to lose attack. Fuck. Mm -hmm. 
Man, all the stuff I made sucks. Okay, cool. Sacrifice. Oh, this one's better. Don't tell Tyrannus is better than everything! Apparently. <laughs> Just to be safe. I brought back to Poseidon. Really, it's really you, Poseidon. After a thousand years, you're really back. Aha, Poseidon, now the four of us are here. You must have suffered a lot out there. Oh, this is nothing for Poseidon. Look, after going through so many challenges, I finally found our old master, Nicole, who was missing for thousands of years. Hey, we found her first, okay? You met her when you were a decoration on Iceberg Island. Plus, finding a stupid master like her is nothing to be proud of. That... that don't know its name, Gargoyle. That Gargoyle with the shield. How can you speak like that to me? Athena, come on. It's a great reunion with the return of Poseidon and old Master Nicole. Yes, yes, yes. It's a rare occasion for the four of us to be together. And so now we can bring out all the power of the moving island. Speaking of this, I'm going to ask you a favor. I want to use a volcano to attack the King of Iceberg Island, the Cyan Witch. <laughs> Teach her a lesson for using me as an ornament. Is everyone willing to help me? No problem, it'll be a piece of cake. Uh oh. Explosions! Hmm. With your powers combined, I am Captain Planet. Huh. The meteor. God, oh, this is like what happened to cars in JoJo. Part 3! Part 2, actually. Jesus, my bad. Action part. Yeah, my bad. Joseph was the one that was messing with him. Yes, perfect. Well, at least that one guy got out of there. With the... Wow, turns out you're all powerful. Aha, uh -huh, how enjoyable. We've blown off the part Iceberg Island. We've blown off part of the Iceberg Island so fast. The sign of which must be in panic. Sign seems like we haven't used this power for too long. We should be have been able to destroy the whole island, but we only blew apart. Seems like it. Everyone take a break for now. Later we attack at full force in the second round. The huge iceberg will definitely see it. Hey, wait a minute. Our initial plan was to get the Cyan Witch to lift the freeze from our friends. Destroy the Cyan Witch with, together with the Iceberg Island. My friends will be dead. That's your problem. Why do you think it concerns me? Because it concerns little uh, Nicole, idiot. Don't be like that, Master Gargoyle. Mr. Gargoyle. Please give us some time. Me and Septim will go to the island to look for the witch. Then you can bob the island as much as you like. Poseidon, for the sake of the old master Nicole, let's wait for the return before we attack. There's no need to hurry anyway. Does anyone have a problem with that? Oh good, I've had no problem at all since 500 years ago. And back we go to fight the Cyan Witch. Oops. Oopsie. Toasty. And we'll 
find the the princess lady. Friend, are you still alive? Just now, this iceberg was shaking so badly, I don't know what happened. You need to leave. The volcano on the neighbor island has erupted. This iceberg will sink soon. What? Really? A oh, hail. Leave right away, but to Captain, she's still inside. What should I do? What happened to you guys? Were they all killed? I don't know. The cave door was opened by the earthquake just now. It was already like this when I came in. The injured companions said that a blue demon either killed them or iced them up. Even the captain was no match for him. By the way, I can't save two people at once. Would you please help me carry him so I out so I can go save the captain? Forget it. You're no match. Take your partner out of here and leave it to me to save your captain. Thank you so much. May Allah bless you. Seated. It's my time. Strange. It's so cold. It seems to be colder than blah blah blah. Maybe first I should buy items to keep me warm from the- no. Items are for the weak. Allegedly. Ow. Frozen, dude. Let's go. dead people. single target. Oh yeah, I was gonna try out to see if the monsters actually leave me if I use them to join the battle. Next time. A soul pill. Take a chill, soul pill. It's a herb. Wisteria leaf. Wisteria leaf. Alright, let's see. Item. I have six. I have five. Okay, so it does use them, which means I probably won't use that anymore. Well, it's like it's a boss fight, I guess. Maybe he comes back, though, after the battle, so I'll check that as well. Remember, we have five right now. But we had six. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'll probably summon something during the boss fight every time, but like anything I have an extra of, because I don't see how that hurts. What's up, guys? Oh, so... Haha, uh -huh, Septim, you're finally here. Who are you? Cyan Witch? No flake lady. God. Here to the gills, bro. <laughs> are you the Septim? I finally meet you in person today. Cyan Witch? That's right. Tell me, why did you take Poseidon away and let him bomb the Iceberg Island? Well, good question that I'd like to ask you first. Why did your men freeze my companions in the ice for no reason in the first place? Oh, good, good. So we are even somehow. Even? Let me make this clear. Poseidon attacked you because of a grudge between you and him. It had nothing to do with me. Please let the spell from my command. Immediately. Let the spell? Yeah, <laughs> sure. I heard that even my spell is defeated by you, so show me your power. I'll let the spell if you win. Name her. Let's see how many vampires I have. Oh, I do get them back. Sick. Okay, what would I like to summon? I don't know, we're super good. I guess she has ice, so it makes sense, I guess. Wild time. No. I can't challenge her shields, unfortunate. Ah, oh, let's just get out of the way. Hmm, she really doesn't like him, I guess. Oh, stop it. I wonder how many of these I can summon. Oh wow, I can summon multiples. That's hilarious, actually. Okay, you can only have two. What's decorate mean? Not bad, your reputation is well deserved. No wonder you were able to beat Musvel. How about joining us in the other world? The Dread King was one also once a human like you, and in the end turned into Lord Satan's favorite. I'll pass, I already won. Are you going to lift the spells from my companion or not? Of course, that's child's play. Oh thanks. It is done. I've lifted the free spell from all your friends. What about those Arab soldiers? 
them. They died long ago because of my freezing power and icicle crash. It doesn't matter if I live to spell or not. What about this captain? Actually, one of them is still alive, this fiery girl. I have no objection if you want to take her with you. Why didn't you kill her? <laughs> you, you're worried I've done something, aren't you? Don't worry, I had planned on killing her too. But when I was about to do it, the earth started to shake violently, so she lived. Are you alright? Demon, stay away from me. Not a demon, you misunderstood. Go away, you kill you killed all my companions and now you now you want to insult me? No, I'm here to save you, you've got it wrong. Haha <laughs> Septim, I must go. I'll leave you to enjoy this woman, ha 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 ha. Come on, loser. Screw you, you're obviously with them. How can you not say you're not on their side? Dumb girl, Septim saved your life. How can you be so mean to him? Go away, you hateful monsters. I'll kill you myself if you come closer. I'll show you. You're so annoying and you talk too much. <laughs> Nicole! <laughs> I, I, I just, just, just... Why are you coming here? Do you want to make a second Lillian? I, I, this first woman was mean to Septim, so I want to help. Enough, return to Moving Island. I'll handle this by myself here. You're just making things worse. No, I, I, I... Go now. Don't think that I will give in every time you cry. Leave. Septim, Septim, why do you treat me like this? I feel bad for her, actually. I deserve to be zapped. A few minutes later on the Moving Island... Uh-oh. Hey, we've waited so long. Are you, aren't you guys bored? Yeah, I can't wait any longer since people you wanted to save are defrost so we can start attacking. Wait, Master Nicole's friend hasn't returned yet. Septim fell in love with another girl and kicked me out. You treated me bad. Uh oh. Typically silly Nicole. Can't even pick a proper boyfriend. Darn it, how dare he bully our Master Nicole. Unforgivable. I advocate firing immediately. Is there any objection? I've had no objections for 500 years. Great, all agreed. Lord. Wow, what are you doing? Oh my god. I'll be like that sometimes. And then we're gonna be stuck with that stupid pirate lady and have to earn her trust, because why not? Big meteor. Hey, idiot, let's get out of here. Oh, Jesus. I have no fear Nicole will save us. What, what happened? Darn Gargoyle, how dare he not keep his word and start attacking? I will sink soon. Let's get out of here quickly. No, I'm not leaving. Why? Because you're an idiot. He's an idiot. My companions were killed on this cold island because of me. I can't abandon them and run away myself. You fool, how will it help if you die with them? Aren't you their captain? I just met some of your companions who escaped. Will you abandon them to stay here in self-pity? That's right. I know you're sad. That's why you have to survive and avenge them, right? Thank you. You're right. I wasn't thinking properly. Enough time. Oh, enough talk. Time is running out. We must leave the island now! Come on, idiot. Why is she walking so slow? Useless. Five minutes is plenty of time. Unless they block the exit. I guess she's not joining the party either. Useless. Fast AF boy. Uh oh. Spirit bombing me.
This iceberg is about to sink. Let's go to shore from here. Darn you gargoyles. Now he's going to even be madder at Nicole for some stupid reason. Even though she should have shocked her. It so shocked some sense into her, obviously. Because she was more listen or was listening. Better. No better. Everyone look, it's our captain. Our captain is back. Captain, is the captain really back? Great, the captain is fine too. Wow. Are there only you guys left? Uh, yes, unfortunately, the others didn't make it. You know, I saw them over there. By the way, sir, thank you so much for rescuing our captain. Don't worry, it's no big deal. Jordan, do you know him too? Yes, Captain, I met him on the iceberg, and he is also here to fight the demons. When the iceberg was about to sink, it was me who asked him to risk himself to rescue you. Friend, I'm sorry for what happened before. I thought you were with those monsters, so I was quite aggressive. Don't worry, you have a good group a group of good subordinates. Good subordinates? They're not my subordinates, they're my brothers who share life and death with me. By the way, may I know your name? Septum. You are the most glorious Mediterranean Navy in Islam. My name is Wadad. I'm... what? Okay. I'm their captain. I see. I currently live in the castle on the other side of the island. You guys must be tired. Why not go there to rest? Very well. We'll take you up on your offer. Salute to the Fallen Brothers. Salute to the Fallen Brothers! The castle I currently live in. It may be a little bit gloomy, but it's not dangerous at all. You can rest at ease. Septim, I'm sorry about what happened last time. What's matter? You ended up arguing with your companion for saving me. I'm very sorry. Don't worry, it was Nicole's fault. There's no need to say sorry. This guy sucks. Either way, I still want to apologize to her. Otherwise, I will always blame myself. Sure, I also want to talk to those trustworthy on gargoyles. So talk, come with me. Let's see. Septum's all in the well as heck. In the meanwhile, on the beach of the moving island. Oh, it's that one. Oh. Very well, Poseidon. How dare you destroy my home? I, the Scion Witch, will now destroy your rotten island. There we go. Don't mess with me, I'll destroy you. Hey, you untrustworthy gargoyles. Were you trying to get me killed? Septim, I'm sorry. I'm glad you're safe. I was worried. Nicole's master friend. I'm really sorry. We must have understood Master Nicole. That's why we fired at the Iceberg Island. After all, it's because Nicole is st too stupid. She can't even speak clearly. Zapper again! Please excuse me. This little flying demon. Flying little demon. I feel very sorry for what happened on Iceberg Island, so I would like to... Ah, uh, hail. Here we go again. Everyone, be careful, it's the Cyan Witch, she's nearby. Poseidon, I've been taking care of you for thousands of years. That's how you repay me? Shame on me if I, Cyan Witch, don't kill you to all today. Ah, here we go. Oh no! Oh my god, ah! Couldn't have happened to a nice person, psych. Wait, can I tame her? Oh, probably not, but I'll try anyways. Uh. I wonder if 
this one will hurt her. Maybe not. Spirit Bomb! Ah, yeah, it did frost damage. Whatever that means. Is that all you got? Can't use my ultimate for some reason. Weird. Maybe now I can use that. I think that noise was saying I could use it. That's what that noise means. Fatality. Who forced me? I'll just let you see my true power. Okay. I didn't do anything. But... Huh. Huh. Didn't we already fight this former you, anyways? use that spell again, I'd really appreciate it. someone to attack while she's murdering us with AoE spell. First boss that actually put me in danger of losing a fight.
did not heal him as much as it should have. Or maybe he did. Tanky as hell, though. I say about items being for the week. I've been using hell out of some items. <laughs> Jesus. You will not die, bro. Now if she uses it again, I guess we lose, but... You son of a bee, how dare you? But I, the Cyan Witch, can transform into water. I'd love to see how you plan on killing me, ha 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 ha. Freeze the water. Darn, she escaped. You dumb thing, it's a trap. Ah, uh, it's our time to shine. Ah, uh, idiot. Why, you guys are awesome, she's frozen. <laughs> the Cyan Witch, frozen and sealed by four of us, she'll never be able to leave this place now. Wow, she looks furious. This is also a problem. If, it will be troublesome if she escapes. We have to keep her frozen like this forever. Yes, yes. Anyway, she is made of water. She cannot be killed. Wow, won't that make her an ornament then? Idiot, stop, stop making such a big fuss over it. Our island also got frozen. We can't send you to Arabia as we agreed before. What? Septim, are you going to Arabia? Ah, oh, you're awake? I've been awake for a while. I overheard a lot of conversations between you and the demons and monsters. Uh, I'm sorry, I almost forgot you're on a, here on a mission to defeat demons, but they're not the kind you think. Septim, if you're going to Arabia, you can take my ship. Perfect. That is my country, and it just so happens I'm on my way there too. Thank you so much. I just don't like to owe anything to anyone. There's nothing to thank me for. Distinctive girl and he has her own principles. I admire her. Alright, Nicole, let's get ready to leave. Hey, I have something important to do, so I'll be away for a while. You guys stay here and look after my home. Septum, Septum, please wait for me. Huh. He has nothing important to do, except keeping an eye on that man. 
Oh, I'll look after a home again. How many centuries will we wait this time? Oh well, you're sleeping most of the time anyway. God, will this obnoxious woman stay with us for hundreds of years too? Ah, uh, I would rather die. I regret now. Darn woman, can't you smile a little? Lillian, I'm about to leave this island and continue my journey to the east. I also want to seek answers for myself. I will come back to you as soon as I find them. Let's go, Nicole. A new journey is about to begin. Who cares about Lillian, bro? Oh, do I get anything if I talk to her statue thing? What happened to the dog? Let me go, let me go. Haha. Uh -huh. Alright, take me. Septim, are you ready to go? I'm ready when you are. Then let's head out. Is everyone on board? Aye aye, Captain. Good, Damascus, here we come. My island. After several days at sea. One late night. The sea is stunning under the moonlight. It looks like a sapphire. It's been months since we left Frank Frankio. In retrospect, it seems like a dream. Lillian, look. This endless blue sea looks like it, as if it can absorb one's soul. You never realized how beautiful the sea was. Are you feeling the same? Nope. What a beautiful song. Where's it coming from? Mermaids! No! Oh, it's her. Her. Septum. Late Septim, why are you still awake? Beautiful moonlight brought back a flood of memories. What about you? Why haven't you slept? Making the rounds for my fallen brothers in arms. See, I won't bother you then. Please go on. You got a long road ahead. Don't stay up too late. Moonlight tonight is beautiful. wonderful. You really, um, have an eye for beauty. Sorry, but could you sing that song once more? Heard that? It was beautiful. Would you please sing it again for me? My late mother taught me this song when I was very young. Moonlight Tonight also reminds me of my mother. Alright, I'll sing once more, both for you and her. Please have voice acting. I don't want to do it. Oh. Galloping across the battlefield, I don't have time to freshen up. Nor dress up. Galloping across the battlefield, I tire of dusty winds. Under the orange moonlight, my mind seeks one that cares for me, one that shares their burdens with me. Never expected that your singing would be so beautiful. Thank you. Do the best I can. Thank you. Thank you for listening to my song. Haha, <laughs> I didn't expect you to blush. It was, really was beautiful. Thank you, I got it. Mr. Septim, I heard from your companion that you're a knight from the Frankish Kingdom of what to the West. Is that true? Oh, those guys can't keep a secret at all. Why are you traveling to Arabia by yourself? I'm seeking knowledge that we don't have from where I hail. I've wondered myself, what's a girl like you doing living a life of war? We, Oriash, Oriash, have been a warrior family for generations, and my father has no son. So he trained me to take his place. No wonder you are not veiled. I heard from my companion that it was required by law. Septim, I've got it. There's Lawrence Scholar in our capital, Damascus. Perhaps I can take you to him. Really? Indeed, indeed. Damascus is my hometown. Hometown. It just so happens to be on the way. Thank you so much. I can't imagine how you can't imagine how much time you'll be saving me. It's raining. Uh, I suppose I must return to my patrol. But I'm still very happy to spoken spoken with you tonight. To have spoken with you tonight. By the way, I really appreciate all the help you've given me. Thank you for avenging my dead brothers. Though I'm still not sure if you're a human or demon. 
Aha, Lillian is an iron fist in a velvet glove. Well, she is almost the opposite. This Arab girl is interesting. Their uh, septum has like the worst taste in women, but whatever. Call her in Damascus. Lillian, it seems that we've taken another big step on this journey. I really hate. Nicole, you just dragged me in again. Oh, doggo. Woof, woof. Well, what happened to you again? Why did you suddenly drag me here? Left him, see? I brought Burr to keep him here. No wonder I haven't seen Burr lately. You brought him here. Yes, yes, look, boy's happy. You just dragged me here because just because of this. You told me before, I thought you wanted to ask me questions. She was busy playing with Burr, so she didn't know what happened outside. Well then, I'll go back to rest. Don't play until too late. Yeah, good night, Septim. Look, Burr's calling me again. Yeah, I don't like the main character that much. He likes all the crappy chicks and doesn't like the good best girl. Paul's like a kid. She likes to keep things she likes by her side. Actually thinking about it, am I not the same? Septim, Mr. Septim, something bad happened. If it's a ghost ship, I'm gonna be. You, did you hear a strange song? Yeah, what's her face? Darn, that, that must be the legendary sign in Aegean, and it has, was her singing voice. Ah, yeah, it was that one trip. Mr. Septim, so many strange things happened during this journey. I must write them down when I get back. Okay, dude. And thus, we travel from Venice to... Wherever. Damascus. Hey. Septim, we have arrived. We have to disembark in Beirut. Beirut, isn't our destination Damascus? That's right. Beirut is a small port with fewer ships. We can avoid unnecessary trouble here. Necessary trouble? I'll explain it to you later. We move on by I land from here, towards southeast, straight to the Damascus, the capital of Islam, Arab Empire. Thanks to Allah, I didn't expect us to return to Arabia safely. My words cannot express how much I appreciate you taking care of us all the way, Mr. Sam. Where are you going next? I went to make a pilgrimage to Mecca. Thank Allah for this blessing along the way. I want to take Mia back to my hometown Baghdad and rest for a while. I have a cousin named Sinbad that likes to collect some legendary stories. I want to go give him my writings from the trip. What about you, Murray? Captain Will Dad and I had a private conversation. I wanted to join her army. Being a pirate my whole life is meaningless. I want to make a difference. Septim, we have to go now. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Take care of yourself. Mr. Septim, you are really a good man. God will bless you. I'm a good man. I am the best man. Take care. Time, we may not be able to meet each other again after this. <sighs> Mr. Septim, we need to go as well. I will take you to the cellar and the others will return to Damascus. Later we will need to make groups of two and act separately. Why? The Caliphate, the highest political and religious leader of the Arab Empire, belongs to the Umayyad army family. However, their regime is becoming more unstable, so many people in our country are worried and panic easily. Therefore, if a large group of Abbasid soldiers like us move together, we will definitely get into trouble. I see. Everybody listen up. Every two people form a group and enter Damascus separately. Jordan, you stay here with Murray and bring up the rear. Gosh, what's in my turn? Why do we have to watch the losers leave? Oh, stretch. Ah. Sword wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Okay, is it my turn? Sick. Okay, my plan is to check. Commander Dad, the shop is made brighter by your presence. Stop flattering your snob, you will fall for money one day. <laughs> humans are above money. Those who have fallen because of money are not worthy of being human. 
spent a lot of money on buying armaments for my brother, so let me buy up on credit this time. I trust you, so please pay in cash. Oh. Why would I want this? Can he use it? Oh yeah, he can use it. Sorry. Yes. Maybe you have to get to a certain level before you can use it. Okay, don't care about these anymore. Okay. I had an appointment with a friend who lives in Medina to meet halfway in Egypt. My ship was delayed for two days. Am I too late? Are you faster than him? Yes, according to my estimation, I will get to Medina in five days, and it will take my friend seven days to get there. Don't know how long it will take my to meet my friend along the way. Uh... I don't know. I'm not doing this math. I don't care. If you know it doesn't seem right, then you know the answer. Leave me alone. Ah, <laughs> dang. Oh wait, I'm supposed to go to the south. Oh wow, they're tanky now. I guess she's kind of in the party. She doesn't take attacks, but she attacks herself, so that's... Yeah. So. Oh, it's a tiger. Kitty cat. Panther! All kinds of animals. Okay, rude. Damascus. I have been to the Mediterranean, seen many cities with my master, Damascus. Is it more prosperous than Venice? Venice was on a par with Damascus, but since being harassed by the Templars, it hasn't restored its former glory. Who are we supposed to see? The scholar? Where's the scholar at, lady? Calfe ordered the whole city on guard. Large shop. Okay. Bye. I guess shell powder is the best feeling I could get. Him. Hey, don't touch my things. Did you say take it? Oh, okay. Greedy. Ollie's house, second floor. Huh. What if we killed him and took his things? Fortune teller. This way, Dad, have you visited Mr. Kindy lately, recently? I was actually just on my way to see him. Is something wrong? I didn't see him when I went to his house in the east recently. It was a bit strange. Really? What did he get himself into now? Oh, Damascus is on alert. Please be careful. Thank you. I will be careful. Uh, okay. Me in. No one can enter the palace without the Caliphate's order. But why? But why? The east. Okay. Mercy, please don't let anyone know I'm hiding here. Why are you hiding? Is there anyone who can arm you? I'm the princess from a small country in the south. I was captured and brought here by the enemy. I've secretly left signs along the way, hoping that my fiancé would follow them here and save me. I escaped yesterday while the guards were not looking, but the city is under lockdown. Okay. Found you! There's nowhere to run anymore! Slave auction is about to start. Come with me and accept your fate. Almighty Allah, please help me. 
Get moving now or I'll show you a world of pain. Oh well, that sucks. Be like that, I guess. We just let it happen? Okay, cool. Good for us. Corners here are commonly exploited and oppressed. This is there's nothing wrong with being a dimmy. Whenever the government needs more money, they decided to increase taxes on us. Okay. Then his house was to the east, but the east of what? Question. East of Damascus or the east of her house? this way. Oh, what's going on here? Caliphate ordered the whole city on guard. I let the auction will start right away. The first slot is Moemia from Persia. The reserve price is 50 co silver coins. Wow! 55, 60, 70? Yeah, I guess. Wait, what? Spicy. Okay. That must be the princess. What are you doing just standing there? Come to the front of the stage now. Last but not least, so swallow war here I present to you, Princess Hulu. <laughs> Got movies and stuff. The reserve price is 300 silver coins. Mamma mia! <laughs> oh my god. My bid is 5,000 silver coins. Whoa! Is there any bid higher than 5,000 silver coins? Oh, from now on you shall serve this lady. Ah, uh, my prince, where are you now? Okay. People keep kidnapping that woman. That's the end of the auction. Everyone may take their leave now. Well, I guess we're okay with this. Mamma Mia! What's in this house again? Nothing. Osman, who's that? Okay. Rude. Oh, where did she go? What is, what are we doing? What'd you say that dude was at? To the east. I guess we, it is outside. I right, screw it, I don't care. This way, this way. Okay, sick. Yay, trip. Oh my god. Got one. Ugh. 
this him? Why doesn't my beloved come back to me? Is it because of the hatred of my enemies? Or just poor fate? Everyone came to see me when I was sick. Why didn't you? No that their intimidation can ever separate us. It's been so lonely without you by my side. I long to see you again. Your absence has turned my world upside down. Okay, weird. Cat. Treasure chest over here. Yay! That is a big monkey. Pissed monkey! Awesome. Alright, what's up, dude? Mr. Septum, this is the home of the famous scholar Mr. Kindy. Damn, I hope so. Mr. Sassy, it's been so long. I'm looking for your master. Is he at home? Long time no see, Mr. Dad. My master caught cold these days. He's not receiving visits. Oh, Master Kindy has got a cold. Is he in serious condition? Oh, I think it's serious. Saucy, this person is from a, f a foreign friend from the West. He has long admired the famous Master Kindy, so he came to vit for a visit. I think Master Kindy can still receive visits with the cold. I'll ask him to meet his friend first to avoid making our guests wait. This way, Dad, my, my master is not, not able to receive guests. The master, Mr. Kinney and my family are very close. I used to visit him all, all the time when I was a child. Besides, I still remember that even when he had a cold, he welcomed me and told me legends. Mr. Septim, it's alright, please come in. Mr. Dad, you really can't. Oh, I guess you can. Oh, there he is. Mr. Septum, please follow me. Let me introduce you to Mr. Kindy. Mr. Kindy, this friend is from the Frankish Kingdom in the West. He admires you and wants to learn from you. <coughs> We're dead. <coughs> I have a cold. I'm not available today. Mr. Kindy, why do you sound different? Yeah. <coughs> I must be cold. Cough. <coughs> the cold. It's a kid. Whoa. What are you doing? That hurts. Don't you know that? Little Kindy, it's you. I'm here to see your grandfather with an important friend. Don't play tricks. I wasn't. I just. I wanted to. Ouch, that hurts. Sweet Dad, please forgive him. He didn't mean to trouble you. Actually, the master, he fell ill and passed last month. Oh, hell. What? Really? Mr. Kindy was such a good man. He's truly gone? He indeed was a very good man. May Allah bless him. Sorry for losing my temper, little Kindy. You lost your parents at such a young age and now your grandfather. I'm so sorry for your loss. You're afraid the Umayyad family will come to snatch a secret map after learning about this. That's why the young Master Kindy is dressed like his grandfather. Secret map? What's going on? That is a map of black magic, so the master kept it hidden his entire life. The Umiads have always wanted these maps to assert their dominance. Ah, uh, damn darned Umiads. Using devious tricks to become the Caliph? If only they could know what it was like constantly fearing for their life. Your dad, do you know any other experts? I do, but Master Kindy was the best scholar in Damascus with the largest book collection. Hey, tell me what you want to learn. I can help you out. I'm looking for the invincible arts of war. You fool, there's nothing like that. 
Otherwise, the world would have been free of war from long ago. What? Don't question me. I read my grandfather's books very often. Although I don't understand them very well, I know what he has in his collection. Oh. What you wish to learn should be fairly similar to a kind of astrology that the Babylonians were interested in. I can help you find something. But Dad, I will stay here for the time being and learn some Arabic. Two of you, one is just about to start learning Arabic and the other is a kid. Are you sure you'll be alright? Oh. Just with Dad, you are here! What's wrong, Asher? Didn't I tell you to return to Damascus? The Abbasid family's Lord Abu has start, decided to incite an uprising and overthrow the Umayyad Caliphate. He was pleased to know that you, the Quraysh leader, have returned and he has requested your presence to discuss some important matters. Wonderful, the descendants of the Prophet can now finally succeed the Caliph. In the name of Allah, I swear to defeat the Umayyads and support the Abbasids. Septim, I have to leave now. I am the leader of the Koryash. I can't be absent from such an absent, important matter. Really appreciate your help. I will study here for the time being. Seems that something big is going to happen, so remember to take care of yourself. Mr. Septim, will you be here for long? We'll be here for a while, so we can meet up another time when you're free. No, no need to worry about going back to Fork for now. No need to worry, go back to Fork for now or something? Little Master, I'm going to check outside. Be careful. Alright, dude. Alright. Excuse me, what happened here? Don't you know our Islamic Caliphate should be the descendants of the Prophet Muhammad and Abbasid family, but a minister from the Umayyad family killed the Caliphate Al Ali and usurped the throne for himself, which upset a lot of people. I see. So the Abbasid family wants to overthrow the Umayyads, right? Not really. The Umayyads always take advantage of their people with exorbitant taxes. That's why they're hated, actually. These kind of things are common in history. Even though the Umayyads are Serp the throne, no one will care if they roll, just roll properly. Soon nobody will care about the opposites in the past. Wow, you do know a lot. I really underestimated you. You dumb. Everyone knows I'm Kindy the Child Apology. You shouldn't underestimate me. Okay. Kindy, can I stay and study with you in the future? You may, but if you wish to stay here, you've got to listen to me. First of all, you should call me Master Kindy. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Master Kindy, what else? You'll need to learn Arabic first. After that, I'll see what else I feel like teaching you. Since then, Septim became a student at Kindy's house. Wow, I read like the wind. During this period, Dad would occasionally come to visit Septim. Uh oh. Go impregnate her. Him, him. Or I've been so bored recently. Septim is always just reading. Are those books that interesting? Septim, oh Septim, I'm going to Damascus to get books. I asked the merchant to bring back. Please take care of the home with Sassy. No problem. He's gonna be kidnapped. Yay, taking care of the books with Sassy. Woo. Uh-oh. Lord, Lord Murden, what brings you here today? Hey, I heard that your old master Kindy is dead, is it true? Lord, Lord Murden, it, it's not true. The master's st still alive. Liar, you dimmest people who don't believe in all that tell lie easily. Kill him to come out if he is alive. Well, well, master, master happened to be away today, so, so... Darn you, stop telling tall tales, scoundrel. Search the house! Lord, Lord Merlin, please stop, please stop. Oh my god. Sassy! You guys! What do you want? I'll arrest you on the spot if you continue to act up. Mr. Septum, please do not provoke Lord Merlin. He serves the Calvate, provoking him and taunting him out to going against Islam itself. 
Ha, you aren't as stupid as I doubt. Everyone search the house. Okay. Fight! Nobody will know if we kill him. Huh, henchman. Oh no, what should I do now? Oh wow. What are you doing? This is private property. Ah, oh, Kindy, oh, the Umiyah family, something. When he is alive, I've come. I'm here to reclaim it. There's nothing wrong with that. Lord Meriden, please, please don't. These belong to the master. Lord Meriden, I found something. Is this it? This is it. It's the map. Good, we found it. Everyone move. I'm glad we're just letting this happen so we can fight them in the end anyways. Typical JRPG things. What happened? I just saw Murden leave with a group of people. Oh, Master, it's not good. Umiads took the Master's map. What? Why did they come all this way just for a map that you told us about earlier? A well, leader Murden is the Emir, the highest official in Damascus, a snake to put it simply. The map he took shows the location of a great demon that's been sealed away. Say that the demon can kill thousands of people within a second. Why are they looking for such a horrible creature? Y'all still don't know? Didn't would Dad just fight alongside the Abbasid army? They say many have joined the revolution now that Umiads have scattered. Murden and the others must be desperate for the demon's help. Can they control it? Not a chance. Grandpa said that it took him some time to steal the demon, so we must stop them. Uh, why didn't we just stop him here? Of course we didn't. Let's go. Let's find a way to stop them. I don't want to, the revolution to die at the hands of this guy. I remember some of that map. The demon is a desert ruin called Tonmer. I'll take you there. Young master, this is too dangerous. The enemy is the army of the Umayyad Caliphate. I want to see what Grandpa has been hiding. Besides, Septim doesn't know how to get there without my help. Well then, young master, be safe. You are the master's only grandson. I will prepare camels and drinking water for you. The camels, let's go. Wow, you seem to have taken a liking to a dad, huh? Oh, stop it. Let's check if Sassy's ready. Alright, let's go. Yeah. Seems like we're ready. Let's go. Oh, wait, what kind of place is Tatmer? It used to be an oasis city in the east of Arabia, but was destroyed by the Umayyad family in a rebellion a few years ago. Destroyed? Is it just ruins now? That's correct. We have to go there by camel because it's nestled deep in the desert. Yay, camels! Oh. <laughs> Septum, here it is. This is Tadmer. Seems that we weren't able to catch up. Mirden and the others have already entered. What should we do? Are we going in? Of course, we can't let them release the demon. Let's observe it, the enemy and find a way to sneak in. Septum, where are we? Admir, a ruin in the desert. Weird, why does this place have such a strong smell of blood? There was a massacre in here a few years ago. The smell of blood is natural. Well, I sense something from the underworld here, and it's very strong. Septum, I'll return now. I'll come out of... To help if you need anything. Get out. Stop right there. Who are you? We're travelers. We saw the shelter, so we came to have a look. Oh, come on. You look like the Tomb Raiders to me. Go away. Don't come any closer. Go somewhere else if you want to rest. Sorry, sir. Actually... In reality, I really did raid this tomb before, but after converting to Islam, I started to feel guilty about it. Therefore, I came to return the treasure, hoping for Allah's forgiveness. <laughs> hey, why are you crying? I, I'm so ashamed. Even if it was Lord Murden that ordered us to raid the tomb, I, I shouldn't abandon Allah's guidance. You fool, Lord Murden did this for the Islamic people. But it is still grave robbing. There is no excuse. Hey, aren't you a spy for the Abbasid family? What did you just accuse me of being a spy? 
That's right, I think I have seen this man talk to someone from Abyssin named Wadad before. Huh! I saw through your disguise, didn't I, you traitor? You... what are you talking about? Oh, Jesus. Nice. Okay. God, I don't think it's all his fault, right? You... you slapped him. Turns out you're a bad guy, too. Did I ever say that I'm a good man? Oh no, don't make such horrible jokes. Okay, there's a switch. Wow, it's magnificent. I expect such a luxurious ancient tomb in these ruins. You're so silly. This is the culture of Tadmer, a oasis city that imitated ancient Egypt. Egypt, I've heard of that place. Isn't it very pretty far away from here? Queen here claimed to be a descendant of the Egyptian pharaoh who settled here a long time ago after the expansion of Macedonia. See, your books mention that the Egyptians were very particular about the tombs being magnificent. I was fortunate to witness it with my own eyes. The Egyptians hoped the dead can enjoy a luxurious life as they had before death. However, many terrible mechanisms were set up to protect against raiders, so let's be careful. Dutch the switch. Perfect. The now only resentful ghosts wander about the city, just waiting to devour intruders. Go back, leave here. Ah. Uh. Okay. Yay. Fight me, heathens. Who is that? Ah, uh, it's you, old Kendi's grandson. What are you doing here? Yes, yes, you arrived at the right time. We can't find the way in. You're old Kindy's grandson. Maybe you know what to do. Me? What are you waiting for? Obeying the commander's order. It's the glory of commoners like you, don't you understand? Worthless lives are all in my hands. If you want to stay in Islam, you better find a way for them. This makes no sense. Doctor, what should we do? Should we help them? It's fine. There's no point in fighting them now. Let's just look for a way for them, and wait for an opportunity to deal with them. Great, I also want to know what secrets are inside. It would be boring to go back too early. I remember my grandpa wrote on the map, if you want to open the first door, you need to find a brick lighter collar than the others. Hey, what are you working? Whispering about. Get to work, stop babbling. Hey soldier, keep an eye on them. Report to me if you see any suspicious activity, you understand? That's, but whatever. So we didn't want them to summon the demons, but we're gonna help them summon the demon. Very smart. Ha ha ha, very good. It was right to move to ask you to find the clockwork. You go in first, check if there's any danger. Soldiers, more clockworks may await for us. I still need these people, so keep an eye on them. Oh, Lord Murden, something, something is inside. What's in there? I I just saw a black cat. Coward, don't fuss over a cat. Ruins always have rats. So it's common to see a wild cat too. But, but that wild black cat, it flew. Idiot, stop daydreaming and expecting me to believe you're on, on your, in your idiotic dream. Sorry, I must have imagined it. Guard, you what a bunch of useless losers. Yeah, useless losers. Hey, what is this? No, hey, another dead end. Go ahead and help us find the clockwork. What? Septim, I know what this is. Indy, what's on your mind? Patterns on the gallery, they are the zodiac signs of Babylon. Zodiac signs? Zodiac signs are the 12 signs that the sun moves across. In astrology, they have their unique symbols and different meanings and elements. Would you like me to explain them to you? Yeah. Yes, please. Okay, first, let's start on the right. Starting from the right, there are six signs. Pisces, Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, Leo. Now let's look on the left. Starting from the right, there are six signs. Virgo, Libra, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Aquarius. These 12 signs have four elements respectively. Earth, water, air, and fire. Each element owns three signs. Nothing to me. So we're doomed, huh? Uh. 
There are four elements. Earth, fire, earth, air, and water. Gather three elements. Earth elements. The door of fire will... Earth will open. Gather the... Once four element doors are open, all four elements are gathered. And for thy, I will open the gate of firmament. What does it mean? I guess I understand the secret of this clockwork. This is classical Arabic. Arabic. No wonder those fools don't understand. There are four doors next to us, and I think they represent the four elements. Fire. I mean, that's what it said. Fire, earth, air, and water. And the doors in the middle is the gate of firmament. The constellation gallery ahead is the key to unlocking the clockwork. Would you like me to explain the elements of the zodiac signs? Yes. Okay, this may take a while. Let's head to the corridor. Why don't you just solve it then? You just gotta click the ones... Okay. First of all, the 12 zodiacs are on this wall. If you look at them from the far right onto the corner, the order is... You told me this already, but I need to know the elements. One of the water elements, Pisces. One of the fire elements, when the sun and Aries meet, day and night are of equal length, which is called a vernal equinox. Days will get gradually longer after this day. Fire, or water fire. Taurus, one of the earth elements. Gemini, one of the fire air elements. Water, Cancer, one of the water. When the sun and Cancer meet, the day will be longer than all others in the year. This is called the summer solstice. Leo, one of the fire elements. Virgo, one of the earth elements. Libra, one of the air elements. When the sun and Libra meet, day and night are of equal length again. This is called the autumnal equinox. After this day, the night will get gradually longer. Scorpio, one of the water elements. Sagittarius, one of the fire elements. Capricorn, one of the earth elements. When the sun and Capricorn meet, the night will be the longest of the year. This is called the winter solstice. Aquarius, one of the air elements. I got it. At least they keep the same order. These are the elements of the zodiac in astrology. Water. Fire, earth, wind, water, fire, earth, wind, water, okay. fire, oh wait, what? The door has been opened. Give me treasure. Pain masses, bro. It's a brick house. He's mighty mighty and letting it all hang out. A brick house. Look at us. Puzzling. Puzzle puzzling. That frog has a spark plug on its butt. Oh, those things are actually kinda hurt, huh? Oh, 
Oh, it still didn't work. Okay, screw y'all then. Stop following me, weirdos. I love when they let you use your healing abilities outside of battle. That's always... Oh, that's a really good healing ability. Get us an Earth, boy. See what enemies we get for this one. That's oh, a mummy king. King acquired. Oh. Heck. 
Now Septimus be the one with that ability, that sucks. I wish Nicole had it. A boomerang. Anyone actually use a boomerang? I think it's just a fucking weapon, I think. Oh hell. One shot him. How are we supposed to tame him if you one shot him, Nicole? <laughs> It should be open. And thus the flood. Darn it, you made me wait so long. Useless losers. He's like a tiger. Ah, uh, hell, it's a labyrinth. Why are these guys still falling? Oh, it's her. Watch it. capturing people, to be honest with you. Okay. 
new thing. Perfect. You should be tameable now. Welcome to the team, loser. I stole a gate ring. Whatever that is. <laughs> All the buttons have been pressed. Left him. I screwed this for him. I mean, I can suck him up. Alrighty. Held the door. Oh my god. Survived that one.
Put on her. Oh, she can't wear it. God dang. Whatever. Okay, wait a second. Let me look at my stuff real quick. Can I fuse anything cool? Useless. 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 Ah, oh, useless. I feel like fusing in this game is not the best. Oh, whatever. Don't care. Whatever. Frago! That hurt. That didn't, that didn't hurt. You always get something good when she's still and stuff so far. Clockworks are set up to stop you from moving forward. Don't risk your life and return now. Down as a tragic massacre, the furious demon vows to kill all intruders as revenge. Oh, hell yeah. Ah, oh, it should be your old kindy. You definitely made these engravings, but what do these words mean? Lord Mirrodin, this door will can't be opened. Back off, you good-for-nothings. Hey, this door's yours. Go ahead and open it. Wow, Grandpa must have engraved these. Let me take a look. Pascal Arabic. Arabic. A specter is locked behind the stone in the abyssal ghost town, Kindy. What does it mean? I guess the stone door has a vicious demon lock behind it. Seems that this is what I'm looking for. How do we open the door? Wait, it's a demon. Why are you so eager to release it? I got Pete. Yay! Uh, Rare Really, won't you be killed if you let it out? 
Huh, that old Kendi was able to trick it into getting trapped there. That useless old Kendi can deceive it. Why can't I, idiot? You little b word, open this door right now or I'll kill you. Oh, why not then? The tablet said the door will open after knocking four times. Huh. Hey, you get in there. Me? Yes, you. Shut up. Just get in. Yes. That's a piece. Report. It looks like a tomb. There's nothing here. Arn, how could that be? I'm going to see it for myself. Oh, that'd be a hell of a funny if they tricked him into going in there. He lied! Andy, why did you tell them how to open a door? I could have handled these guys. I told them because Grandfather left a note on the tablet in ancient Semitic language that only my family can understand. Semitic. Maybe that's it. Oh. He said, my descendants, the demon inside, is reasonable and harmless. Ha ha ha. I want to see this demon in person now. Ha <laughs> ha. Impressive. It turns out old Kendi had to expect that the Umuyad family would come here. That's why he left that engraving. Let's go. Let's see what's so fascinating about this demon. Alright. What's up, please? Guard a trap. Old Kendi set a trap. Hey, you, you there. Go. Take a look. Hurry up. Lord Meriden, the stone door is still tight. We can't open it. Incompetent fools open that door by any means necessary. Son of a bee, even in death, that darn old Kendi still sets me up. Hey, you open this door for me now. Us? <sighs> All he does is scream and boss us around. Uh oh, what did you just say? Nothing, my lord. I said Lord Mirden is such a wise leader and it is my greatest honor my entire life to have the opportunity to serve you. Seems you still have some sense. Go open that door. Anyone who disobeys me will suffer an excruciating fate. Easy peasy, watch. Stone door, stone door, Lord Meredith ordered you to open it immediately, otherwise you will have an excruciating fate. Ah. Lord Mirden, this wicked stone door didn't listen to your order at all. Please kill it, and then we can get out of here. Son of a... Did you just make fun of me? Everyone kill him. Lord Mirden, you have seen that we have solved so many clockworks along the way. Can you make it out if you kill us? B-word, you, you're trying to piss me off, aren't you? Once we leave this place, you're dead. Okay, what's up? Oh, oh, the beanie babe and the flying cat. Meow, what are these guys? How dare you come to my home, meow meow? That thing is cute. Oh, slick and familiar, let's see what we have here. Hey, woman, are you, you the, the, the great Tadmor demon who's killed thousands of people? Oh my, he, who even are you? You've just met and you're so inclined to call me demon? Meow, this guy must be talking about the incident five years ago, meow. Oh yes, yes, that does ring a tiny bell. Yes, there was indeed a period of time when I was called a demon. Listen up, woman. Our great Islamic army can forgive the massacre you committed, but there is one condition. Mm, that's very intriguing. Please go on. We are the great Islamic Umayyad army directly under the Caliph. I am its supreme commander, Mirdan. There are currently a handful of repulsive rebels fighting against us. We will forgive your past crimes as long as you kill them for us. Are you the army of the Umayyad Caliphate? Yes, exactly. Many people fear and terror just by hearing the name of the Umayyad army. So, do you know who led the army from Damascus to end the Tadmer resistance and then killed everyone in the city five years ago? Ah, oh, I thought you had something more important to ask. It was me who led the troops and annihilated those unwilling to submit. You... are you sure? Huh, it was indeed me slaughtering all who don't submit to the tactic that I am most proud of. Also, I know you love blood like me, so I didn't come empty-handed either. These two are two men here. One is the darn grandson of the person who locked you up, that old Kendi, and the other is his friend. These two will be your offering. What? Yeah, you know, don't give food, just... 
Don't eat to others. It's just rude, Meow. By the way, Commander, I want to tell you something. I hope it won't disappoint you too much. Son of a bee, will you agree or not? Don't beat around the bush. My name is Kama. I'm Ak. We have lived in the city since long ago. I love this place and the people here. But one day, a group of Umiyad troops wiped out this place and everyone who lived here. I was in a rage. Ankh and I went on a small rampage of Umiyad troops to Vince Manger. Two people got scared and sought out old Kendi, a famous sage, to sail us away. Enough. Do you think I don't know this? It was I who looked for old Kendi to sail you away. Will you agree or not? If not, I will use old Kendi's trick to sail you up again. Oh, that sounds scary, but do you really know how old Kendi sailed us away, Meow Meow? <laughs> Commander, we have- Oh, Commander, we have to tell you one thing. I hope you won't- You won't be too upset. That is, old Kendi didn't sell us at all. If you don't believe me, go and ask him, Meow Meow Meow. Old Kendi had a sincere talk with me that night. He taught me that what I did wrong, so I promised him that I'd live in this ancient tomb and never come out. After he returned, he was so afraid that you would send some unlucky people here to die. So he lied and said that we were sold up. That's it, meow. So do you understand? From the very beginning, we've lived here freely, all of our own free will. What? Darn that old Kendi, how dare he fool me. You, you demon, what are you doing? Are you old Kendi's grandson and his friend? Please come with me. Okay. Locked. Ha! Ah, stuck. B word, open the door, let me out. Feel free to knock, no one will open it away. Anyway, you will spend your whole life in there. The intense flame of revenge took so many tears to be extinguished. I didn't expect the enemy to come to my door. Miss, are you the reasonable demon that my grandfather mentioned? Oh, that's how old Kendi described me. How is he doing recently? He passed away, actually. Really? In the blink of an eye, another human friend passed away. Old Kendi was a very respectable person. Miss, are you really a demon? Oh, you silly. I am a fairy. A fairy of love. Ever since I appeared in this world, I have been searching for my true love. The life of a fairy is long, yet that of humans is short. Whenever I fall in love with a human, I have to constantly face the sorrow of my old loved one aging and dying. Whenever my loved one dies, I mourn for him for decades. After my tears have dried up, I search for another who is worthy of my love. My last lover died in the Tamar Massacre. I've been crying for him for several years. Am um, I the chosen one? Your eyes are so beautiful. One is black and the other is blue. It's like the one I love most. Uh oh. Fighting attack. Hey, who even are you? Don't touch Septum. Septum, who is this old woman? Why is she looking at you like you do have some good relationship or something? <laughs> Seems I am late to this relationship. Turns out someone else made their move first. Now, Kama, you have some competition now. She's younger, cuter, and so energetic. Do you really want to compete with her, meow meow meow? <laughs> this young man has such charming eyes that I really have to take a moment to consider this. Miss, your black cat is so interesting, it can fly and talk. Ankh is my friend. Ankh was already here when I came into this world, so I don't know what she is either. Flying cats exist, but not all Egyptian cats can fly. Meow. Hmm. It's about time to get moving. I will replenish your strength. Let's go. I'll oh, thank you. Then Septim, I'll wait for you up there. Hurry up. Boss fight. Hey, why is this old woman so annoying? Why is she even... What is she even thinking? Uh, she gonna zap her. What she do? She zap people. Septum, you're too cool. You made two fairies fight over you. Not funny. One Nicole isn't annoying enough for me. Really? Then quick, let's get out of here. I want to see the sun. Really want to see the sun again now. Boss fight. Another sword. When you combine all the swords of sailing, you get the Omega Sword of Sailing. 
to fight the final boss. No. Probably. Oh, she left me. What the hell? Why would you do that? That's why you died. Oh, well, at least you beat the least. Still, you stop attacking me. Ah. Can't move. Oh, I'm hitting the wrong key. That's... Wow, wow, we're finally back outside. Hmm, the flying guys seem to be arguing over something again. Hey, I'm serious. I was the first one to go after Septim. First come, first served. Ah, look how nervous she is. So cute. That's right, this kind of innocent look isn't something that can be imitated by an older woman like you, Meow. Hey, are you trying to pick a fight with me, you thousand-year-old wicked cat? Hey, are you listening to me? You can't follow Septim. Um, are you finished? I'll never allow you to follow this person. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, it's a demon. Who did I think it was? Of course it's you, Monkey Golem. You've never spoken to me since being my neighbor. Why are you so enthusiastic about interfering with personal affairs? He loves you! He is an important master- oh, okay, no. He is an important ma person that our master wants. You better stay away from him. Oh, did you just give me an order? But I do not belong to the jurisdiction of Satan. He, even if he governs the underworld, he still has no right to interfere with my freedom, right? Septim, you may not know, but this woman is a real demon. You may be killed by her at any moment. Five years ago, on the very same battlefield, she seemingly went crazy and killed thousands of soldiers in the Is. I heard about it. She lost her lover, so she attacked the Islamic army so ventured. That's right, Septim. Lord Se Satan wants you to join the underworld. If this crazy woman kills you, wouldn't it affect Lord Satan's great business? Sorry, Satan's plan is not my concern. I reject your proposal. How dare you? Fine, then I'll have to defeat you and take you to see the world to see what's going on. Oh, look at that bad boy. Oh, a new party member. Let's go. About time. The party is full. He doesn't have an ultimate yet. What do you do? Fear Vortex. I hurt. He tanky. Oh, he real tanky. Ah, oh, something fell. My bad. Oh, my nose is itching. Oh, God. <laughs> Bless me. Sorry. It's way weaker than the chick's magic for some reason. Where's the cat at? Shouldn't he be helping me? Huh! Huh! 
Lightning, super effective against flying monsters. No, it is not. Okay. Add your blood. I did no damage. Okay, so he's weak to win magic, we've learned. Maybe you weak to this. Oh, that's wrong with that. My bad. Oops. Tanky boy. fight with you, Septim. Let me ask, where will you go next? Searching for the so-called invincible arts of war, and I'm interested in studying astrology under Kindy. Tama, he is so special. If we go with him, we will surely encounter many interesting things, Meow. Yeah, Septim, may I travel with you? No. Don't worry, Saints men will surely trouble you on the way. We can fight for you. We'll be of great help. I can control you anyway, but you must never get in my way. No, I have been persuading you for so long. Why did you cheat on me? Did I cheat? Yeah, well, it's not her fault. I think it's fun that Satan's interfering in this matter. So I want to know what's going to happen next, Meow. Yeah, look, Ink is too curious. Unfortunately, she's a good friend of mine, so I have to accompany her. Besides, Camel might not steal your septum. And you will soon have a cute pet like me. Isn't that a good deal? Meow, 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 meow. That seems to be correct. Deal. The two of you can follow me as long as Ink becomes my pet in exchange. Hooray, that's great. Suddenly having a feeling of being fooled. Septum, we will be companions from now on. I, comma, am, comma. I appreciate your guidance. Uh, pet number two, I also have another cute pet named Boar. Let me introduce you to him. Come to the Black Bronze Pot. Yeah, this is interesting. A bronze pot. Where people can live and really exist. Oh no, there's already a dog in the bronze pot and now a cat comes. Not only that, it's also a woman. Forget it, let's go back to Damascus. Go to Damascus it is. Camels. Matter. Let them look at the desert in the distance. Isn't it a bit strange? Right? The desert is blood red. I wonder what happened. Come, let's check it out. A battle! Oh, Jesus. What's, what's going on? Battle happened. Obviously. Duh. 
Uh, what happened? Meow, no wonder there was a strong blood smell. I can even smell it here. Seems like war broke out. Has there been any war recently? Would it be the war between the Umayyad family and the Abbasid family? I didn't expect him to fight in such a remote desert. Captain, the blood smell is so strong, and there's also a familiar devilish smell. I oh, know, Septim, the army in black is with dads. What, with dad? Weep. Well, this person is still alive. Monsters, monsters, everyone, everyone was. Monster, what monster? Skeletons, everyone was the magic circle, kill, kill. Oh. Soldiers, gun septum. Something's wrong. Is the tragedy scene really caused by the war between the two armies? Listen up. We need to check if anyone is alive and also search for Wadad. Septum, look. Isn't that Moray? Moray is over there. Oh, no. Not Moray. Oh, he's fine, actually. What the hell? Don't kill me. Don't kill me. I mean, look how freaked out this guy is. Seems like he's going to wet his pegs, meow. It really is. It's really you, Murray. I'm glad you're fine. Why are you here? Accept him, sir. Accept him. Thank God. Please help me. These odd monsters want to cook and eat me. They won't hurt you. Don't worry. What happened here? I had been with Commander with Dad. We chased to defeat the defeated Umiyad army and came to this desert. Unexpectedly, when Commander Wadad was about to destroy them, a demon appeared. It killed a large number of troops from both parties. A demon? Yeah, somehow everybody, everyone's blood gathered and formed a magic circle and summoned a skeleton. This one right here? You mean this magic circle right here? By the way, how did you survive? Well, although I was a pirate, I had never seen such a scene with thousands of people fighting. And it terrified me. So I pretended to be a corpse from the beginning, so neither the enemy nor the stupid skeleton found me. I'm speechless. And how about Wadad? Commander Wadad was also hurt by the skeleton. At that time, a hero appeared and defeated it. The de Dread Knight. Hero, who is that person? I don't know. I was so scared that I didn't even dare to look up. I only know what I heard. But that hero's voice, I'm sure I've heard him somewhere before. Oh, it's... what's his name? Okay, what happened next? After that skeleton was defeated, I made, it made a terrifying sound and disappeared in this magic circle. Commander Wadad, leading the rest of the soldiers, went to the magic circle with that hero and chased after him. Seems to be a trick from Satan again. Captain, this magic circle is used to summon demons from the other world. It's a passage connecting the two worlds. Jumping in here should teleport you to another world such as Underworld or Hell, where they should be. Alright, Kendi, search for survivors and take them to a safe place. I'm entering this magic circle to save Wadad and others. They might be in danger. Septum, I want to go with you. How can I let an opportunity go of an opportunity that broadens my horizons? No, it's too dangerous. This is not a game, and I won't let you follow me. You can use the camel. He's gonna sneak in after me. Let's go! Or hell. Oh, hell. It, yeah, this is hell, yeah. What a gloomy place. It's full of eternal blood organs and blood. Really, hell? It looks like some place in hell. It looks sort of familiar. Let me think. Well, I don't have members. I'm sorry. All good. Most important thing is to find Wadad and the others. Let's go. Ah, here he is. Told you. Well, what the hell is this place? Oh, I suppose. That's why I told you not to follow me. You're right. I'm going back then. <laughs> Uh-oh. You idiot. Boo-hoo. It seems I can't return. Can't stand you. Forget it. Come with us. Will I be able to leave this place if I go with you? We don't know either. We are actually in the same situation as you. Ooh, I feel so regretful. Meow meow. Com comment reminds me of an old proverb. Curiosity killed the child. Killed the child. 
Like, stop modifying proverbs that are bad about cats all the time, okay? Come on, Kendi. If you decide to come here, just confront reality. Everybody into the pot. There's no sword. There's no seal sword this time. I don't How's that thing? Another cat. On, on that barbecue grill, there are human bones. You want some? The fresh is a flash from the Arab soldiers that just got here. Arab soldiers meet? Ah, it's child. Don't run child. Have the children have the most tender, delicious flesh. Really? Uh, okay. He hit so soft without magic. Oh my god. What the hell, Nicole? Why did you hit it so hard? I'm getting more and more regretful now. Wow. Septim, I, I know you must have been wondering if that's the flesh of Wadad. Stop your nonsense. We have to hurry up. Got no time for no flesh? Flesh barbecue? Heavenly Hurricane! Oh, child, very slow. He ain't gonna make it. He don't get eight. Murloc? Swimming in the ocean, causing a commotion? Fish to grab. Ah, return my brother to me! Oh, he pissed. Brother, bro? I know you aren't related, but it don't matter. You can join him. Better than the Vampire King, I wonder. Oh, I'm dead. Oh. 
Swallow war. The war swallower. Testing. What is this? Kind of orifice with teeth. Custom bun. Oh, that noise is really annoying, actually. They're trash, that's what they are. This, teeth, teeth. It's a trap! Oh god. <laughs> nice. Oh, that guy! Poor Neil, yes! Didn't I kill him last time? How is he alive again? Prepare to die, Cornelius. Even if I'm in the underworld, I will kill you for Lillian. I'll never let you go as long as you are alive. Who's that, Septum? <laughs> you haven't forgotten that lovely Lillian, have you? Didn't I tell you, no matter how beautiful the love or how happy the life, there's still nothing but illusions. Well, losing them cause endless pain, so why are you so persistent? Human beings can never escape this pain and dread. Since we can't escape, the best option is to become dread itself. 
so that you never dread. Welcome to the hell of dread of the underworld. I am the master of this place, Dread King. Oh, he's the Dread King? You you are the master of this underworld realm. Ha <laughs> ha. There are so many things you don't know in this world. I am the right hand of Lord Satan, responsible for making this world fall in dread. I am not interested in fighting you today. I must research more knowledge. Huh, ridiculous. People like you don't need any knowledge to bring dread. Knowledge must be eliminated and distorted. It is at least easy to eliminate knowledge. But to restore knowledge, one needs to understand it first. Didn't you taste the joy of distorting knowledge in Tadmer? You mean the time I made the two Islamic armies fight each other? That's right, Septim. That you did what you did is more brilliant than we expected. No wonder Lord Satan wants you. Oh, Septim, in this world, it's kill or be killed. This is the only truth in the universe that has not changed for thousands of years. Humph, you're wrong. I thank you for allowing me to reflect on what I did wrong last time. I am what I am. I will not let myself be a shot in fruit like you. Oh, hell. Stupid, think it over in jail. I will release you once you change your mind. Septum, Septum. Oh, it's him. Hurts, where am I? Seems to be directly under the room just now. We have fallen from the room above. Wow, it's a prison cell of the underworld. We are locked up. Oh, a prison. They really thought a prison cell could trap Kama, did they? Oh, well. Strange, how is it possible? Oh my god. Oh, please, you haven't been in hell, have you? Prison cells here can even trap even your soul. Yeah, this isn't good, Septim. Wouldn't you like to reconsider accepting that guy's offer now? No way, I'll never agree to it. Okay, well... Party- oh, thank you. I can heal from even over here. Fantastic. Perfect. Perfect! I just remembered, the dead Dread King is the most terrifying presence in the underworld. Its domain is called the Hell of Dread, though it was once known as the Bloody Maze. I had no idea that Cornelius was the Dread King, either. Meow meow, this is bad. Why don't you consider accepting his conditions for now? No way, I'll never agree to go in the other world. They killed the person that was most precious to me. Bro, you suck. I can't wait to tear them from limb from limb. How could I join them? Uh, Pink Floyd thing again. Oh, we flash back in time again. What's going on? Have I returned to the past again? thinking about Lily and I went back to the past before I even realized I have no control over my abilities at all. Lillian? Oh my god! Lillian, I remember just recently deciding not to save you. I didn't expect to see you again in such a situation. I really don't know what to do. Would you please tell me, Lillian? Septum? Why am I here? Where's Miles? God, I hate this chick and main character. Lillian, I, he... Septim, I believe you're a good person, but Miles, he's also a good person. I, I want to ask you to stop hurting each other. Septim, please promise me you'll get along with Miles. Oh. Yes, I promise you. You need to rest. Stop talking. Thank you, Septim. You're a good person. I trust you. Lillian. Lillian! Septim, can I ask you another thing? No, die. Hmm? Now I probably will die soon. Could you please, please send my word to Miles? Yes, I'll do my best. Thank you. Please tell him Lillian will never forget Miles. Lillian will watch over Miles from heaven forever. I'll tell him. I'll make sure of it. Thank you, Septim. Take care of yourself. <laughs> You again, Cornelius. Set them cold hands, but a warm heart. Ah, you're such a fool. No matter how lovely, beautiful, and life may sound, they're just short and empty. Just one moment and you lose everything. What awaits is nothing but endless pain. You come from the future, am I right? It seems that your ability to time travel has awakened. 
That woman is an important part of Lord Saint's plan. I won't allow you to save her. I'll nail her on the cross and make sure she suffers as she dies. Once I've driven miles to despair, Lord Satan's great plan will be realized. <laughs> Cornelius, how dare you? Return to your own time. The future me will get rid of the future you. You think so? You think so, bro? Darn it, I was inexplicably sent, but inexplicably sent back to the original place again. I can't even protect those most dearest to me. Oh, it's her. Captain Kindy, what? There you are. What are you doing here? With Dad? I struggled to find a way out of here. I heard you shouting, so I rushed over immediately. Such a shame. We came to save you, but just ended up trapped here instead. Don't say that. Let me see if I can unlock the cell. Yes, there seems to be a mechanism there. Convenient. Thank you, Wadad. Is there anyone else? No, demons and monsters have been attacking us all the time, and only me and a warrior were left. The monsters defeated him and took him away just now, leaving me, me alone looking for him. A warrior? Who is he? The great soldiers that recently joined Magariba. He's already accomplished much under the leadership of Commander Suleiman. Oh my god, we know who it is. He seems to hail from the Frankish Kingdom just like you. The enemy calls him the Death and Gold for his dauntless nature in battle. Death and Gold? Indeed, we first met him when we encountered a skeleton in the desert. He suffered great casualties, but he managed to defeat the skeleton and save us. But in retrospect, it seems that the skeleton lost the fight deliberately to lead him here. Miles, now I get it. Let's find an exit first to get Kindy out safely. After that, I'll help you look for the warrior. Alright, convenient. Yes. Random people will keep joining my party. Let's save. I don't want that cutscene again if I die. Yay, let's get out of here. Cloud Pricker. What the heck is a Cloud Pricker? Is that a sword? Is it an upgrade? The Cloud Pricker Sword! I have so many of these. What happens if I get proficiency with them? I'm gonna use it. Why not? What is a Cloud Pricker? Oh, here it is. It is a sword. Oh, it's a throwing weapon. He's in battle to deal damage, apparently. Oh, God! John Nicole. <laughs> Gotta escape from here. Oh my god. She learned a new attack all of a sudden. Makes no sense. What the hell? Oh, you turd! Oh, that stupid woman. Well, it's part of Conley's Conley's fault for using that stupid new attack. I guess there was a crit. I don't know. Either way, annoying. Annoyed. Proficiency went up with it, I wonder. Oh. How do you proficiency it? And key. 
bizarre sword that contains strong, mysterious power. Does it have to get kills to do it? Ah, oh, nice. Evil blood gown. Nice. Perfect. Oh wow, that's a lot of defense. Holy crap. There you go. Good for you. Oh. How do we get this boy out of here? Supposed to be back here? I thought the whole point was to come back here and get him out somehow. Why are there two exits? What in the world? Oh hell, I don't need to do that. Another sort of ceiling, wow. Underworld ceiling mess is different better than the one from the human world. Okay, I like that. I differ better. Looking a different same actually, dude. You lied to me. No money for you. Come, come, first class goods are waiting for you. It's trash. Hello, we have rare weapons and armors that may never come in the world. Come out, look. That's a good one. No, wait, I have that one. Alloy horn. Alloy horn. I'll buy it just in case. A fiend bow? Tiger Paw shoes. Hell yeah, I want Tiger Paw Are you kidding me? Actually, I'd rather have these shoes. How are you? I'm, no, I'm okay. Like, huh. 
this art what's up my miles never being dumb again hey miles <laughs> hey miles it's really you hey that's, that's the warrior i was talking about do you know him no oh, miles for them hey dude get up miles are you all right wake up where where am i where's that monster Great, I'm glad you're fine. I thought everything was doomed and had been worrying about you. This friend is also from Frankia and he's come to rescue you. Septum, why are you here in Arabia? Talk about it later. We need to leave this hor horrible place as soon as possible. Oh no! Darn Septum. Lord Satan's plan will be completed once the 13 candles burn out. Yet you scum disrupted me again. Okay. I oh, think he's got the same attack. Are you weaker? Oh man, we all gangbanging him. Which means we should summon more gangbangers. Not me. Yeah. yeah, he doesn't seem like he got stronger for some reason. Weird. Experience true fear. But... Oh, transform. Good for you, man. At least you're not as weak as I thought. Exciting. Yeah, like a pillar on his head for some reason. Well. I have an AoE heal now, heal now so. Looks to be you. That is a really strong spell. ultimate do again something dumb maybe I'll hurt him more since so it's not the gargoyle I uh yeah, I did pretty high I guess can he be tamed that would be hilarious no <laughs>
What is her healing abilities? Oh, near death status. No. Are you dead yet? Take this. Left him. Oh, trash. Really? Dead night. <laughs> no, <I'm sorry. laughs> oh, and pass it up. What a pity. It was so close, Lord Satan. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. Are you really Satan subordinate? Sir Miles, if it weren't for this nasty septum right now, you. You should know better than me about who is Lord Satan. What do you mean? Ah, uh, never mind. We have plenty of chances, Sir Miles. I will never disappoint you. Praise rest assured. Stop talking nonsense. Today is just the time to kill you. You have deceived me for so many years and even killed my beloved Lillian. Ah, uh, I, the Dread King, will never be killed and will never die. He disappeared. Guy's yeah, difficult. Maybe one day he will come out like a cockroach again. Without saying his plan, they have been talking about it repeatedly. What kind of terrible conspiracy is it exactly? Miles is Satan. Septum, will this glowing ma six star magic circle be the exit? Give it a try. It's not a big deal. Anyway, the situation won't get any worse. Quad. Oh, we're back. What is this place? We're saved! This is the Mosque of Damascus! And this holy mosque! Human bodies are littered everywhere. Looks like the war in Damascus must have been quite brutal, too. Better get out of here and check out what's going on outside! Hey. Everyone's dead! The street is so quiet, it seems the people have left to seek refuge. I know where treasure is! Captain, when I led the troops to the east in pursuit of the fleeing army, I heard the army directly under the Caliph's command remain in Damascus to defend this place. If that's the case, there should be fierce fighting in the palace. Let's take a look. Sally. I don't know the current situation, which worries me a lot. If the opposite family succeeds and starts to treat the Demi more harshly, what should I do? 
Doesn't help to worry about this. It's dangerous outside. You should go home. Huh? Treasure? This is true. This is true. God, he's still here. Ah, oh, I hate you. Ah, he's got the best treasure, I know it. Greetings, Commander Wadad and Sir Miles. Thank you for your hard work. How's the battle going? Commander Wadad, the fight is over. The defeated Umayyad troops fled to the west to Egypt. Really, it seems that the winner of this revolution has been decided. Yes, sir. Commander Suleiman personally went to the, pursue the remnant party and left us to take over the palace, but... What's wrong? We already won. What difficulties do you have for this mission? Yes, but a strange monster appeared in the palace. It has already killed many of us. Darn it, could it be the work of Satan or Cornelius? Not only was that monster invulnerable, but there was a strange foreigner next to him claiming to be an envoy from the Tang Empire to help the Umiyad uh, Caliphate. Tang Empire? Where's that country? Septim, that's a big country in the Far East. Grandpa's- that's where you're from. Grandpa said that they seem to be stronger than our Islam. Well? Septim, I have to check what's going on. Would you like to help me? Islam is very powerful already. I want to see who's that person from a country stronger than Islam. Alright. Let's do this. Wow, is this the Umiyad Palace? Looks like it. It's pretty big. I didn't expect to see such a magic, majestic stone castle in the desert. Umiyad and family used a lot of time and manpower to build it. Oh, who are you? Don't man. Careful, it should be this guy. Surround him, don't let him escape. Is he you, the foreigner who killed many of our brothers? I am indeed a foreigner, but I didn't kill these soldiers, al Aren't you? The proof is right here. You won't get away with it. Oh, hell. This lady, what we see may not necessarily be the truth. I'm a monk. I don't tell lies, Amitaba. Amitaba. Careful, this guy used a weird sorcery. I was bounced away before touching him. Hey, are you the goon from the Tang Empire hired by the Umiyad Caliphate? I am from the Tang Empire, but I'm not here to help the Umiyad Caliphate. And why did you come here from the east? I like to travel around the world. This time I came with our caravan from the Silk Road. I didn't expect war in your country. That's it. Darn you? Do you mean all the corpses here are fake? Someone else killed your people. You arrived when I was hesitating whether to chase that person or not. Now let's go and believe that. Catch, let's just catch him. He always causes trouble, bro. Like, she has, like, zero... Thought process at all. Oh, hell. Oh, this ain't working. I don't open! He's unkillable. He's gonna one shot me. Hold up, don't be hasty now. The monster which you're talking about is here. This whole man's skills are so weird. He remains unharmed no matter how we attack. Oh, hell. Oh, what's that monster? This should be the guy you're looking for, right? Oh, it's pissed. What is that? Okay.
kind of inexplicable monster must have been sent by Cornelius. No, you are wrong. This is a man-made creation. Man-made creation? Ah, that guy is still obsessed with this. I need to try to persuade him again. Okay, Ninja Man. Hey, wait. What? This monster is made of wood and bronze. What an exquisite technique. I didn't expect something made out of materials like these to be able to move and fight. It must be the power of the devil. Cornelius' black magic must be making it move. I don't know if the old man is telling the truth. Let's follow him to see if we can figure out who he is. Septim, you can go now. I want to stay here to study this thing. No, it's too dangerous to stay. Come with us, Miles, and I will move it for you to study when things are over. Septim, I suddenly recalled something. Grandpa used to say that there is a mysterious martial art in the Tang Empire which allows you to bounce the enemy away with your hands before the enemy approaches. I guess that amazing old man must be a master of oriental martial arts. Oh, well, sounds interesting. So this bronze monster is also controlled by eastern martial arts? I don't know. That's why I want to dissemb disassemble it and study it carefully. Okay, let's find the old man. His mar wonderful martial arts might be exactly what I'm looking for. Yay. Oh, hell. That's a monster. Huang Wei, the Emperor asks you to uphold friendly relations with the Arab countries. How can you intervene in their affairs without the Emperor's authorization? Huh. <laughs> May I ask you who we are? Do you, a uh, commoner, understand national affairs? Okay, let me ask you. The Umayyad Caliphate has had friendly relationships with our Tang Empire. Why shouldn't I help them if they are in trouble? The Lang Lay, these are the Arab countries' affairs. They are changing governments. Firstly, we outsiders have no right to intervene them. Secondly, huh, secondly what? Tell me. Once you intervene, it means that Tang supports the Umayyad Caliphate. The opposite Caliphate wins. Border clashes will become unavoidable. Ha <laughs> ha, you stupid. Don't you see this clockwork beast behind me? With it, even the opposite Caliphate start Sar, seen army will be no match for me. Wang Lei, smart strength is not everything. You are a smart person. Why can't you understand such a simple fact? You pedant. Okay then, I will use the clockwork beast to teach you what determines everything. Oh, I get to it. I think he's gonna win. Oh, it hurt. Weak. Oh no, the old man from the east was injured. I need to help him. Oh great. I really don't understand. Why are you always so nosy? Why are you still arguing with me when the enemy is right before our eyes? If you have anything to say, wait until we sell this behemoth. Enough, Sister Nicole. Let's stop things. making things difficult for Septim and solve the immediate crisis. Oh, hell.
fucking more enemies by the second. Awesome. That's how I'm not dying. Okay. Actually, I'll save that in case he does like a special attack on her and she needs to heal back up. It's where the heck did you come from? You won unfairly. Hi, right, loser. Metabot. And how do you explain using a clockwork beast to attack me, an older man? Reflect on yourself, Wong Lei. Are you okay? A few cuts. Nothing serious. I was careless for a moment. Thank you. So oh, sorry. You said so you really weren't with them. Yes, I am Huiyan, a monk. That one with the clockwork beats is Huang Lei. We are from the Tang Empire in the East. He is one of the envoys sent here by our country. Unexpectedly, he went self-assertive and planned to intervene in your internal disputes to earn merits so that he could ask the Emperor for a promotion. I see, so did he make those clockwork monsters? Yes, he is a genius in this aspect, but he took the wrong path. Except we have to catch that guy, or he will make a bunch of monsters. Right, Kindy, please take care of Master Uyan for the time being. No problem, I am very interested in the Eastern Tang Empire and the Clockwork Beast. I will consult Master Uyan. <laughs> you are very studious. Ask me anything you want. 
Come here, loser. Actually, what's up here? Random encounter! Level one up, I think. Dang it, Nicole! Oh, it's broken. Uh oh, I'm stuck. Gotta get out of here. I'm scared to save. I can't get out! Wait. Genius. Perfect. I am so smart. I don't know why that glitched, but it was really weird. Oh, Unleavened cake does not want to be used, I've learned. Alright, screw the items. Screw the wolves. I need a save spot or something. Hey. Hey. Is that always been her attack? critical attack or something. Let's see if we got any proficiency with this stupid weapon now. If not, I'm gonna change it. Okay, yay. You can get proficiency. Takes a while of using it, I guess. Now we're ready for a boss fight. Treasure, treasure. Hey! 
Magical crystal or B. Increase your proficiency. Where did this guy go? What is this? Rocks fall, everyone dies? Ah, oh, single target, trash. Please. He still didn't go up. I don't know how to do it. Weird. Hey, it's this guy. Oh, he's so fast. What the? Heck? He's not that. I'm fast. I finally found you. What do you want from me? Dang bang. Sorry, since you're a dangerous man, I would like to ask you to stay quiet before the war is over. Darn it! Except him, this guy killed many of my people. I want him dead. Hold on, don't kill him yet. No! Come on, Miles, why did you stop us? The guy is talented. It would be a waste if he died. Right, but I didn't mean to kill him. 
By the way, Miles, what do you want him for? Conquer the world! Because he's Satan. Miles, haven't you given up evil and returned to good? So you have joined the Islamic army to start all over? Giving up evil and returning to good? What a joke. What is good and what is evil? Septim, let me ask you, what are you living for? What are we living for? I haven't thought about it. What for? I grew up in the church and have always believed that the ultimate purpose of humans is to glorify and serve God. That's why you thought God was more important than Lillian's safety when I took her away. I finally understand now. That's right. But do you know how long I have I suffered, struggled and suffered? How did God repay me in the end? The moment Lillian died, I finally understood God and the church are nothing but lies. Let me tell you, since God doesn't care about us, the ultimate goal of a person's life is to have power and strength and to finally stand at the top of the world. I joined Islam because I wanted to use them to conquer the world and prove God in an inco is incompetent and a joke. Is this your conclusion? Septim, after working with you this time, I found that you are in fact a rare talent. Although there were some pleasant, unpleasant misunderstandings between us in the past, I still want you to join. Want to invite you to help me conquer the world? No, oh, Satan. What do you think? I appreciate your talents. We can share this world. Don't worry. You don't need to answer me right now. You can take your time. Wait a minute, Miles. What is it? Have you decided? No, Lillian asked me to tell you something before she died. She said she will never forget you and will protect you in heaven. Lillian, she really said that? <laughs> How hilarious! Heaven? What's heaven? There's no heaven in this world! Huh, if I still believed in heaven, why wouldn't I kill myself to meet Lillian in heaven? <laughs> Sept was thinking real hard about that question. Dude, why are you still here? I chased him for a long time, but lost him at the end of the road. Leave it to me, I will find him. They're miles. Really right. What is it? Did you catch a foreigner? I lost him, but Sir Miles didn't want to let him go and went after him. What a pity. Huang Lei is extremely smart, but he lacks wisdom when it comes to choosing the right path. Wisdom to choose the right path. Everyone believes that they are walking the right path, but who knows if it is really the right path. Young man, it's not hard. With the wisdom of the ancients in your conscience, you know it more or less. Wisdom and conscience? I have none of these. For example, the Quran in your country and the four books of five classics in our country help guide you in some directions. This is the wisdom of the ancients. I am not Islamic. I am from the Frankish Kingdom further in the west. Hey, stop standing and talking. We've walked through so many places, including ancient tombs and hells. I think you must be tired. Septum Master Hu Yan separated from, with this caravan. I invited him to live in my house to ask him about the Tang Empire in the east. That's right, let's leave here. Yay. Leaving here. I say a boy. Scene. Hmm, weird. Alright. I think I'm done capturing the spirit people though. That's kind of a pain in the butt for unnecessary pain in the butt. Wait, where are we supposed oh Commander Will Dad. We heard that monsters appeared in the palace. Lord Abbas worried about you and sent us here to take a look. 
Thank you, these monsters have been wiped out. I will report to them soon. By the way, what is the current situation in other military districts? Forces of the Umiyad Caliphate have almost crumbled, apart from some who escaped. We have arrested nearly all of them. Lord Abbas is planning to hold a meeting and has invited you to discuss how to deal with them. Septum, I may be busy for a while, but what is your plan? Yes, I'll study at Kenny's house. Besides, since this mister is from the Tang Empire from the East, I want to ask him more about the Empire. Yeah, Dad, you are so stupid, don't you understand? Septim wants to learn special Eastern martial arts from this master Huey Yan secretly. If he does, you will be far from his match. Indy, I truly want to learn from him, but why must I learn these in secret? Septim, I will never allow myself to lose to you all the time, and I will prove it one day. Whatever. What? In AD 750, the Abbasid family of the Arab Empire, Islam, succeeded in a military revolution and overthrew the original owner of the Umayyad Caliphate, and that was the beginning of the Abbasid Caliphate. Abbasid Caliphate stopped the military expansion policy and made every effort to develop cultural exchange and maritime trade. The Arab Empire gradually entered an unprecedented golden era in this history. At the same time, Septim and Master Hu Yan lived in Kendi's home. Septim began to learn Chinese martial arts and it... whatever. Ah, yes, the stick is mightier than the stone. Hip-hop, hip-hop, hi Oh, he really did, hi -ya. Yeah, take that, take that log, yeah. Naughty log, bad log, spank. Ha 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 ha! Oh, he's wearing Chung in me. Ah, uh, Key Fist. That's a good thing we learned these martial arts. I can stop wars now. Oh my god. Eventually, I oh my god, he won't stop hitting me. Ha 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 How can you do it with a stick? Oh my god. Septum learned Flame Strike. That's what we learned after all that. AD 751. Time flies. It's been almost a year since I set foot in Arabia. Turns out astrology isn't really what I'm looking for. Does the distant Tang Empire really have the answer I want? No. Septum, are you, are you leaving with Master Hu Yan soon? Why are you still on the tower? Also, I want to go to the Empire T Ting Empire with you. It's so f unfair that you go here there alone. Hindi, I've already told you no. The journey is not for fun. I won't change my mind, even if you bother me like this every day. Huh, you do this every single time. Up here. Treasure? Glory? A dead end? Who knows? I'm glad we figured that out. Ah, yes. Your boy has to pee really bad yet again. We get into a battle, hopefully. Power's kicking my butt. What's up, boys? Kenny has always had a strong desire for knowledge. Huh, I want to see the Tang Empire for myself. Dad, yeah, what are you doing here? Septum, why did you leave without telling me that you were going to the Tang Empire? Sorry, would Dad. It's a difficult decision for me, but I eventually decided to not tell you. Why? I don't understand at all. Septum told me that you wouldn't have let him go if you had known. He had no other choice. Why, Kindy, show some awareness of the situation. Septim, I told you that I will challenge you sooner or later. If you really want to leave, you'll have to defeat me first. But Dad, don't. I swear in the name of Allah, I'll let you go without any reservations, so long as you can defeat me. Here we go. That's right, you seem to have improved a lot. But I know Flame Strike. Oh, are you looking down on women? I'll make sure to prove it to you later. Flame Strike. Oh, I can't use it yet. Lucky you. I have life still. Good luck with this. 
Oh, can I tame her? That might be interesting. Not now. Take this. Rocks fall and she dies. Why? Why can't I win? <laughs> Darn it, after all this time, why can't I defeat you? But Dad, believe me when I say that you become much stronger than before. What does it matter? You beat me, just go. I see ya. Dad seems to be crying. I'm afraid we won't have the chance to see her again after this time. Girl really doesn't want you to go. I have come to a significant decision. I shall go with you to the Tang Empire. Master Kindy, no matter what you say this time, I won't let you off on your own. Left him back me here. If I don't come with you, we'll never see each other again. For the best. Kindy, I still can't accept your company, but I promise to both of you that I shall return. Don't worry. Like. Kindy, those days we spent together were my happy. Thank you truly. See you, nerd. No! You fool, you big fool! Dad, Kindy, thank you both. I will never forget you. The rest of our journey will be tough. First, we'll have to cross this vast desert to the east. Then we enter China along the Silk Road. But I've got it. Let's hit the road! Ah, hell. Ah, yes. Time to pee. Perfect. Hey! Alright, and now, where do we go? North? Ah, oh, hell. I'm done collecting you, Pokemon. Oh. <laughs> Yay! Saturn Thorn Ring has reached its max level. Yay, our proficiency went up again. Yay, yay. Septum is level 30. Yes, he is. Get our camels. Here we go. It's gonna be a long road back to Frankia or whatever. All the way to China. Baghdad, that's not China. Septum, this is Mesopotamia. We are about to arrive in Baghdad. Baghdad, what kind of place is that? It's a prosperous trade town on the Mesopotamian plains. We don't have much water and food left, so let's go there to get more supplies. Ah, someone we know is in Baghdad, actually. What 
that be Master Huiyan? Lady Boss. I am, and you are? Master, I'm really uh, Master Huang's grandniece. Er, Leon, it's great to see you blossom into a beautiful lady after so many years. By the way, why are you here? I'm married an Arabian merchant. This shop is here. Really, I'm. Um, why are you talking to the guests in Mandarin? Mandarin! The guest is an elder in my hometown, so. Uh, I remember that. So there's a poem in your country. You who arrive from an old country, tell me what has happened there. Did you see when you passed my silken window the first cold blossom of the plum? Yeah, that's the one. Take your time with your old friend. Master, why did you come to Baghdad? I'm going to India for Buddhist scriptures. One of my friends entrusted me to visit Arab countries. Leave for India soon. There may be a war shortly. What is it? Recently, many travelers have come here to enlist in the army of the Prince of Tashkent. Could it be related to the incident last year with Gao Jianji destroyed Tashkent? Thank you for your kind reminder. Two guards are patrolling the entrance of the Prince's camp, so don't break in. Break in, you say? Discount? Oh hell, oh uh, hell no. Screw your discount, fight me. I said no! God, my coins. I said no! How do I get out of here? Any weapons? Good weapons? fickle the universe can be. Fate played a cruel trick on man. The prince wants to restore the country. He feels grief, anger, and hatred. The war is about to start. Baghdad is full of smoke and dust. A fierce battle is unavoidable. Countless casualties for both sides. Yeah. Uh, no, you don't. That's more people I don't care about. Hold on, His Highness is hosting a banquet for a great warrior. You're not allowed to enter, right? Fine, how long will it take? It should be over soon. Just wait a few moments. That's alright. Let's wait here for a while. Oh my god, I actually have to wait for five minutes? Are you kidding me? Mister, I have met you back in Damascus. That is a lie. I was indeed in Damascus before, but I don't remember you. Believe me, we definitely met each other, but we weren't introduced. What does it... Where's my friend at? I have a friend somewhere. Wait, there's treasure. Yay, treasure. Oh, did he kill them? The soldier is hammered. These two drunkards are hopeless. They drink.
Crescent sword. Many rivers in this world bred civilizations. Young man among the four rivers, which one is not in the Islamic region? I don't know. Oh, I didn't click. What? I know the Nile is in Egypt. Okay. Well, one of them is bound to be right. I don't know what counts as the Islamic region. The Ganges, I guess. Okay, dude. I don't know. One of them. Yes, the Ganges is... Uh, the, I clicked the Tigers. Whatever. Thank you for the boots, I guess. Oh, you want to fight? Everyone face me. Listen to my commands. Left turn. Foul turn. A face. You're very good. Keep practicing. What do you think? They carried out my commands. You will surely win. What are these little kids doing? Charge, charge. Defeat the tame soldiers. Haters of the tang, huh? Uh, you must be from outside, aren't you? How do you know? Those locals don't usually talk to female slaves, so. Alright, hurry up, General, whatever your name is, before I slay you. I'm ready. Can we get in now? The banquet should be over. Someone will greet you when you enter. Thank you for accepting to help us fight against the hateful invaders. No. Uh, excuse me, why do so many troops suddenly appear in Baghdad? By the looks of your clothes, are you a monk from India? Yes, I am a monk who practices in Buddhism. Amitabha. Amitabha. Good, then let me tell you. To be honest, the Tang Empire in the East recently went too far, invaded the neighboring country without a declaration of war, and even destroyed the nearby Tashkent for no reason. What? How could it be? Doesn't the Tang Empire embrace peace? That's what they said, in our opinion. Aren't they just bullying the small countries around to expand their territory? Like this time, they did it without any reason at all. The King of Tashkent was so kind to host them, but they destroyed Tashkent in return. He even boasted that it was to promote the prestige of the Tang Empire. The Prince of Tashkent was lucky to escape, and he called on all countries to take revenge against the Tang Empire. The Tang Empire also interfered with our internal affairs and obstructed the revolution of the Abbasid family. That's why the Caliph is determined to stop help Tashkent against the Tang Empire. We are the army sent by the Caliph. Okay. Something this isn't looking good. These countries in Arabia want to attack my country. I have to inform my people quickly. Sounds like your country has done something wrong. Why do you still want to help them? Ah, you got me. I'm a, also a bit puzzled. Please trust me, I won't make the mistake right from wrong. Just because the Tang Empire is my motherland, I'm just trying to stop the war. Stop this war? Why? Once a war starts, regardless of whose fault, the people are the ones who suffer the most. Although the chance is slim, will you help me stop the war? Well, I'll see what I can do. Let's collect some information to learn more about the situation. Master Hu Yan, didn't you tell me that the art of war in China is very similar to the invincible arts of war I'm looking for? If so, you don't have to worry, right? The Aptum, the art of war only helps you win the battle, but it is not absolute. The truly invincible art of war is to prevent the war from the very beginning. The incomparable spirit of kingcraft is what you really should pursue. What is the spirit of kingcraft? How do you prevent war from happening? Well, the art of work ceases to kill more people, while kingcraft seems to make pe more people kingship, probably. Makes more people live peacefully and happily. Our emperor has lost the spirit of kingcraft, but I should at least try my best to do something for the world. Alright. Yay, let me in, or die. What a big camp. Two friends, please stop. This is the Tashkent Prince's camp. Are you coming to enlist? Yes, we hope to speak with the Prince directly. Can you report for us? There are thousands of applicants. Our Prince respects warriors and holds banquets for each of them. You may have to wait a few days. Although the Prince said that he could be true warriors immediately. Oh, how can we prove that we are true warriors? 
There is a cave in the northeast of Baghdad which hunts hides our country's legendary Sir's Anvil. The prince said that whoever can get that thing will be considered a true warrior. Piece of cake, I'll bring it here. Wonderful. Side quest. Northeast. Could have told me that while I waited five minutes. But whatever. This oh. is it. Stop. I guess I will tame him since he's already here. Couldn't you just grab the lamp? Probably. to tame him. Or you could just... Treasure. <laughs> magic water. I also have magic bread. Wow. You could have a magic meal. What's that? That hurt. Huh? Oh, it's sort of hurt. Wow. Oh my god, she killed her. Wow, what is wrong with you, lady? I don't want you on my team. Struggling with that menu there. Jesus. God dang it, old man. Jesus, I hate those. Oh, I hate those people. The little add on people. God, they suck. Stuck again. Oh well. Oh, save. Ah, that's annoying. Okay.
Not the safe thing, that's fine. That's pretty easy to fix, but the dang... Uh, the god dang old man killing people is really annoying. I don't really have oh, that pissed me off a little bit. A lot of it, actually. She has. Nice. Yeah, she might be actually really strong to use with that one special ability she hit our girl with. Holy comic damn it. I 
not a single flame in that attack. <laughs> I just used my special ability, but that's cool. Whatever. Where's that lady I got? I don't think that's her, but let's come there anyways. Oh, that's a genius. Was it Frosty Jade? I think that's it. Out of here, baby. Eventually. That's okay. Who cares? They all die eventually. Okay, nice miss. Thank <laughs> you. 
just survived. Oh, it's good for you. Hey, camels. And we back. Yeah, I'm all way loser. No, no, it's not your turn yet. Bruh. We have brought to Sarah's animal back. It can't be, are you sure? That's the one, take a look for yourself. It's, it's real, ladies, it's really Azura's anvil. Please wait one moment, I am reporting to the prince immediately. Oh no, no. Welcome, warriors, I am the prince of Tashkent. How, how could this be? I expected muscular warriors. How could it be a thin old man and a youngster? Your Highness, we may look different from what you expected. Just taking back the Sir's Anvil should prove our capability. Uh, that's right, but but... Uh, okay then. I will believe if you if you can defeat two of the four Arab warriors by my side. You can choose whoever you want. Haha, <laughs> no need to choose. I'll take on all four. What? You, you want to take on all four? Also, if you don't mind, I'll handle them all alone. Your Highness, what should we do? Shall we fight? It might only be a bluff. Try them. Charge! And then there were none! You are so powerful! I am sorry for being disrespectful. Please accept my sincere apologies. I am Rian, the Prince of Tashkent. Welcome to our forces against the Tang Empire. To be honest, I've been very fortunate lately. I not only barred Arabic soldiers from Arabic soldiers from the Islamic Caliphate, but also encountered a warrior whose strength is on par with yours a few days ago. Like, God, Miles, the warrior of Francia. Oh, there he is. Well, what, Miles? Septum and the monk from the Tang Empire. Um, do you know each other? Yes, Your Highness. This is Septum, a Francian knight and my hometown friend, and this is a monk from the Tang Empire. Tang, the monk from the Tang Empire, and... Your Highness, please don't worry. The monk is an upright man with great skills and we are in need of more talents. Please don't give up on him. That's true, then, warriors. Please enter the camp. I've set up a banquet for all of you. Aha. Uh -huh. Oz, I didn't expect to meet you in Baghdad. Baghdad, and thank you for speaking up for us. Come on, Septim. We're from the same place. We should help each other in a foreign country, right? Right. Didn't you go after the envoy of the Tang Empire? Did you get him? Ah, forget it. We did it. We're just there reunited. Let's go to the tent and have a good chat. Oh, Lord. It's a bamboozle. Welcome, warriors. It is a pleasure to meet you two today. We, the Tashkent people, are born loving not only literature and music, but also warriors. The fighting skills you two display now deserve my praise. Amitabha. I think it's supposed to be Amida Daibutsu, right? Wasn't that what it was? I don't know. Your Highness, we are flattered. Uh, Miles is also an incredible warrior. I was in rapture when he joined our army a few days ago. Septim, the abominable Tang Empire in the East invaded the prince's country, making him lose his family. I sympathized with him very much, so I decided to join his army. Help him. Get revenge. Your Highness, if I may ask, what happened between your country and the Tang Empire? Ah, it is heartbreaking. The Tang Empire said envoys to our country. My father was hospitable by nature and held a banquet for them. Unexpectedly, they... they... Weep. It's so hateful. Highness. 
Septum, let me explain it for you. While hosting the banquet the for the envoy, the king didn't take any precautions. So the Tang Empire, Tang's army, took the opportunity to invade. They captured the Tashkit king and took him back to the capital of Tang to be beheaded. Your Highness, did my country, the Tang Empire, really do such a terrible thing? After... After they captured my father, they raped and killed our women and massacred everyone. I survived during the massacre because I managed to quickly jump into a well. But my mother, sister, wife, and people, they were all caught and killed by those monsters. Amitabha. I am so sorry that Tang Empire did such a terrible thing to you. My heart felt convulsed. Do you know who commanded the army at that time? It was the military... Governor of Angji, Marshal Gao, and his advisor Huang Lei. Huang Lei, isn't that the same guy who made the Blockwork Beast? Clockwork Beast? It must be him. He committed these atrocities without hesitation, just in order to earn himself a promotion. Warriors of the Tang know us, this uh, blood debt, but we have too little power. Would you help us? Your Highness, I have earnest words for you. It may be unpleasant, but I insist on telling you. It is indeed the fall of the Tang Empire, but the soldiers also have a family. Won't you just be making more people suffer out of resentment? Your Highness, Tashkent also believes in Buddhism, which has a concept of compassion. You must understand what I mean. Oh my god, here we go. Wait, Prince Rian! This monk just wants to persuade you to not give up on attacking the Tang Empire. Don't be fooled by him. He is from the Tang Empire, so he stands with his motherland. It is, if it was Tang Empire that had been invaded, would he advocate setting aside revenge or resentment like this? Whoa, he turned. Miles, thank you for calling me out. But they still must pay for the blood they spilled. But the people are innocent. I'm not biased. I just want to stop the fighting and reduce everyone's pain. Okay, let's say if I don't take revenge, the Tang's main... Empire's main troops are pushing towards Arabia. Why should we stop instead of them? Uh, I see it is the Tang Empire's fault. Then I'm going to the Tang campsite to find the military governor Gao Jianji and try my best to convince him to retreat. It's a pity that such incredible warriors won't work for me. What a shame. No, Prince Rian, we can't let them go! I know. The monk, this old monk has good intentions. He will, is willing to mediate for us. Your Highness, whether they convince him or not, our military operations will certainly be exposed. Besides, that monk is from the Tang Empire. What if he betrays us? I'll thank you for your suggestion. I never thought of this. <laughs> we must stop them and help lock them up in this campsite. Oh. You'll never catch me alive. Stop right there, don't move. I also make me hurt you. Aha, uh -huh, just like I predicted, they went back on their word. That Tim Ting's army is approaching and we don't have much time. I must stop them as fast as possible. Please stop them for me. The people sh Please stop them. These people should be easy for you to handle. On one of them escaped, catch this one first. Bro, what are y'all talking about? I will kill all of you. Actually. Actually! Where's my friends? Are they just chilling? Don't want to be here? That's cool. Oh wait, why can't I hurt Miles? Did he get upgraded or something? He don't hurt me either, so whatever. Uh -huh, your attacks do little to hurt me! I'll let you see my strength. Oh my god, he cheated. What the hell? Satan? Unlocked after completing the story, Fall on Night. Where, where am I? What happened? Septim, you're finally awake. I was so worried about you. Septim, you lost consciousness for a long time. We were all worried about you. Oh yes, I remember. I was defeated by Miles. 
Yeah, she defeated with you with magic. It was Satan's black magic. I was also shocked. How did Satan use Satan's magic? Did Cornelius enchant him with the magic circle when we found we're in the underworld? Someone is coming. And wah! It's Rien. We are not your enemy. Why did you send Miles to attack us? Huh, how dare you say that? How did I become your captive in the desert? Our captive? Aren't we the ones who were knocked down? What's going on? Finally awake, Captain. Master Hu Yan, what's going on? Uh, I found out that you were defeated by Miles, so I sneaked back into the camp and took Prince Rien as hostage. Fortunately, Miles and the Abbasid army are more concerned about the prince, so I finally make it to the oasis. I'm sorry, Master Hu Yan. I was too useless. Sometimes you win and sometimes you don't. Don't take it to heart. I'm so sorry to take his highness as a hostage. <laughs> you people from Tang Army are all the same. I can't believe anyone from your country anymore. Amitabha. Please, Prince. Trust me, I promise I will do my best to stop Marshal Gale. You don't need to worry. Oh no, monsters! What? Wow, they're walking fast. Monster, what happened? Above the desert, east of the oasis, settlement suddenly appeared and many ghost-like people are walking around. We gotta stay here for several days. There's only a large desert for the east. No settlements. We don't understand either. That settlement looks like the previous Tashkent on the Silk Road. Impossible! Tashkent is still further east, farther than Persia. Traveled thousands of miles to be here. How could Tashkent be near Baghdad? Why something's wrong? Either way, we're going to leave now. You should also leave as soon as possible. Okay. Let's go. Follow them. Impossible! My country has been long been annihilated by the hateful Tang Empire. How can it be here? Something's wrong. Shall we go have a look? Yes, I'm worried if it's Master Huang Wei playing tricks again. Day Desert. Mercy just told the truth. There is a settlement. How could that be? That it is Dashkin to my hometown. Unbelievable. I have been looking for food for these days, but I've never seen a settlement. Uh, I get it. Could it be in the Mirage and Legend? Mirage. This is an illusion created by the Mirage Demon, which you may see a luxurious palace or an oasis in the desert. This demon aims to lure travelers into chasing visions until they're exhausted to death. Hmm. It's unexpected that there is such a demon in the desert. We should probably save the prince. Except him, this settlement in front is unusual. I sense an aura of evil. Be careful, meow. An unusual aura of evil. Septum, there seems to be another desert mirage. I see a flying cat. Have you seen it? Meow, yes, yes. I'm a desert mirage. Just ignore me. Meow, meow, meow. Goodbye. Oh my god. Septum, the cat talked. How powerful the mirage is. We must find Prince Rian as soon as possible. Ryan. Oh, what's up, people? Oh, uh -huh. There's a well. I can't go in. Where's the prince? Give me the prince or die. This place sucks. Hmm. He's alive, I guess. What's up, man? Mr. Hu Yan, is it truly you? Amitabha, it is indeed it is I. Have we met before? Master Hu Yan, it really is you. I attended your sermon at the Buddha in Chang'an. It was incredibly enlightening. I've admired you since. And you're from Tang? Also from Tang. May I ask your name? I'm Captain Duan. I serve under the military general of Angji, Marshal Gao. You serve under the military gen governor of Angji? You're not far from Baghdad. Could it be that Marshal Gao's troops have already arrived somewhere near the Arab countries? Marshal Gao's army hasn't yet arrived yet, but there has been whispers of 
The scent from Tang Rule heard across the western regions. I was ordered to go ahead to Arab countries to investigate. I see. So what are about these ghostly visions? I have absolutely no idea. When the merchants and I walked here, these strange images and figures appeared out of nowhere, scaring them all away. All of them away. Oddly enough, the visions looked reminded me of those I saw when the Tang army was hunting the Prince of Tashkent down. Tashkent down. Are they scenes of the past? Indeed, take a look. There's a copy of Lord Huang Lei and I. The whole thing is really baffling. See, they don't react to us at all. Could this all be a mirage? I've never heard of someone that can actually enter the mirage. By the way, Master Hu Yan, why have you come to this remote desert in the western regions? I had been traveling around with the caravans, but ever since I heard there would be a major conflict between the Tang and Arab countries, I wanted to see what I could do to stop them. Alas, it's rather complicated. Last year, our army was sent on an expedition to Tashkent, learning from the art of war. Lord Huang Lei used deception to destroy Tashkent without endangering our own forces. But unexpectedly, the Prince of Tashkent escaped by the sewers. It's said he has gained the support of, from the Abbasid Caliphate and is planning to on invading Tang. Heard more or less the same. It was wrong of the Tang to use such men. No wonder the Prince of Tashkin wants revenge. Suppose that when Rian saw the shadows of the former Bull Tang army, he was scared into hiding in the sewers, just like how he escaped last time. Rian? Except we've got a point. That well might be the entrance to the sewers. So let's head down and find him. That's who, yeah, and I'll go with you too. Okay. We keep gathering allies. Huzzah. Oh, somebody broke that bridge. How dare they? How dare they? No, wrong building. You almost got me. Uh... Oh crap, I forgot. Nice. See you later, alligator. After a while, crocodile. Hippity hoppity. Can I learn a new ability? I get him thunder. What's that? Boom, Shakalaka. That's not as strong as the other one, I don't think. Maybe it is. I don't know. Yes, my sword proficiency has increased. Does it increase every time I level up? It seems like it. Which means I should have been using it at the start of the game, but I'm an idiot. Huzzah! I'll definitely use the track ram against these though, because that thing was to hurt her for some reason. Treasure. 
trash. I feel like most stuff in the chests are trash, actually, but whatever. Trash everywhere! Oh, that's cool. Holy Light Sword! has reached this max level, which does something, I'm sure. It's a trap! Uh, how dare they. chest. A dulcet fruit. With all the swords of ceiling combined, I can make a super sword of ceiling. Allegedly. I did get more proficiency, so I'm cool. Ah, uh, yes. What's up, man? I found him. Prince Rihanna's over here. Father, mother, how could this be? Prince Rihanna, we finally found you. Oh, don't touch me. Go away. Go away. You were despicable, Tang. In the guise of friendship, you slaughtered my entire family. Alas, the prince must have witnessed the Tang troops burning, killing, and plundering his home. He must have drove him, driven him to mad. Master Huyan, is this phantom of the Prince of Tashkent that escaped at the time? Oh, that's not a phantom. It's the Prince of Tashkent himself. <laughs> Stand up, mastermind of the insurgency who turned Arab countries and Western regions against the Celestial Empire. Get up, I'm taking you B-words back to Chang'an and flaying you to death to deter the Western regions. But Duan, stop. I know the type of person Prince Rian is. This matter is obviously the Tang Dynasty's fault. I won't let you harm him. But he's a mastermind behind the insurgency. Amitabha, it is understandable that Prince Brienne wanted revenge. I can't bear to be harsh. Master Hu Yan, I am a royal soldier of Tang. The leader of our enemy on the battlefield is right in front of us. I can't let you. Is it true that you acted dishonorably when attacking Tashkent? Yes, on that day, Lord 
Wang Lei said that our army lacked the strength for the battle after traveling such a long distance, so he thought that we should deceive them to reduce our losses. How about, did you think it was the right thing to do? Alas, I'm still struggling with the matter. The people of Tashkent are honest and hospitable, yet we have slaughtered them by taking advantage of their good nature. I must admit to my feelings of guilt. Mitaba, I'm glad that you haven't gone straight like Huang Lei and have kept the Dharma in your heart. Then what about the prince? Shall we let him go? Mitaba, the Arab countries will surely keep to up the fight against the Tang Empire should Prince Rian return. It may be best if we retain him for the time being. The prince is a good man, but his vengeance had affected all those around him. I do this for the peace of the world, but I can't bear to see the prince fall into darkness for my ace hatred. Master Huyan, I appreciate your thoughtfulness. I almost made a great mistake. Mitaba, thank you for your mercy. I won't let the prince go. I shall take the responsibility of his care from now on. Please forgive my interview. Master Huyan, I trust you in that case. I will no longer concern myself with this matter. Okay. Oh, hell. Lord of Wang Lei! Captain Dua, you dare collaborate with the enemy? Lord of Wang! Deal with you later. Seize the barbarian prince! Lord of Wang, don't do this! We had wronged them first! Don't touch me! Don't touch me! <laughs> you B words, don't touch Prince Rian! Have to be careful, this Wang Lei has no shadow. He may be also be a mirage of this place. Or the Mirage Demon. Man is no official of the Tang Empire. He's the Mirage King, a cruel monster of the desert. Meow, yeah, in the deserts of Egypt. There also used to be such monsters who would summon mirages from the wish fears of wishes of man. Meow meow. Dima Yi! So you have the help of monsters. How boring. What's your purpose making such illusions? My purpose? To show my hospitality, of course. Hospitality? And the Mirage King, after all. It is so rare to see someone passing through my lands, and so I decided to create these illusions from this friend's memory to welcome you. Ah, but Lord Rian was almost driven mad by you. This is no way to show hospitality at all. Oh, but this was exactly my purpose, and I was so close to success. For so many years, I have been trying to prove to the world that there is no difference between reality and illusion, but people don't usually don't understand such things. Amitabha, this world may be like a dream, but illusions are always illusions. They can't be real. Enough of your nonsense, bald man. Why don't you see for yourself if you can defeat my illusions? Right, here we go, he's a crab. He's a pissed off crab. Alright, friend. Take this. Illusion of this boy. Bloody shit. Oh, I heard that. Became a crab. Oh wait, no, he's a treasure chest. Sorry, <laughs> my brain's dead. Lord, he's always been a crab.
nothing bound to hurt him. Oh, there we go. Back him up. Oh my god, what the hell? I was just thinking how he wasn't doing much damage and then he murdered her. I can't hurt him anyway, so... Wait a minute, stop fighting, you're not today's main guest. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> dun, dun. Oh, shit. Wait, stay your hand. I spent too much effort in creating this barrage of Tosh Kent. Don't make excuses. How can a mirage match reality? Meow, I saw through your Tashkent mirage immediately. It was no big deal, meow meow. My primary goal today was to welcome the prince. I didn't know there would be so many monsters, so I didn't hide my spirit. If you believe my illusions are so easy to see through, I wonder how you will fare with my next one. What the hell? What's going on? Why are we in the desert? The well, in the sewers were mere illusions created by the Mirage King. Only the desert before us now is real. That's why the illusions disappeared after we defeated him, Meow Meow. How strange. He shouldn't be working with Lord Satan, should he? Baba, why haven't these flying desert mirages disappeared yet? As for Yan, these aren't mere illusions. They've been following me for a while. You could call them my friends. So we're just friends, huh? And we're going back. I told you that Samton wouldn't be fooled so easily. Why didn't you listen to me, Meow Meow? Wait, pet number two. Didn't you agree not to worry about Septum? Why don't you keep that agreement? Now the Septum, you should really choose your friends carefully. Where... Where is here? Go tap in! I dreamt that I returned to my hometown! <laughs> Amitabha, Prince Rian, this world is impermanent. You can treat it as a fond dream. So yeah, we've already wasted much time. We have to hurry to the tank camp. Indeed, I must persuade Marshal, Marshal Gal to retreat before the war began. What about what about me? Can I leave now? Your Highness, your the Arab countries are sure to start war if you return. I'm afraid you must stay with me until the Tang army retreats. But, didn't you say you were going to Tang camp? Would I be killed? Very not. I won't let Tang army find you. I swear on my life that you'll be free of them. Of harm. The Tang have proven themselves unworthy. I cannot believe you. Sir Hu Yan, I I'm also heading to the Tang camp to report to Jia Dushi. Dushi. I'm going to the Oasis to arrange camels and drink water. After that, we can travel together. Yuan, I implore that you do not tell the Tang army that Prince Tashkan is with us. 
or not, I know when I've got to do the right thing, please rest assured. Let's be on, let's get ready to head out. I don't want to go inside the thingy. Hey. I never heard about this Mirage King monster before. Oh, whatever. Septima, I don't know if Lord Satan can find you. You must... you have been out of his range for a long time. Even better, I don't want to meet him. I don't know if he will... we will meet Satan's subordinates in other places. Woof woof. Yay. Okay, so I don't get proficiency from level up. Oh my god. Why didn't you say that beforehand? Where the hell are we supposed to- oh, what? Where am I supposed to go? No way says! Bruh. Broken? Okay. Now I'm just walking on my own. What is going on? I had to hit the spacebar key back there for that to happen, but I don't know what the point was. Hmm. If I had the space key, like, walks along the road. Yeah. Oh, maybe... Stop it. I am so confused, actually. Oh yeah, I had his space on that edge. Okay, cool. Let's go. Got the food and water ready. We'll have to walk a long way back. Thank you, Captain Duan. Now all I need is to do is convince Marshal Gal to stop the war. Master Yuan, won't do us any good to overthink it too much. We shall hurry up and head to Tank's camp. Yay, camels. Be right back. Grabbing a. Mmm. Let's wait for a pause. Okay. At the same time, in the. Pa oh, God. In the Palace of the Arabian Empire. I've heard that the Prince of Tashkent was kidnapped by Tang Bandits soon after he came here to ask us for troops. So far. Only 82 degrees in here. My god. Things I do to not have my AC make annoying noises. The last time the Maga Harbor, Haribla, rose up, the tanks and their armies to help the Umayyad Caliphate suppress us and kill our men. Huh. The Tang Empire has indeed been too arrogant. Do you think we should teach them a lesson? Oh, Caliphate, back then, we sending troops to Tashkent's prince to help him take revenge. Now that he's nowhere to be found, there's no need for us to pick fights. I don't think this would be wise, Lord Solomon, Suleiman. The Tang Empire is powerful and has already annexed many countries. His troops are also eyeing us and may attack at any time. They have been pushing their borders westwards. In my view, we should take the initiative and deploy our troops to resist the Tang invasion. What? Well said, Suleiman, we dad. In the defense of Islam, I order you to lead your troops immediately and launch an attack on the Tang Empire. I Septim took Prince away and messed up my whole plan. It. My body has not felt well as late. It's as if a powerful force has been striking me from within. But my head hurts. My head hurts so much. What's going on? Not so. What's up? Congratulations, my lord. The day of your awakening has finally arrived. Cornelius, weren't you already? Darn, my head, my head! He's becoming Satan. Yeah, go camels, go!
palace, wherever that is. I thought we were going to Chang'an. These are the western regions. If we continue heading east from here, we'll eventually arrive at my homeland, the Tang Empire. What's up, man? Stop, who goes there? I'm Captain Duan in service of Marshal Gao. These fellas are merchants traveling together with me. So it's you, Captain Duan. The Marshal informed us that you were up ahead. I'll speak with the Marshal first. You can follow me in later. Strange, this is still Arab territory. What is the Tang army doing here already? Seems that the Tang army marched at a pace much faster than I expected. Must speak with Marshal Gao as soon as possible. If they've already marched their troops so far, why would they turn back from just a few words? Prince Rian, just let Master Hu Yan try his way first. It won't hurt in any case. By the way, if you meet any Tang, just remember that we are merchants. Don't give us away. Eh. Yay! Oh, that guy's freaking out, bro. Huh? So many soldiers? What is this? Isn't this obvious enough that you want to sell me out to the Tang? Master Huyan, the canyon is the eastern border of the Arab countries close to the Talos River. We consider the normal marching speed. The Tang army shouldn't have arrived here yet. It must be as you said, they forced to force march all the way here. Amitabha, truth be told, this whole thing seems to be going in unexpected directions. Captain Duan, could you please go ask around for us? Got it, Master Hua. Hmm. Ah. Hmm. What's wrong, Septon? What are you looking at? Ah. Master Uyan, don't you think this can looks like a perfect site for an ambush? I was thinking the same thing, but get my mouth shut out of fear that they would hear me. My experience, one does not set up an ambush without knowing the enemy's route and schedule first. If we deploy an ambush too early and without knowing when the enemies will come, we're more likely to get exposed, which would put us at a disadvantage. Are you saying that the Tang has learned the plans of the Sarakskin army? Very possible. This explains why they marched here as fast as possible. My old job was to secretly collect intelligence about enemy operations and launch surprise attacks on them. That's what, how we achieved so many victories, so I'm quite familiar with the signs. Uh, but it looks like the situation has gotten really tricky now. The Tang army is confident in victory. It'll be hard, extremely hard to persuade them to retreat. If they do win the battle, they'll definitely continue to push westward. Get out of here. Master Huiyan, Marshal Gao's troops are still far behind. This army is the vanguard led by Lord Huang Lei. Huang Lei, not Marshal Gao. That's right, he's already heard you're, that you're here. Lord Huang Lei said that you're an old friend of his and an assistant that I travel for to tell you that he'd like to meet you. Abba, this isn't good at all. Didn't expect that Huang Lei would be here and said. Marshal Gao. He will be much trickier to him. Master, shall we decline? Hey, Taba, since we've come this far, there's no reason for me to back down. Septum, please take care of Prince Rian later. I'll go speak with Huang Lei alone. In that case, I'll head back to Lord Huang and know that. to let Lord Huang know that you're coming. I think we should go with him and take Rian with us. Uh oh. Ah, hell. He can teleport now. Miles, weren't you supposed to be in the Tosh camp, camp in Baghdad? What are you doing here? Who are you, Miles? Are you here to rescue me? I am so touched. I have been kidnapped by these Tang bandits. Hurry up and he's gonna kill you, bro. How dare you? Who the hell are you to speak with the devil in such a tone? Uh oh. Who are you, Miles? What's the matter with you? Aren't you here? Here to help me? <laughs> Miles is no more. The great soul inside his body has finally awakened. Sorry. Cordelius, you're a monster. What have you done to him? I remember what you did in hell last time. Ha <laughs> ha ha, what have I done? I just helped his soul to awaken on its own. Don't you think so, Lord Satan? What? He's the devil, Satan. 
That's right, Septim. I am the legendary Satan of your precious Bible. Piles was simply the name I used when I reincarnated as a human. After acquiring a human body, all my memories had disappeared, and so my loyal subordinate, the Dread King, ensured that I would awaken. Oh, Miles, as a Templar, you spent so much time hunting and murdering those who don't believe in God when you were the real devil all along. <laughs> what you're saying is just so hilarious. Let me ask you this. If God upheld the values of fraternity, do you really think he would send someone to pers persecute those who don't believe in him? Anyone who is not a complete fool knows that it would never have been the case. Those were all elaborate plans of mine. Hundreds of years ago, I ordered my subordinates to infiltrate the church, tamper with the word of God, seize positions of power, and encourage the men of God to hunt down heretics. No wonder the church has become so murderous and cruel. Turns out it was all you're doing. Thank you for the compliment, Septim. Now that the underworld and westworld have fallen into my grasp, the east is my next target. Tens of thousands of years ago, we fought against God side by side. Once more, you and I shall join forces and conquer the world! What are you talking about? Miles, you've been hypnotized by Cornelius. Uh, looks like your memories of your souls hasn't recovered yet. Fine, I'll prove what I just said to you. In the name of Satan, I summon you. Reveal yourself, my loyal servant, Nicole. Septim, who is summoning me? Why is there an intense order of the underworld? Nicole, take a better look. One in front of your eyes, who is he? Lord Satan, what are you doing here? Lord Satan, I didn't know that Miles was in fact you. I'm terribly sorry for striking at you with my bolts of lightning. You believe me now, Septim? I assigned Nicole to your side to tempt you to join us in the underworld, but to my surprise, your influence was enough to make her join you for real. How useless. Forget it, Islam and Tang Empire are about to wage war on one another. I've been looking forward to this day, enough to inform the Tang of all the movements of the Islamic armies. What the? So the Tang it came up with the plan for this ambush because you're been leaking them intelligence? That's right, Septum. If your members have come back, you would remember that there's nothing more I love than fear, darkness, and chaos. It took me a pretty long time to awaken, so I'm not expecting you to restore your memories immediately and give me your answer. I surely miss the time when we challenge God together. I'll wait for you to awaken on your own and join us willingly. God. Oh my god! Darn it, what the on earth is going on? The time in what language were you speaking just now that we couldn't understand at all? Prince Rien, Miles has betrayed us. He's been leaking information on the Islamic army to the Tang. What? Why would worry you my ills? Baba, it's the war between the Tang Empire and Arab countries destined to break out. Alas. Master Huyan, I'm going... I've got to meet Huang Lei with you together. We can take him as a hostage if necessary. Yep, here we go again. It'll be safe as staying around here. Just go by yourselves. Alright, screw it. I don't care. You sure? Man. Alright. Oh my god, they ate the old man. Well, you hate to see that happen. Oh no, he's with me. Sorry, my bad. Lord Huang, Master Huyan is here to see you. Oh, what a guest of honor. It's been a while, Master Huyan. Perfect timing. Come to look, take a look at this recent completed clockwork beast. Not bad, isn't it? Amitabha, Wang Lei, you and I have known each other for a long time, so let's cut to the chase. Can you tell me why, who you're planning to ambush by stationing your troops in this canyon? See through my plan in a single glance, you're indeed a wise man. Based on our intelligence, the countries of the western regions have colluded with the Abbasid Caliphate to attack the Tang Empire. Marshal Gao has ordered me to set up an ambush and eliminate the barbarians once and for all. I heard that you took advantage of the trust of Tashkent to destroy them. Is that true? Know about this? Indeed, I'm deeply puzzled as to your motives. Master Huyan, have you ever read The Art of War or heard the phrase, All is fair in war? Back then, our troops had already traveled a 
long distance instead of fighting to the bitter end. It was much better to use a little bit of wisdom. We managed to eliminate the enemy without losing a single soldier. A true display of the Tang's empire's power and prestige. Your actions have completely ruined the Tang's empire reputation. In the western regions, how do you consider that? Oh, these countries in the western regions are weak, small, and filled with barbarians. They don't have a say in how the Celestial Empire deals with them. Alas, what kind of talk is that? You're indeed lost, completely lost. Master Hu Yan, your wards have such me. I've always seen loyal to the Empire as a soldier. It is my duty to serve my country in its wars. Amitabha, are you ser really saying that you're supposed to harm the good and kill the innocent as you wish? Is this what you call duty? I mean, this stubborn old monk is such a pain in the butt. I've improved the clockwork beast that you defeated last time. If you want to get in my way today, you'll have to get through it first. Alright, dude. Alright. Alright. Alright, dude. Actually, screw this. Those gears. It's not. Oh my God! They're hurting me. much as you said, honestly. Unless it has like a second form after you kill it. Oh my god, it has a great head! Who did she just see all? Yeah. Oh, she didn't heal. Okay, so she's charging me, I guess. Yeah, I just want to see what happens. Super effective or not. Second form. Is that really an upgrade though? 
I would argue no, probably. <laughs> oh, laser beams. Okay, that's kind of an upgrade, sure. My god, he is shooting laser beams! Oh, that was my check. Okay, sick. Frosty Jade. Gave you popping off, bro. Okay, so good job, man. Darn, how dare you destroy my clockwork beast? Guards, guards. Now, if you destroy my clockwork beast without even a shred of mercy, but these are human beings made of flesh and blood. I'd like to see how you deal with them, old monk. Please stop this, Lord Huang! Why do you have to push Master Huyan so far? Back off, Captain Duan! Since when were petty officials at, such as you even a say in such matters? Lord, Lord Huang, but, but... Oh, they're speaking in Chinese. Huyan, we better get out of here while we can. As for stopping the war, we'll have to wait until later. Ass, what a pity. <laughs> booking it. Rian, hurry up and come with us! <laughs> nice. Uh oh. Ah, hell. This is bad. Ah, hell. Going on, Huyan. Where did this army come from? And the uh, Abyssin Caliphate's troops. It's it's too late for everything. What? Advance. Kill these Arab barbarians. Oh my God. It's murder. Well, we didn't work that one out. Oh. Old man, you promised to give Instinct Army to stop this war, and this is the result. Man, this kind of thing isn't supposed to be easy. Master Huyan is trying to his part to stop all this. Thank you for understanding, Septim, but this time all my efforts have been entirely in vain. Septim, I have one favor to ask you. Turn back time. There are anything you need. I owe Prince Rian a great debt. Since I failed him once, I shall not break that promise again. Decide to head down there to join the fray. Please take care of Prince Rian for me. Take him away from the battlefield safely and return him to Baghdad. Sir Huyan, are you are you sure you to go down there to fight? If after everything is said and done, it all comes down to his empire. Why bother with all your high and mighty words saying that what you act for the sake of all humans? Prince Rian, you're wrong about me. As a monk, I must make my last effort to separate these two armies with my martial arts. What are you trying to get yourself killed? I, I was speaking in anger, that's all. Please don't act so unrationally. I'm counting on you, Septim. How did it turn out like this? <laughs> in addition to martial arts, Master Yan has also always instructed me about something else, Kingcraft. He never liked from me, but with his own behavior, he always showed me what Kingcraft was. In fact, the old man cared about nothing but to destroy my enemies. The old me cared nothing for nothing. Oh, whatever, birds. It was Master Yan that taught me to always care about the happiness and peace of others. Truth be told, I do admire him a lot. That's why I wanted to visit his country for a better understanding of the Kingcraft he spoke of. Aren't you worried about him? There aren't many Ang or Arabian soldiers. It seems they're, that they're only vanguard troops. Nothing that Master Huyan can't handle. Let's go. I promise to protect you. We should climb up this path. See if we can find anywhere safer. Oh my god. We are under attack.
Six twenty-two. We're starting to get there. Gilwood, what is that? weapon experience points go to this sword. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure. Yay. Oh. Ambush. It's a ramp. Oh my god, I poked myself in the eyeball. Jesus. Please stop. Hurry up, Prince Rian. Hello? Oh my god. He's about to more shorts him. No, he's not. Oh, the battle at the Teal is so fierce. Over there, there are enemies there too. I curse the Tang, there's nowhere to run. Well done, I am not Tang Soldier, I am Rian, Prince of Tashkent, one of your allies. Charge kill them! Princess is how battle works. Once one loses himself in the slaughter, whatever you say is useless. How? How come back then? It was I that launched the coalition. Seems that this place is not safe enough either. We should push forward. But you're a dingus. You're a dingus. And we all knew it. Just spawn or something? Yeah, it looks like it. Wait, no. Just a dead end still. What the hell are we supposed to be doing here? Oh, no! Great googly moogly! This is an ambush! Yes, I don't know. I am confused. Wait. Oh. Wait. Yeah, what the hell? That's weird. 
Uh, I'm stuck. So, oh. Oh, there we go. Weird. That was a weird interface, but we did it. Oh my god! <laughs> we made it! Yes, it's a miracle. Oh no, Arab soldiers! Having climbed so high, we should be a little safe on our right. Well, I wonder how the battle's going down there. Not too good. A lot of dead people. There's long. Our troops seem to be outnumbered by the sacred army. They're struggling on the battlefield. It's all because that old monk who we on. Were it not for him, we would have time had time to set up an ambush. We lose this battle. It's all that traitor's fault. Wait, Lord Huang, where are you going? Stay here and keep the enemies pinned down. I'll head back to the stronghold. Request reinforcements from the government. Lord Huang, that's a job for a messenger. Our troops are still struggling in battle. If the commander leaves now, they're sure to panic. Captain Duan, are you telling me how to do my job? If I don't go now, I may soon be in grave danger. Report! What is it now? Our reinforcements have arrived. Marshal Gao is leading them in person. Whoa. Huh? Uh-oh. More tank soldiers have arrived. Uh, is that bloody Marshal Gao with them too? But the strange thing is, there are supposed to be more soldiers in his army. Why aren't they here as well? The Master Hui on now. He's in front, still trying to figure out how to separate the two armies. Oh, there he is. I see him too. That's strange. Look, he is fighting both the Arab and Tang soldiers, but he's not killing them, just pushing them away. Both armies are attacking him. What the hell is he thinking? Even to this moment, he's still thinking about stopping this war. There are too many, so many Tang soldiers now. I hope Master will be fine. Oh my god. Don't you need to be down there? Darn these Tangs, this is an ambush. Kill them all! Seems this place is not safe enough either. We better keep climbing. Perfect. Wongley. Long lay reporting for duty. What was going on here? Didn't I order you to come to play an ambush here? I'm sure this is all the traitor who Yan's fault. He conspired with those Arab barbarians and leaked our plans. Lord Huang, stop accusing an innocent man like that. The Saracen army arrived earlier than expected. It was our own negligence that we didn't expect them to take a shortcut. In Duan, what nonsense are you talking about? What is it? Wasn't it this old monk who disrupted our plans? You were the one who challenged him with that clockwork beast, and that's why our plan got delayed. That's enough. Shut up, both of you. You bunch of fools. It's, I'll figure out what happened after we return to camp. Right now, our priority is to deal with the ab these Abbasid barbarians. Oh, hell. What's up, man? Master Hu Yan. I'm glad that you're not hurt. I was really worried about that you would get killed over something that I just said in anger. Thank you for your concern, you two. I was fighting for what I believed all my life, not just for something so superficial, Amitabha. It's just that Prince Ryan. My apologies. I just did what I could until the very end, but still I can't stop this war. It's okay, but what now? Are you going down there and fight again? Well, there are too many soldiers, no matter how hard I try to separate. It will only be in vain. The Tang army has now gained the upper hand, and this Marshal Gal is an old acquaintance. 
Looks like I'll have to wait until the Tang army lands to politely persuade Je Gal. General, let's withdraw his troops. As to Leon, I believe that your motives are pure. I apologize for my rude and offensive wars in the past. Danger, enemy is in sight. Still quite dangerous here. Let's take Prince Rian to somewhere safer for shelter. What was doing? Grass. Kill wood. Ah, uh, hail's hey, dead end. Nice. The safest place. Dead end. Looks like there's no way through here. Can't go down for the moment. We better stay here for now and wait out our, the battle. Look, a huge army of air troops are reinforcing the battle. Ah, uh, hail. Here comes our girl. Marshal, Marshal Gal, bad news! But what's all the fuss about? Marshal, there's a large army coming to reinforce the Saracen army. Our troops have gotten a second wind and our, our... Our enemies have gotten a second wind and our troops are gradually... Getting overwhelmed, please give me the order for our next move. Marshal Gal, what? Well, we have nothing to be worried about. There's still another army of 10,000 soldiers advancing toward it. Tell them to get... They're here as soon as possible. Double time. I at our, your command. Amitabha, how could the situation turn out like this? What a surprise! Now the Arabian armies have gained the upper hand. Arabian warriors don't seem afraid of death at all. Fighting and killing with them, is all they've got. The tank soldiers lack such morale, so they're fighting just because they've been ordered to. Muslims believe they are dying fighting for Allah. Their soul is going to go straight to heaven. That's why they're willing to fight for the better end. Report more bad news. What's the matter now? Didn't I tell you to order the tr troops to come quickly as they can? I'm sure, Gal, since you rushed forward to support Lubutur Wang, many of our troops are still far behind. They won't be able to make it in time. What nonsense! Didn't I make it here just fine, useless fools? How many won't be able to make it? Marshal, about more than half of them. Much more than half? Marshal, yeah, bad news! Useless, a bunch of useless fools. Eh? Spit it out. Absent Caliphate. Spread a rumor through the western regions that our armies have plundered their lands on our march home. The countries of the western regions have revolted and started to attack our rear forces. What? Darn it, how dare those barbarians switch sides right before the war. But guys, the, the tables have turned. Marshal Gal looks really pissed off. Like the battle's over and the Tang Empire has lost this one. Ah, you reap what you sow. The Tang Empire has committed too many ungrateful, unfaithful, and unrighteous misdeeds. This is exactly what they deserve. 
Perhaps the Arabian troops can march all the way to the capital of Chang'an. Tarian, I, if I asked you to persuade the Arab country to withdraw their troops, would you be willing to me? You want me to persuade the Arab Arabian army to retreat? Are you kidding me? The Tang Empire destroyed my homeland for no reason, and now the Arabian army is finally exacting some revenge. I'm more than happy to watch this happening. Prince Rian, what if I were to beg in the name of the lives of all those who are going to die if this war can end? Well, I am. Um, Rian, I was planning on going to the Tang camp and playing Marshall myself if they had won. But now that the tide has turned, I have no acquaintances in the Arab countries to appeal to. I must beg you to take up the task on my behalf, not just for me, but all those who die if the war goes on. Tell them that vengeance has been exacted and persuade them to retreat. Hearing your words, reluctant though I am, I am not going to say no, but the Caliph was already quite upset with the Tang Empire when they aided the Umayyads. He just used my situation as an excuse to get back at the Tang Empire. Uh, so that's what this war is really about. This war just destined Amitabha? Just take a good look around, Huang Lei. Look at all the sins you've committed in the name of glory and wealth. The poor bad news behind us. Shut up! So gal. Retreat, retreat, all units retreat. So gal, our soldiers are still fighting on the front lines. If we fall back like this now, we will just be leaving them to die. Captain Duan, Marshal Gal's decision is for the greater good. Have you heard the saying that a man of great ambition does not bother about trifles? A petty official should not question others. But we're their superiors. If we flee and leave them behind, the men fighting for us, how can we face anyone in the future? God dang it, Captain Duan. Last, I'm the Marshal, not you. When I say retreat, you better do as I command. Let's get out of here. Ah! Hmm. Uh. Now oh, this isn't going good. Dang armies collapsing so much for their mastery of war. There were way fewer Arabs in this battle, but they still won in the end. And this is exactly what they deserve after all the unfaithful and dishonorable deeds they've committed. If the heavens smile upon us, the Islamic armies will cut through the Tang Empire and make those B words taste my pain as their empire burns around them. Uh, what on earth should I do? What should I do now? Buddha, please instruct this fool. Please tell me how to just stop this devastating calamity. Last for more than 30 years, I've never killed a single creature, let alone a human. I've always upheld mercy and compassion, but today blood and death have become inevitable. What a horrible shame. Buddha, I am willing to sacrifice my life to ease the souls of the soldiers that are about to die by my hand. Buddha... Merciful Buddha, I beg you to lead their souls to the other side. I shall carry their sins alone, Amitabha. Septim, I would like to ask you a favor. Sure, anything you need. Throughout our journey, I'm happy to have called you my closest friend. I must go down there and stop the Saracen army from... If I'm killed in this suing battle, please cremate my body and take my ashes to Shaolin Temple in the Tang Empire, the place where I was raised and trained. What are you talking about? Didn't you say that you wouldn't enter the fray again? Obviously, it's because the Tang Empire is losing, so now he's gonna enter. That's funny. If the Arab countries invade the Tang Empire, I'm afraid the war may drag on for years. I'm not wise enough to think of any th other way, another way to prevent this calamity from spreading. But if the Tang Empire won, I don't know. It, it seems like he's really taking a side here. He's just acting like he's not. Except him, as you can see, the arts of war and deception are by no means everything. And having lost the spirit of Kingcraft, the Tang Empire now is absolutely no match for the Arab country. Please promise me that you will never get your perceived. Seek the true meaning of Kingcraft and bring the idea back to your homeland. 
I'm sorry for not being able to accompany you any further, but I'm sincerely honored to share this journey with you. As to who yawns, since things have already gone down like this, why do you have to... Septum, you know I can't change who I am. Please take good care, Prince Rian. I'm counting on you. In the earthly world, Dama is still beyond reach, just like the clouds floating above, high above the mountain, in the canyon and under the sand I shall be buried. Together with my unfulfilled dream and deepest sorrow, I plan to travel to India and learn more about the Dharma. But now this dream of mine seems to be out of reach. I am Master Huiyan, a man of the Tang Empire. While I stand, you shall go no further. Those that you defeated are just vanguards. There are countless monks as mighty as me in the Tang Empire. You're still going to evade Tang. You will do so over my dead body. Uh, weren't you the old monk that was trying to help the Tang army but refused to kill anyone? What's so scary about you? Master Huyang, isn't this, isn't this suicide? No matter how strong martial arts are, it's impossible for him to defeat all those Arab warriors only by himself. The old master has always been merciful. How can he cut his way through so many? I understand why Master Huyang is doing this. I'm trying to make the Arab think that there are other mighty warriors defending the Tang Empire. Consider the price they'll pay if they insist on marching further. This is his way of trying to avoid more men being killed in the future. This is his last gift for us. It sacrificed his life to teach us the true essence of Kingcraft. Ah, hail. There are tank soldiers here. Well, wait a second. We're not your enemies. How's this? I just saw you. We're in this together with the tank monk down there. Oh, what's up, guys? Septim, what are you doing, Dad? Doing here? The dad? What, what, Dad? These two saved the ticket army. Please allow us to handle them. No, wait. They're just travelers. I've met them before in Damascus. You just wait down here. I'll have a word with them. Septim, I didn't expect that we would meet here. Truth be told, I never thought we'd never see each other again. This is great. Do you guys know each other? Or just tell him I am the Prince of Tashkent, one of his allies. I am not with the Ting army. Oh, so you're the Prince of Tashkent. Very pleased to meet you. The army of Baghdad of yours is still stuck in the swamp area for now. Commander Suleiman and my own troops are, cur are currently making battle. Dad, congratulations on your triumph over the Tang Empire, but are you here to capture me? Septim, what the hell are you talking about? Just put your sword down. I'm here to rescue you. Rescue me? Yeah, that Tang monk on a killing spree down the hill. Our men just saw you with were with him earlier. So I'm caught between a rock and a hard place. I wouldn't want to, you to get attacked for no good reason. But on the other hand, I cannot explain it to my men if I just let you go. So how about this? You pretend to be my captives for the moment and come with me. That's it. This way, no questions will be raised and no one will attack you. See, and you'll go. Let us go once the war ends, right? Of course, you're not really my captives. Please trust with Dad. An excellent idea, Septum. Let's do that, shall we? Dad, thank you for doing this. I could trust you. Thank you for your trust, Septum. These two have surrendered to me. From here on now on, they're my captives. No one lays a hand on them without my permission. Commander we're dad. Things should be alright now. Let me get you out of this battlefield. Heck. Way, way, way. Meanwhile, on the battlefield in the valley. Rest in peace, old man. Be careful, this guy's a demon. Go around and stay away from him. Oh, is he dead? He must be dead. Watch out for the demon. Go around from his both sides and make haste.
I know he was planning on stopping the Tang Empire if they won, but it's kind of funny that when the Tang Empire is winning, he's like, oh, we'll just have to wait for the battle to end, and then I'll talk to him. And then when the other side's winning, he's like, oh yeah, I gotta kill them all. I mean, you could say that's because Rien said that he probably wouldn't... I mean, he said he would try, but... I don't know. It just... Master Hu Yan. High above the mountain. A foolish of you, old master. If you had left us alone and continued your journey, things wouldn't have turned out like this. Accept him. But dad, keep your distance. This guy should have been dead, but two of our soldiers were killed as soon as they approached him. Oh, dad, this thing is definitely a monster. Except him, given my position, there's no, really nothing I can do to save him. I'm terribly sorry. Not your fault, Wood Dad. I'm not blaming you at all. He was without a doubt a great mentor. I've learned so much. I had never thought about before him, from him. Dad, I hope you create me the Master's body and take his ashes to his homeland in the Tang Empire. I have no problem with that, but none of my men can get any closer to his body. Not a problem. I'll do it myself. I can help too, as a show of respect to the old master. Farewell, Master Ruat Yan. In 751 AD, the Abbasid Caliphate and Tang Empire, the two of the most empire, powerful empires of the East and West, fought a battle in Talos. The Tang Empire suffered a great defeat with most of its troops completely wiped out. After the battle, the Tang's empire control over the western region was severely undermined. It could no longer deploy troops in East Central Asia. This moment also marked the ascendancy of the Abbasid Caliphate, which slowly but surely surpassed the Tang Empire to become the most advanced country of its time. I'd be like that. Dad, the war has ended. I promised Master Hu Yan that I would take his ashes back to the Tang Empire. Hope you can take Prince Rian to Baghdad in my place. That won't do. You'll be heading back to Damascus with me. What? That's not what you promised me. I haven't broken my promise, well not entirely at least. Mr. Yin has got back his freedom, but as for you, I have another plan. From now on, you'll be my slave. You'll come back with me, never to return to the Tang Empire. What the hell? Dad, what on earth are you saying? Kindy misses you so much. If you stay with us forever, they're sure to be pleased. And of course, no one will near be nearly as pleased as me. Dad, I really appreciate your kindness, but I promised Master Eon to take his ashes back to the Tang Empire. Huh. I knew you'd say something like that. Guards! Yes, Commander Wadad. The slave is an accomplice of that Tang monk. He's trying to escape to Tang Empire. Stop him. What? You're being, you're being a dick. Good luck with that. But Dad, what are you? I've always had my own way of doing things. Sorry. Septim, you won't be harmed if you do as she says. The Tang Empire has already lost the power of Islam. You don't really need to go there. That won't do. I've noticed it already. This girl seems to have weird intentions for Septim. Nicole, I'm impressed that you actually have guts to say that. Who was the first one to have weird intentions for him, meow meow? That's enough. I can decide for myself where to go. I don't need anyone else to decide for me. I, my head, it hurts so much. What's going on? Ouch, my head, it feels like I'm getting torn apart. Septim, are you okay? Is it because what Dad and Kama are being so outrageous that they drove you to fury? <laughs> yeah. Stupid Nicole, stop talking nonsense. It's a greater miracle greater than the pyramids that you didn't get a headache from you, meow. Ouch, my head, my body. Septim! Five years later, 756 AD. Cap second capital of the Arabian Empire, Baghdad, residence of Septum. What the hell? Oh, it was just a dream. There were a lot of things from the past in my dream. Prince Ali, fabulous he, Ali Obabwa. What is this place? What a magnificent city. Nicole? Nicole? Come on, Ankh. What the hell? What's going on? They're not in my bronze pot. Where are they? Uh oh. Master Septim, is there anything we can help you with? Aren't it where where is my weapon? 
Now, sir, how may we help you? I am, this must be in the past. And which help are you here? Weren't you frozen? Master, what are you saying? Oh yeah, I've traveled back. It's you who released me. I've been serving as your slow subordinate along with Moose Bell, or maybe it isn't. Is there something you require? Is there something you require of us? Ah, eh, nothing for now. You can stand down. We'll do it. Okay. Jeez. What on earth is going on here? Mirror? Oh. Mir, the Emperor of Francia, and the envoy from the Tang Empire have arrived. They're waiting for you in the hall. Now, aren't you Murray? What were you addressing me as just now? Lord Septum, you are the Emir of Baghdad. Me, the Emir of Baghdad? Indeed, I'm the, in the Islamic Empire. Your power is only second to Caliph. Gaze upon the majestic side of Baghdad. Outside the window. Those solemn and elegant buildings were all designed and built by your own hand. Is that so? These buildings were built by me? Now, Murray, my apologies. My husband's amnesia has relapsed again. I'm sorry to trouble you. Dad. Now my husband dreams about the past. He suffers some loss of memory when he wakes up. He'll recover soon. No need to worry. You're most welcome, with Dad. Honestly, I do envy Sir Lord Septum for having a gentle and capable wife such as yourself. After you two wed, you enjoyed a harmonious relationship and even helped the Caliph conquer Ochland, who earned a prominent position. Dad and I got married. General Murray, please greet our guest for me. My husband and I will be there right away. This is a mirage. That's what this is, maybe. Understood, I'm on my way. Your husband, what's wrong with you today? Is your amnesia particularly severe? Here, relax now. Look at my face and recall carefully. Don't you even forget me? Oh, Dad, my, my beloved wife. Alright, I remember now. I'm Septum, Mir of Baghdad, the true holder of supreme power in the Islamic Empire. Dear husband, have you finally recovered your memories? Come on, your greatest wish- it's the Mirage Demon. Wish over the past five years is about to come true. Let's head to the hall together. We shouldn't keep our guests waiting for too long. Wait a sec. Dad, where are the clothes I used to wear? Black clothes. That blue outfit I used to wear when traveling to the Tang Empire with Master Huiyan. Dear husband, I think you may have been dreaming about that old Tang monk again. Come on, that was five years ago. It's been so long. Dad, I'm not sure why, but I feel quite dizzy today. It's not as if I'm not supposed to be in this world. I'm feeling sick in this tight outfit. I need to change into something more comfortable. Dear husband, we're hosting distinguished guests today. Not the time to be so willful. But Dad, please just tell me where it is. By all his name, I'll say that I'm not feeling well enough today to welcome our guest of honor. Fine, you win. The clothes you want are in this room. Go find them yourself. But don't say I didn't warn you when our ghost guests make jokes about your outfit. Thank you so much, Wadad. You're the nicest person in the whole wide world. There they are. Oh, here they are. My old clothes are in here. Change back to your old clothes. Alright, Wadad, let's go. Hi, do you know what you look like? A sneaky thief. Don't be so mean, my lovely wife. This outfit makes me feel at home. For whatever reason, I can only feel like myself when wearing this today. I'm sure that you'll be a total laughingstock to the Emperor Frankie and the others. It's not my fault for you. My fault for not throwing your ugly clothes away. Don't be mad at me, with Dad. Let's get going. Oh, it's the statues. Good morning, Septum. Aren't you the four statues of the moving island? What are you doing here? Oh, how dare you say such a thing? You're the ones who moved us here five years ago. Your husband, you moved them here to decorate our new house when we got married. Just got married. That's right. Lately, we've heard from the Earth Spirits that you went so far as to join hands with Satan to destroy the world order. Even God quite disappointed. 
Haven't you noticed yet? In your traveling days, the angels have been trying desperately to stop you from meeting Satan today. Dear husband, we better hurry to the hall. We shouldn't keep our distinguished guests waiting for too long. Oh my god. Wait, Septum. What's the matter? Guardian Spirit, comma, Guardian Spirit, on, please come out now. Comma, Ankh, I heard these statues speaking of angels that may plan to attack Septum. I'm not sure whether this is true, but I would ask you to protect him. No problem. Dad, what are I'm an Ankh doing with you? Your husband, they were gifts you gave me when we decided to get married, don't you remember? Yeah. Back then, you said it was inevitable for me to meet dangers in battle. That's why you gave me your guardian spirits. I know how precious those guardian spirits were to you. You gave them to me. I felt like I was the happiest woman in the world. I've heard from the statues that you may be in danger over the next day few days, so I decided to return the guardian spirits to you to keep you safe. I never remember now. All this fi happened five years ago. Thank you, Wood Dad. I'm touched by how thoughtful and attentive you are. Thank you so much. My God. This scene sucks. Wow, look at this pool. That's really nice. Ah, the endless hallway. Oh, God. Yeah. I don't want to talk to people this way. Your husband, you don't have to greet our guests yourself. Just let the General Murray have some. I know. Oh, wait, what? Now, Murray, please invite our guests into the hall. Here we go. Lord Septim, the King of Francia, the Archbishop, and the Envoy from the Tang Empire are all here. What the hell? Haha, uh -huh, Septim, it has been a long time. How does it feel to be at the summit of power? Miles, aren't you Miles? Septim, my dear friend, why do you look so surprised? And look at you, what are you wearing? Isn't this what you wore five years ago during the Age of Chaos? Been a while, Septim. Still, oh, been a while, Septim. Do you still remember me? Lilia? Lillian, you're Lillian? No, I'm not. Take a closer look at my face. Nicole! Ah, you're the worst. How could you not recognize me immediately? How do you and Lillian look so much alike? How did I ever never realize it before? It's all because you never cared about me before. You never even paid attention to what I look like. That's why I let return to Lord Satan's side. He's the King of Frankia now. King of Frankia? What happened to the old King of Franklin, Chancellor Pepin? Septim, don't you remember anything? You and I joined forces together and annihilated them three years ago. The shock on the King of Frankia's face was one thing, but Pepin, the mayor of the palace, wouldn't believe that you had betrayed them until he struck him down. Possible. I, I killed Lord Pepin, the man I respect the most. That's exactly how this game is played. It's kill or be killed. His son Charles continued to lead the rest of the troops in resistance to me. But I wiped him out last month. I'm here to rendezvous with you so that we may like, prepare for our eastern exp expedition. An expedition? Something did you forget? This is our greatest desire, to conquer the Tang Empire in the east and rule the entire world. Now that I've got the entirety of Europe under control, and the entire Islamic world is under your control, with 200,000 soldiers of Francia and 300,000 soldiers of the Islamic world, we can crush and conquer the Tang Empire with overwhelming force. And that, my dear friend, would be the greatest military operation of all time. Lord Septim, the Tang Empire is in the middle of a civil war right now. Emperor An of the Yan Empire controls the east and has driven the old fastest Tang Emperor into the mountains. Now that the foundations of the Tang Empire is crumbling, it's the perfect time for to, for to march your armies f eastward. That's right, Septim. Lord Huang Lei, the plenipotentiary of the Emperor of Yan, has come to us with a deal. The Emperor of Yan has promised to attack to the rear of the Tang Empire. When we attack them from the front, after we conquer the Tang Empire, I'll rip up that deal and eliminate the Yan Empire. I guess I'm stunned. 
Gun Empire, the day of our victory is close to hand. Ha 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 ha. I, I feel as if I'm in a dream. Is all of this reality? Septum General Moray told me that you're not feeling well today. But I still recommend you take a look at the Great Army of Art. They're ready to march forward. Oh my god! They're everywhere! Hell. It's a mirage, bro! It's a mirage! These, these troops! Oh my god, I never thought this would be how I finally visited Moester Huan's, Huyan's homeland. Septum, time is of the essence in war. Now you hold supreme command over the army. You must be decisive. No, not yet. Please allow me to set my mind straight. Ah! Oh, I don't know. Time to set off. I've made up my mind. I've decided to march east. What? Has been my wish for many years to go to the Tang Empire. As the supreme commander of the Islamic world, I have an obligation to expand my empire's territory. Please rest assured that I'll take care of domestic affairs while you're away. In that case, I'll be counting on you, General Murray. Alright, everyone, let's march on! This has to be Mirage Demon stuff. Has to be. Where's our camels? Alice again. Alice, here I am again. Yuan, I've broken our pact. Not only did I not take your ashes to home, Yuan, but I'm no longer the Septim I used to be. Septim, my dear friend, ahead of us is the territory of the Tang Empire. Our long-awaited wish will finally be achieved. Even back in the days when the Empire was powerful and overwhelming, it was no match for the Islamic world. Now that they're suffering a civil war, we're bound to achieve victory in this expedition. Oh, what's up, Ghost Man? Wait, that's... Master Huyan? This can't be happening, you old monk. Didn't you die long ago? I am the Tang Monk, Master Yuan. He, he, he's in the past. No, that's the invisible Tang Monk. Oh. He must be protected by Allah. The expedition is against Allah's will. Retreat! Thick. What? Your Majesty, the Islamic armies have collapsed into panic and chaos after hearing that the invincible Tang Monk has come back to life. What? Nice. Your Majesty, the Islamic believe, armies believe that Allah has sent the invisible monk here to stop them from marching east. They're all either kneeling on the ground to pray or running away. Darn it, what the? Except them, your armies are already in the disarray. You better hurry and rally them. Now. Your Majesty, our formation is scattered by fleeing armies. Everything has fallen into chaos. Darn it, go rally them. I'll be there in just a second. Oi, Septim, are you listening to me? That's really on. How are you still alive? I'm terribly sorry for breaking our pact. Uh, you died five years ago. When you, what you see before you is just my soul. Didn't you promise me to travel to my country and learn about the essence of Kingcraft? Turn around and look what you've wrought. Is this what you really want? I want. Cream power, great glory, and untold wealth. Are they worth betraying and killing the commander that trusts you the most? Are they worth destroying countries and families? Come on, answer me. Answer my question. Septum, don't let him get to your head. He's just a ghost, a spirit that wants you to abandon the power and glory we're about to obtain. It doesn't matter if I'm a ghost or not. Just clear your mind and think about the question of that. I know that there's a kind heart in you. Calm oh, now. Ask yourself, ask that kind soul of yours. It's all just like a dream for the past five years. Power and glory. When I was a child, my happiest times were when Lord Pen Pepin trusted and appreciated me. When I was with Kindy, with Dad, and you, Master Hugh Young. Years peaceful time and friendships are what I treasure the most. I wouldn't give them up for anything, even supreme power of the world. 
What nonsense are you talking about? I, Satan, am your best friend in the world. Conquering the whole world has always been our shared dream. I remember who I am. I am Septon, not a, some Amir. I know exactly what I want for myself now. Miles, I'm pulling out of this expedition. I'm starting from scratch and heading to the Tang Empire to continue my pursuit. What the hell are you talking about? Are you going to leave behind your troops? Over the past five years, I've been waging wars across the world and unleashing suffering onto his people. But now, I want to return to my pursuit of the essence of Kingcraft in the East to make up for what I've done. Oh, uh, I knew I was right about you. Let's get going. Wait, Septon, you can't just walk away like this. Let's return to Baghdad together. With Dad. Septon, this is exactly like five years ago. You just ditch me whenever you want. Huh. I swear by Allah that this time I'll keep you with me forever, even if I have to resort to force. It's all my fault. You treated me with nothing but kindness and love. But I kept breaking your heart. I'm terribly sorry for that. But I must leave this time. After all that needs to be all that needs to be done is done. I will stay by your side forever and ever. Huh, no, after you've gone, I doubt you'll ever come back. Is this not a mirage? What the hell? Up to my dear husband, darn you! On, oh. Mentala. This must be our for you, Septim. Been waiting for you here, waiting here to take you to a place called Tianshan. Tianshan? Aren't we supposed to go to the Tang Empire? Tianshan is on the path to the Tang Empire, so don't worry. There's an enlightened one living on top of Tianshan that can help lend you a helping hand. Tianshan. All right, let's hit the road. Is this not a mirage? What the hell is going on? What in the hell? We were expected to enter Riyadh's homeland. Hush, can't. The first time I thought I was here in was during the Mirage King's illusions. Sometimes a mirage can be more real than reality itself. You'll have to keep a composed mind to prevent your senses from being deluded. Leverage my powers, Amir, to help Prince Rian get his country back. All those years ago. It's a shame that he died of an illness so suddenly while hunting. When I came here today, the memories of tra us traveling together all rushed back to me, bringing with me them many mixed feelings. Prince Rian also passed away. I mean, how things change and how time flies. The world seems to have completely changed in just five years. This is an illusion. I'm going to be kind of upset. Useless stuff? Oh hell yeah, I want that. I'm rich, who cares? Who the hell uses that? Nobody. Nobody uses that. Guess I'll buy it just in case, but nobody uses it. Take start. Cool. Ah, sheep. At the foot of Yin Mountains lays a plain for TLA people. The sky covers the plain like a dome, while the grass is vast beneath the blue sky. When the wind makes ripples in the grass, my sheep and cattle will emerge before your eyes. What are you talking about, baby? This is a little green, a ewe lamb, just born from greeny with gentlemen. What are you talking about, crackhead? All seems collapsed. There is no way down. Where the hell are we supposed to be going, old man? Guess we don't go here? Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, Romeo. Where we're supposed to be? Let's just get on our camel. Trolls.
Oh my god, what the hell? Abaddon! required. <laughs> the hell is Moose Bell doing? I guess he's part of our squad now. Place, old man. Imperial Blade Blue Fang. I might actually equip that even though this. I mean, it's getting there, but it's still super weak. I can't use it. Sick. Thank you. How is it? Who uses that? Oh, she uses it. Okay. What's up, old man? Evan Walker Wangshi Cow. Excuse me, sir. What's the matter? Well, I want to visit the Three Mountains, but I only know that one of them is not in the Terram Desert. You know which. Oh. Gunlu Mountain! Has to be. Trash. See you, man. Guess I'm going the right way. Oh, what the hell? Long Lay, have you come for me? Indeed, at the best of Lord behest of Lord Saint's command, I've been waiting for here for you a long time. Lord Satan offered to share the whole world with you once the Tang Empire was eliminated. You'd rather choose the stick over the carrot. How stupid are you? Long Lei, weren't you serving the Tang Empire? How could you secretly betray your own homeland and submit to Miles? Little child, you don't know anything. The Tang Empire is too competent, incompetent to appreciate my talents and abilities. Fortunately, Lord Satan has a real eye for talents, so why shouldn't I serve him? Come on, are you going to return or are you going to fight me? Choose now. We're on fight again. Luckily, we have new friends. Oh, 
Wait a second, I don't see what's his name. Oh, there's my spell. Healing item, wow. Just use that. That's probably more. Gotta be right. You suck. Thing. Picture for kids. <laughs> Alright, I'll make you pay for what you did to me next time. Okay, dude. What a shame. How can someone as smart as you not see through the vanity of the world? After who you am. Must have been Miles' appreciation for his talents that led him to abandon the Empire. Similar to my relationship with Lord Pepin in the past. 
You have a point. As an old saying goes, it's hard to find a true comrade. Wong lays ambition aside. He may finally have found someone willing to appreciate him. Here, screw him. Oh hell, it's this guy now. What? You ungrateful B-word. Lord Satan has placed so much trust in you and has done nothing but patient and tolerate. And you failed, yet you failed him again and again. The way I see it, Cornelius, you're the one, actually the one who failed him the most. Miles was deeply in love with Lillian, and you murdered her. For him, I shall seek vengeance. You fool, you know nothing. All I did, I did to awaken Lord Satan. Only after a hatred toward God filled Lord Satan's heart could his demon potential could, could awaken little by little. I never expected that Lillian would come out of nowhere and soften him up. And just for that, you murdered the innocent Lillian? Heh, <laughs> you guessed it. I, it was how I turned my disadvantage into an advantage since Lord Satan was so deeply in love with Lillian. Once she died, his hatred towards God grew even greater. With Lillian's death, Lord Satan finally began to awaken. But your meddling almost screwed up my plans. You monsters never treated anyone as a real human being. Hey, we got all our stuff back. Perfect. Let's see, River Ferry. does demonic illusions. The Mirage King. Even though I'm kind of losing faith that this is a Mirage, which kind of sucks if it's not. Where's uh, our boy at? Abaddon. Abaddon! Abaddon! Is he gone? There's Amon. Where's Abaddon? Oh, there he is. He transforms into the Dread Knight, allegedly. Or oh, he's done, either way. <laughs> oh, that was easy. Idiot. Oh, he's just gonna leave? This must be the Mirage, whatever the hell. Must spell Sion Witch. Sion Witch, sorry. Called us, Master? Got nothing to do with Satan anymore. Are you still going to follow me? Master Septum, the Guardian Spirit contract that binds us means that we will always be your lowest servants, no matter so long as you live. It's one of the strongest contracts in the underworld. Lord Satan has only ever allowed it to be signed by his most trustworthy partners. I see. Then you shall continue to follow me. I expected that Satan would treat me with such courtesy. What kind of friendship could we have built in that? I don't know. A mirror's mansion. Hell. Is it time for random encounters? Ah, oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Not like this. Where's my girl at? Sucks not having her, bro. She's been with us the whole game. Nicole! Nicole! I don't know if I want to waste, so I might not get... Well, 
Ah, screw it. Oh, that was a waste of them. They were one hit dead. Oh, well. No, they're extra dead. They were not as tanky as I believed them to be. Or clouds or something, whatever. Holy word stone. How are these things? I don't know, but they're probably about to join my army. I can feel that. Gotcha. Run my team Go down real quick. I think they'll probably be treasure. Oh wait, there's Yay treasure! I knew it. Felt it. Tons of treasure actually. Oh my freaking god, what the hell just happened there? He may have made a mistake. Bruh, that was the savage. Wait, where's my... Don't tell me I don't have revival stuff. What? Hmm, that's weird. I could swear I had a ton of it, but I guess not. It's okay. I forgive me. Blaze Ray. Nice. Uh, let's just go ahead and get this out of the way. that thing. Ah, screw it. If it survives, it survives. Oh, she did. Nice. Oh my gosh, she healed so much. Keeps doing it. Wow. No way. No. Okay. Okay, screw this chick. 
Tanky find me. What evil do go there? How dare you break into the Celestial Forbidden Grounds? You're mistaken, I'm not an evildoer. How dare you deny it when you are such a dishonor of evil? Cut your crap, prepare yourself. Oh, now I can use the soul pill? Oh, thank god. She's probably still dead, but we can try. Oh, thank god she killed for some reason. So you're telling me there's a chance. Get on petrified, or do I have to do that myself? Yeah. I was gonna try to capture her, but whatever, man, just punch her. Hey, it's my girl. Septim, how could you just abandon us and leave by yourself like that? Hey, welcome to the party. You're acting like this is a familiar feeling. But are you also going to help Miles stop me? All the time we traveled together, don't you know me at all? Everything I've done has been for the sake of my own dreams and the people I respect. I've always acted on my own free will. Why, when Miles asked me to help him achieve his ambition, Conquering the world, I didn't want to be just a puppet only serving someone else's goal. That's not what I want. That's not me. Lord Satan sees you as a true friend. He truly misses the blonde bond you shared when the two of you challenged the heavens in your previous life. Previous life? What kind of bond did Miles and I have in our previous lives? We were both once angels. Lord Satan and the Archangel Michael were twins. But when God chose Michael to serve as Archangel, Lord Satan was greatly offended. In this, his anger, he called upon- That's why that statue looks the same. He called upon his closest comrades to the heavens to oppose his decision. You're the one that he trusted the most. See, but what happened in our previous lives has nothing to do with what I want to do now. I've got a goal of my own. Please convey this to Miles when you return. That- that's not gonna happen. Lord Saint ordered me to, at all costs, to- Well, I wouldn't like to be rough with you. Perhaps you wish to continue traveling with me just like before. What should I do? The Lord Satan has put so much trust in me. That's why he sent me to stop you. I've always been into you, Septim, but I also have lots of respect for Lord Satan. What else should I do now? Aw. Oh. Oh, there goes best girl. Here we are. Treasure. Ghost Cloud. What? Oh. Hmm. Ghost Cloud. That is, I don't care. Whatever. Oh, that's a blade. But Dad? The Mirage. It has to be, right? Dear husband, please return with me. 
Dad, no one knows me more than you. I never thought even you would try to stop me. Why shouldn't I? In the past five years, the two of us built a perfect home together. Now you just want to leave just like that. But what about me? Terribly sorry, but I've thought this through. The extravagant royal life the Islam offers means nothing to me but a bind. That's really not what I want. Dad, my beloved wife, are you sure you don't you not want to go travel to the Tang Empire with me? Dear husband, I'm not someone indulging in the lavish royal life, but I was born and raised in the Islamic world. This five is my home, and it is what I love. You want to travel to a foreign land for the pursuit of your own dream, but you never considered that this isn't what I want at all. Dad. Bring it on, dear husband. You have to beat me to continue your dream. Otherwise, return to Baghdad with me. What? Betrayal? I cannot help you this time. As a woman myself, I know exactly how the dad is feeling now. You're both my friends. In my spirit of fairness, I won't help either of you. Meow. What the hell? Oh, I don't care. I'll beat her. But dad, don't waste your energy. You can't beat me. I don't care. Unless you kill me, I won't let you leave. I can do that, I guess. Uh, magic out. Whatever. We'll just punch her to death. The classic. The quality. Why do you leave me again and again? Why? Why? Dad, my apologies. This time you'll have to return to Baghdad all by yourself. Septim, do you ever feel lost? She really is quite a decent girl. Be told, I do feel a little lost. I hope to get to Tang quickly, complete my journey, and return to her as soon as possible. Well, those who, those who have lost their sympathy and compassion can never understand the spirit of Crankcraft. I'm very pleased to see you have such a state of mind. Anyone else we're gonna beat on our way? Hey, what's up, little guy? Have you heard about an alliance living here? Yeah, there aren't any kids around here. Young fellow, I'm speaking to you. Are you not a kid? How rude. I'm not some kid. I'm the renowned Yuan Yuan Youngling. Okay, fine. What a long title you've got. Well-renowned Yuan Yuan Youngling. Have you ever heard of an enlightened living nearby? Ahem. They have been waiting for you in the stone chamber for so long. Remember to ask me politely next time. Okay, loser. I do. God left a prophecy that a demon shall terrorize the world on the dawn of the second millennium. Shall infiltrate the world, myrtle realm through windows, and seize the destiny of mankind. An obscure prophecy as it is, I must understand its true meaning before I can warn the world about it. Maybe this isn't a mirage, and that's really sad if it's not. Because I feel like we skipped a lot of the really important things. Oh, what's up, Buddha? Did he just, is he chinese at me? I don't understand what he's saying. But they simple chuckle, your sorrows are chased away, your anger is eased, and your regrets are put behind. May you be free of illness, free of aging, and free of suffering. The constant smile, May you outlive even the most venerable. Yeah, he's speaking Chinese. I don't know. I know it's a Chinese game, but I don't understand what he's saying. Ain't heaven lotus seed. Nice. On the midnight of each day, I go to the top of the mountain to observe the universe and stars to learn about the future and the past. Say astrology, or perhaps you have a similar craft in China as well. Fortune method of fortune telling is called King Xing Xiu. Through this, we predict the future through the relationship between positions, 
seven primary stars, and four major areas of the ecliptic and lunar orbit. By calculating the location of the stars in the ecliptic at the time of someone's birth, and then reading its zodiac position and morals, their destiny can be predicted. Quite similar to Western astrology, would you like to explain further? There are 12 zodiacs, namely lifespan, wealth, br brotherhood, residence, offspring, servant, spouse, illness, wonder, safety, wonder, safety, career, morals, and appearance. The zodiac signs are Sagittarius, Scorpio, Libra, Virgo, Leo, Cancer, Taurus, Aries, Pisces, Aquarius, and Capricorn. Thank you for the explanation. I guess the Qi, Xing, Siu, fortune telling method may have originated in Western regions or Europe. Maybe. I don't know. I've never heard of it. Oh, nice. It's a sword. I have a lot of these. Here we are, Septum. This is the enlightened, legendary lightning that I've told you about. I don't see anyone here. All I see is a sword. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Oh, there he is. What's going on? Who oh, need to be surprised? I am the Juan Yuan Divinity, transformed from an ancient sword a millennium ago. I've been waiting for you a long time. Kid, you're in serious trouble now. With how deep you've gotten involved, Juan Yuan... Hui Yang begged me to assist you. Oh hell. Oh boy, I haven't even resolved the first problem yet, but the second one is more challenging and already at our doorstep. Ah, uh, ha da da. Come kid, follow me outside. What a weird thing that's going on here. Ah, hell. Quad. Miles? I'm Septum. I put so much trust and respect in you. Is this what you think of our bond? In our previous lives, we made a con pact to conquer the underworld, the human world, and the heavens. Now that most of the underworld has fallen to my hand, and the human world is soon to follow, how dare you try to quit on me now? Oh, this is what saying the lord of the underworld. Like, what a heroic and gallant young lad. Sure enough, what an overwhelming aura, but nothing can truly be conquered by force. This younger man has understood this point, so he wants to search for the answer on his own. Humph, oh B-word, who the hell are you? What makes you think that you're qualified to lecture me? Septum, don't let those guys get in your head. The army of Frankia is already it's ready to march, and what dad cannot suppress the commotions of 300,000 soldiers by yourself. I need your assistance. The end of the Tang Empire is close at hand. All we need to do is command our troops to attack, and the whole world will be ours. By then, the uh, wishes of our previous lives will be fulfilled. Appreciate your kind offer, Miles, but I hope to follow a path of my own, not one that someone else laid out for me. I have no impression of what may have happened in my previous life. Those things mean nothing to me. Septum, you! Oh, is he pissed? Avalanche! He's pissed off. The Devil King of the West is getting furious. Fine, to me, power is everything. This is my own belief. I won't take no for an answer unless you have enough power to convince me. Miles, there is no need for us to turn on each other like this. <laughs> Annoying! You betrayed your fellow companions, and I, Satan, despise you. Miles, please stop interfering with me. I've got something which I need to do. Oh, if you wish to convince me, you'll have to use your power to prove to me that what you said is right. Alright, wait a minute. Whatever. Can't be too hard. I am the hero of legend. You hit so dang hard. Yeah. 
That's what you just do? You heal? You heal him? Stop healing. Cheat. Always. Left him. I have it and it seems now is the time for me to intervene and honor the promise I once made to Master Luanyan. Wait, old man, what are you trying to do to my septum? I knew it was a mirage. Eh? It suddenly turned into night. Really? In the desert? Are we supposed to be in the mountains? Why are we standing in the desert all of a sudden? Where's this place? When did we arrive here? Who knows? It seems like a dark desert after dark meow. It says, Take a closer look. Everything that happened earlier was just a mirage. You finally returned to the real world. I knew it. What? Kill him. Meow, yeah, it's all the Mirage King's doing. We were all fooled. This time, we're all playthings of his mirages. How humiliating, meow. Gee, so all the experiences in the past five years were nothing but mirages created to deceive us? I called it. Back then, I, I was about to bring Septim back to Damascus and things after that. They, were they all illusions? They, these years, were they all fake? Juan, Juan. You and I have always stayed out of each other's way. Why did you intervene in my affairs? I have no choice. How can I leave a monster alone and watch you be with others? Ah, you were once a promising young scholar in pursuit of the truth, only to get trapped in the desert by a mirage. You died on your journey to India. But since then, you've totally changed and become unwilling to see the success of our other truth seekers that traveled westward. Your soul has lingered on the desert to bewitch any truth seeker that passes by. Huh. They looked down on my mirages last time. That's why I used <coughs> these empowered ones to give them a taste of my true abilities. If you just let me do my thing, those morons would have died in their final journey to the east. I just never expected that my plan would be hindered by you and the soul of that dead old B-word. Ah, Mirage King. My human minds are exactly like Mirages. You've been indulging in those illusions for too long. Is that not why your own mind was disoriented in the end? Come on, young fella. Open the bronze pot. I'll need its power. My bronze pot? Okay. We did it. Spirit fusion pot in the name of Juan Yuan. Please aid me in selling and fusing this evil spirit. Ugh, what is going on? Spirit fusion pot, my friend, it's been off hundred years. I never expected to meet you again in the exotic world. What a magical fate we share. I, I still can't believe this. Five whole years. Five whole years. All that happened was nothing but a mirage. That's not the case, child. Your ability to travel through time and space, all the Mirage King did was steal it. It seems that you've got to master control of this power, but Mirage King knew how to bring it out. What you experienced cannot be called a Mirage. That was some. There was some truth within. Truth? Indeed, the Mirage King took... Ex exploited your ability to create a Mirage that real... That's real in most parts. Saying that all things will happen as we experience them. If you return with this Arab girl to her country, you will wed her and eventually become a ruler and lead a great army to conquer the East together with Satan. But there's one exception. Even when you lead the army to match East, there will be no Master Hu Huiyan to show up and stop you again. Why? It was Master Huiyan who led me all the way to meet you. No, he has already passed away when you cremated him. He left this world forever. The reason you met him earlier was the Mirage King had used his ability to thoroughly deceive you. 
What he didn't expect was that Master Huion's soul seized the opportunity and showed up to jeopardize his entire scheme. So that's how it is. Master Huion has left forever. Even after passing away, he still looked after me, out for me. Kyle, there is someone important that I want you to meet. Come with me to my mountain. Oh, oh hell, here we go again. Everyone, you must still be shocked. I'll return to my chambers first. You can find me there when you feel better. What the hell? Hi, right, little kid. Is place really Tian Shan, or is this just another barrage? What are you saying? Of course this is Tian Shan of the real world. Are you still de-oriented from the Mirage? Right, I still haven't totally sobered up. Except to my husband. We're not, we're not married, by the way. <laughs> Ignored. Oh, wait. Thank God that was a mirage. I was about to say, that would really piss me off, actually. If that's how we were getting to the end. Doctor, I find that you have a lot in common with Lord Satan. What do you mean? You're both explicit in what you like and dislike. Hold on to your own ideals and stick to your goals once you set your mind to them. Really, I haven't noticed it before. So all those years were just a mirage. The Mirage King is so powerful, Meow. It's embarrassing that even both of us were caught aware, unaware. That old immortal was even more powerful. He not only managed to see through the deception, but also caught the Mirage King. It's incredible. I wonder what he looked like when he was young. You guys are lame. After getting toyed with for five years, you still don't know what's going on. Okay, whatever. Alright, here I come. Give me power. Unlimited power. Oh, what's up, dude? What are you doing here? Master Yu Huiyan, so here you are. Yuyan, even after you pass, your soul continue to protect me. I can't thank you enough for this. Ah, ah, Septum. Today should be regarded as the day of your rebirth. Why are you being so sentimental? Master Yuyan, is there any chance of you returning to this world? I mean, Tom, you already know that my whole body, worldly body, has turned to ash. It was only my soul that brought you all the way here. Deeply sorry. You told me to bring your ash back to Tang Empire, and yet I've been indulging in an extravagant life in the Islamic world. Amitabha, the only reason I made such requests is to keep you moving forward and to prevent you from keep giving up your pursuit of the essence of Kingcraft. You've given up that extravagant lifestyle of yours resolutely. That's not something you need to worry about. For many years of cultivation of martial arts and Buddhism, there is Surya in my ashes. Quite a precious item. Keep it on you, and it should be of use in the days to come. Thanks, Rira. Mr. Huiyan. Would have liked to travel to the Tang Empire with you and learn the essence of Kingcraft. And is there a problem with that? The reason why I've stayed here and waited for you is to travel to Tang with you. Is that so? Indeed, but I'll have to change the way I look. How I look. I have another more important identity for this trip. Now. Yeah. This is one of my previous incarnations. My name is Lee Jean. What was going on here? And that child is who I wanted you to meet. What on earth is going on here, Zhuan Yuan? Lee Jean is also Hu Yan. There are different forms of the same soul and different in reincarnations. When you got caught up in the Mirage King's illusions, it was Yi Yi who asked me to help you. Back then, I was terribly worried that you would go down the wrong path. Fortunately, you turned out not to lose your faith. Back, Ji Ling had quite a crisis himself, but he chose not without any hesitation to rescue and bring you here. Sorry to hear that. It was all my fault. Stop saying that. I was once one of the founding fathers of the Tang Empire. When I learned that Tang had fallen into turmoil, I had planned to return immediately. But thanks to you, I stayed here and discovered a greater danger. Satan's plan. Satan, no miles. Me and Frank you up now, right? He's one step ahead of us. He's already gone to the Tang Empire. If you wish to turn with my dad, Satan will rush back to Frankia, seize power, kill your commander, and invite you to march east with him. See, then what would Miles head east for? Satan is looking for the same thing as you, with the spirit of Kingcraft. Kingcraft? What you did is to learn the spirit of Kingcraft and return to your homeland. What you want, yeah. 
Zane, on the other hand, is looking to destroy Team Craft to prevent it from hindering his plans. The Demon King is cra Craft as he crafty as he is ambitious. Once the essence of King Craft is destroyed, he will be able to conquer the world and bring it to chaos without breaking a sweat. King Craft means order, order and mercy. Without the essence of any world, would return to the Dark Ages, just like what's happening to your own land now. Get it? After arriving in the Tang Empire, I'll do whatever I can to stop his scheme. Are you coming with us too? I cannot. It's inappropriate for me to return, intervene in the human world, but whatever you're in trouble, you can always return to me. Do not allow yourself to be bound by your past friendship and let the devil have his way. You shall always be put in, always put the well being of all human beings first. Have the sword though. I want you to have this. This investiture altar is a treasure used to form contracts with monsters of the East. Jesus, we're only halfway through. Honorable and heroic life of my last reincarnation, as Master Huiyan has brought me great pride. Hope you will also have a heroic journey in the days to come, one that you can be proud of in your later years. How's going on? Introduction. After obtaining the Vestiture Altar, you can check the Eastern Monsters you can fusion the Spirit Fusion interface from the main menu. What this dang sword, though? Weird. Cole, I'm going to leave. Do you want to come with me? What's the matter? Don't you want to come with me? Do you like following Satan better? I'm afraid that Satan will punish you. It's fine if you don't want to join me. Septim, aren't you angry with me anymore? Angry? Why would I be angry? I'm afraid that you're angry with me because I helped Lord Satan in the Mirage last time. That was just a Mirage. How can I blame you when I myself was tricked by it? Septim, are you serious? Can I continue to follow you? Of course, we've been traveling together for so long. I feel lonely without this dear partner. Septim, that's so kind of you. You're my favorite. I need to save and I need to use the bathroom. Yeah. Yay. Ooh. Teleport me. Oh, I don't want to talk to her. Dad. Dad, my beloved wife, aren't you are you sure you don't want to go to this hanging empire together with me? Haven't I already told you? You're just wasting all your time. Dad, thank you for so much for everything you did for me in the past five years. I was happy with you these years. I'll never forget the time when you sang to me under the moon. Your beautiful voice and silver moonlight enchanted me. It's the most beautiful memory I have in my mind, a treasure I'll never forget. Dad, trust me, I promise you I'll be back. I'll return to Islam to stay with you for the rest of my life after finishing my studies in the Tang Empire. Septim, will you go back to your hometown Frankia or stay in the Tang Empire? Don't worry, I'll stay with you after reporting what I learned to my commander in Frankia. Then we will enjoy the moonlight together on the roof of the mansion in Baghdad. I'll rest on your knees all night and immerse myself in your beautiful singing. Really? Of course, I swear in the name of Allah that I'll keep my promise. Thank you, Septim. I know I'm selfish, but, but, I really, really hope you don't leave me. Septim, I'll wait for you. I'll wait in Baghdad until you come back. Whatever. 
Dad, thank you. You helped me lay the ghost of Lillian's death. And maybe find out happiness is. In reality, I'm the one who should thank you. Except him with Dad is a strong woman, you don't have to worry about her. When I was with her, I also felt that she was very gentle meow. There's always discrimination against women in Islam, but the dad never suffered or surrendered to the social environment. And that's why I admire her from the bottom of my heart. Let them come. We will help you to complete this journey as soon as possible. Do I actually have to walk all the way down the mountain or is there a shortcut? Ah, uh, hell. Play shortcut. Help. What? No. Darn you, ghost man! Ah, uh, here we go again. Oh wow, we actually have a fourth party member. So the party's full now? Oh my gosh, heal right- that's such crap, dude. I hate how this team has a delay on it, it's so stupid. Oh, that's dumb. Whatever. Don't care. Traveling down the mountain, yay. Be really mad if I'm not supposed to be going this way. It'd be quite the shame. What the hell? That's, is this nothing but just a dream? 
What are you thinking about, Septum? Oh, it's nothing. Let's hit the road. Very long side. Walk. Whatever. Side. Spin off thing. Dang. We arrived at Chang'an, the capital of the Tang Empire. Finally, it feels like we've traveled forever to get here. Wow, it's pretty. Oh my god. Finally, Cheng Yan! Who are those people running through the streets or who are those birds? Alright, teach me, teach me kingship. Wow, what a big city! This is the capital of Tang, Cheng Yan. Hmm, I've traveled to many countries, but this is the largest one I've ever seen. Yeah. Had Egypt not perished, Chang An wouldn't be a match for it. Secular, I heard about this place from Arab merchants, but it's still dubious. I was still dubious about it before. Seeing is believing, I can feel it now feel its magnificence. That's when I got it. The architecture of the spirit fusion pot is the same as here. That's why it feels so familiar. Hmm. I don't know the origin of the pot yet. I can assure you it's from China. When it comes to the origin of the Spirit Fusion Pot, the Zhuan Yuan Divinity seems to be clear on it. You can ask him when you get the chance later. Asking the Western regions on our way back to Europe, I'll visit Tian Shan to ask him. Right now, I need to find a tavern to spend the night first. Septim, are you here to read those books? Books here are pretty expensive. Don't worry, Master Hui Yan it has a good friend in Chang An. You can borrow books from him and stay at his residence. Is that okay with them? He is very hospitable. Just tell him that Master Hui Yan sent you, and it should be fine. That's perfect. Don't be shy when having someone to lie on. Nicole, quiet please. His name is Bai Lian Yi. An official of the Imperial Court, he lives to the south of the West Market. West Market? The merchants of the city ply their trade in the East Market and West Market. Just keep going straight ahead. And you'll see the West Market. Wow, I can't wait to see the West Market. Septum, hurry up, let's go. Geez, what's the rush? I'm the one doing all the walking. Just about to take good rest. Bye, Lian Yi's house is never closed. Just, you can visit at any time. Still stay open at night? How is that possible? This is quite a safe place. It allows us to recreate the one world described in Chapter of Harmony in four books and five classics. Leaving one's door open at night. This is just one of them. Yes, Master Huyan mentioned the chapter of Great Harmony. I didn't believe this any country in the world could actually achieve such a thing. How amazing. We should check it out as soon as possible, Meow. Alright, everybody's in the pot now. Fantastic. So many pot people. This is Elder Bai's house. Goodbye. His name is Elder Bai Lian Yi. Elder Bai is just the nickname I call him by. He is Grand Master of the Court and pretty knowledgeable. You can find everything you need to know at his home. All the official residents have guards? Just head inside. I told you before that this place is very safe. 
Hi, Power Ranger. Hi, Foo. Bye, Lou. Greetings, this is Master Bice Residence. The door's left open. Oh, I don't care. That's why all the, the watering plants there refuse to talk to me. Oh, I'm sorry, but you're mistaken. He's born me. Okay. Last case. Okay. But thought. I shall. Uh, could he be a mute too? Eh, turns out you can speak our language. You have me worried about how to communicate with you. You're lucky for our master. He's in the study right now. You can just walk in at any time. I can only speak a little Chinese. Thank you. People here are actually quite fun. Hold and solve. I need that. Oh, there he is. When God figure. That's weird. I allow guests to come and go freely, but how did it manage to attract barbarians? A barbarian. Uh, do you understand Chinese? I'm not very familiar with it, but what exactly does barbarian mean? Ha uh, uh, uh. Ill-mannered and uncultured foreigners from abroad. Those who we refer or who we refer to as barbarians. He's a dick. So it's an insult. My apologies. Please pardon my impoliteness. Feeling vexed because of the Barbarian Chancellor Anne, who recently gained the Emperor's favor, and it's driving me crazy. Is your Emperor one to favor ill-mannered and uncultured foreigners? Is Chancellor Anne a beauty? Ha ha ha! No, of course not. She Concubine Yang is his beloved beauty, while well, Chancellor Anne is his beloved jester. That's what it is. Oh, it is. Isn't that typical for an emperor? Ah, <sighs> most emperors end up like this as well. By the way, who are you? How can I help you with something? Dear Elder Bai, my name is Septum, and I came from the Frankish Kingdom. I came to China just to learn kingcraft and the art of war whoop from you. Who are you calling old? My name is Bai Lian Yi. How dare you call me so rudely? You are old. I'm sorry, that's what my friend calls you. Hey, seems like I was wrong after all. You really are a barbarian. The Chinese pay a lot of attention to etiquette, and only my peers have the right to call me Elder Bai. Yes, Bai Li Hanley. You can only address me by my full name if you're my elder. These etiquette is really difficult to master. So how should I address you? Just call me Master Bai. Got it, Master Bai. Mentioned you that you're from Frankia? I haven't heard of it before, so where is it located? It's located in the west, and it's farther than Arabian countries. Master Huiyan encouraged me to come here. Huiyan, I haven't heard from that brat in a few years. How's he doing? I'd say that he's in pretty good condition. But his human body is already dead. What? What did you say? Say it once more? He's doing pretty well after his death. Hey, you don't want to be called old, but you move at the speed of slow. Hold on, let me gather my thoughts. Alright, Ethno Citric, old man, hurry up. You mean that I'll never see him again in my lifetime? Indeed. How did Huiyan meet his end? He died on the battlefield of Talos while trying to prevent the Arabs and the Tang army from entering a full-blown war. Sacrifice himself for the country. That's no doubt the action of a true man. Maybe he's not suited to be a monk after all. Should be a general and butcher those treasonous, treacherous ministers. Instead, that would be most satisfying. The country seems to be loaded with treacherous officials. The Wang Lei, for instance. Wang Lei, he's just an arrogant lunatic who doesn't possess the makings of a treacherous official. Currently the most evil of the lot, include Concubine Yang's cousin, Minister Yang, Chancellor Li, Chancellor An, General Xi, and many more. Wang Lei doesn't even come close. Hmm. Well, Wang Lei was the one responsible for Hui Yan's death. What? That sneaky old fuck. Perhaps I underestimated him. I'll do a thorough investigation on this. Thank you for informing me. 
Nothing since my first time in this country. I'll have to trouble you in the future. You're most welcome. Boyan's friend is also my friend. Treat this place as your home. And you may stay here as long as you like. What you should require should be in these books. Feel free to make as many copies if you need to. Aren't these books treasures? You don't even bother closing the doors, so aren't you afraid that they'd be stolen? <laughs> Please understand these books, but you still choose to steal them, then so be it. Believable. Alright then, I'll be imposing on you here for a while. Book montage! Again. Captain, the Tang Empire seems to be filled with interesting things. Shall we go shopping tomorrow? Go ahead alone. I'd like to read more books. How boring. Is everyone from Frankia as studious as you? What a rare gift that is. I'm a mixed race of Oriental, de Eastern Oriental descent. Now, unlike me, the Franks have different skin and hair color. That makes sense. It's no wonder why you wanted to come to the East. Have you thought of settling down here? Maybe your ancestors were Chinese. My lord treats me well, and since that... They're plagued with strife right now. I'm obliged to help out. Uh, if Chancellor Ainge shared your mindset, those treacherous officials wouldn't have been reduced to such a state. Alright, do you know where Shaolin Temple is located? Hmm, <laughs> that place which teaches good Kung Fu? It's quite far away. I'm going to sue Yan to send his Sarira back. Hmm, Hu Yan was a t monk from Shaolin Temple after all. Shaolin Temple is located in Mount Song, southeast of Luoyang. City, since it's promised, make sure to handle it properly. Promptly. I'll be back once it's settled. Oh, uh, here we go. Another side quest. Check. How the hell do I get over there? The magical soaring oil. Here we go again on our own. Southeast. That's southwest. Thank gosh. Now they must teach me Kung Fu. Can I help you, sir? Excuse me, I'm looking for the Shaolin monk who are Master Huiyan's peers. Master Huiyan, my grandmaster is a peer of Huiyan. I just came back and found out that they've all gone out. Well, please tell me what you need. Perhaps I can help you. If not, I'll head down the mountain for some urgent affairs. I'm here to deliver Master Huiyan's Sarira. Master Hu Yan passed away. Yes, and he had helped me a lot. But I hope to fulfill his last wish in return. What's the relationship between you and Master Hu Yan? Master Hu Yan taught me some martial arts before. Master Hu Yan once taught you martial arts. That means you are an elder to me. Am I supposed to address you as master as well? Doesn't matter. Just call me Septim, please. Septim, so you are not Chinese. I am Wu Yao Wan. Well, what should we do with this Surah? Um, although I do have urgent matters to attend to, the Sarira Master Huiyan is more important. Well, could you please head up the mountain first? Should I go this way? No. Do you practice Shaolin martial arts? You should go through the Wooden Figure Alley on your first trip up the mountain. Should I get the Wooden Figure Alley? It's just behind the pagoda. Move the pagoda first and you'll be able to get it. Thank you. You're welcome. Please be careful when you walk in there. Get out of here, Pagoda. Turns out there's a switch here. And yeah, there's a passageway behind us, like he told us. What's up, dude?
Easy enough. Taste my kung fu. Mr. Clockwork, is this another trap set by Huang Lei? <laughs> not so. When Huang Lei was a child, he was a monk in the Shaolin Temple. During that time, he took no interest in martial arts or dharma, but instead learned club mechanic clockwork in secret. See, legend has it when Gu Guizi lived here, he learned, crafted this to teach Mikias and Luban. Mikias and Luban? I don't know. Wait, what? Must we take such a dangerous route to the Shaolin Temple? Ha ha ha, of course not. This road is for monk's martial training. That monk tricked you because he wanted to test your strength. I'll show him my strength. I'd like to see how he would explain this once I got it, get up there. What a turd, actually. Oh, I hope they're not all as strong as that one was, because that might be a problem. Another sword. Oh man. Quite the journey. Oh my gosh.
Yeah, I'm away. Oh wait. Oh, that's nice. Upgrade. Oh, that was a helmet. Oh, I have a staff for you, dude. I actually didn't think about it. I don't know if it'll be an upgrade or not, but it might be. with me past illusions. That doesn't really make sense, but I'll take it, I guess. Okay, we got the stick. Tortoise shell. What's up, guys? What? Left him. It's so da so dangerous to go alone this way. Can we look for another? Left him. You shouldn't go any further. It's too dangerous. What's going on here? It's actually a test of bravery for people who want to pass through here. Those monks are just illusions. What a boring setup. <laughs> I was actually going to fight them all, but that's okay. I ain't afraid of no ghost. Hey, loser. Master, you got out of there so quickly. I guess that means your skills are indeed excellent. Why are you sinister? You lied to me and tricked me into taking this route. Right? <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's just that if you haven't been to the Wooden Figure Alley, you're not qualified to say that you've learned Shaolin martial arts. Never mind, it was an eye-opener for me anyway. Now the monks have all gone down to fight against the bandits. Would you mind letting me keep the Sarira of Master Hui Yan? Hand it over to the Disciple, whatever his name was. 
Master, I'm also heading downhill to chase the bandits. Sorry for leaving you here. What is it? Recently in Luo Yang, a merging cult has been stirring up trouble everywhere. For the folks peaceful life, us Shaolin monks have gone down to eliminate those past. You intend to go as well? Of course. Why else would I have learned Kung Fu? Are you going to Luo Yang? Yes. I'll go with you. Is that fine with you? If I'm traveling, I'd like to take a look around. Great, since Master is here, please give me some pointers. I should probably tell you this, I haven't actually learned that much Kung Fu from Shaolin Temple. I don't do Kung Fu, I only murder! I have one skill and it's kill! <laughs> ah hell, there's a river in my way. God darn it! I'm so hungry, and with the dull set fruit on you. Yeah. Hey, brothers, it's time to enjoy the food. Oh my god. Okay. Now. Yeah. Oh well. I forgot you can't use directionals for some options because it's dumb. Master yeah, One shouldn't forget Luo Yang. Compared to Chang An, it has a different style. Luo Yang is the eastern capital of the Tang Empire. When Emperor, Empress Wu Shi Tan reigned, she enjoyed it here the most. Thank you for the introduction, but let's cut to the chase. Of course, the one I'm seeking is a habitual bandit that has recently joined the Black Altar Sect. Black Altar Sect? It's the emerging cult that I mentioned before. They keep taking in wicked people and using evil spells to hurt people. How can you find- that's one ugly child, what the hell? Then how can you find the one you're tracking? He goes by the name Black Hand Master Hwang. I've heard that he often hangs around in Spring Court. Okay, let's go. Oh, little we'll children here. Fine flavor third. Usashi over there. Oh wait, there's treasure. Multiple treasures. Talk to me, kid.
but okay, sure. And the dwarf umbrella, whatever that is. There's a lot of treasure in this place. Treasure. Boom, poppy room. Boots. Oh, that's pretty. What? Too far. Never too far. Too far is a. Oh. oh, it's just some monks. Beat the hell out of them. Place for Talus to. Oh. Well, that one had the right idea, I guess. Said that guy was supposed to be at, to be honest with you. What? what? You got quite a special face. Would you mind letting me take a. Thank you. In that case, let me start with your facial structure. You don't look quite Chinese. You look a bit like those turkey cognate, but not quite so either. Uh, it's hard to tell. Right, I'm a mixed ancestry. Mm, your eyebrows are bushy, thin, and long, which means you must have the wisdom and capability to serve the emperor. In addition, your mouth is wide and large, meaning that you have the ability to serve as the background of the nation. Your eyes and pupils are quite surprising, of two different colors. The white part of the eye is clear with distinctive brightness. Together with a large round shape, they represent that you'll enjoy riches and honors if you serve a wise ruler. The bridge of the nose is oh, shut up. The bridge of the nose is on the in the shape of the back of a blade, without any bumps at the end, meaning you have no brother or sister. The short fluffy hairs on your temple suggest your parents must have passed away long ago. You're right, I was born an orphan with no family. My apologies, I'm just telling you what I see. It doesn't matter, please continue. Your ears are thick with the top slightly higher than your eyes. Your ears do not stick out at all. Both of them have big ear lobes and are fairly ruddy. Suggesting that you're an upright and brave man. Your lips are red and symmetrical. Both corners naturally curling upward, meaning you're intelligent and fond of study. However, however, your eyes are piercing with swirled eyebrows. Your nose is too sharp, your ears have no oracle, and your lips are too thin. Together with all this implies that there have has been much killing, fighting, death, and misfortune in your life. Your facial structure is extremely complex, contradictory, and extraordinary in terms of physiology. What's more, I can see all nine colors from your offering at the same time. Given that each color is related to different meanings that are all contradicting each other, I've realized that I still have much to learn. I apologize that I truly cannot read your phone. I wonder how old you are you now. Eh, 23, 24, I'd guess. I see, it must have been fate that brought you here. Judging from your scars and bloodshot eyes, I'm sure that if you have something that must be done, it will be an endeavor most challenging. I'm afraid you may be severely hurt or worse. I would advise you to think twice before you make a move. Thank you for your advice, but no matter how difficult it may be, I must keep moving forward. In that case, please take care of yourself. So-called physiognomy is surprisingly interesting. Tell one's fortune only through the shape of their face. I must come back again for more advice if I get the time. Hell no. 
Hell no. He does not shut up. Hey buddy, why are you sighing in despair? I am uh, Who am the one I'm I don't want to talk to this dude. No. Yeah, thank you. Where the hell is the guy I'm looking for? Is it you? Indicating in the books that Confucius compiled the six classes, but only the five class suits can be found circulating in the world. I'm not sure which volume is missing. Remember that the Yes, I don't care about these questions. I don't care. Rejuvenation Hall provides herbs of all kinds. I'm looking. What are we supposed to be looking for? Um, Please take a closer look. This sword was carried by Emperor by Taijong, the second emperor of the Tang Dynasty. And he was a prince of Kim. It's been well preserved. Since you're a regular customer here, I'll give you a generous offer. 2,500 tails of silver. Emperor Taijong, just 2,500 tails of silver? Is this thing valuable or not? Keep in mind that I am a collector. Do you have anything more expensive? More expensive? Sure, this is a Goryeo vase. Once owned by Yang Guang, the Emperor Yang. It's an extremely <laughs> rare and precious antique. It'll cost you 3,000 tails of silver, quite the price. Well, I did hear about the Emperor Yang of Sui. This race seems kind of valuable. Is there anything even more expensive? Even more expensive? All right, then I'll have to offer you the most precious treasure of the Pine Antique Store, the Seven Star Sword of Sao Ming Day. A famous warlord of the Big Kingdom Air period. This is something more than just precious. It's one of a kind. Let's say 5,000 tails of silver. And how does that sound to you, Official Wang? Sal, Sal, this thing is indeed famous enough to befit my status. You know what? Just wrap them all up. Wrap them all up? Of course, wrap them all up. When have I ever haggled when buying things? Right away, thank you for your generosity, Official Wang. Your Wang. How can he eat such a valuable and expensive antique as if they were just a piece of meat? Bears. Bears! This was beautifully cut. Dang. Just something from recent times. Worthless, totally worthless. Rat mallet. Where is the guy I'm looking for? I know he said he was somewhere, but where? Where are you? Are you the one? Or please have mercy, I haven't eaten. Okay, yeah. So I can. Can I just give you money? Oh. 600 gold coins, here you go. Here you go. Now, thank you enough. Famous Black Altar Saint is headquartered in the outskirts of Luo Yang. Follow the path beside the road, and you'll see a place that is usually guarded by a few talents. Ordinary civilians are not allowed in. Okay, all this is going the right way. Those are here. How the hell do I get in? Let me in. A place for Talus. Oh. That's an annoying attack because it's very slow. I don't understand. I guess I gotta find some life first, but I don't know who. 
kill me. Thank you, man. I'm not reading that. <laughs> to be honest with you. This one? Oh no, I wonder if I bought too much naturally. You seem to be troubled, my friend. Yes, I bought more than 100 pearls from multiple places in the Tang Empire, but I can't seem to figure out the exact number of pearls. And it's not easy to count them. I've counted in groups of seven, threes, and five. There's always a remainder of two pearls. You count them for me? Oh, ah, oh, hell. Thank goodness. What these divine flavors? What is that crap? Oh, I got the Mirage King as an attack thing now? Cool. To. I don't know you at all, so just stop talking to any random people you meet. Learn some manners. Cool. supposed to be here but I don't know where to go here and I'm getting kind of frustrated kind of frustrated master please wait oh my god we found it what's the matter I'm a monk so I'm not allowed to enter a brothel oh no we did not what should we do master you're not bound by Buddhist commandments therefore you're not restricted from entering of course you plan to use me all along that's not the case I went back to Shaolin to ask for Buddha's guidance in the end, Buddha sent you. Okay, just wait outside for me. Thank God. Alright, which loser is he? It looks like you're new to the place. May I introduce you to- I said that black- Uh... Guang, that B-word? No matter how our girls serve him, he's always unsatisfied. And now that he's joined the black altar sect, he refuses to pay his bills. The bod may know what- where that master Huang has gone. The who? Are you the bod? You know of a man called Black Master, Houndmaster Wong? That B-word fled all the way to Chang'an. Someone saw him in Rest Market. Gentlemen, would you like a girl? Well... Good. Septum! Just kidding, don't get serious. You want a girl or not? You've been mumbling for a while. Let me think about it. Alright, so we need to leave. Master, what have you found out? found out that the Black Hound Master Wong went to seek refuge in Chang'an and that he frequents the restaurant named Dukong Tavern in the West Market. Chang'an, that's pretty far. I haven't had it the chance to visit yet. Fine, I used to stay at the West Market for a while. I can lead the way. Mm, as expected of Master. Go for quest. Go for quest. What we're doing here.
God. Ah, uh, I see what I'm doing. Oh, God dang it. Jesus Christ, dude. This is huge. That's it. Get off me. I'm trying to get the item. Don't disturb me. How's that guy? What is it? And it murders someone in the tavern. Broad daylight. Truly how times have changed. The culprit. Man named Black Hound Master Wang. I've recently heard that he joined the Black Altar sect. Although, other than the organization being big and powerful, they're capable of using evil spellers. Who would dare to provoke them? Uh, I'd like to meet them and see for myself which is more powerful. Their evil spells are Marshall and Marshall. Anyone know where the Black Altar sect is located? I do. I've heard that they're probably hiding within the ruins of Old Chang'an City. Since a few daredevils went in, never made it out. No one dares to go there anymore. Huh, no one dares to get close, you say. Who you on? Focus on our objectives. Where's Old Chang'an City? Outside Chang'an, towards the southwest. Thank you. You've learned to put on airs just after a few days of being my master. This guy. Missionary Mulder. The great city of Babylon has collapsed. Now it's become the land of devils and the nest for all kinds of evil and hatred evil spirits. That's exactly what Chang An is going through right now. Put your faith in the Lord. Only those who seek to help his salvation shall be saved. Only through the Lord can only Only through the Lord can only reach immortality. I know where to go. Southwest of Chang'an, apparently, exactly what it told me. Another ugly child. Yay. Yay, camera angles. Right here. Oh, wait, treasure. Spirit World Indicator, are we about to run into a maze? Looks like this is the place. These ruins are the leftovers of Chang'an City from the Han Dynasty. It was later excavated after being submerged by the Yellow River. Okay, let's go in. Wait, someone is coming. Oh, that concubine lady, probably. Hey, concubine lady. That's strange. Could it be a female ghost? Treasure. Ah, uh, the thing is, I need treasure. Thank <laughs> you. 
Finger CD. Oh, nice. How is this? A treasure. Salt Peter. Salty Peter. Testing. Ornicopia. Flavor the fifth. I don't know what that is. Unknown purpose, perfect. That's what I like to see. Catcher! Ah, humph, to think that lady would dare to break in. Time to have some fun. Ha 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 ha. Who's there? Who are you guys? We're looking for Black Hound B Word Huang. Who are you calling a B Word? My name is Master Huang. That's close enough, anyway. D -d Don't you dare think of leaving this place alive. Okay, dude. Let's go. Yeah. 
by Mirage King. He really ain't dead yet. Lady seems to be in a pinch. Yes, let's go in there and take a look. Ain't the white gourd. In the white room. Nah, bah, bah, bah. The mirror's got. Sense blade. Well, there you go. Even more equipment. you not to be so easy. A dice just wandering spirit. Hurry up and surrender yourself to the underworld. Yeah. How dare you meddle in the affairs of the underworld. Seems that if I don't teach you a lesson, you won't know the power of the underworld guards.
Top for a regular monster. Yeah, I got you, bro. Pissed me off anyway, so. Ultimate ability, let's go. Yes. Pain Sulfur. Sure to be good for something. Better. Star One Eyes. That's oh, kind of like the other one. I shall shoot extra freaking hard. I guess.
Oh, finally. The girl isn't hiding here either. Hmm, we can't find her anywhere. I hope she's fine. The club member card. Oh, hell yeah. That means I can go into the Talus place. I guess. That girl is really good at hide and seek. I wonder where could she be hiding? Oh, there she is. Hey, there's one over here too. Don't let her get away. Oh, what's up guys? You happen to see a beautiful lady just now? No, I only see two ugly men speaking to me. Who do you think you are? Ooh, great question. He's a monk from the east and I'm a knight from the west. Ha ha ha, master, you've got it wrong. Are you're seeking death. Oh, sure are eerie. More importantly, we found the we have to find the lady quickly. God, she's escaped. Again. Get out of here. I don't know where she went. I don't care either. Brewer! He chose this life.
where could she possibly be? Or if she's in the place I checked at the... I think I really do need to leave though. I think that might be the answer. Uh, but that means I'm backtracked again for nothing! For nothing! annoying noises with that sword. Well. this I'm going down home hopefully she'll show up wait no that's that's no I think right way I know I have the membership card, unless that's to the brothel, I don't know. Can't be this way, could it? That's new, so maybe it is, I don't know. Maybe I just missed that chest. I don't. Oh, thank God we found her. Jesus. Glad we looked. There you are. Ah, don't come near me. We're to save you. Really? Who are you? Only suspicious people would be here. You're the one who's suspicious. Stop quarreling. My name is Septim, and this is Wu Yan. We're here to nab the robbers. My name is Wang Sue, C U A, and I'm here to catch thief. Eve. That foreign clergy who's been living at my home. He promised to build a church in Chang'an and thus my parents donated a huge fortune to him. However, I find his actions to be really suspicious. Clergy? Yesterday I saw the clergy carrying a suspicious bag and so I told him all the way here. Young ladies like you to be running around at this time. Chang'an city sure is peaceful. 
There's something I haven't seen in other countries. This is some... It used to be fine in the past. Hey, miss, don't you know the security in Chang'an City is getting worse and worse? Concur, that's precisely why I can't let the villains go. Miss, do you perhaps possess any extraordinary capabilities? Don't you dare look down on me. I've learned service ships since I was young, and common folk aren't my match. Way back in the day, but it's different now. Besides, these robbers are extremely vicious, and to my surprise, you actually broke into their hideout. Alright, let's leave. There's no reason to stay here. I must investigate this place. I lost the courage here, which means that there must be a special mechanism behind this wall. I must find a way through and see for myself what the clergy is up to. Are you suggesting that we follow you? No one is asking for your help. What the hell is she doing now? What an insensible lady. Mm, since we've done this much, let's go an extra mile and help her out. Master is right, but Buddhists should be charitable at heart. I wonder if there's a way to get past the wall. I recall that person named Gu from the Chang'an West Market grocery shop once told me that saltpeter, sulfur toner, bamboo tube it can be used to create dynamite. We should be able to blow up this wall with it. Like we just said, oh, thank God we already did that. Then bring them to Gu. Oh my God, I got, oh my God, I got the Go for quest. Jesus, have mercy. Oh my god, I might as well dig a hole with how much of a gopher this game thinks I am. Oh lord. Foolish fool. Where's that? Oh my god, we just went. Well, this place is hell. I should actually put indicators. I'm gonna actually put an indicator. I'm glad they put that in the game, because I'm gonna finally use it. We're right next to the West Market. I need to rest or heal or something. That'd be great. What I want to know is when you had time to talk to the grocer in West Market. Need to heal. Thank you, please. Yes. Okay, someone got murdered. Heal me, God, you turd. You seem to have an opinion. The Imperial Concubine sucks. Okay. Oh, don't care. Get out of here. Taking too long to upgrade the other thing, honestly.
Where's the armor I just bought? Oh, there we Yes, finally. Okay, sick. Hey, can you make explosions? I guess I'll wait a second though. I could buy something probably. Oh, I bought this. What does this do? Uh, I've... Give me that. But then I might miss a quest thing, so I probably won't use it, but I still have it, so whatever. Actually, I need to buy more of those. I think I can have two of the same thing, so... Alright, dude, make me a bomb. You know how to make dynamite? I do! You craft some dynamite for me? You craft dynamite, I'll need, yeah, all the stuff I got. How much you've collected, all, I'm here. Got everything you need. It'll take some time to make dynamite. You can come back. I hate timers. <laughs> Actually, I need a rest anyway. It's fine. Whatever. Joy luck in it is. Treasure, baby. Obtained the fish crisp. Oh, yes. Oh, and a Miraculous Fairy. Oh, baby. Everything. Stuff. Fatnizer. What? Oh, it's Fatnizer. Perfect. Wait, what? Said yes! What? Did I heal? Oh my god, this place sucks. Do I hit, need to hit no to get a yes? Is that how this works? So, whatever. Whatever, man. Move away from the dynamite after lighting it, since you risk, else you risk getting hurt in the explosion. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Besides this kind of stuff, I can also craft some more weapons and armor. I can show you some of my weapons if you got the time. Okay. Sure. Oh, I guess not. Actually, he's a liar.
Dandy dandy spirit world indicator. So to watch these feel whatever you want. Explosion dynamite. It should probably be placed here. We did it. That guy should have been like, What the hell is that? Better not. Fan of Cosmos. There's all damage status except for. No. Yeah, that'd be broken if it got rid of near death. Different world in here. I was just wondering who was the one who blew open the cave entrance. It turned out to be you. Dangerous here. It's better for you to wait outside the cave. Not a chance. You can't even open the cave. You suck. All the ladies of the Tang Empire like to run around like this. I think she's an exception. Ah, uh, here we go again. Aster, we should see this to the end. Should we though? this loser? You're Cornelius! Hey Septon, what a coincidence! Cornelius, what exactly are you plotting? Have you forgotten that you took the money from my father and promised to build a church? This isn't made out of human bones. It's constructed using people who recently perished. I arranged their bones into a mandala which symbolizes the heaven depicted by Buddhist. Didn't you come here as a missionary? Why are you studying the Buddhist scriptures? Ah, uh, you already know the answer. It's just that you haven't remembered it yet. The reverse mandala was designed by you. Me? You'll eventually remember something. No matter what, I'll definitely seek revenge for Lillian. Why don't you look at this poor little monk? Oh, hell. Who you on? Cornelius, what have you done to him? Those who are unable to overcome their fears must succumb to the control of darkness. Master, save me. Who you want, get a hold of yourself. Let them take your, take your time with them. I've fought this thing before. God. Okay, he's, he's one shot everybody. Quit using that damn move. Like for real. He won't stop. Water does fire damage? Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm really about to die to this loser. Perfect. Perfect spell for this crap. Oh, thank god he finally stopped spamming it. There might be a chance. I don't know how much health he has left, but let's summon some bad boys. We're gonna need them. Oh my god, he just healed everything. What is this, dude? Like, honestly, what is going on here? is going on. since he's a boss, but I'm gonna try, cause God bless, bro. Yeah, sick. Okay, we're gonna have to keep doing that, cause he hits way too damn hard. Lord almighty.
I bless this guy's tanky, and that 3,000 healing didn't help. said earlier. What does this do again? <laughs> Did, but okay. <laughs> Thank gosh we beat him. That guy was awful, actually. You're about to give me my first loss in the game, honestly. I'll say honestly some more honestly. Is he dead? I don't think so. Who you on? Are you okay? Uh, I... I... He doesn't seem to be hurt. Maybe he's just overwhelmed by the mental shock. Who you on? Can you still walk? Yeah. Is he going to be okay? Why don't you bring him to my house? I know a good doctor. Okay, besides, I'd like to visit your house as well. You mentioned that Cornelius is currently living there. That's right, my father said that he was a friend of an official and was introduced to stay with us. Friend from China. Cornelius have any Chinese friends? Yeah, that friend of my dad is also an eccentric person. He likes to build weird machines. Oh. It'd be a long lay. I recall that Miles wanted to make use of a long lay previously. So it's not surprising if you met Cornelius. Who are you on? Did you hear that? We're leaving. Mmm, yeah. How do we get to your home? It's at the southeast corner of Chang'an City. Hey. Excuse me. I have an item for this. No, I'm like right next to the exit. But I would have to fight an enemy, I'm pretty sure. Where's my item? Where's the escape play silent? There we go. What the hell? What? That's what it's for! That's what it's for! Oh my god, where's this place? South. Oh, here we go. It's my humble home. Please follow me. God, it's Galki from Street Fighter. 
this master who you wrong? So you're the daughter of a long, long time no see. Isn't this disciple Wu Yan? What's with the dumb look? He's scared by the bad guys. Not a timid person, just what happened? I, I... That foreign missionary was performing deeds, most disturbing, creating an effigy of the Buddha from corpses. Corpse Buddha? Uh oh, what are they doing over there? Where am I? Grandmaster, what are you doing here? Leaving the world for death. Hush and blood are scattered like smoke with dust. And worshipping the rocks, the Bhikkhu have us no luck to comprehend Brahma. Grandmaster, I do not quite understand what you're saying. More than the existence of flesh and skin. The body turns into dust, and then the soul goes to heaven. Even if dust is used to shape Buddha, so what? Grandmaster, thank you for enlightening me. What happened? It's a long story. Please come fir in first. We'll sit down and talk about it in detail. See Mr. Wong to discuss some matters. Got like the biggest forehead in the world. Christianity and Islam remind us to worship idols. Their meaning should be the same point that Master Hui Rong made. This is the reason why the Chinese keep questioning the scriptures and seek out originals. After changes in space and time, the scripture may have been misinterpreted. Thus, it's necessary to find out the original text for comparison. Hmm. Brother Septum, come inside. Hi, right, Power Ranger Man. Thank you so much for sending CU way back. Please stay here tonight so we can repay you. Using you would be- is he the same one as the other one? Are they, are they all named Hui Rong? Using you would be an impolite on my part. I also happen to have some questions which I would like to ask your daughter. I'll take that as a yes over all these years. This is the first time you've accepted my invitation, ha ha ha. At night. So the Florin Kurt Orgy was the one who was paying the tricks. That was close, my little girl was saved all thanks to the both of you. I must properly repay your kindness. Yes, we must properly thank them. Why don't we build a temple for the young monk and a mansion for the hero? Back to work. How can we possibly succeed? Party refused your offer um teen times back. Righteous deeds cannot be measured by physical possessions. Speak for yourself. I know, I know. I'm just a merchant. I have nothing to offer you except for money. But this hero isn't from the Shaolin Temple. What do you think of our offer? I'd love it. And Master Mr. Wong Septum is an outsider. He wants to learn that martial arts from Master Hui Yang. Oh, those are two different Huis. Okay, got you. What? No wonder why I can sense an extraordinary aura from him. I knew there, always knew that he's no ordinary person. Master Hui Yan is considered to be a grand master. Where's Master Hui Yan? He said that he was going to study the scriptures in India. He returned as well. In order to prevent the Arabian countries from setting foot in China, Master Hui Yan was killed in the Battle of Talos. What? Captain has since. Sent his oh, Septim has sent since Caesarea back to the Shaolin Temple. Yaba, Matiaba, Amitaba. Ah, uh, Mister Hu Yan. I I would like to build a martyr shrine for him. There's harping about building another shrine again. Those treacherous officials are to blame for involving themselves in politics and creating mayhem. Hu Yan's death is also caused by this chaos. According to Hu Yan, it's all because the Tang Empire has been straying from Kingcraft. Indeed, Chancellor Li has just been executed, and yet another treacherous official like Master Minister Yang appeared out of nowhere. And then Lu, Shuan, Lu Shan recently became a Chancellor as well. The Emperor is also apathetic towards politics. Make matters worse, Chancellor Anne has taken up the position of Giadushi. Much, much military strength does a Giadushi hold? 
judging from the situation, one third of the country's troops are currently in the hands of Chancellor On. One third? By that if he has the intention to rebel and actually take action, and the Empire might just come to an end. I would like to seek an end to the Emperor, but unfortunately I have no way of doing it. I might be able to if I manage to successfully bribe all the officials. Although bribery isn't honorable, it doesn't seem like we have much of a choice. Are you relying on you, Benefactor Wang? No problem, leave it to me. Heading outside to get some fresh air, Septim, would you like to join me? Yes, my daughter doesn't need to burden herself with state affairs. Please accompany her. Oh, wow, he's found another girlfriend. Daughter seems to be... The verse is coming. My daughter seems to be fond of the hero. Ah. Miss Wong, what's the matter? Septim, thank you for saving my life. This is for you. Why Ascension Minute? Wong, please don't understand. I didn't save you for something in return. This is a thank you gift for saving my life. You offer me a red papaya, I'll give you a jade pendant in return. Its purpose is not to give thanks, but to cherish our relationship forever. You offer me a golden papaya, I'll offer you a precious jade in return. Its purpose is not to give thanks, but to cherish our relationship forever. You offer me an oak leaf papaya, I'll give you- Ooh, What are you about papayas? Same thing, but with jade this Sounds like a classical poem from the Book of Songs. But I don't understand it well. Is it used to make friends? He, it's for making friends, but only between two people of the opposite sex. Women in Chang An are really good talkers. Septim, where did you come from? Came from Gao and further west to whether where you people call the Kin Empire. Well, the Kin Empire is the furthest western country which we know of. Why did you come here? I came to China seeking to learn its culture. China's culture is very, really developed, very well developed. And from your point of view, what's the best part of Chinese culture? I'm not sure of the details. I think that my homeland can stand to benefit from its humanistic concepts and ideologies. Hmm, Septim, you've quite a practical personality. In my case, I prefer to dabble in art and poems. Many exceptional works have been produced in the past hundred years of peace and prosperity. Uh. Septim is teasing other girls again. Isn't that great? Septim is really popular with ladies. Damn, I can't you see that he's she's jealous? Green color lingers deeply in my heart. Although I'm unable to reciprocate, why can't you take the initiative to send me a message? I know this one. This poem is called Yearning for a Talented One, right? Yes. You're mistaken, Miss Wong was actually singing another song. What do you mean? He's asking why you won't express your feelings. Let me sing one more. Many of the plums have already fallen to the ground, but most of them remained on the tree. So the young lad who attends the court may delay no longer or risk missing your opportunity. Most of the plums have already fallen to the ground, and only little remained on the tree. The young lad- Why does she keep saying the same? Don't wait till tomorrow. Plums landed one after another, and now a dustpan is required to clear them up. The young lad who intends to court me, hurry up and hesitate no more. Eugene, Lee Jean, tell me what Wang Xiong Wei's song means. Hmm, this poem probably means that she's willing to marry Septim on the spot if he wishes. She wants to marry Septim for saving her life? She's been flirting with women along the way enough for Septim. Oh, calm down. Don't be angry. That's just Wang Xiwei's unrequited feelings. We don't even know whether Septim is willing or not. Ahaha, uh -huh. Septim hasn't been learning Chinese for very long, so there's no way that he'll be able to read between the lines. That stinky lass. She's too presumptuous. Wait, someone is coming. These dumb poems. Alright. Wang Lei! They're absolutely worthless. Will singing them make my belly full? Will they provide me worms like clothes do? But she can soothe people's hearts. Soothing people's hearts, she says. Ha ha! Something invisible and intangible. The contents of the four books and five classics can civilize a person. 
Are they really worth this as you claim just because you can't see them? Can the four bucks and five classics be used to build a house or feed me? Only manufacturing and creation are truly dependable. Here we go. Who is it? It is in Lord Huang. What can I do for you at such a late hour? Mr. Wong, I'm under urgently looking for the clergy who's staying at your mansion. Lord Wong, the clergy whom you brought, has committed evil deeds, and now everyone is looking to hold him accountable. Evil deeds? I don't think it happened yet, right? What does he mean? The clergy stole some dangerous items from me, so I'm here to retrieve them. Hold on, I'll search his room. Are you kidding me? The item, please be careful with it. Don't drop it. Oof. Are you afraid that I can't compensate you if I break it? What is some of this doesn't make sense. Oh, is it exactly how dangerous it is? The new type of clockwork mechanism which I'm researching on. And it's extremely dangerous when used improperly. Clockwork mechanism? You won't understand anyway, so there's no point in asking. Oh fudge. Oh there you go. And we're just gonna let him get away with the two kids. What's going on? Looks like my new invention had exploded after being smashed by Master Wong. Darn you! Me, yeah, I didn't even raise a finger. Besides, I've also suffered heavy losses. Nothing to do with me. Farewell. I told you. That's our Grandmaster, what should we do? Father! Mother! Miss Wong, my condolences for your losses. Your family members were all good people. So they'll definitely attain enlightenment. And we did nothing to stop him. Miss Wong, do you have relatives of whom you can depend on? Relatives stay very far away. Let's settle Miss Wong down for the time being. Mm, but we can't possibly let the girl fall amongst like us. Here, why don't you watch after Miss Wong for now, and let us and the monks deal with the aftermath. Okay, let's ask he asked Mr. Bai for help. There he is. Coot. Mr. Bai, this is my friend Wang Su Yue. See you away. Greetings, Master Bai. Septim, how did you manage to acquaint yourself with the Chang Yang girl so quickly? Master Bai, you've misunderstood. Wang's family perished in a fire, so she is now alone and help. I would like you to take care of her. What? This is serious. What happened? It goes like this. So that's what happened. I understand now. Meriton Wang was pretty well known for his philanthropic deeds and didn't deserve such an end. I'll try my best to help, so please stay here with peace of mind. That's... I'm very grateful for your kindness. I can't express my gratitude enough. Uh, leave the funeral to me. My Samaritan Wong's family rests in peace. Every books. While we get pestered. Septum. Wong, what's the matter? Please don't call me Miss Wang. Wonk, whatever. Call me C-U-A C -U -A instead. Might misunderstand if I do that. Goodbye chided me the last time. Septim, were you married back in your homeland? Yes. This young lady... Oh, well, listen up. No, I've always been alone. <laughs> well, I do have some friends, though. Then, Septim, do you mind? Mind what? you mind marrying me? I'll definitely be of help to you. Well... How impudent. Great that I can't promise you a happy life. Septim, are you implying that you detest me? That wasn't my intention. Then what do you mean? Eventually I'll be returning to my homeland, but I can't take you everywhere with me. I'm homeless anyway. I don't mind following you wherever you go. Besides here, there's no other place in the world where a young lady like you can walk around safely. Now I'd rather follow my parents into the afterlife. Mitsuya said, Heaven places a great responsibility on a great man. Haven't you heard this before? Tribulations are considered to be a test. Allowing her to tag along with be the best training you can get. 
Manage to ensure safety while traveling. You'll be able to achieve greatness in the future. As expected, I can't win with him in an argument, as I didn't read as much Chinese literature. Can't win with her. We've only known each other for a short period of time, and since I'm in, not in a hurry to leave, take our time to make a decision. The world is unpredictable, and life is full of ups and downs. Turmoil brew during the peak of the Tang Dynasty. Prosperity, peace, never last long, and the smoke of war doesn't disperse. Who pity the life of my orphans and widows? What do we do now? More go for quest? There tomorrow. You know, as duty has been handled, so you don't have to worry about it. Sorry for the trouble. Don't mind it. This is all so fake. Besides, the Emperor wishes to meet you after I chatted with him. The Emperor wishes to meet me? Emperor is interesting. New and interesting things as your presence here. It doesn't hurt anyway. Would you like to go? Of course, I'm interested as well. Great, I still have business to deal with. Wait for me outside. The Imperial Cal Palace Gate, located at the north of Chang'an City. Wait a minute, Septum. Long, what's the matter? I don't want to be alone. Please bring me along if you're going out. Mr. Bai told me the Emperor wants to see me. It is inconvenient to bring you along. And I go to the Imperial Palace. It doesn't matter. I'll wait outside the palace, wh place where I'm not allowed to enter. Oh, okay. Why is it so quiet today? We're by the Emperor's holding a farewell party for Chancellor On at Mount Lee. All the officials have already arrived. Farewell party. Chancellor An has been appointed military governor of Fanyang. Uh, time sure fly. Now we head to Mount Lee too. It lies just southeast of Japan. Southeast, I see. But will Miss Wong come with us too? Be sad to stay alone. I want to follow Septum. Uh, okay, but you can only follow us to the foot of the mountain, Lee. Then you need to wait for us. No problem, Mount Lee is a beautiful place. So annoying. I'm tired of this dude's crappy harem. Here we are! Explosion. I'll go up the hill and let them know. You can just wait here. Got it. Boom! Scenery around here is very good. No wonder a detached imperial place is located here. Well, it's good that you cheered up. There's a stone monument over there, and I'd like to see it. Well, then go see it. Leave me alone. Septum, excuse me. What's the matter? Mountain reeks of evil. I'm afraid troubles are around the corner. Oh, I see. Wong, I'm going to wander around here as well. Okay, enjoy yourselves. I'll memorize this poem here. Let me up. I am civil and military. What are we doing? The Emperor has prepared a banquet for Chancellor On where Is what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Ah, here we go. Jesus. Uh, a long time since I traced my willow eyebrow. I do not care. I'm somewhat be real honest. Autumn goes and spring pollen. <laughs> What the hell is that thing? It's like some kind of weird fish. Vermin assault.
<gasps> the bamboozle. It's always a bamboozle. What's this? That's strange. I've already placed the seal, so how did anyone still manage to break in? Who are you? Now, haven't you heard of Evil You, the world renowned founder of the Black Altar sect? Sorry, I haven't heard of that name before. I see, so you're already. What are you doing here? Ah, I'm cursing the Emperor with the Tang Empire's destruction. Why are you doing that? Oh, you possess a patron god. In the past, I was. Ignored by the gods, no matter how much I prayed or worshipped them. So why have they appeared now? God doesn't dabble in pretty human desires like yours. Isn't that right? Ah, that's why I turned the go to the ghosts instead. They're much more generous and try their best to satisfy whatever I ask for. What a selfish person striving only for his own benefits. Ah, haven't you heard of the phrase, every man for himself, but you seem to possess good aptitude being able to summon ghosts and gods as well. What say you? Would you like to join me? We can search for the Zhuan Yuan Sword together. I know where that is. Zhuan Yuan Sword? I've heard of its whereabouts in the western regions. It's an artifact which can only be used by someone of Chinese descent. And rumor has it obtaining it means conquering the world. Once the world belongs to me, I'll reward you handsomely. Who's then treading down a corrupted path? You're delusional as well. Why don't you become a di my disciple instead so that I can knock some sense into you? <laughs> so you've chosen death, Patron God. I suggest that you stay where you are. You're unaware of the Spirit Fusion Plot's powers, right? You have Spirit Fusion Plot? It, it, it can so any ghosts and gods alike. If you understand what you're up against, get out of my way now. Ha ha ha, I'll have to experience it for myself. We want to have a look as well. You have more ghosts and gods? Not bad at all. Have a taste of my Spirit Fusion Plot. Yeah. You actually suck on my people. You morons. It's your turn to taste my spirit fusion pot. This is... <laughs> this is ignorant. But, th th that's a real spirit fusion pot. Ha, ah, that's great. So it turns out the original is in your hands all along. Now I just have to grab it for myself. She can still stun people. That's actually oh, well, that works and it's kind of broken actually, but whatever.
Larry's weak to light. I got that one. hittable by it or not. Time. Super strong. That's pretty ridiculous. And it doesn't take all her mana either. That's crazy. even take. I don't know. But whatever. Now I'm not using her mana for anything else in a fight anymore though. I know that. finally defeated him. Not yet. He used paper figure substitute technique, which is a Chinese spell, and his real self has already escaped. Paper figure substitute technique? Sounds really interesting. I'll have to learn it if I ever have the chance. Are you planning to prank others with the spell? I can't think of a better use. Speaking of which, his talismans seem a little peculiar. Guess so, I'm not familiar with Chinese spells. Most talismans spells in China borrow their power from ghost or god. And it's done by writing incantation on talismans, but the incantation used by evil you seems to be borrowing its power from Satan himself. Satan? 
Hmm, seems like Satan has managed to gather some of China's powerful demons. Like we'll need to face Satan in the future. It's just a matter of time. Satan is truly formidable. Except him, you don't seem too keen about the idea of provoking Satan. That's to be expected, Satan. Except him was originally supposed to conquer China together with Satan. Enough, I'm not here to conquer China. Alright, calm down, I'm still talking. On you want, sword. I wonder what power does it hold. I mean, we've already met it, so... Oh, oh sneak. Who are you and why are you here? Steward Gal, what happened? Majesty, a Western Barbarian has broken in. Oh, yet another one who hails from the West. Here, yeah, Steward Gal, bring him to me. I'd like to meet this person. Yes. Come in. There's what's his face. Isn't that person Miles? What a surprise to see him here. You mean Satan? It's like they forgot he's evil. Septim pays his respects to His Majesty, the Count of Eve Heaven. Long live the Count of Heaven. I believe that's what was written on the book. Good, good, you may rise. Septim pays his respects to Your Highness. Long live Your Highness. You may rise. I didn't expect a barbarian like you to know your ba manners. Barbarian, what's your name? Your Highness, my name is Septim. So you're Septim. I heard that you're currently staying in Master Bai's house and that you're also an outstanding foreigner. I've been eagerly looking forward to meeting you. Majesty flatters me. I'm fascinated by the Tang Empire's developed culture. I still have much to learn. Hehehe, <laughs> your Chinese is already sufficiently decent. So, Septim, why did you travel all the way to the Tang Empire? My initial objective was to master the method of winning, winning wars. I soon realized that a king's role is much more imperative. Therefore, I'm trying to learn more about kingship. I hope that one day, Western countries will prosper like the Tang Empire. Excellent! It is rare for Western barbarians to understand our principles. The journey to the Tang Empire must have been arduous. Why don't you join us for the banquet? My gratitude, Khan of Heaven. Hold it, your majesty. Baron is not supposed to be here. We need to find out what's going on. You're right. Explain yourself, Septim. I met a strange Taoist on my way here, and he was caught casting a death spell on Khan of Heaven. I tried to stop him, but he got away. What? Is that true? Yes, he called himself Evil Yu, the leader of the Black Altar sect. The sect is be left behind on the mountain. His altar is left behind on the mountain. Stuart Gao! That's not Zinagard over there right away. Your Majesty, there is indeed a special altar left behind on the mountain with some spell scrolls. I'm afraid the death curse story is true. Are you saying the Black Altar Sect is a rebel group? It did reach my ears that the Black Altar Sect is not a decent group. They come and go without trace. If that's the case, I owe Septim a big favor. He's truly an extraordinary barbarian. How does your majesty intend to reward him? Uh huh, exactly, let me think about it. How about this, Marshal Gal? Ah, oh, Sis Loser, ah, oh, hail. Yes, your majesty. We lost a war in western regions, Marshal Gal, and now I've come up with an idea to punish you. Yes, I'm guilty as charged. I was going to appoint you General Chief of the Right Yulin Guards, but I decided to have Septum fill in. And for your stead, you'll be his deputy and help him do his job until we get rid of the Black Altar sect. Hell yeah, and your majesty, you're going to have a barbarian we barely know fill in as for me as general in chief. Septim here is for is here for cultural exchange and he just did me a big favor. I don't see anything wrong with such an arrangement. Hey, Marshal Gao, you're not Han either. His majesty is too broad minded to bother about nationalities. That's very true, your highness. Shame on me. That settles it then. What do you say, Septim? For your recognition of me, Count of Heaven, I won't fail you. In this way, you serve the court as well, albeit temporarily. So don't have to call me the Count of Heaven. You just call me your majesty like others do. Yes, your majesty. In this fate, Marshal Gal was the general in Talus back then. What kind of person is he anyway? Great, great. Now back to the party, everyone. Here we go. Party time. 
Um, temporary general. Who'd have thought I'd one day have to answer for a barbarian after working like a dog for this country for almost 30 years? I don't know, man. I know you're upset about this, temporary deputy. Just know I never meant to fight you for power. I'd appreciate it if you could give me some pointers. You'll need more than some. Have you read any books on military strategy? I have read The Art of War. I can't really put its ingenuity into words. That's it. Take one copy of the Ultra... Arch of War, and go back to where you came from. You could take your time learning the method to winning wars. I'm afraid military strategy is not the key to the method of winning wars. After all, you lost Talus. You know about Talus, brat. I was there. The monk who stopped the Westerners from town attacking was my friend. He died to clean up your mess. Barump. I am no mess, rat. That is all. Hey, Miles. I'm tired of you. Miles, long time no see. Satan! Not too long, actually, Septum. Congratulations on your achievements. You being here means you've come up in the world, right? Not as much as you have, I'm just a guest. But you're, or you are a general. Be frank, what do you want? Ha ha ha! There are so many things that I want to do, but something bad will happen if I share them. All in all, you better be careful. Oh, I will. Thank you for your suggestion. Of course we won't do anything about it. Can I leave? Oh, uh, yeah, we're trapped. What's up, man? Y'all stepped him a few words and you got promoted from a nobody to general in chief of the UN guards, which is totally unheard of. Thank you, eunuch, for your support. Yeah, you know balls having weirdo. I hate that his majesty likes you so much, and I'm grateful that you saved his majesty from danger. You're noted for your unwavering loyalty, eunuch, and I finally got to see it today. Ha ha, I'm flattered. Really, do we have a chance to get together, Septum? Let's talk more. That's your majesty. Screw this place. Let me out. Let me out. This place sucks. Um, should I call you general? Septum is fine. I'm not Han, so the roles don't matter to me. And you are? Okay, Septum, I'm not Han either. Actually, I'm a foreign student from Japan. In the Far East, my name is Akira. Akira. And I use the name Hayashi. Surname Hayashi. The surname? Did you give the surname to yourself? Yes, we don't have surnames in my country. So I picked one for myself. You can just call me Hayashi. I see. I should pick a surname as well. No, forget it. Only nobles in my country have surnames. Can you imagine a country where all the people have surnames? Haha, <laughs> tell me about it. I can't believe the people here think much of their bloodlines. I'll call you Septum. You come from the farthest west while I come from the farthest east. It's serendipitous that we met. Well said, Hayashi. You seem to have hit it off. How incredible. Really a good idea to the point. Answer on Douchey, who has military power in addition to getting to deal with foreign countries. Didn't mean to talk to you, Vanilla. Man, I'm ready to leave. Let's go. By the way, what does the General in Chief of the Yulin Guards do? The General in Chief of the Yulin Guards leads the Emperor's personal guards everywhere. Every Yulin Guard is one in a thousand, the best of the best soldiers. I see, so it's their job to put down a small-scale robber group. Absolutely right. I can deal with them without much effort, even without your control. You mean you don't need me? Well, don't waste your time trying to get rid of me. I won't give up this position. I just want to leave. Is that possible? Can I do such a thing? Dare I be so bold? What are you in the ducks? Oh, oh here's. You're not noted. Oh. Here, another barbarian, the blonde one sitting next to me. Both his majesty and I think highly of him. Must be Chancellor On. Who? That's Dong Zhuo. Whom de everyone detests. What a glib tongue he had. Who dare speak their mind on such an occasion? Chancellor On, Miles and I go way back. I'm surprised to see him here. Oh, you know each other? What a nice surprise! Couldn't be a coincidence that Miles showed up. Be up to. I leave. Please. Thank you. Oh. Oh my god. 
cursed. Uh, have you met Hayashi Septim? One of you is from the end of the far east, and the other is from the far west. Uh, uh, these two are much alike. Getting them to know each other is like bringing the world closer. Yes, thank you very much, Your Majesty. Alright, Septim, gather the right Yulin guards with Marshal Gao and have them stationed at the foot of the mountain, just in case. Yes, Your Majesty. Well, did I expect you to end up being a temporary general after you went to see the Emperor alone? How unbelievable. Well, in general, Septim, you're one hell of a talker. It's just a matter of coincidence. I didn't expect that either. I've never doubted. Ability, and I believe make a difference. Uh, Tully Septim is a great general material, and he's good at literature and martial arts. I'm even close to knowing about Chinese literature. In any case, you're not returning to Chang'an for the right? Yes, Marshal Gao is going to make me report for duty for the Yulin Guards barracks at the foot of the mountain. I want to visit the camp too. Not a game. Women will only get in the way. You're not the general. Is there a rule that women aren't allowed to enter a military camp? No, there's no such rule. <laughs> Mr. Gao, don't underestimate women. Princess Ping Yang's women soldiers found the t founded the Tang Dynasty after all. Captain, please hold on. Please let me take part in these military affairs. This. Is that okay? Didn't you come here to study Hayashi? In fact, I mainly learned military tactics, therefore please let me in. It's a rare opportunity for me. It's difficult to do things without friends, even if you're a general. Having cronies can help a lot. Okay, thank you so much, Hayashi. Our group is bigger now, let's set off. This is the place where the right Yulin guards are stationed, and there are in total a thousand soldiers who escorted the Emperor. Total strength of the right Yulin guards. They have the total of 3,000 men, all of whom are carefully selected elite. Can we deploy all of them here? Given the threat from the Black Altar sect, it's better to assemble all the forces we can use. Well, I'm afraid it's hard in such a short time, as our support personnel may not be able to handle it. Let me help you. I'm good at counting and distributing supplies. As the daughter of a merchant. Huh? You are a merchant's daughter? Yes, my father was Samaritan Wang. He was quite famous. I see. I'm sorry for my importance. Since a logistical problem can be solved, we can dispatch our troops right now. Let's talk about the details in the main tent. General, there's still time before we rally the 3,000 Yulin Guard. What is your plan until then? Gather intelligence about the Black Altar sect and recruit some more talents onto my team. Talents? You and guards are the best talents in the whole country. What more do you want? I fought the leader of the Black Altar sect once. He's not easy to deal with. I need to find some masters of martial arts. So what if one or two of them are superbly skilled? We have an army! Master Huiyan, you're saying? I don't get why some can stoop so low. I'll drop by Shaolin Temple and see if there's any luck. See to the rally, will you? Roger that. Yay, go for quest. Let's go. Yeah. Okay, I don't care. Leave me alone. Oh, leave me alone. This isn't important. I said I don't know. I should punch you. Why does he keep asking me questions? Stop taking my money. I 
This is why you don't talk to random people in this game. They either ask you dumb math questions, or they just... Scam you, bro. Scam. Shaolin Place is this way, I believe. God bless America. That weapon doesn't add as much damage as I thought. I should probably go back to the other one that grows. Probably. Wait, potency goes up anyways. I don't understand that. Oh, once you get... Wait. Potency or proficiency? Oh yeah, it goes up whatever, so that didn't matter. Whatever. Dumb. Wait a second. It was going up though, so that might be something special about this sword. I'm gonna use it. I don't care. Good. Pressure C it is. Master Septon, nice to see you again. I'd like to visit Master Hui Rong. Is he there? Okay, Master Hui Rong is dealing with Samaritan Wong's affairs in Chang'an, but I can pass you on your messages to him. It so happened that while the Emperor was missing meeting me in Mount Li, the leader of the Black Ultra Sick was trying to kill him with a spell. The Black Altar Sect again. They're getting audacious that they even tried to kill the Emperor. Due to this event, I was appointed the temporary general of the right Yulin Guards to destroy the Black Altar Sect. Does this mean you've gained a promotion? Master Septim, you deserve it. Temporary promotion, and this is why I hope you and Master Hui Rong can come to the Yulin Guards to help us. Well, this is interesting. I'll pass the word to Grandmaster Hui Rong, but I'm afraid Master probably won't accede to the request. Why? We monks have detached ourselves from secular society. Thus, we cannot enlist in the army, but I think we can help as volunteers, and the Grandmaster will determine the extent of our involvement. I see, thank you. It's a pity that I failed to recruit more talents. So I'll go back to the camp to discuss this matter further. Okay, waste of time. Yeah, you go for quest. Oh my god. Everyone attack. Oh my god. Long way. Can we just kill him? You know, you came here at the right time. This person is Wong Lei, a talent I invited to help us. Talent, yes, of course. He is indeed a talent in terms of competence. Hee <laughs> hee, I didn't expect you to call you, you know, Septim one day. You two already know each other? Kind of. The clockwork weapons Wong Lei made have so much destructive power that no one could stand against him. He's strongly recommended. Oh, incredible, isn't it, Wong Lei? Theoretically, yes. Humans are no match for mechanisms with great power. Besides, failure is the mother of innovation. So that thing can actually defeat me? That's correct. Want to give it a try? Why not? I'd like to see what you've been up to. Here we go again. This time it's a horse. Good for us, because that's what we do, baby. Yeah, pass it. Why? 
See how much damage it'll do. Not that much. Other one's better. For single target at least. Is he gonna have three faces like the other one did? Or is God, we haven't even broke the first one yet. Finally. You suck, horse. You suck. is still too weak. How could a human possibly knock out that thing? Darn it, I'd last again. All my work has been damaged by General Septum. However, strictly speaking, long lace machines are indeed powerful. It's like he'll be a pain in the neck, yeah, for surveillance purpose. It's worth keeping him around. If I'm an official, I'll be impartial. I'm going to see past our disagreements. I believe Hong Wang Lei will make a contribution to the Yulin Guards. You do have a good eye to see how remarkable I am, General Septum. You might have lost this time, but I'll come back with a better one. Thank you, let's talk inside.
What the heck? What is a villain like him doing in the Yulin Guards? My decision. He may not be a nice guy, but you can't deny he's got talent. I happen to know some intelligence about the Black Altar sect, and I won't tell you a single word if you get rid of me. Dustin, come on! General Septum, I don't think it's appropriate to bring your wife to the barracks. This Wang is not my wife, Wong, whatever. She's in charge of the logistics. And she isn't, then what's with the poem I heard last time? Poem? Stop talking about relevant stuff. Back to the intelligence. Whatever, it's none of my business. Here's the thing. I've been dealing with the Black Altar Sect for quite some time now. I'm sure you have. What kind of dealings do you have with them? The power of the clockwork beast I made comes from demons summoned by evil you. See, so it's not a simple mechanism that you made. In that case, you won't be able to make more clockwork beasts if the Black Altar Sect is gone for good. Eh, yeah, I found a new way. Let's... Last time the clergy stole my new power source. And accidentally blew up Mr. Wong's mansion. They knew it was you. It wasn't even I who brought it there. Don't you think your inventions are way too dangerous? Well, tripping and falling are the first things you do while learning how to walk. Feel so sorry for Mr. Wong, though. Tough luck. Jesus. Let's put that aside for now. The most important thing is do you know how to capture evil you? Evil you used to be a bandit, and I'm well aware of the exact location of their lair. Let's take a look at this map. Let me see. Right here in the mountains, west of Lua Yang. Okay, with this clue, I'll scout ahead with Hayashi. The rest of you stand guard here. They're obviously where those talus were that I ran into in that one spot. Obviously. Obviously, bro. Do Yang is up there, which means... I don't know. I see talking about... I don't know. Oh. Hey. I don't want to do this. Yeah. Uh. is level 40. That indeed. You do be. Turn back. I don't care about King Trip at all.
Sucks, God. Yes, there's so many random encounters. It's so toxic, actually. These are mountains, they're west of Luo Yang. What, is, what? Oh, wait, are you talking about here? Oh, thank god we found something. Welcome to the long abandoned bee pit. How may I help you? Is there a bandit slayer around here? Oh yes, up here the bandits come out every now and then. You shouldn't go up there. Thank you, we'll keep our eyes open. You're running in here, come to me if you need anything. By the way, Hayashi, what's up with that outfit? Haha, <laughs> in my opinion. I need to get outfit to move at night. During the day, you look just look fishy. Really, I find it rather awesome. Even for everyday wear. I guess you can say that. You snicker when you meet an enemy and they'll freak you out in no time. Right on, right on. That's it. Awesome, isn't it? Yeah, you made me want to put it on. Never mind, let's get down to business first. Defeat the Han. Did they send me daughters when I asked for sons? Literally 90 degrees in my apartment. Literally, not figuratively. 90 degrees. Here we go, Demon Lord Fortress. What's up, guys? You're Septim, right? I'm here to join you. Join me? Who are you? My name is Zhang K. Behind me is my pet exorcist. Roar. No, oh, it's a lion. This is the first time I've seen you seen a real one. Wait a minute. How did you know we're short-handed? I heard of it and rushed here for the recruitment as soon as I could. I'm not bragging, but my kung fu is one of the best. Not to mention I've got exorcists by my side. Okay, you're hired. That's temporary help for now. Impress me and make it official. You won't be disappointed. Let's go, Exorcist! Billy. A lion boss? No kidding. It'll scare people to death. You know me? Of course, boss. Are you drunk when the day's still young? We've got things to do. I'm ready to fight, boss. Let's go big. Fight what? Fight, fight for the country, of course. Hell, what's going on? Hey, what are you doing here, boss? How do you call me boss? Because you're my boss. Is this some kind of philosophical question? Philosophical? Philosophical? I'm the boss now. Septim, given there's no one else, I'll kill you here. Oh, sick. What do you mean? I'm a wanderer who kills outlaws for people, and I have come here today to kill you. The bandit leader. Is there any misunderstanding? We're not bandits. Why do you cover your faces if you're not bandits? I don't want to waste words. Let's get it.
least it's a multi-person boss fight, so I can actually use that one ability. I guess. Water long leap. It's actually fire long leap, but whatever. Explosion! Oh yeah, the soul has a new ability to test out so they don't die. Oh no. Oh yeah, there we go. Darn, I didn't expect a bandit to be so skillful. I've told you we're not bandits and we have come here to investigate. Who is it? Who? What's going on? There's two septums. Your septum? You're a knockoff? There are two septums, which means one of them is a fake. Darn it, get out of our way, the real one. What? Oh my god, fake me. Uh, I guess this is one way to. 
Why are you faking being me? Makes no sense. At all. Whatever. Candace are doing. What the heck? Oh yeah, dude. Damage, I like that. Squishy like damage is taking life, but maybe it's not dead yet, so. Please spare my life. Why did you pretend to be me? It was your worst leader evil use plan. What did you want? Leader gave me an incarnation talisman and turned me into what you look like. And I was going to reorganize the bandits to re ruin your reputation. Where's evil you? I I don't know. Doesn't matter. Take them all back for a little talk. Sorry to have mistaken you for a bandit. It was evil use fault, I won't blame you. Real Septim is the general right here. Uh, looks like it. I have a lot of issues with evil you. For years I've been trying to track him down. But he always got away, I know where he's at bro. In that case, we, since we want the same thing, why don't you get on board with us? Well, I never plan on joining the army, but this really, could really work. Great, it's still them. Let me show you around. There's paperwork you need to do, follow me. Uh, our current combat power should be enough, yet at this moment, the trail went cold. No, it didn't. I know where he's at. Exorcist. Back me up, bro. Here we go. Alright, I believe Zhang K has introduced Exorcist to you. Seriously, General Lion, the Yuling Guards are about to become a circus. Aha, uh -huh, a circus. Isn't that fun? What a wonderful idea, Marshal Gal. That will certainly boost the soldiers' morale. Let strength speak for itself. By the way, as to the bandits, it's too bad they didn't leave any clues behind. Does anyone have anything you think to add? 
I hear the Black Altar Sect has a stronghold in Luo Yang, and I've sent someone to look into it. Right, I was hunting down the Black Altar Sect followers with a monk from Shaolin Temple a while back. A detailed search of Luo Yang should be in order. Me, one of the new clerk works is at ready. Good, I don't need many, thank you. Reporting in! Oh no, a bunch of the Black Altar Sect followers are breaking in. What? How many are they? About a hundred. Are you kidding me? What kind of pushovers do they think the Yulin Guards are? I would just say they cast strange spells. Oh, they can't act recklessly. Genkei, Hulei, and Hayashi, you'll lead the attack and I'll guard the entrance to the barracks myself. The Swam, you'll be my orderly. Master Gal, take 500 Yulin Guards uphill and protect His Majesty. Yes. Alright, move out. Okay, sir. It's time to duel! Pretty pop pop attack. They keep coming. What the hell is going on here? Oh, these are the Confucius. Oh no, I lost my skibbity pop attack. Oh, hell. Oh my god, these guys suck. I hate them. Oh, there's dead people. Their old enemy is in retreat. Doesn't look like a loser's retreat. They must be up to something. In addition, Huang Lei met Chancellor Anna in private during the chaos. A busy man. Please keep watching over him. Gotta meet Marshal Gao uphill. Understood. Actually, a ninja. You got rid of the enemies. His Majesty all right? It's safe up here. His Majesty is all right. Oh no, bad news! There you are, General Septum! His Majesty, His Majesty is missing! What? Let's go and check it out! You have one job, Marshal Gal. God. There's no trace of the enemy, but I couldn't find His Majesty anywhere. See anything unusual, Your Highness? No, His Majesty, His Majesty just disappeared out of the blue. Shoot, it could be a spell from the Black Arctic set. Meet the Yulin guards in search of vicinity, Marshal Gal. Yes, your majesty. Oh, I'm the majesty now. Yeah. We're in trouble. The Black Arctic set could have cast a spell, but how are we going to look into that? It shouldn't be hard for you to track it down, Septum, since you excel at casting spells. What do you mean? I'm talking about your previous life. Also, your past memories mean a lot to me. But you'll need to recall it first. Think of the friends whom you can't see. Oh, and the others. I hate to admit it, but it's actually not a bad idea. Hey, guys. Master Hu Yan turned into Li Jing. He said he regained his memories of his, from his previous life. Perhaps I could run it by him. Yo, dude. Septum, Satan suggests that you retrieve your memories from a past life. Because you're, they're useful to him as well. I guess so. Maybe the only way to solve our current predicament. Generally, people will recall things that have happened in their previous lives after they die. That's the easiest way to gain memories of our past lives. Ah, uh, do you mean I need to die? 
It doesn't mean that. You have to die. Just you need to realize that your existence is based on your soul rather than your physical body. The spirit fusion pod is exactly a place where only a soul can exist. It may be easy for you to truly understand yourself in the pod. Isn't that what I'm doing now? Only my soul is in the pot right now. Not exactly. Now you're in a state similar to dreaming. You know there's a door leading toward downwards in the pot? Door, there should be a place where other demons are detained under the door. I hell? Would you like to try to go into the door and have a look? I tried, but I failed. I really get in. You failed because you can't get in with your physical body. You need to break free from the idea that you cannot leave your physical body. Okay. Where is this place? Ah hell. Light and dark me. I'm you from the past. I'm you from the future. Past future? In the past, you were smart yet stupid, strong yet weak, kind yet selfish. It's full of contradictions. You feeling with confusion, challenged God together with Satan. At the same time, you knew it was a waste of effort. Therefore, I am the experience of your past errors, and I am the unmet goal you've selected. Nice, we did it. We're super powered now. How was it? Go to the lower level of the spirit fusion pot just now? I thought you were going down, but in fact I saw you return to your body. Huh, so that is what's in my mind. It's better this way. You should understand yourself in your mind. Instead of out of your body, what did you see? Well, I began memories of my previous life. Most of the spells that Satan and the Dread King used were created by me. I'm the best. The spell evil you used to kidnap the Emperor was taught by Satan. It would be easy to track down. In addition, I've also gained memories of the future. No, they are the goals towards a bright future. Great, you've known the cause and effect of your past, and you've also known what to do in the future. This is exactly what is called great wisdom in Buddhism, but this is just the beginning of your journey. Oh my god, it better not be. Many people think possessing great wisdom means success and do wrong things as a result. Yes, I will work hard. Thank you, Master Huiyang and Li Jing. It doesn't matter how to call it. Well, just do what you should do. Hi. Ah, here you are. Please, wait a minute. I can track the teleportation circle made by Evil You. Ah, you can go to hell through the magic circle. The Emperor was sent to hell by the circle. Hell is a place where there are pans filled with boiling oil and mountains full of knives and a rabbit. Something like that. Besides, people can only enter hell through the circle and they need to find a way, another way to relieve it. In other words, one might not be able to come back after entering. That's right! I don't require all the members of the Yulin Guards to enter hell, so follow me only if you have the courage. Badoop. I've been here, sure enough. This is a reused place. The Bloody Maze, we're here again. Oh, well. Really hell! Beard Marshal Gal. Are you kidding me? I've been through a lot, but it's my first time to come to hell alive. I'd rather be afraid of it after death instead. Ha ha ha, great! Not the time to be afraid. Oh my god, these losers. What's up, guys? We have three members of the Yulin Guards. I admire their courage. The official members of the Yulin Guards are brave enough to save the Emperor at the cost of their lives! All of them will come if you order them. Seems all people have arrived. I think it's enough. We can't expect Chancellor On to follow us. What the hell? Eunuch, Miss Wong, why are you here too? I'll do everything for the Emperor. Except him to say I couldn't come. Fine, you guys. Just stay with me and don't run about. But how can we find the Emperor in such a place? Plus, well, this maze is large. Let's divide our forces into two groups to search for Marshal Gao, your team goes ahead along the way, and the rest come with me upstairs. Okay, we have no time to waste. Let's go. Oh, they're dead. I like how all the nameless people went together. That's fantastic. I really approve of that. I'm sure they'll do great things. The Devil Flute! Okay. 
It's even the same enemies. Make way, make way. It is your boy. Can't believe these enemies are back, really. Toasty, baby. Oh, these guys are actually tanky. In a lot of levels recently. Combo, combo! Scandal subduing. Oh wow, what the hell? That's weird. Extra dead. Oh, I heard him this time. Nice. Another dead end. What? Ducks. Ah, oh, this way. Ah, oh, hell, get off me. Here we go again. Cornelius. Septimau, how dare you scare me? Ha ha ha, Cornelius, you're still easily scared. Well, it seems you've regained your memory. You used to enjoy frightening me in the past. You seem to have failed to become terror itself. You're still a coward after all. It's all your fault. Well, in my opinion, you're just shirking responsibility. Stop talking about old times. Where did you take the Emperor? I didn't do it. You're asking the wrong person. Of course you didn't do it. 
But you are the one who came up with the idea. So you always have, isn't that so? <laughs> you should know it's hard to get anything out of me. You helped me restore my memory because you knew... Want to know the method of making that thing, right? To be honest, that thing is defective and won't work. It's up to your Lord Satan to decide if it works or not. Seems you can't be persuaded. Let's see if you'll change your mind. If I beat you up, perhaps you'll become the king of suffering. Ah. Guy up again. Well, that's just fine. Billion damage. Use too many, outside my spells, I'm not going to use too many resources. I do want him to die at like a reasonable pace, though, so I'm just still using the same spells. Suck. because I don't want to stay here forever. And he's yelling himself. But Scan is still doing like pretty much counteracts it. that the Emperor isn't here. Go back and take uh, the other way to meet Marshal Gal. What about this dude? Father? Ah, uh, is it to see you away? Father, why are you here? I was brought here by the Western clergy and he said I was dead. Thus I had to stay in hell and so. Anyway, where are your mother and brother? Left with you too. That's so, then you must have also... 
No, I'm still alive. <laughs> Stuffed him up in the entrance to hell and I got in it with him. Ooh, it's great that you're fine. Let's leave this awful place now. I think he can. Well, I'm a long time no see. Master, Master Hu Yan, aren't you dead? Well, I still have some matters to resolve in the mortal realm, so I haven't left yet. Master Wang, you already died, and you'll only become a wandering ghost, even if you return to the mortal world. There must be some mistake. I'm I'm a Samaritan. I should go to heaven instead. Samaritan is just a title. But I accumulated countless merits by downloading, donating money to the poor, and building bridges and temples. Am I still not a good person after doing so many good deeds? I told you the story before. Once upon a time, an emperor asked Patriarch Bodhidharma from the Shaolin Temple how much merit did he accumulate by building temples and providing money and food for money. But the Patriarch Bodhidharma answered him candidly that he had no merit. No merit? That's impossible. But you did his hypocrisy. You didn't help anyone's money. For example, when you invite a friend to dinner, you might uh, bring him war food and warmth, but it doesn't change his mind and turn him into a good man. I see, but although I have no merit, I didn't do anything heinous to deserve this hell. Really? Didn't you always bribe officials for privileges? Well... I can tell you clearly that the Tang Empire is on the decline because many officials have been corrupted by bribes. You were one of them who harmed the country. Shouldn't you suffer in hell? What the f- Well, I don't think so, but that's okay. Well, about that, so I want to say, Master Wong, although you can get out of hell with us, you would just become a ghost wandering in the mortal world and cannot go to heaven. What you can do now is confess your sins immediately and suffer in hell. Pretty rough, man. Father. You worry it was my fault. Master Yan, lightning like roars and lightning, awakening me from a dream. I won't go with you. I want to stay in hell and reflect on my fault. Yeah, no matter what you do, I'll try to make it up for you. It's unfair for you to suffer like for me. As long as you pursue your happiness and be a good person, I'll be satisfied. I I will. Okay, that's enough. You should go. Yes, farewell, father. Wow, that game for him. I mean, when he the only time I heard him bribe somebody, I know there's all this stuff that happened in the. Probably not what we saw, but like, the only time he offered to bribe was to help us, which would have saved people, allegedly. But whatever, man. Obviously, I can't see the whole story, but still lame. He seems like a pretty good dude, from what I've seen. But whatever. Whatever, whatever. Oh, his group would be the... No, maybe not. This way now. Nope, still blocked. That's probably like an in-game thing or something. Other. Yeah! <laughs> 
Thirty thousand. What the hell? Is that right? Thirty thousand. I don't even know what to do with that. I don't even know what to do with it half the time anyway. So what the hell? See them. Boys? Where are the boys? where the shop used to be back in the day Like Alter Sect? What's going on? How can you get here? Stop talking nonsense! Why did you- where did you hide the Emperor? I don't know what you're talking about. Please leave here. <laughs> There's an exit in the magic circle behind them. The Emperor must be there. So you are the people who are guarding that. Darn it, charge! Whoa. Oh, what? Ah, uh, new ability. We got pure Yen Thunder. Stick with the AoE for now. <laughs> These are normal confusion people, they are so screwed. Teleport? You have you all come to save me? Evil you, you leave the Emperor alone. No way, the Emperor is my sacrifice to Lord Satan. Sacrifice Satan? Ah, uh, Lord Satan said it's a good place for sacrifice. Lord Satan promised to give me the magic power to dominate the world. If I sacrifice the Emperor. That's complete and utter nonsense. Leave the Emperor alone. You don't want to be killed. If you go further, the Emperor will die first. Oh, it's saying, what's up, man? I'll protect the Emperor. Attack those believers. What? You are. Hey, he's double crossing you. It's a double double cross. Oh my god. Bet you didn't see that coming. He's going to double cross you, then he's going to double cross me, and then everybody will be double crossed. Just saying things. I like how the team just decides to ignore the fact that we know he's Satan. And all these problems are caused by Satan, so I, I just can't spend my disbelief there. On how stupid these characters are. Like, for the sake of the plot. Okay, 
Nice, one damage. Well, you has been killed. You can rest now, your majesty. Are you alright, my lord? Oh, Chancellor Miles, fortunately you're here. Glad we caught up or the consequences would have been terrible. Great to see you're alright, my lord. Let's talk about the other things back to Chang'an. Yes, yes, let's go back to Chang'an. Although you didn't make a great contribution to solving the crisis, I know you also made huge efforts. Yes, I'm ashamed. It's a pity that I wanted to appoint you as a formal official, but there were too many objections. Now the Black Arthur sect has officially collapsed. As we agreed before, I'll remove you and appoint Master Gal as the general of the right you lead in guards. Yes, your majesty. Okay, go to do a handover now. What? Feels so good to step down as general. What are you going to do, guys? Goes without saying that I'll quit. What am I saying for if you're leaving? Me too. Hey, you're leaving too! Oh, we're only here because of Septim. I'm afraid you'll have to find your own men, Marshal Gal. I understand. It's working as Yulingar was amazing, but I've got a better offer. See ya! I ain't saying, dude. Even when you were rescuing the Emperor, Huang Lei had frequent contact with Chancellor Iron. I'll tell after him, see what he's up to. General Gao, I admire your courage to go to the depths of hell with me, as well as your loyalty to the country. As Master Bai said, you people truly want to help you, this will only increase your enemies. Seeing Chancellor An corroborating with Miles, I'm almost sure a terrible disaster will strike the Tang Empire if it happens. How many people will fight shoulder to shoulder with you? Well indeed, no one I guess. That's all I have to say, just do our best. What the hell? <laughs> what a <laughs> I'm going to keep up with Hayashi to investigate Gate Hong Lei. What about you? I have some free time, so I'd like to stay in Chang'an for sightseeing for a while. You have no place to stay, you're welcome to stay at my home. Really? Thank you so much, Master Bai. Septimus is tired too, right? You come back early when you're done with your business. No problem, I'll be on my way then. Where the hell are we going? What are we doing? Maybe I should go to Master Buys first, just to make sure. What's up, gang? Holy crap, it's empty. They lied to me! It was all a ruse to get rid of me. Oh my god. I didn't want them in the party anyways. They actually make things more difficult, surprisingly. What am I supposed to do now? Ah, uh, I'm the Emperor now. You probably... Go to Luo Yang, I'm guessing. Since nobody seemed to give me any kind of tip on what to do. Minecraft makes the ocean noise before she does that spell for some reason. Nice. I really thought we could go to the Talus place before we killed that dude. But whatever. What's up, boys? I didn't even talk to you. Get out of my way. I'm guessing this is not the right place. Ah, darn. The place for ta I have a membership card. By the way. Okay, where the hell? Am I supposed to go to the mountain? Like, where would they be? Where would they be? 
Or maybe I... I don't know, actually. We'll figure it out, I guess. I actually know a place I want to check real quick. I wish probably just auto attack these guys. Oops. West Market, I guess. Let's check that out real quick. I figure it's either West Market or the freaking Gallon Temple place. I guess it could be that mountain too, but... Uh, I'm not going to do all that man. unless they made me some. I don't see it happen. Where would he have gone? Like, for real though.
There doesn't seem. Holy hell. Rock. What the hell is this? Demo's workshop. Welcome to Delmo, I'm the devil of Siamine Hong. Don't bother me, I'm working Oh, these are the game people. Okay, cool. Nice. Gulp. Oh, we found them, random people. Uh, there are plenty of ways to lose weight on the market, but there aren't any to gain weight. The only place we can exercise around here are the sports clubs. Very troublesome without a club member card. I have one. Don't bother me, I'm listening to my singer CD. I'm famished, is there any way to be immune to hungry? Does anyone have fruit and flavor of the gods certification? I want them. I do. For Alan Kuo, if you want some Tom, Dick, or Harry dolls. Not being able to collect all the games over the years is one of my life's greatest regrets. I'm broke. You how troublesome. I drink all the scented tea, but don't have the time to buy more. Dang. I'm watching Portrait Album right now. Gangster Gloves. Once you've successfully collected all the signatures of the Domo team, I'll give you some Tom, Dick, or Harry doll. Good care. Please. Oh, signature. Hey, right. Pan, what's that? It's a drink made. Oh. But I don't have any. Speak to me when you find it. I'm not doing that. Hell no. I'm not doing the demo freaking quest squad. Hell no, nah, boy. Oh, he found it. That's not for me. I am very, very confused. Where? Oh no, it was this way. Album. Oh, I need that for something I don't care to do. Yeah. Oh, that's all extra. Hanging the bill looks here. Oh, please. That was a noise. Awful. Uh, I don't think the Fury Temple is going to hurt these guys, actually. Oops. Yeah. Um, how do you hurt these people? Oh, they just got to keep running them up. Okay, sick. Oh, the other one died anyway. This one don't seem to be going the same way.
sucked, actually. No one gave me any hint of where he was going to be at. It really hurt me. I don't understand. Using the Tian Shan figure on the painting, I can teleport to Tian Shan right away. Oh, maybe this guy will help me then. Hey man, you got any idea where this loser is? He won't talk to me. Septim, I want to travel to Tang with you. Oh, are you going with us? However, I cannot leave here for now. I've sealed an ancient demon here. I, it keeps me tied to this. But I have an idea. Find a treasure that can replace me and keep the demon sealed. The sword of sealing you have on you would do the trick. I've got plenty of swords of sealing. I can give you as many as you want. Wouldn't that be wonderful? If you have 17 swords of sealing, I can get out of here right away. Do I have 17? 17 swords of sealing? I have enough, maybe? How many do I have? Go. Thirteen. Not even close. What? This place sucks! Now you're going to the same place. You suck. Maybe I should go to that camp where what's his face is. That's probably good. Where is that camp? I don't remember. Yes. Are you there? I don't know. Uh. I think I know where I want to go, though. Yeah, it could have been an auto-attack group, but whatever. My boys, here anymore. Oh, Where are we? Ah, oh, it's a big circle. Thank God. Where's that one thing? At? to use that one thing to teleport around the talisman of earth whatever it is and what's the one 
Yes. This. Where is that one place? The where the guards are. Is that place like not accessible after you get demoted? Please stop. God, please stop. at all. It's just I cannot find where the hell I'm supposed to go and these enemies won't get the hell off me, bro. Ah, Lord Almighty. I'll just go into random buildings until I run into somebody. Not here. Who are you? We have the new items, right? Where is the stupid tab for, like, this teleporting place? Not here, bro. Freaking stupid. It's so stupid. Okay. Sword apparently means to make everything disappear. Because it was in new, I couldn't. Whatever. There's a teleport item. I know I have one. I mean, I can't. But.
Burst stone thing. Where the hell is this? Oh. I wish. Where have I really not been? This is a good question. I like how I can leave using this thing though, but I can't leave normally. Oh, please don't ask me any dumb questions. What the heck? Oh, whatever. Good. What's the deal? The time. Aunt Chancellor Ant's coming out. There you are, Huang Lei. Since the clergy speaks so highly of you, I bet you won't let me down, will you? Of course not. I put everyone to shame when it comes to wisdom. Excellent. You're pretty reliable. More. With my help, you'll definitely ascend to the position second to no one, Chancellor. Oh, second to no one. No, that sounds not bad. Should be perfectly content to spend all day doing re academic research then. Is that it? I see. I'll make your wish come true. You won't regret this. Come on, let's talk inside. You snake. Heard that? They're conspiring to take the throne. Precisely. What should we do? Need more concrete evidence. Turn uh, Chancellor Anne in. I can find something if we sneak into the mansion. That's not a walk in the park. The way I see it, I should stay in keep. Thank you. I'm gonna go warn Master Bot. Oh, thank God. We figured something. Oh, where is it? Wrong. Why are you all here? Need a septum. Miss Wong was taken away. What? We were attacked by the remaining forces of the Black Altar Sect on the way back, and Miss Wong was taken away in the fight. Septum, they want you to go- Okay. Okay, I'm going now. Septum, I'll go with you. Last, please come back safely. I'm teleporting. At least I figured out how to teleport. That's me. 
Because then I don't have to fight any of these losers. I need to go to a grocery store. Grocery or whatever. Grocery store. Whatever you want to call it. Friend, why do you say that? I've been going around doing business and collecting the complete battle equipment of Emperor Hadrian the last night of the ancient Roman Empire. I couldn't even find them, even in... Would you be able to accept it if you were me? You can only come across such rare treasure serendipitously. Okay, you can't accept it. My friend, if you can give me... Do I have that? I think I might. I think I have all that. Yeah. What? Yeah, I have. What? I think I have. What if I hit now? I have that reverse. I guess not. Screw you then. I had them all, but I guess not. I need, yes. These. Okay, Talos losers, let's do this. Alright, what's up? Thanks for the not help, you bird. Master Who Wrong, what are you doing here? I noticed that there have some been some suspicious characters lurking around this pagoda. And I reckon they're the Black Altar sex followers you've been make who've been waking waves lately. Same reason we're here. Yeah, I'll go with you then. Divine flavors. Zero Blade Heavenly Yama. Plus one damage. Let's go. It's huge. Value upgrade. Yeah. Bead. Anything but the bead. Wow. Nice. 
Let's be old guy. The hardest thing in the game to hit. Do you have any divine dew? Here, yeah, maybe. Uh, when will I see the light? Yes. Pain heaven fan. Game software. Oh, wonderful. Yes. Sages guard this place to send these. Do I have it? Have it. Feed Tai Chi figure heaven fan. Have Tai Chi. God, are you kidding me? So I have a bead. I haven't had a safety fan. I don't know if I have a type of figure. Divine what? Well, divine flavor. Must divine water or something. Maybe that mirrored water counts. Let's go back and check. Hey, really? 
little hell in this game, because God bless, dude, there's way too many enemies. Maybe it's downstairs, I don't know. Wait, there's something down there. Alright. Garment. That is not what we're looking for. You suck. play for now. Playing is a good idea. Oh. Help me get this stupid statue thing. Oh, forever. Hell off me. Alright, let's go look for some divine dew, I guess. That fleeing thing helps a lot. Got divine dew, bro, please. everything do okay you are you a divine flavor yes okay for you then oh I've got all five volumes right here not bad at all they did not what the Hit the no key, but that's all right. I need divine do. Oh wait, oh no, this crap again. Divine do, bro. Yes. So we bought it. Sick. Let's go. God, I hate fleeing battles, honestly, but this game is way too overwhelming with constant enemies. Because the game puts you in a bad situation if you're too weak to fight things later on, but I think I'm pretty overstrong from fighting everything. Maybe. Give me the stupid statue. Oh, Chang Chang? I don't want Chang Yi. What? Thank gosh. But I want that. I don't understand. How do I get your statue up, bro? What the fudge? 
Oh, we found. Oh my God, Taiji figure was fell all over, blending in on me, bro. Yeah, we can go back to doing battle. We get this figured out. Hey, take it then. Turds. Hate y'all. Everybody get on a pedestal. Oh no, it's this puzzle. Or... Oh, it's actually simpler. Oh, you suck. Not as simple as I expect, unfortunately. It reads to pray, draw, and draw lots with their heart ones which will The fortune stick box came from the Tang Dynasty. You pray sincerely, ask for what you want, and draw lots after the search for the matching explanation on the shelf behind. Such a simple cr and crude method really be effective? Oh yeah, God bless. I didn't mean to click. Oh, that's cool. Chang Yi will do something. Seems that we need something heavy to press on it. This thing. This thing. Something. Do I actually have to slide it? I'll do that. Okay. How is this? Thing attached to the corpse control figure, it means the clockwork was made from corpses and that you can use your corpse control figure to move it. Corpse control figure? It's a kind of spell. Find the fortress. Oh. Oh, no. I will skip every battle right now. Not the one I need. I'm a bug man. Bug man. Can I use that on this one over here? Or do I have to get a whole new one? Please don't make What is this? Oh, you gotta be good. My money!
Да, 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 Shaking something out there. Damn, I should be pretty close to leveling up, I believe. I believe you. You're shooting rabbits at us. What's up, my guy? Evil you. Swank. Sir Septim, are you here to save me? Are you alright? You're too done talking. Evil you, you're still alive. How oh, rude. Why do you all, all say that I'm dead? Y'all saw you die in that village. Do I look dead speaking to you right now? <laughs> Is dead man a fake? I don't think so. The one you weren't even there, bro. The one in front of us may not be a human, but rather a ghost. You foolish monk, stop talking nonsense. But I will admit that things are indeed pretty strange. I haven't eaten and slept for a long time. Am I already immortal? That's it. It must be. I've achieved immortality. Alas, every ghost says so. No matter what you are, I'll just make sure you die again. Miss Wong, you better keep your distance. Oh hell. Don't turn her into a monster. Get out of the way, woman. What's happening? Just one of my spells. Did you think I was painting portraits just for fun? Darn it. This is my possession spell with which I can control others as I please. For Satan ordered me to protect the woman you want. So I helped protect her by letting a powerful devil possess her. Satan again. On second thought, since I'm already immortal, why should I bother following the commands of others? Wouldn't that be strange? I this is more fun. Girl, go and kill something. Light, I guess. Okay. I know. Well, I've already used light on her. It didn't work, so. Septim, it seems that Miss Wong has been possessed by an evil ghost. I'll ask the exorcist to use Lion Roar and see if he can force the evil ghost to reveal its true form. 
Hey, hurry. Exorcist. R. Oh, what the hell? Exorcist, after I use my special move, you suck. No, I'm just kidding, it's fine, whatever. What, where am I? Brother Septon, what happened? You're possessed by evil you spirits, but you're fine now. You better keep your distance for now. Oh. Do you have any other tricks? Though you defeated my paper figures the last time, that doesn't mean you can defeat the real me. Take this. Alright, bro. I have bad news, and I have bad news. Chungi! Chungi! Oh wait, what? I don't have enough fidelity. I know who can, though! Chungi time! Out the rabbits. She has to heal. Putting in that damage though. Could he possibly be dead dead this time?
Damn, Exorcist. <laughs> As expected, I've attained immortality. You can't kill me anymore. Who are you? Don't you want the spear fusion pot? Spear fusion pot? Oh, yeah, so you'll just give it to me? Oh, yeah. Welcome to the party. No, impossible! But well, since you're not human, it should have no problem with you. The legendary spirit fusion pot was in your hands all this time. I brought it from my hometown without knowing it was such a big deal. By the way, how much do you know about the Juan Yuan sword that evil you spoke of? It is an ancient legendary artifact crafted by Emperor Juan Yuan. The Emperor used it to slay the demon Chi Yu and build this peaceful world. That moment was the beginning of Chinese culture. And after that, the Zhuan Yuan sword was passed down onto many heroes, all of which accomplished stuff in the legends. I've heard of. Hey. Now that the problem's gone, we'll be taking our leave. I see, man. Please. Everybody run. Everybody run. We're not dealing with this. It's not our problem. Yes, we're out of here, baby. Now that we got Miss Wong out, I'll part with you here. Thanks, you guys. I can't thank you enough. I'll take Miss Wong back to Master Bai's mansion. Before I go, investigate Chancellor Anne's rebellion. Have you already found concrete evidence? Ayashi and I overheard the conversation between Chancellor Anne and Huang Lei. I'm sure they're plotting a rebellion. What? I can't pretend I did not hear that. I must go with you. Me neither. Count me in. Okay, so I'm to the party, guys. Let's go. Starting to melt again, it is hot, boy. See you, girl. Get out of here. Bye. That was great. Is Miss Wong all right? I'm fine, Master Bai. Fortunately, Septim saved me. Well, you are still active, manipulating the Black Altar Sect after death. Is he this powerful? Yes, yeah, Septim is so strong that he isn't afraid of any ghosts. Well, it's nothing special. I've seen all kinds of monsters and ghosts. In a word, I'm exhausted from all this, so I'm going to freshen up myself. See you, lady. Septim, you've done lots of work. Take a good rest today. Might as well. I'm planning to go to Chancellor's and to visit I have oh my god not plot with the lady not plot with the lady no oh wait can I go yes See you now first heard everything okay so yes let's go no plot yes and I know where her stupid mansion is now a miracle. Progress. Okay, guys, what's up? How are you all here? I mean, you came at the right time. We were having some disagreements. I'm not sure who we were wrong, and I want to break in, but Hayashi stopped us. Uh, since we've confirmed Chinglet Sir Ann is guilty, we should deal with him as soon as possible. I think so as well. No, if we break in without conclusive evidence, it will be regarded as an act of treason. I see, so you're arguing because of this. Lin Meng was right. Who? Without concrete evidence, it will be difficult to convict An Lu Shan. Better to let us professional spy handle this. Uh, Chancellor An is leaving Chang An soon. We can't delay any further. Might as well, since it's too difficult to keep a close eye on Chancellor An. I think we should continue monitoring Huang Lei. Huh? Why? Right, Huang Lei isn't very vigilant. It will be easier to monitor him if he stays in the Chang'an. 
Wong Lei does something suspicious, it must be Chancellor Ann's orders by letter. As long as we find the letter, it can be used as evidence. You're right, it's safe and secure this way. I see, this is indeed a good plan. I'll monitor and inform you if he does anything unusual. Too hard to do it alone. How about the four of us take a turn? Well, it's better to take turns, as it might take a long time. Fine. Okay, so let's take turns to watch him. What? Christ. What's the matter? The Master Bai has adopted me as his daughter. Uh, so when Miss Wong, CEOA, is married, she'll have parents there. Oh, that's great. Congratulations. I actually was up. Excuse me, Septim. Today, Huang Lei received a letter at Chancellor Ann's house. We should be able to use it as evidence. What has Huang Lei been up to lately? Looked like he was making some some new clockwork device, and he seemed nervous receiving after receiving the letter. Seems like this is the right time to strike. Let's infiltrate there to investigate. Her Zhang Qi and Master Hu Ruang, we agreed to infiltrate the place tonight. All right, let's infiltrate the place and investigate tonight. I'm ashamed to ask for your help in these major national affairs. People in the Tang Empire have been kind to me, so I'm just repaying this kindness. Same for me as well. Let's go into action tonight. Got it. You guys, please be careful. Ninja Man again. There he goes. Everyone's dead. Guards seem to have been killed by arrows. Hmm. Looks like Shang Ki and the others arrived early. All right, let's head us inside. Let us head inside as well. Oh, here we go. Wow, exotic treasures are lying all over the place. Chancellor Anne sure is wealthy. It's said that Chancellor Anne is as wealthy as an entire nation. It's hard to believe you don't witness it with your own eyes. It's hard to believe when you witness it with your own eyes. I probably read that wrong. Ah, oh, it's Chang Yi's. Ah, oh, Chang Yi's. Fungus and treasure. A million guard day. Oh my god, please. Oh, she's got some flailing hands over there. He's got all the spells I bought. Nice, good for him. So 
luck again. Uh oh. Time for the old trickaroo. Haven't had to do this in a while. Hello. How did you get in? Duchess Rongi. How did you know who I am? Majesty ordered the Duchess to marry Ching An's son and King Ju. So the whole capital knows about it. Uh, his real motive is to use my marriage as a way to hold Ank Kyung Chu as a hostage. Cheer up, Duchess. We're here to find evidence of Chancellor Anne's rebellion. Recently, many heroes have sneaked in, attempting to find evidence, but this mansion is designed by Huang Lei. This managed to stop them in the tracks. You know how to enter and exit the mansion? The paintings. Chancellor Anne probably did too many evil deeds, therefore the entire mansion is filled with secret passages. You try and looking around. Some more herbs with me, please use to restore some vitality. Vitality. Much obliged, Dutch. Oh, and also, Huang Lei recently recruited a bunch of Western barbarians who are able to use West witchcraft. Please be careful out there. What the hell, Lillian? What septum? You you two know each other? Huh? Weren't you killed by Cornelius? Miles definitely. Misunderstood. As a matter of fact, after Miles took me away, I found a doctor and saved my life. What? I no longer love Miles. He only used me for my own benefit. Except him. It's a trap. I finally understood that you're the one who truly loves me. Will you return to Gallia with me? Look, Boar still recognizes you. Boar. Except him. Boar is still inside the Spear Fusion Pot. Raj King, how dare you play your tricks again? Raj King, <laughs> it's just a couple of little demons transfiguring themselves into someone else. None of my business. How despicable, how dare you trick me by turning into Lily. You weren't so dumb. You really kill demons? I'm not sure. How is this? Mm hmm, as expected, accept him. He managed to see through Lord Satan's spell. Lord Satan wanted to give you a chance to return home immediately, but I didn't expect you to be so appreciative. Go back and tell Satan I've noted the slightest attention to Lord Satan has already given instructions to destroy your physical body if you resist. Come get me if you can! The Horseman. Wow. Crazy how he falls for the same trick every freaking time. Oh, one guy. Yeah. Right, uh, no. Where's... Oh, uh, does he count as something else? Where's our boy? That or you or whatever. I don't, know. I don't care anymore. Screw it. Looks like we've been discovered. I'd be like that. Or lie embracers. Scrolls, do not care. Help oh, me.
perfect. Hello, I'm the Rain Master. I don't have it. Okay. Okay. Ah, oh, hell. I don't care about the bombs, sorry. Oh, I... Try this one. Oh, what's up, guys? Oh, these stone statues look really familiar. Oh, yeah? Who are you wrong? It's Zhang Kei. Hmm, they're very lifelike. Almost like they'll come alive at any time. The skills of the sculpture is amazing. Yeah, I suspect that these statues are they themselves. And this magic can also be found in China. You might want to ask Evil You about it. Evil You. Oh Lord Septim, I swear that wasn't me. You know, should know that I'm stuck here and can't go anywhere. Are you familiar with this type of spell? It's just that I did make some talisman and gave them away, but it's not impossible to do them. Uh, why don't you release me first? I'll sincerely repent for my sins and be eternally grateful to you. I won't release you. And if you don't save them, I'll just get rid of you. No, please don't. I'll give you a new talisman, but using it will deplete all your stamina mana. Hmm, let's give it a shot. <laughs> Septim, thanks for your hard work. Cornelius, it's a good opportunity to eliminate you here now that you've wasted your strength. <laughs> Who cares? I didn't need it anyways. Let's fight him for the 50,000th time. Ah, yes. This is just meant to be. An internal conflict with the same boss. Over and over and over again. Oh boy. Better than that, son. Is indestructible. Shame. Thank you for saving my life. Zane might be the one who has harmed you, but I also bear some of the responsibility as well. Satan. Heard that Satan is the greatest demon in the world. 
Uh, it explains why we experience so many weird occurrences. Now she it may be very well become dangerous from here now onwards. This is, doesn't really concern you. I suggest that you work together for quite some time now. I can't possibly back out now. All right then, let's go together. Well, as long as we find evidence of Chancellor Anne's rebellion, I don't think we'll be staying here for long. What is this? 50-50. Yes, we found it. Uprising in Chancellor Anne's military order. Seems like Chancellor Anne is really planning a rebellion. Here we go! Oh, hell. Stop it. I was trying to pick up the item. Long lay, so that's where you are. Sit down, I'm busy right now. Infinite power equals the material mass multiplied by... Long lay, come with us to see the Empire. Your Emperor, you're such a disgraceful scholar. Stop making a den. Can't you see I'm busy? Call me when it's time for dinner. At the speed of light, then squared, so I miscalculated here. She's too preoccupied to speak with us. Let's look for evidence of Chancellor Anne's rebellion by ourselves. I've already found it. What? Look, a note written for Huang Lei by Chancellor Anne. Hmm, let's see what it says. Huang Lei, make sure to hide the military orders and uprising plan once you've finished reading them. After raising the troops, we'll head to the royal palace via the secret passage and assassinate the emperor. Now we finally ascertain what they're trying to achieve. We must report this to the emperor without delay. There appears to be an unusual mechanism under this. Let me give it a shot. Oh, nice. Switch for the secret passage. Or Chancellor Anne manages to mobilize the troops. We must find the military order and uprising plan, and use the secret passage to submit the evidence to Chancellor Anne's rebellion to the Emperor. Hmm. Hmm. What? Alright, I got one of those things at least. Ah, it's a new weapon. Portrait album, got, got a lot of their things, but I'm not too worried about that. To find the military, which one am I missing though? Or shut up. Nobody's talking to you. Ah, uh, hell. Come on, guys. Oh, oh no, I know who that is. Oh my god. Whew.
Hmm, have I used this one yet? Nice. Rising plan and Chancellor Anne's military order. Seems like Chancellor Anne is really planning a rebellion. No, no crap, dude. Really. I like how the attack effect changes. Down here for now. Now we just gotta go back to what's his face. I don't mess with this. If I ever get a turn. Had enough battles in here. I think from the con I have not played 100 times, but I'll take it. Over. Maybe I hit the R button so much that I thought it was 100 times, but I know I did not flee for 100 times. Oh, that for a fact. Big old fact. Come on, Lion. The Mimic? What the? Oh, it's Wukong! I'd like to capture him if possible. He's probably super strong. Super strong in lore. Oh, Winning Buddha. That's what he's called. Can't get him, so we gotta kill him. Well... Hopefully he won't kill us. Oh, he takes damage, so there's a chance.
God, he's sanky. Ugh. It's a miracle. Possible, bro.
Oh, we finally killed him. for this crap. new gloves. See it actually. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Actually, I can check by doing this. Super crown thing. Yes. Oh, wait. Oh, uh, that's too loud. My brain ain't working. Don't care anymore. On the other side. Hell, what is she doing here? Isn't this one lay? One lay apart from your trees, and I'll also take a chance to avenge my family. So noisy, didn't I tell you to call me only when it's time for dinner? Did you see that I'm busy? Lime's light seems to be affected. Kill her. Kill him. Kill him, kill him, kill him. In order to obtain infinite power, we must multiply the material mass by the speed of light, then square it. No, I've missed out gravity. Light seems to be affected by gravity, and gravity is defined by... What the hell? Hmm, and that's gravity. Mother, mother, brother, sister, this evil dealer is finally dead. Finally rest in peace. Is he really? Did that actually kill him? That would be hilarious. Hello, I'm the wind count of hep. Oh, yeah. I learned bursting. Oh, she learned bursting gay all of him.
What? I thought she learned Burst and Gale or whatever. What the hell? something. I don't care anymore. Oh, yeah, I don't care. <laughs> Actually. Dragging the Dragon Throne really suits you. Right, it looks like it was specially designed just for you. <laughs> you sure know how to talk. This place is directly connected to the Royal Palace. Come without me. I can't meet the Emperor dressed like that. That's not the Emperor. Who are you? Uh, who are you? How did you get in? What, who are you? Urgent matters and need to see the Emperor immediately. Excuse us, Mr. Yang. It's the same if you tell it to me. Mr. Yang. In terms of rebellion. Rebellion? Men, someone wants to rebel! Someone's playing to- Oh my god. Okay, thank you. It is an outside rebellion. Can you listen to the full story? Who's making a din? Majesty, these people are trespassing. Majesty, we have an urgent master to report. Oh, it's Septum. You haven't brought a lion in. Did you invite up the performance troop again? Your Highness, that's a golden lion, raised by yours truly. Its name is Exorcist. It's been a while since I've attended court. We take a seat, Your Majesty. What? What? Alright, state your business. We found out the Chancellor Anne is planning a rebellion. Nonsense, Chancellor Anne and I are like father and son. Why would you rebel? <laughs> Calm down, Your Majesty. It's an uprising plan we found in Chancellor Anne's mansion. Alright then. Master Yang, bring it to me. Master Yang. Hmm. Hmm. Although this plan is titled as Rebellion Plan. How can we ascertain that it's from the Chancellor and himself? Majesty, I reckon that this plan could have possibly be written by anyone. And it shouldn't qualify as evidence against Chancellor Anne. They might have very well be attempting to frame him. I suggest that we do something. Majesty, you mustn't. It'll be too late when Chancellor Anne returns Ban Yang and starts an uprising. How dare you teach the Majesty what to do? Men, take him down! <laughs> yes, sir. To assist, do you wish to rebel? Majesty, I have no such intentions. Majesty refuses to give us a chance to explain. I'll gladly sacrifice all my life to warn and prove my loyalty for my country. These guards are useless. Grab that baldy! <laughs> what could this be other than a rebellion? Majesty, I'm fully dedicated to the welfare of the country. Please understand. You've hurt all these people before my eyes. Do you still think that I believe you're still doing this for the country? Your Majesty, learn my mistake. Master, who are you wrong? Master! There's the common people of the world, so don't interfere. Your Majesty, please consider carefully for the sake of your people. Master, who are you wrong? All these suicide monks. Uh, Mr. Yang, I think it's better if we investigate this matter thoroughly. Your Majesty, please don't listen to the lies of that baldy. Although Chancellor Anne possesses great power and military might, but for him to plan a rebellion is unthinkable. Are you kidding me? I can't possibly let outsiders gain credit for such a contribution. If Chancellor Anne is really plotting a rebellion, I should be the one to expose. I'll never let this bar baldy and barbarian take the credit. You darn villain. Isn't Hu Ruang's sacrifice sufficient for you? How dare you have to, the cheek to remain obstinate in this dire situation? Then calm down. Oh, nice. I am rebelling. Miles! Mr. Yang, leave this tent to me. 
Insolent lunatic, how dare you pull a sword with the palace guards? Grounds. Files will be warded handsomely if you take them down. That's when you've gone overboard. I think that I'd actually hope that you'll join us. Your expectations are not of my concern. What exactly did you come to China for? Uh, in the past, I could only control the rulers and make them do my bidding. Why are you speaking European? Don't you dare speak Chinese. Now I'll realize my personal desires. I'll first seize the powerful China, then proceed to conquer the entire world. Ha ha ha. Conquering the world that fascinating to you? I'll never join you. Hitting yourself against me will mark the beginning of all your suffering. Not again. Same bosses, bro. Over and over and over again. Thingy, take care of him. I don't have any power for it. Oh well, just punch him. Stand no chance. Until you do a one-shot ability or some bull crap. Kill me alive. Son, what now? What you gonna do now? Oh, well, it didn't work. Wait, because he's lost. And he's Big old cheater. I need to heal, so. Darn it! 
it! How dare you destroy my physical body! Man, what hell's going on here? Is that actually Satan or are we actually fighting? Oh, God, we took out Yeah. Fared. Man, quick! Come and kill the rebel! Oh, see, I, I hope he stays dead. Arnold, although we barely escaped the bunches of death today, didn't manage to get rid of the world of evil. Uh oh. It's a bomb! Septum, septum. I'll just have it. Where am I? You're inside a secret passage. I saw that your situation has taken a turn for the worse. I immediately threw a snow bomb and brought you out of the real world palace amidst the chaos. Thanks, dude. Miss Swing, why are you here too? Septum! You're badly injured. Let's not talk here. We must escape for now, lest soldiers soldiers catch up to us. I've already sealed the secret passage. Don't fret for now, but Septum, he's in critical condition. I'd like to return to my hometown, although relatives are waiting for me there company you, so you better recover soon. Fortunate. The Emperor doesn't want to give us a chance. One here has already given their all, such as the fate of the Tang Empire. Hayashi, I hope that we'll remember what we've learned here forever in our hearts. Septum. Hey, that you don't forget the lessons which the Tang Empire has taught us when you return home. I must say, I thank the Empire for making a friend like you. I won't forget. In the near future, the Tang Empire will fall into an era of war. Zheng Kei, I'm worried about Siu Ye's well-being then. Can I trust you to take good care of her? Rest assured, I'll take care of it. No, Septum! Let us part here, Miss Wang. I know that you have feelings for me, but we're different from different worlds. Maybe this is for the best. Septum! Unlocked after completing the story, Sunset of the Tang Empire. What's going on? The flashback, flash forward, flash sideways. We're flashing through time. I'm so. Oh, oh flashbacks. Was well, quite a journey, flashbacks. My life flashed before my eyes. Song, someone singing. I'm endlessly yearning to be in Chang'an. Insects home of autumn, but died the gold brims. Where am I? Am I dead? Is this the Western paradise? Above, it's Confucius. Above is the black night of heaven's height. Below is the green water billowing on. The sky is long, the road is far. Butterflies, my spirit, the spirit I dreamt of. Take it through. If the, for the mountains pass in the way, endless journey breaks my heart. Well sung, though I'm unfamiliar with its meaning. Song feels really beautiful. I wrote it. It's called Endless Journey. What a splendid poem. Fellow friends, thank you for appreciating my poem. Would you like to come in for some drinks? My name is Septim. You are? I'm Laureate Lee. Who? Oh yeah, Lee. Famous poet, Laureate Lee. Oh, wow. Wow. You're the famous poet, Laureate Lee. Yes, you heard of my name, but you don't look Chinese. <laughs> Did you come from abroad? Ah, oh, bro, I'm sorry. Hmm. I, I'm the also one who left my hometown, and the sentiment of your poem makes me feel homesick. I'll, I'll never make it back home ever again. Now there are wars everywhere and the people are destitute, it might be hard for you to leave. Has the war already started? Yes, it's already been several years since Chancellor Ann started his rebellion. So several years, it's been that long. You are Chinese and yet you're able to understand my poem. It shows that you have put in lots of effort to learn the language. I think it's what I came here to for. Came here to for what? The country has been emitted much from foreign countries. For instance, Master Zhuan Zhang journey to the West to acquire Buddhist scriptures, which made our culture prosper. Foreigners who come to visit and learn are hard to come by. 
now they can't even return to their homes. I'm unable to offer you much help. Please take the sword, so at least you'll be able to Juan Yuan, defend yourself. Juan Yuan sword. Tiny blade reflects one's own heart. Without any obscurity, it also reveals the correct path to its wilder. By seeing through the hearts of others, you can purify your own. Thank you, bud. This sword is just a cheap bargain bought off the streets. I gave it a good name. I called it the Juan Yuan sword. I knew it. Juan Yuan sword. Where do you go? I encounter a ghost. <laughs> oh my god. Septim, I finally succeeded in summoning you. Oh, it's Michael. What's up, dude? Place is Tian Shan. What's going on? Did I die? You died. Your soul started to wander around. It's only until you thought of the Juan Yuan sword that I'm able to summon you. Now you're finally qualified to take hold of the Juan Yuan sword. I'm already dead. That's a tribulation which you're destined to experience. Only though, through such enlightenment, can you resolve your troubles. Troubles? Your memories are still very vague, as you're unaccustomed to death. You'll gradually recall the events of your previous Seems to be related to Satan. Why is Miles here? <laughs> it's Michael, bro. Ha ha ha! I'm not Miles! <laughs> you saw Archangel Michael. Satan's twin brother. Hmm, I've heard of the legend. Some statue on the moving island was you. You're right! Satan was once an angel, but his pride caused him to fall from grace quickly. Ah. Uh, used to be a single heart and mind, but now we can't understand each other anymore. Paradise lost! What is he trying to accomplish? You're the one who sowed the seeds of causation. I I've sowed the seeds. In your previous life, you created the reverse mandala for Satan. Using it, he led the underworld and attempted to alter the law of cause and effect. In the end, a huge battle ensured between the heavens and the underworld. In which heaven was victorious, Satan has been banished to hell ever since. But he hasn't given up and is still bent on a comeback. Therefore, we allowed you to reincarnate into the mortal world to let you face the cause and effect of your own actions. First Mandela, that's right, I recall now. I designed it while I was in heavenly realms. Now Satan has managed to fully reconstruct it. What does he plan to achieve? Find him and you'll understand. I do. Except him, I must first create a new body for you. Is that even possible? This is a special exception considering the nature of your purpose and its importance to the heavens. This will consume a large amount of energy, so be careful not to stray too far from me. Otherwise, your new body won't sustain itself. Like, I'm not fated to die yet. How long will this body last? It can last for another 30 years, so do use it well. Septum, congratulations over granting your physical body. Li Ching, where are the others? I only know what Kama and Ak are currently at Tiat Shan. As for Nicole, she seems to be searching for your soul, but I don't know where she is. Ah, oh, looks like the list of things to do hasn't decreased at all, even after death. After you finally obtained the Shuan you want sword, you can count on me for assistance along the way. Give me the sword. Sword is mine! Excalibur! Necessary. Oh my god, he killed my other sword. And now we may only use the Zhuan Yuan sword. I don't even have it equipped. What the hell? But the Zhuan Yuan sword! Did I actually not get the Zhuan Yuan sword? More. Screw it. The bonk and people, it's your boy. <laughs> Need to kill Satan. I'm a bonk. Except him. Meow meow. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Aren't you already dead? How did you obtain a new body? Perhaps you've mastered the ancient arts of a gift. That can't be right. We witnessed Hayashi bury your body with our own eyes. It was the Shuan Yuan mortal who reached out to help me. He said that the heavens have constructed a new body for me. 
That explains. You even look a little younger than before. That darn fogey, he didn't even bother to inform us, meow. Uh, I didn't try to hide it intentionally, it's just that you didn't ask. I thought that you had returned to the heavens. Uh -huh, my soul was wandering aimlessly, and I even went to meet the great poet Laureate Lee. By the way, what are you doing here? Alma said that she remembered something interesting. Oh? I remembered something that happened while I was still at the heavenly realm. Now you didn't mean it, Chin, it, it these hundreds of years. This is due to Karma's stubborn nature in the matters of love. Although she claims to be born out of love, she's just a wandering soul in search of love after all. Now, how insulting. Am I just a wild kitten's wandering soul in your eyes? No point arguing with him. All humans are the same, obsessed with mortal affairs, and thus were unable to recall their time in the heaven, just like me. I forgot all about Wadad. What happened to Wadad? Dad and I are twin sisters, born of a single soul. Oh, here we go. Twins? Yes, with an inseparable heart. I was supposed to be Wadad's guardian spirit when she was born, but unfortunately I missed my chance. The story reminds me of Satan and the Archangel Michael. Yes, Archangel Michael, Satan are brothers, and of the same soul. Yeah, well, that explains you two bear a resemblance each. Septim, when the matter between you and Satan resolved, I'll become Redan's guardian spirit. Hmm, what's most important now is to find a way to stop Satan from committing evil again. A few years after your death, they started building the reverse mandala within the ruins of Chang'an, and it's almost complete now. It must be Cornelius' is doing. Satan's physical body has already been destroyed by me, so only Cornelius is left. We must stop him this time. Captain, you can use Tian Shan's teleport room to travel between Tian Shan and Master Bai's home in China. Captain, this will be the last time we meet. Thank you for your help, Kama. Meow, how about me? All right, thank you, Aunt. By the way, where did Nicole go? You've no idea. She's been clamoring about searching for your soul ever since you died. But we went our step away since. <laughs> Where to start searching for? I know, we go to Bai's place, obviously. Obviously. Master Bai here? Elder Bai has passed away. Oh, sick. What is it? Ever since Chancellor Anne's rebelled, his illness deteriorated with no signs of getting better. These books... Take them if you want. I've consulted Elder Bai regarding this before, so I'm sure he won't mind. Remember all those that I've read. Besides, I can't bring these books with me on my journey. Let's just leave them here. Well then. Well then. I just teleport. But where's the fun in that? Hey, mute man. He's just going to ignore me. Boy, is it ever hot here. Oh, hell no! Cornelius! How does your newly resurrected body feel? Great, but does it have anything to do with you? No, no. As long as you're happy with it, you seem to be in good. And much better than I imagined. You don't have to worry about it. I heard that you've successfully reconstructed the first mandala. Is that true? Indeed, the reverse mandala has been completed, and it is waiting your arrival. Cornelius up to this time. Then why don't you show me this reverse mandala of yours? Yes. Here, where's that little brat Nicole? You know where she is? That's weird. I ordered her to bring you here. Well, what's going on? How did Nicole get involved with it again? Doesn't Cornelia seem to be behaving too respectfully towards you? Something's wrong. Be careful. Let's ascertain the situation first. Top priority should be locating the reverse mandala and destroying it. Whatever. Oh my god. Oh, it's the boys. Combo breaker. <laughs> Welcome 
to the good guy team. Idiot. You just gotta believe. Oh my god, you stupid hoe! Oh my lord, my... Ah, oh, that pisses me off. Oh, there's a new chest here. Why? I want it. I have an inciting spear! Who can use that bad boy? Is that better than this, though? It is, wow. Insane in the membrane! Insane in the brain! Time long armor! Luong! Luyong! Team Black Reaper. How many of those do I have now? I might be able to get your boy. That one guy. I quit. Uh, no. Oh, no, no. No, no, no. no. I have 17. Okay, now's the time. Uh, I'll be back, boys. I have to go get your boy. That's helpful from here. Chan, here we come! Right place? Oh, hell no. Take me to the actual... Uh, there's more than one way to get around this. You turds. Take the portrait! Yeah! Finally got the sword. We need to get the little boy to help us. Whoever he is. Mysterious. Wow. Amazing. Secret. Stealthy demon goad thing. Here I go. Better be here. Where you at, small child? You really gone. Oh, there he is. Come with me. You have 17 swords of ceiling. I can get out of here. Okay. I have enough. There you go. Ah, with so many swords of ceiling, even the demon Xiao won't be able to break free. Demon Xiao? That's the demon I'm watching over. Quickly, put the thing. that the super demon that started China when they killed it? Put these swords in the stone chamber. The demon Xiao is painted on the mural. Mural. Put these swords here, right? No, don't touch the mural! Oh, Jesus Christ, what have you done? <laughs> we finally escaped! Yes, who are these old brats? Oh no, let's hurry and seal it up! 
You wish to steal me? Hey, 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 not unless the Emperor Huang and Zhuan Yuan sort of here. Have that. Yes. I don't think I have the Emperor Huang, though. I'm looking good. About that. Forceful. Where's the Black Reaper at? Yeah. yeah. Going sword, go. attack or something. Still 99999 damage from health. I paralyzed him. Hmm. Ah! 
So for all that damage again, I am so frustrated right now. Vitality back except for this. Please don't, dude. What the fudge? Such bullcrap, dude. It really is such bullcrap. Am I supposed to die to him? Because, like, this is near impossible. He's healing more than I'm doing to him. Constantly. I gotta revive him. I need to do something about that stupid Black Reaper. He's actually hurting me. I didn't think about him being the thing until I was getting destroyed by this guy. I hate to use Vitality to do it, but this guy happened. What the hell just... Oh, bullshit! I'm pretty sure I had the other one highlighted, but I could be wrong. It keeps doing it. It is highlighted. I just made sure. Oh my god, this this game, bro. That's so toxic. Okay. <laughs> what is going on? Okay. Okay, screw it. I don't know. I can't get rid of them. The game is being dumb. He's healing too much. This is dumb. Okay, that's my first loss, and it's because I have crap still. Okay. Alright, got it. Thank you. Could you imagine if it's. 
Alright, we're here. That's not bad. I could choose not to fight this guy, but I want to, so I'm going to. But I need to make sure everything's ready. Before we do that, I'm gonna go to the store, I'm gonna buy a lot of vitality stuff, and I'm just gonna spam the hell out of this Ruan Yuan sword. Um That is what we're gonna do. Can't spam the Juan you want sword. He heals way too much. It's ridiculous. What is this? You have? Okay. Antiques. I don't care. Actually, crazy enough. Oh wait, there's another chest there. Full tiny chest. I like the blueprints. Cool. Oh, don't do it. I need vitality stuff. As much vitality as possible. That's the best you got it right here. I think I'm ready this time. Hopefully. I didn't expect to have to fight that stupid demon, to be honest with you, because... All it said was, give me the key. It's... The whole point of giving him the swords was not to have to fight him. God dang it. That's the whole point. Why do we need the ceiling swords if we can't use them anyways? Okay. Don't touch it. That's just crap, crap RNG right there. Good thing we saved before we went in there. Thank <laughs> you. 
Actually, let me check something real quick. Uh, it's only one at a time. Screw that. Alright. Let's see, let's start with that AoE attack this time. That's nice of him. Let's use that one. We did it! Ebrion, I can't revenge you anymore! Ah! Take that, you idiot! Ichio yo! Gio! 
Bird? God bless. Oh my, that's awful. Dude, that was close. Jeez, just listen to me before you do anything. Here, pass me these swords. Why do we need to sew him? He's dead. Good, now we can go out and have fun together. Coming with me? Yeah, I've been getting bored staying here for so long. Obtain Juan Yuan Young like Oh, that was him when he was a kid. Cool. I don't know what that does for me. Oh, wow, that takes a lot of vitality. But that's cool. I didn't even know they were the same person, but now I do. I guess it kind of told me probably, but I didn't understand the translation. Likely. Where's the five element, whatever it was? The five element something, something, something. Five stone necklace. Where does that go at? Did he not wear it? She can wear it. Why can't he wear it? Oh, because it's a necklace? I'll save that when she joins my party. That's fine. That's a crappy item, but whatever. I thought I was going to get something awesome. Well, I mean, I got the little fella, but as awesome. Okay. Back to the main storyline. Can't believe it only took us two times. Well, uh, three times actually. Yeah, three times. Because the second time he just one shot me off the bat. But yeah, that's pretty miserable of a fight. Especially with health. I don't think I'm over leveled for it. So I, I think I might have been under leveled and possibly since I got so many levels from it. But yeah, it was tough. Base race. That's literally a base race. What the hell just happened? God, I just spawned in and they one shot me. Jesus Christ. First young Juan. Oh, wait, he's probably over here. Oh, release people. That's cool, I guess. Feel bad for the final boss. If I get to use him, he's probably dead. In record time. Sorry, right, Satan. <laughs> That's all I could say. Sorry, Satan. I want to let me save. And the dumb thing again. You override it, actually? Let's make sure. What's up, Step Septum? I am a god from the heavenly realms. Knowing that you would be in trouble, I came down to. I have three swords, but you could only have one of them. I hope you've made the right choice. Good luck. Long deep. Maybe it is. Yeah, that's a good one. How on earth did this hat place transform into something like this? Ain't it serious? Got to hand it for, to them for building a human bone Buddha hall here. I don't understand. What does this reverse manda actually do? Septum, let's make another dynamite and blow this place up. 
Got it. Do I actually have to go all the way? What the hell? Me and Nicole. Why are the there two septums? Septum, I didn't expect you to return. Explains why Cornelius would make a mistake. Could it be Satan? You possess my body? Satan? Cornelius, how dare you lie to me? You said that we could revive Septum. That's right. I said that I would resurrect Septum's body. But I didn't say the soul would remain the same. Septum, I'm sorry. Septum. Uh, aren't you a foolish one? But, but, I couldn't find your soul, so I... But you done with your lover's bickering. Cole returned to my side. You were once a great g demon general under my command. I erased your memories and sent you to Septum in an attempt to seduce him. Never did I expect you to join his side. I love Septum. I'll never follow you. Hey, best girl. A dog which by the hands that feeds is a bad dog. Observe how I deal with people like you. You'll destroy anyone that doesn't bend to your will. Hey, Septum. It appears that you have a new body which is created by the mortals. Looks like I'm right. No one else possesses such great abilities. I've returned to destroy you in the Reverse Mandala. Ha <laughs> ha, Septum. Haven't you realized how powerful the Reverse Mandala truly is? Back then, using only part of its power, granted you the ability to time travel. Once fully activated, it can interfere with the laws of cause and effect. With such pow great power in hand, do you even need to obey the will of heavens anymore? Law of cause and effect. The law of cause and effect, a restriction of force upon us by the heavens, and because of it we'll never attain true freedom. You're right, but I don't regret any of my decisions. Think about it. Do you wish to remain as a lackey for the heavens? Being your lackey sound like a better choice? <laughs> it doesn't matter anymore. I needed you to operate the reverse mantle in the past, but now I've obtained the memories required to operate it from your physical body. Which is to say you don't need me anymore, am I right? Then bring it on. I take you. Hey, Sane. Surprise! I got a present for you. Hey, boo boo! Huh? Oh, I didn't do near as much damage as I was expecting. Hey, tanky. Boulder smash. Hey, dude. What the hell is he doing to me? Okay, guy. What the fuck? That's not cool. God, he's spamming! Oh, I hate you, bro.
Not again. Ah, bro. something. Yes. Gotta be kidding me with this crap, dude. I think I bought a lot of these. I bought some mana, giving things to. That might be a problem. Chang Yi's doing some damage, but nobody else can do anything. Probably use that one shot spell right when I revive him, and I'm gonna be kind of pissed, but it is what it is. So tanky, actually.
feel like we're having a really hard time getting our spell. Really sucks. Is what do I have that I can use here? Nothing really. Really. Hopefully she'll get her spell off, but I highly doubt it. <laughs> Good, fantastic. It's a miracle. Hmm, so you have the help of Joan Yuan Sword. And his youngling. It's fine, it's more convenient to do things without a body anyway. Jeez. Him is level 50. Yay. That fight sucked. I got another sword of ceiling. Our Satan ran away with his tail between his legs. Except him, you've become so much more powerful. No, he's heading for the reverse mandala. What'll happen then? Septim, be prepared to face the true form of the Devil Satan. His magical powers off the charts. I'll now unseal this John Ruan sword, so you can use it to fight against Satan. Juan, your Swan sword unsealed. Nicole, let's go. This will be the final battle against Satan. No. Mm. Mm. That was a very hard fight. I wanna let me save. Let me save, turd. Oh my god. Yes, thank you. Finally, geez, okay. I actually have to equip it now. What if I forgot to equip it? That would suck, actually. I don't even... Eh, whatever. It might be helpful, I don't know. We have to 1v1, it will be. Except to no one in the universe has your ingenuity. The Reverse Mandala possesses the ability to sever face, destroy cause and effect rewards, to wicked deeds, and even bestows treacherous fates upon good deeds. Yes, I was the one who designed the Reverse Mandala. Of course, I know it very well. But do you know why I left you in the first place? What are you trying to say? First Mandala is a failed creation. I ran away because I was afraid to face your disappointment. Well, I would ever blame you. You could take as much time as you need. The real problem is the law of cause and effect can only be extended at present. There isn't enough power to completely sever it. How much power does it take? Uh, expending all the seawater, extinguishing all the stars, and compressing the entire universe into the size of a single grain of sand. The power required exceeds all of those combined. Putting it bluntly, even if we know the method, only God is capable of accomplishing it. Challenging God is just wishful thinking. I have no choice. But to become... Come to my senses when I realize this. Oh, the God can accomplish it. You must be lying to me. You're lying. You're lying to me. This is like paradise lost against like multiple religions and belief systems. Since you obtained the memories from my physical body, why haven't you realized it yet? Lies, you're lying. Shut up. <laughs> Stop deceiving yourself. Open your eyes to reality. It seems like the only way to drag you back to hell is by force. Okay, let's see. Why don't you play with my subordinates first? I am not worried at all. I actually have to kill him first. Okay, I stay. Ah. Okay. I turned his force. Okay. I'm so down for some supreme level magic. Oh, 
uh, actual one of the four divine beasts or whatever. Why not? Ah, there's mine. Maybe. Do you have anything like that? You do not. Crash. Probably save her stuff, like usual. Even though a thousand might not be enough healing. Kuzaku! I do some of another one. What the hell? This hits everybody, sure. Alright, let's summon Changi and we'll summon the fairy thing. Crossy Jade. Oh, that hurt. They die. How's that guy keep surviving? I'll think I'm not bad, not bad. You're worthy to be my opponent. After I'm getting more fond of you now, won't you reconsider? Oh, there's nothing to reconsider. I want to live my own life. Oh hell, he's pissed. Oh, why do some people always never learn? Ah oh, hell, where's space? Space! for his, uh, thing. Oh, that did some damage. I'm gonna let him attack and see what we actually do with this new sword. Oh, we do some damage. Oh, here we go with this young bullcrap again. Oh.
I don't think he actually out heals my damage though, like the other guy was doing. Because I do 8,000 with the youngling, so he heals 9,999, it's still not enough. Unfortunately for you. I think his last form is harder, which is not me. I'm not complaining, but yeah. Losing our ability to arrive really quickly. He's dead. He just killed all of his health, so I think we're gonna lose here actually. I have to go shopping. Stop taking turn. Um, yeah. How that happened? Maybe I could stun him or something. Because I didn't get a turn there, which was cool, I guess. That was fun. He just decided he was going to take all the turns. Uh, let's go shopping real quick. Now that's an old bell. Oh. He was about to die, so he's just like, oh, I get all the turns now. Cool. Must be nice. How convenient. Stop. Oh, 
that's nice. Oh, well, that's really nice too. Looks like for me, I have unlimited money, almost. Do I have any better revive things here? Or is that not an option? Well, regardless, 100% health is 100% health. Can't really beat that. Oh, that's 50. Oh, that's nice too. Perfect. Don't have any money for anything else, so screw it. I don't think, anyways. Maybe I do, but I don't care. At least it's not one of those things where I would have had to, like, they make you where you can't leave the area and you have to beat the boss with whatever you brought in. So you just gotta keep going till the RNG doesn't screw you. Oh, that's rough. Time for y'all. I'm sure that White Reaper would help, but the Black Reaper sucks for me so far. Yep, somehow. Oh, be hot. Just keep summoning them though. Ah, oh, dang. Crap. 
paralyzing. I doubt it works, but it might. You know, uh, you know, it Seeing a little spammer again. For how many rounds? Mm, half ain't a lot. We gotta be using here. Good thing we had all that money saved up. You. I wonder if the Juan Yuan sword actually does more now. Oh, it's not here anymore. Okay, so cool. Well, that settles up uh, thought process, I guess. Idiot. <laughs> Although I'm defeated, you'll never truly kill me. Septum used to spare a fusion bot. But no! Ah ha ha, idiot! <laughs> oh, we got him. We got him. Sit your butt in that pot. Now we can be friends forever. I can torture you forever. And ever. So she would probably have Byakyo, I'm sure, because she has lightning powers. He had Suzaku, he had Gimbu, she would have Seiryu, probably. Interesting. I'm locked after the pursuit of Kingcraft. Kill him in the spirit fusion pot, he won't be able to escape for at least 99 years. I keep him still for all of eternity. He'll be able to break out when he once he gathers enough power. I hope he'll repent before that happens. Thing to repent, it may take tens of thousands of years. 
Nicole, the heavens want you to be reincarnated. Nicole is reincarnating? Nicole needs to face her sins when she was still a demon general in the underworld. But taking into account her credit for stopping Satan, the heavens has specially arranged for Nicole to be reincarnated in Europe. In a few years, Septim, you'll be able to meet Nicole in your next lifetime. Septim, be sure to look for me then. I'll definitely find you. And then they're gonna turn her into that one chick, and I'm gonna be so pissed, actually. Septim, I need to go as well. I'm going to the heavens to watch over with Dad from above. I hope you'll find with Dad and take good care of her. Don't let her become a loner lover of love like me. Mm. Now, comma. Goodbye. Don't need to save the Tang Empire, which is on the verge of collapse, so I'm staying here and we'll be sending you back to Europe. Sure. Farewell, and please take care of yourself. Up to me. In order to maintain your new body, I must stay by yourself. Thank you. Thank you. Lord. Well, Monk, how about you? I hope you don't mind if I follow you. You're definitely welcome to. Oh, it's him. Septim, are you a man or a ghost? How could this be? I personally buried your body. Haha, <laughs> the heavens didn't allow me to die before my mission is completed. Hence, they created another body for me. It's great to have a religion like yours. I should join one too. It has nothing to do with religion. That said, what happened here? Answer on and launched an attack on Chang An while the Emperor and high ranking officials fled overnight. The guards killed Master Minister Yang in their rage. Good. Evil will always give us retribution. Soldiers claim that Concubine Yang is but also one of the main culprits, and they requested the Emperor to execute Concubine with the gang. What happened next? The Emperor had no choice but to order Concubine Yang to hang herself in a temple. Uh, how about my other acquaintances? Do you know their whereabouts? Right now, the entire world is in chaos. Zhang Qi and Wang Cia tied the knot and formed a resistance to army to fight Chancellor An. Oh. The monks of the Shaolin Temple would dispatch to pacify the people, and I've heard that your friend Wu Yuan has ranked up quite the contribution. Ranked up quite the What are your plans? I am about to return to Europe. Are you? You mean Japan? Yes, I've delivered the knowledge which I've learned back to Europe. I don't get it. What? Did you bother making such a big sacrifice? Is it because of your Chinese bloodline? Perhaps. The Emperor, you know, did we ever confirm he's full ch that he has Chinese? I don't know. The Emperor has treated me well, and I've had many good friends. I think it's been alluded to the whole time, but he never confirmed it, I don't think. I really don't wish for China to fall into such a predicament. You're the one to talk. Didn't you guard the Emperor too? <laughs> that's true. Well, I hope that we'll cross paths again someday. Don't get your hopes up. We'll be at distance, which even letters can't reach. You're right. Take care. You too. My counterpart. Farewell. I'll never forget this adventure in China. I will too. I will never too. Farewell. What a journey. Prince Ryan returned to order in. I thought he died of illness. We saw the crisis of the Tang Empire was facing. His hatred subsided. Thereafter, he composed a lot of moving music, widespread. What the hell just happened? It, it, it. Indies descendants became scholars in the Islamic religion, famous for their theories of law, of cause and effect. It just goes immediately, so I gotta read fast. Kama watched over with Dad from above and eventually passed away after spending 10 years with Septim. Okay. Now I can move on to my next woman. Captain Duan became renowned for his incorruptible integrity. He eventually took over as Jiadushi more than 10 years later, but was unfortunately killed by one of the rebels while pacifying a rebellion. That sucks. Wu Yuan actively promoted Shaolin Temple's martial arts and assisted the Imperial Guards to pacify the rebellion, but the teachings of Dharma gradually died out after Huey Rong's death. After Zhang Qi and Wang Cue tied the knot, they formed a resistance army to fight Chancellor Alan. Septim returned to Europe and helped the Charles establish a new dynasty. Using his newly acquired knowledge, however, due to subsequent dark ages of Europe and history became created. Nicole received a new name when she reincarnated in Europe. It better not be that stupid chick's name. 
Many years after, with Dad's death, Septim found Nicole, and the two spent the rest of their lives together. Ah, she found a new name, Nicole. Perfect. After spending a lifetime inside Septim, Zhuo Wan Yuan's sword whereabouts were lost. The end, I guess. That was a very good game, but God, it was long. Alright guys, thanks for watching as always. As always, like I said, I'll leave a link to the game. And if you like the video, please like and subscribe. It helps the channel grow, and I always appreciate it. And I appreciate y'all watching the long play videos too, because that's like the main way I get through these long games. Because like, I, if I take breaks, I get so sidetracked. That was fun. Um, the translation wasn't bad. It definitely, the story, I don't know if it was the translation it actually in some parts. I think the story didn't make sense because it wanted you to suspend your disbelief so hard at certain points because we knew the whole time who Satan was. So it felt like the characters had to go along with things just to progress the story, which was really frustrating, like really, really frustrating. But overall, it's fantastic. It's an old game, too, so... I think it's an old game, anyways. It looks like PlayStation graphics. That just came to Steam. It doesn't matter what and where the scriptures of King Craft were created. As long as people harbor evil thoughts, we can easily disturb them. <laughs> Bro, why did he have to say anything at the end? What a loser. Anyone that... Anyone there, let me out! I'm the great Mirden, let me out! Oh, Mirden, he's still here. What a loser. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I'm gonna click it just to see what happens. But that was fun. Alright guys, bye!